Pick auto. <laughs> <laughs> nah. Pick freedom. I mean, yeah. autocracy doesn't make you invulnerable. I, mean, I know you auto, think that's awesome, good, but... but it's not that good. Yeah. I don't know what you mean. Besides, that was like peak bomber meta. Was it? It was. I think so. This guy thinks there's a difference between now and then. I like how me not giving a fuck and just wanting to sim meta. I like how Gao has, has stopped Pagodas and he has 23 faith and hasn't enhanced. Dude, I can't wait. I can't wait to hear people shit talk your game like that. You're so. I am so um, excited. I am so excited. You're so you're so, so overconfident, Glossin. I don't, I don't think so. Glossin's like a perfect player. I am perfect. Ah, yeah, I've true, never actually. made a mistake yeah, in so my strong. life. Knights, uh, are you hosting? You, you wouldn't know that, but... Um, yeah, I just lost my Connected. Civ. You just lost your Civ? Launched. Okay. Lobby's up. <laughs> Looks like um, is failing. You're showing it, you're just showing... What, Miyoto? Um, well, Klaus is in my lobby, so... <laughs> Let's go. What's up, Ashwin? Um, dude, I, I barely woke up. I'm such a degenerate. <laughs> I have a problem. Good, good, good. Arby's late again? That's the situation? Yeah, who would have thought? Uh, anyone really. It's a strong possibility. Wait, why? Oh, is it because of this? Wait, why am I unable to... Full screen. What exactly are you trying to full screen? Like one of the streams. Are you on multi Twitch? Mm -hmm. Huh, works for me. What Maybe it's hell? just a skill issue. I'm pressing F. Have you been watching this other game that's going on? No, not really. Plasma's PM to me, like, holy shit, Argent's actually doing really well, and then, um, I loaded in and Argent is stuck trying to kill a coastal. Wow. Pretty classic S stuff. What the fuck is going on with Knights' stream? Dude, I actually didn't know Knights Oh, was, hold on, um... hold on, hold on. I need... Yeah, neither did I. I was actually gonna ask you that, too. Um, I can do draft for you guys. <laughs> I can do draft. <laughs> That's nice. Are yeah. we abandoned players channel? I'm just too Wake fucking me, blind. Um, all right, in playoffs channel, you said. Yep. My ban any coastal sieve for me. Portugal, Philippines, Carthage. Okay. Did someone ban Chile yet? I don't think anyone's banned yet. You got Yoda banned to... Maya, Babylon, Shoshone. Feel free to ban. Orcus banned Zulu, Macedon, and Ottoman. Maya, what was it? Maya, Shoshone. Babylon. Babylon. Okay. And Yoda banned who? That was Yoda's ban. Oh, okay. I banned Zulu, Macedonia, Ottomans. Zulu, Macedo. Okay. No, we didn't want to ban anything. You have to ban. You gotta <laughs> ban Chile. Are you gonna ban Glosson? Are you waiting? I am. Well, twelve G just stole one of my ban. Rome. I'm banning I've Chile. Put his, I've put his bans in the playoff uh, channel, by the way. Yeah, yeah. yeah I'm banning see. Chile. I'm trying to figure out what else I'm banning. I'm banned so far. Oh. Russia, Belgium, Spain. I'm gonna go look at the thing. I'm banning Chile. I'm gonna figure out the other two in a sec. All right, we're just missing the last gloss and ba uh, ban Inca and Persia. Inca Persia. Oh, right, my is such a hater. Right? Glossin. You guys You're are actually so insane. Like no one banned like a really fucking obvious like sieve. I don't understand. What's that? Yeah, yeah it's the Miota sieve. Oh, Nubia. No. Nubia. Oh, should, uh, Songhai. And it's oh, Songhai. in the game. Oh, baby. Who's got it? Oh, yeah? Ah. Uh, I 
haven't played I have it. Oh, bad. Wait, I got like the worst sips. What's going on here? I don't want these sips. Call me Cal. Whoa, hey. I, I like your draft. Whoa, 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 whoa. Back up. Back up. Now, now one quick fucking second, sir. I will not be. I mean, actually, I just play Austria into the pillow, right? I won. I won both my play my my qualifier games with with Diplo. Maybe I should just do it here too. What do you guys think? Diplo enjoy us. I mean, I'm a Diplo enjoyer. Hundred percent. Uh, win rate. Finals, finals win rate. Oh my god. Yeah, so I'm well, just... you don't have a hundred percent win rate in the finals. Let's be clear. Just with Diplo. With just with Diplo, I'm saying. Yeah. I have a fifty percent chance to win in the finals. What does Cuba do? They have culture mm. from other civs. Is it three culture or is it five culture? Why don't you it's pull up the free. fucking master list and look your goddamn self? The master list is fucking like five patches outdated. No, uh, it's, I mean, Kubo, it's only Kubo like at most like four patches just... updated. I don't think so. I mean, Eep, that, Eep actually yeah. does a good job updating it. He does. Uh, this, is a, it, this is uh, a pro Eep stream. Yeah, every stream should be <laughs> a pro Eep live? stream. Is he... Eep's a good guy. <laughs> Wait, is so do we not have a single yet? coastal in this draft? No, there's one coastal in this draft. Oh, should I fucking grief you guys? <laughs> I'm down. I mean, you guys it? have to do a random coast, right? It's like, uh, uh, I mean, only you have to if... do it six inland. Ryan, yeah. Can you post um the Actually, draft? Yeah, play the I, can, I, can I post the what? The draft. Oh. But am I griefing you guys or am I griefing myself by picking the sieve? Griefing us. Because you actually <laughs> have a ridiculous it's, private it's, here. It's going to be great. Look, it's going to be great. You're going to pick this. Then I'm going to be All right. close. Yeah, it's interesting draft. I mean, they didn't ban Songhai or Jerusalem or like, I don't know. There's like a lot of good Sue. Kind of interesting. The map has changed a lot with it's the co hill coastal tiles being more likely to be hills. Mm -hmm. I think has changed the the calculus of which subs are super OP. Like. When Sue doesn't have flat land, it's actually so much worse. Yeah, no, yeah, no, I I agree. I mean, I I actually said that when I made the the video that I said the map's hillier now, so that yeah, kind of incentivizes less less good Sue Sue land. But I don't know. It, it's still, seeing something like Songhai in the game, like it's kind of just an auto pick, mm -hmm. you know. For uh, Miota, it's certainly an auto pick. Well, Glosson got it, but yeah. Barkus is watching. Hover. Yeah. You know, you go. Watching Glosson play playoffs where sometimes he decides that he's supposed to be some other player who he's never been in his life. And he's like, yeah, I'm going to go like chariot rush down someone. And it's like, Glosson, come on. Yeah. What are we, we doing? You know, here? you're not. What are we yeah. doing here? Yeah. Where's the goat? The goat's late. And everyone is surprised. I'm super surprised. I mean, I bet the house that Arvis would be on time for the first time in his life. <laughs> and surely now this time it'll be different. <laughs> And once again, I've been left homeless by RV. So. <laughs> All right, everyone, get your bingo cards. Let's let's discuss the bingo. So I actually haven't looked at this yet. Am I getting scammed? What? Huh? I'm. Also getting scammed. Maybe the tiny URL broke. Do you have the? Oh, here it is. Okay. Um, generate bingo card. Perfect. All right. Here's here's gonna be the stream bingo card. Barkus Smoge. That's a fucking free space. Uh, accidental whispering. That's another free space. <laughs> Post uh, turn 100 industrial, another space. Dude, these are so easy. I wanted someone to win. You know, I wanted there to be a I, sense of that's, reward that's for true. the Twitch viewer. Yeah. I feel like a lot of the time, there is just, it never happens. Yeah. Yeah. Teaming. Yeah, that's free space, literally. Gloss and Whisper. Our face goes freedom. Uh, love it. Love it. Auto Zero. That's a cool one. 
I think it's going to happen. I'm actually very confident it's going to happen. That's I, think cool, I, I don't think so. I don't think really? so. Yeah, like hmm. we were talking about this earlier, but um, like 12G and, and Arvius are probably the two biggest freedom players in the whole tournament. Hmm, that is true. But I think between Glossin, Knights, and Barkus, were you watching the in-house yesterday? No. What happened? Um, they all went to autocracy. They all tried to factory art each other. They teamed three <laughs> times in the space of ten turns. This is the game that was like, surely it won't go four hours, right? <laughs> it didn't go four hours. <laughs> yeah, true. I mean, you're not wrong. Yeah. Help. I need you. Exactly, Tex. Exactly. Bomber strike. Get Dude, I, Bible, I don't think that's that free of a square. Because uh, Miyota's gonna self like self sack his own bomber stack. Uh, like if that was that one. The one that I'm then... sad didn't appear on your bingo card is Miyota suicide bomber. That's my ah, favorite. Okay, I was actually gonna wonder where that was. Zero yeah. backseats in Twitch chat. Surely not. Surely, oh, surely, surely yeah. not. Wait, did you do you wanna do you wanna talk about the players? Um. Yeah. This is a good time. This right? is a yeah, good let's, time. Let's yeah. This is a good time. Yeah. All right, everyone. Welcome to the stream. We have a number of players, but you might be asking yourself, who, who is playing in this lobby? Who, who are the people? And if you're not familiar with 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 Civ, you might be like, who is Arvius and why is he offline? Um. Yeah, a lot of people don't know who Arvius is. Probably yeah. the least known member. Exactly. Of the yeah. 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 Uh, so let, let's just let's just start with Arvius actually, in case you don't know. So Arvius is actually the top placed player in this lobby. He is the rank two player in this tournament. Wow. Yeah. Holy shit. You know he and Azuso, they're both three wins. Azuso is only ahead on tie breaks. So that's fucking crazy. Very, yeah, there's a very real chance sense in which Arvius is tied for first. That's that's unreal. Yeah. So, where where has Arve Arvius actually made an appearance in the last tournament finals? Um, he's been playing for twelve fucking years. Oh my he's been god, for a long time. <laughs> Holy shit, he's always been playing longer than Hawks has been alive. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, definitely agree with your preferred timing here. Definitely, de shut up, Karen. Definitely agree. He's definitely an, 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 like a, he picks honor, but then he doesn't attack. Like he just is like, come fuck with me, boy. <laughs> I'll plant the city, turned 120, punish me, bitch. Like that's the obvious mentality because, <laughs> because he never dies. Like he, he's so fucking He's so good. impossible to kill. Yeah. He's, it's literally, I feel like 90% of the players play like it's a sim game that they wore in. And Arvius plays it like it's a war game that he's sometimes forced to sim in. Yeah. Weaknesses, sim, and scientist decay. That scientist decay shit was so fucking funny. That was amazing. That was one of the funniest fucking things I've seen. Um, for anyone who doesn't know, uh, Arvius, we, we're playing with a, um, a a new feature in, in Lekmod where it punishes people for hoarding scientists until the very end of the game. And what it does is it'll decrease your bulb value by 12% every single turn after the first turn. And Arvius didn't know this existed in one of his games and then ended up having two scientists that had zero bulbs. So it was, it was, it was actually like hilarious because, you know, no one knew. Um, okay, so that's Arvius. Arvius is an incredibly strong player. He's very, very popular. Um, He's a popular streamer, but beyond just that, he's also like an incredibly good war player. And I think that cannot be understated at all. Um, I think there's one thing that happens in these tournament games, a lot of war. Yeah, exactly. He's mentally strong too. Agreed. And I, and I think we're, we'll start seeing some of the, uh, the weaknesses for the other players. And that is certainly a relevant point to me. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Um, get your Barkus Smoge bingo check. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> okay, are we still offline? Good. Um, no, okay, he's online now. He's uh, so. Is he on Twitch yeah. online? Yeah, he's on Twitch. What? Okay, mine hasn't updated then. 
All right. Uh, Miota. Miota is the. No, he wasn't in the last tourney finals, was he? Yeah, it was really Damn. tragic. That's Miota's that's probably sad. one of the most consistent tournament players. He's almost always makes. He always makes playoffs. He almost always makes finals. He's got this insane conversion rate, right? Yeah. Most of the games Miota makes it to ideology, he wins. It's actually such a good point, and I think it's just it's a testament to how good he is at um, just finding a way to always like be relevant and win the game. It's such like a a slept on characteristic of people. I feel like where it's like oh like this person knows how to win like. What does that even mean? But Miota, I mean, he proved it. I feel like I, I was kind of skeptical about me saying this. If you'd asked me like three months ago, mm -hmm. the guy won Diplo twice. Like what? <laughs> Who the fuck is this guy? Where's Miota? Like, you know what I mean? like, like that is the most un Miota thing I've ever seen in my life. Um, his preferred timing. I agree with you in the sense that it's comps, but that's not to say that he's not comfortable with yeah, a bunch of other stuff. Yeah, he's competent at basically every single time. Yeah, yeah. He, he's, he's so good. His, um, I think his play style generally is, Miota you know, wants to be in a lot of cities, he wants to be making a lot of hammers, and he just wants to be shoving, shoving, shoving. Yeah. He, he, he pretty much is like a, a very, like, he only really knows how to play wide. I, I don't even, I think he'd kind of agree with that too. Um, and he's not afraid to to play tall when he has to, but... You will always see him build a monument. That's all I'm going to say about that. Yeah. <laughs> if there's anyone that's going to build a monument, like, instantly, it's going to be fucking Yoda. Um, yep. So, okay. That is Miyota. His game assessment is very good. His sim is really strong. You know, I think a lot of... We put a lot of, like, value into and weight into um, people playing Weavey and, like, what kind of roles they play in Weavey. Miyota's always the wide player. Like, he's very, very good at Sim. But he is renowned to just trashing all of his bombers. So we'll see if that happens this time. All right, Glossin. Oh, and Miyota was ranked fifth. Uh, very weird, honestly, for him because he has historically, ex like, only been ranked. Uh, he's always been, like, in the top five or, like, top three. I think it three. might be time to uh, just swap over because the guys are greeting up on their. Okay, yeah, yeah. We, we can come back to this. Yeah, there's, this will always be here. Okay, so Arvius is finally... So Arvius is lobby. picking... Okay, we don't know what he's picking, but let's let's talk about the civs real quick. Knights is playing Iroquois. The last civ in a million years I would have thought he'd pick. <laughs> what the fuck? Dude, he's gonna he's he's doing either classical or medieval or yeah. knights. Important note, none of them are coastal, which means there's no coastal random. They're just gonna all be playing inland, which really fucks map generation. Um, so we'll see what happens there. There's uh, gonna be so much warring this game. It's gonna be know. awesome. Uh and, and but frankly, like that kind of game really favors Prussia and it really favors uh Arvius because it's Arvius and 12G because it's 12G. Yeah. Uh, so. I mean, there's a lot of real war bonuses going on here. We've got the Songhai bonus. We've got the Iroquois movement bonus. We've got the Sioux combat bonus. So there's a lot of people here who have clicked civs that are like, you shouldn't be able to kill me. Yeah. Good point. Um, and we saw Arvius just lock in Canada. So let's, let's like run through the civs really quick. I, guess mm -hmm. I, I think this is an important point. Um, okay. So Arvius picked Canada and... Canada is an interesting sieve because I feel like it's much more of a passive sieve. We've seen Arvius, who's obviously a very, very strong war player, but he takes such a passive route. And I think Canada is a really good sieve to kind of benefit from, uh, from that kind of play style, right? Like you're going to scale mm -hmm. incredibly hard. The guy loves picking freedom. And um, if freedom really synergizes with commerce, it really synergizes with patronage, all of which uh, Canada does a really good job. Who do you think are the favorites here? Who do you think it would be the surprise wins? I think the obvious favorite is going to be Miota. Um, he's made it to three different finals. He's really, really consistent. But anything can anything really can happen. happen. Like, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. So let's let's start on this Arvius cap. Arvius is playing Canada. This is a fine Canada cap. Like I've you you've seen all of us have seen so much worse. Right, I think Canada is like... I've seen like... worse, but I, I do hate this start. He's going to struggle to grow to three. 
he's not gonna have hammer tiles to work once he's at three yep but but i see three camps and that has to mean something right (laughs) it means something it it means as little as i can put the weight on it okay (laughs) well i i think it's important um coffee is a great like regional for canada though that's not a a fur like a trapping lux because Mm -hmm. it's brewery but obviously the growth is is a good a good point but we know he's gonna be playing tall anyway all right uh let's go to knights so knights is playing iroquois he's got furs oh oh shit start (laughs) this is fucking cracked oh my god and what's even better is like he can easily easily get like natural roads going right this is fucking disgusting oh man and he's 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 showing us yep i'm i know the iroquois tech i'm going to be doing sacred path look buying either of these furs is gonna just teleport his settlers oh my god yeah oh Oh, my god yeah this is amazing like he he can easily cross all the rivers he won't lose any movement fucking incredible okay that's knights let's go to barkus Oh, what? Oh, what? Why wouldn't? Why Is he? he where did he spawn? Did he spawn in place? He had to, I guess. And his iron no. is two left. Yeah. I feel like. I w- guess would these you are all move here? City t- these are all city TPs touching his capital, right? Like the problem is actually his production tile access, right? There's obviously great TPs. Don't get us wrong, but. He did kill a TP, and typically you want to avoid doing that on Sue. Where, where did he kill a TP, actually? On – oh, wait. Never mind. He didn't. No. Yeah, no. I'm the TP is the the fine. fine. It's, he just doesn't have any production tiles. Yeah, yeah. I mean, but this is Sue. That is like a problem with Sue. Yeah. The cotton, he'll improve. He's going to have iron. He'll chop the deer. That's three production tiles. It's not that bad. But he's very close to the coast, so something to keep in mind. Yeah. Um. Okay. That's Barkus. Let's look at Miota. Miota is playing Prussia. Dude, is this not super reminiscent of the tournament game that he had with Conrad and... Oh, God. Yeah, with all the lakes. With all the lakes, yeah. Yep. This looks exactly like one of the previous caps he had. This is like... This screams tall to me, which is... It's this lake spawn is really rough because his settler, settler movement, movement to the left yep. is it's terrible. Yeah. Oh man, this yeah. actually looks actually. So I, I I think I'm right. Like, not moving, um, as Barkus actually potentially kills a uh, it, it guaranteed kills a TP spot because you could land on horse. So, mm. I mean, obviously that's not like a good reason, but yeah. So we'll see if Miota goes what he does here. I'm actually very curious. This is usually the turn where he'd select monument. Um, if he's playing lib, Miota does not believe in two scouts. But, bro, I swear to God, these people have been watching my guide since we started tournament. Like, I swear. No, it's when he plays serious, he makes Yeah, scouts. when he plays. Look, anyone that tells you, oh, no, you don't need two scouts, like, they are lying. They would pick it in tournament. Look, like, Miota is the, like, monument first guy. Okay, Glossin. Um, this is, uh, like, on gold looks great. Like, I actually... I love this. I think it looks pretty good. Um, it's really easy to settle, like that banana city. This is a nice capital. It's such I, a good cap. I think it just lacks the three food tile, but I think he got think a pop. So, do you think Glossin would ever play piety here? No. Glossin he, also has a crazy start. Yeah, Abraxas calls three stone. Abs- like, dude, look how good that city is on the fucking river there. Like what? Yeah. Holy shit! I feel like he's gonna force tradition here, and he's gonna go for Petra Oracle or something like that. That sounds like Glossin. This, yeah. this is just like a very much a Glossin yeah. type thing. Um, okay, Glossin start is crazy, and then looks look at twelve G. So he got incense. Yeah. Look, I think incense gets a bad rep. I think some of my best games have been on incense, but there's. <laughs> I see four desert incense. Oh, Look at that desert no. salt, too. Oh, oh man. Oh. Dude, this poor guy. <laughs> He's also on the shrine required sieve anyway, so the relative benefit of incense is so much worse. And he has a, he's got th- 
three stone i see so that that's good right what do you play here i don't know let's let's, let's spend some time on here yeah <laughs> i mean 12g is some of the more interesting decisions coming up right? i think of all the people to get this start i think look i we didn't really talk about 12g much but he's an incredibly strong player incredible like incredibly strong his biggest flaw is lack of lek experience and honestly i feel like a start like this is like <laughs> disproportionately like not bad does that make sense because on imos mod you're more likely to get these really janky starts lek is like kind of spoiled a lot of people with like consistently good good starts and like knowing how to play mm -hmm. does that make sense like for instance yep. if, if knights got this start i think he wouldn't know what to do yep but it's it regardless of regardless the it sucks. In the start, yes, it, like it's pretty bad. Yeah, we're at, we're not gonna sugarcoat anything. It still yeah. blows, but it's not as bad as as it could be. So is this an honor start for Tolji? Do you think? Um, I mean, I see a lot of stuff. I, I think honor helps fix a lot of the problems, right? You have a lot of the growth, kind of, you know, like you're coping when if you say it's fixed, but it's better. Oh my god, that's so bad. Yeah. Uh, I know. Has 12G this. ever played Honor? Yes. 12G is, is incredibly experienced in terms of like playing multiple mods and stuff like that. So like where normally like people like if they're switching between different mod types like would get overwhelmed. I I don't think he's like too phased by it. So when people were asking turn 0 like who you guys are the think are the favorite? I was actually really heavy on 12G. Like, really? 12G is a very strong player, and he's got a lot of late game experience that, especially somebody like Barkus or Knights, doesn't. Sure. Yeah, I, I mean, if it gets into stealth, um, I, I probably still favor Miota, but marginally, like very marginally. Mm-hmm. But Arvius is also like incredibly good at that. Yeah, you know? there's a lot of there's strong just late a lot of really strong late yeah. game. And then it's so funny because you have the complete opposite of the pendulum with Barkus and Knights who have little to no experience at all. Yep. Um. So you can can we, can we watch a different? Yeah, stream? yeah let's, let's look can't. at someone else. I, let's look at let's look at oh I know let's look at Knights. <laughs> yeah. Let's oh, go. this is the happy place again. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Oh, he's getting the Mesa. Glossin's uh, not getting the Mesa. Uh, what would you play here? Um, Looks like he built a monument. Oh. So he was definitely thinking Lib. Yeah, I would have thought Lib, and now I'm not sure. There doesn't seem... You could play Lib and kind of run it into Miota, but that lake makes things difficult, right? Yeah, yeah. Hmm. It's tough. I think it's the Liberty. Um, Do you have enough space? No. Like, I mean, you, but I, mean I, like, I, I will say coastals are not nearly yeah. as like. It's it's like six degrees Liberty and try to run it down and. Like just believe you can kill Glosson. I think that's the play. <laughs> I mean, Knights is very much like I'm gonna force this onto you rather than like. Yeah. I'm gonna like out click you, right? You know, he's mm -hmm. like a more of a brute force type player. I mean, I'm very similar in that way. I mean, if you think about Knights has been really on the come up. If you think that he started playing Lek in 2023, like this is that's insane. Yeah, no, no. I mean, look, like th this is clearly someone who is trying to get better. Uh, he, if anyone doesn't know like he's very much like a member of like um like my discord and like the rising star community and stuff and he's done an incredible job at like developing and get getting better and um he's like he contends like some of the best lobbies i mean that proves it proves the point because he's here and he's playing right this is i think this is his first tournament that he's playing in yep he did click liberty so I expect to see some kind of like gold generation yeah, actually, pantheon. Hold on, hold on. Uh, then... Streamer panels. All right, sorry. Yeah. 
I expect to see some sort of gold generation pantheon into some sort of like classical or maybe medieval war. I think he's going to just try to shove units in. Yeah. I mean, it's an interesting thing, right? Like, uh, Iroquois doesn't have much of an advantage attacking, but it's mm. crazy good to defend, which I think, you know, it might scare Glossin from trying to push into him. Right, like what? What? Glosson's ideal timing is usually like around crossbows, right? And that's when Iroquois like pretty much unfucking killable with those units if if you have the right type of spawn for it. So, I the, think if you look at Glosson in tournament, he's very rarely succeeded in these games where he's early ward. Right, part of it is because he threw the game with um with Sira and wait, oh, hold God. on, I, I don't mean to interrupt, but Glosson got another pop rune and he's four popping. Fucking Glosson, is that? <laughs> I forgot to put them in the bingo. The <laughs> gloss and high roll. Dude, four popping, turn 14, with this many hills. Yeah, like, it's all lapis. Like, what? And he got a spear, so if he gets this tribute, like, we're going to have problems. Why would you buy that one, gloss? No, buy the desert. Wow. Oh, His cap is so good. <laughs> what the yeah. fuck? I'm kinda Wait, and Glosson's lib. Yeah. Oh. Interesting. I hmm. So, do we have like policies? Oh, we should check Miota actually. Yeah, let's let's check all the policies real quick. Yeah. Um. Okay. So, Barkus is Liberty. Okay. No surprise. Knights there. is Liberty. No Arvius there. is. I we don't know, but it looks like late monument for some reason. Oh, he's taking policy now. Who's monumenting after policy? This could be piety. Oh. What? I I guess he decided he was playing honor late. He needs to watch late. the videos, guys. No, he decided he was playing honor late. He saw the CS, so then he's like, oh, okay. Now I see the situation. Arvius is going to run it down. Arvius is hella running it down. Oh, God. 12G scout is so fucking dead. Oh, I mean, it's, it's, you know, like, you're playing with Arvius. Let's see how, let's see 12G's reaction. Live 12G reaction. I don't know. Like, the way he's moving he, his he, mouth, I feel like he's, like, annoyed, but at the same time... I, I kind of... It kind of looks like he thinks it's a bit funny. I, yeah, he, right? Right? Like, I, was, I was hesitant to say that at first, but... <laughs> yeah, I think he thinks it's funny. I mean, he got... He got... He's got a lot of growth in his cap, so he's five popping, which is really important, um for this capital especially because there's just not a lot of hills um and then it'll help your gold situation a lot especially as especially as honor um but yeah i see um uh, the last one we missed was miota and miota's piety so we miota have is piety, piety. Yep. okay do you think he miota definitely um miota like to me comes across as someone that like would pick the fucking lake pantheon do you know what i mean like i i, I just yep. i just see it and the problem is i have so much experience with miota doing something that i think is incorrect and then him being like no it was correct yeah that i can imagine him doing anything <laughs> right no you're 100 percent right that, you're 100 percent right think there's something about me or about miota <laughs> <laughs> all right so what do you think of berlin as a city um I think it's I, it's naturally a bit more defensive. I in yeah. intuitively you would have I, I would have put it one down. Put it on the gold actually. Really? I I know Miota to be someone who's very very aggressive with settling on Lux, right? Yeah. Because he likes the relative advantage of not having to build so many workers. Uh and Tom makes the point in chat that there's no coastals, right? So I think he equal. wanted that city city so that he could get the um the hill but I could be wrong. For the capital, but he's not working horse, I, I guess. No, well, he's he's building a shrine right now. Oh, I see. No, but he has enough hammer tiles, right? My, um, Iron, horse, ear, hill. So, oh, he's on five, Bob. No, he's on five, yeah. Um, so it's not enough. I guess. I, 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 don't, I know. don't know if that's worth it. I, I'm just saying I think that's why. Like, especially because you have to chop the dyes anyway. Yeah. I don't. I don't think it's worth it, but. Me, um, that's the only thing I can think of. I, I, I think settling on coast is objectively good. He, it's also just one turn faster, right? Um, he would have delayed one turn to have gone on the gold. I don't know. That's he. Okay, yeah. I he needs to be unhappy. It's not a 
great look. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. Yeah. I, I I feel like I'm oh, oh maybe is this like skirm brain? Is it like Arvius is there and I want a city with like that controls the choke well? Potentially. Potentially. Prussia doing coast Yeah, exactly. That's the thing. You're very much incentivized to keep doing coast as as Prussia, right? Like, no, it's that's not how um the being coastal is a modifier on trade routes, and being Prussia is also a modifier on trade routes, so they don't stack the way you'd like. They oh really? Just stack linearly. Yep. Oh, that's lame. Now you know. Now I'm disappointed. Yeah. All right. I mean, either way, I think one of the main things. I would like to see from Yoda here is like some sort of demo pantheon. Um, I because you have the um, Uluru, mm -hmm. you don't need to push Faith Gen and stuff like that. I think early Faith Wonders is so important. It's so good on on Piety because it lets you avoid having to rush temples and stuff like that, and you can like mm -hmm. do other stuff. Um, so hopefully he picks like a, a, a demo path here. It's 100% craftsman as Miota. I don't think so. I think he's only gonna do like five cities. Oh, it could deny the lib boys. That's a really good point. What is this warrior? This he's only met Arv and like he's only met Arv and knights though. So and knights is not gonna do craftsman. I don't know. I I don't know if that's actually that great. What'd you say? This barb warrior that in Miyota's land has just been avoiding his units and trying to hunt down the worker. It's been pretty funny. <laughs> okay, Arvius. What is... So, okay, I'm, I'm convinced just looking at the spawns and looking at how close Barkus is that Arvius is just going to run it down at comps. I think he's just going to show up. Into 12G? Uh, no, into Barkus. Oh. I don't know, man. That's a lot of planes. I, Arvius is very... Arvius is someone who's like, if you like watch his streams and stuff, he's super conscious about this is this bonus. I want to put this tile here because it, you know, is on a hill or something where like, I, I can't stand on this desert tile or this oasis tile because it makes yeah. me vulnerable. Like, I feel like he'd have, he'd be more inclined to go into Miota than he would be to go into Barkus just because of the Sioux stuff. That's true. I, yeah. Also like going into Liberty Sioux versus going into Piety. Uh, kind of a no-brainer when you say it like that. Yeah. How many warriors does Arv have? Dude, who fucking knows? Um, uh, I, I think at least three, four, five. What? I think it's... Yeah, it's five. Okay. I mean, I think his start was literally warrior, warrior. <laughs> or no, I mean, there's a scout there. But he's almost late scout. I'd, I'd, dude, I don't know. I mean, I think I, I I remember like watching one of his games, and he was he was pretty upset with himself that he didn't play honor and he like did something else. So I'm not like super surprised to see him taking a more, I guess, aggressive style of sim. But Arvis historically has been very much I'm just gonna sit here and play piety, and there's nothing you can do about it. Like that's been his his mo. So. Yeah, I think the whole RVS like kind of idea is that you will never be able to kill me, and I can greed as hard as I want as long as I want. This is and actually so definitionally obvious. So, yeah. uh, Tin in my chat says saw El Dorado bought a warrior turn two. I don't think any other person would buy a warrior in that case. I would like if you put me there. I'm buying a worker. I'm buying right? a worker, especially with the fucking like wheat tile you have right there, or something like that. Or like at least I buy a scout. That way I can just instantly start monument next turn or a worker or whatever it is. Uh, it appears like the warriors are doing things for him. So I mean, yeah, they they killed a 12g scout. I I think like my, the way I play honor as most people watching probably know is I'm very much, I'm going to like use the most limited amount of resources I possibly can. I'm going to try to maximize the units I have. Arvius is like, I'm just going to build as many fucking units as I, <laughs> as I want. My game will be slow, but I'm honor and it's fine. Like it's a very, it's a, such a different um, like mentality, but it works for him. So mm -hmm. got to hand it to him. I really like this. I like the the deer getting improved. Oh, I thought the deer was for the expand. Uh, never mind. I don't like it anymore. Um, I know. I think it is. It is. Yeah. He, he okay. just needed to chop the iron. Yeah. Okay. I see. 
Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I really like this. I like you know, city comes down, it works like a let's say five year old tile. It's always nice. Yeah, and, and then not to mention it just goes right to either it could go to uh, coffee if he needs the luxes up, or it could go to um, the hill to chop, and then you know into the next bison. So it, it looks it looks really clean. Oh no. Yeah. I don't okay. Know no, no, no. I don't. No, no. He's not. He's not. He's not. He's not. I I I will say I think Barkus is very let's let's like let's check Barkus spot actually but yeah. this is a really good talking point I think Barkus is such like he's so cheap you know what I mean when I say that like he is so <laughs> I'm going to like spend as little time like as little resources on this as possible and if I get punished I'm going to be really upset about it <laughs> right so I'm actually very maybe proud's not the right word but i'm i'm happy to see him you know be very cautious with that settler and um you know be very very like it might slow him down to settle that, like a little later but he's making sure that Arvius isn't going to snipe his fucking scout right like i think that yeah. is a very conscious decision and um i'm i'm happy that he that he's like you know making that cuz i know like bark barkus like a little while ago definitely would have been like Oh no! Fuck this guy! Like, <laughs> like his game's just over, and he mental booms. This goes back to what we were gonna talk about in a little bit once the game kind of settles. But dude, I I don't understand this Sparky spot at all. How is this liberty? He I don't literally. I don't, I don't know. He can't put a settle like down left of him. It's impossible. He's blocked by CS. I don't I don't know what he's thinking. He is um like like his live settler is gonna spawn and he's gonna walk in the other direction. I mean. Frankly, if this if he was next to anyone else, you're running it down at cons. I'm running it down at Buffaloes, hundred percent. Oh my god, look at that! Did you see that? That was so fucking pro, right? He knows he doesn't want to go down left, right? So he shoves the worker onto the tile where the lip settler would normally spawn, so that it spawns so it can cross the river. Yeah, it's great. It's great. Yeah, I mean, obviously it's a lot of TPs, but Barkus's land itself is a little bit suspicious. Um, in terms of like picking liberty, but yeah, I think honor was probably a stronger pick here because it. I literally see four cities. Like, <laughs> so let's just recap. There are zero tradition players. There is, um, how many liberty? Boston, um, uh, Barkus, three Knights. liberty, yeah, three liberty, three liberty, three two liberty, honor, two honor, piety. one piety, no trad. Which is funny because Trad was the most commonly uh, one with tree in uh, <laughs> in qualifiers. So okay, Ryan, don't look. What pantheon would you guess Mieta took? I I, I I wait. Barkus is forcing the settle. Is he gonna go like touching silver? Um, what what do I think he took? I think he took the fucking lake one. He took vision quests. What? I mean, that's better than. How wide is he gonna go? I don't think he's going that wide. There's just not enough space. Yeah. Huh. Or like Miota, being Miota here is actually very worrisome. You're you got Arby's on your right playing honor. You got knights on some compact liberty build on your left as Iroquois, right? Mm -hmm. Everyone's neighboring you. You have very few early game hammers, right? And you're in the middle. You have to do something. This is, I don't know, pretty rough. It's pretty rough. Agreed. It's so weird not seeing them settle on Luxes. Like, it's just, it feels It wrong. just doesn't feel like Miota. Yeah, it really doesn't. Um, we haven't looked at Glosson in a bit since he's put down Expands. Um... I mean, wait. Oh, he's greeting. I guess he wanted that horse. Okay. It. I mean, no one's really surprised here, but Glosson's game looks really fucking good. Dude, I don't know. Like, the the Glosson is like having this like really really strong start, and then <laughs> throwing, throwing it, it away. away. <laughs> yeah. <You know? laughs> okay, I'm glad you said it the same yep. time. <laughs> I would have felt like more of a dick. <laughs> no, I mean, come on. We're... Yeah. It is the gloss. It, it is the gloss. I think if anyone is allowed to say that, it's both you and me. So, 
Wow, look at these seas. It, I mean, like, uh, like his land is just so crazy. Yeah, coastals with hills. So nice. And he's like, ooh, 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 ooh. Djibouti already has a wall. I don't know if that mm. affects anyone, but well, it affects Arvius. It means that. Well, and twelve Yeah. But I, 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 I don't know if anyone's archering. Yeah. Look, I mean, something that I I was very vocal about how I did not agree with how Fuser was playing his game. But it, he did kind of show me that, like, you only need two horse archers to kill a city-state. And that kind of blew my mind. Wait, you only need two? You need two. That's nuts. So, double pop plus hills equals good. That's, Who would have uh, thought? Yeah, everyone's surprised. Everyone's surprised. <laughs> Is this a situation where he starts starving if he stops making settlers? <laughs> Tom says, I don't think Glosson had strong start. Well, you're wrong. Uh, what'd you say, Ashwin? Is, is this a situation where Glosson will start starving if he stops making settlers? Uh, no, no. He improved the uh, the farm. The wheat. Yeah. Okay. yeah. All um... right. So let's look at Knights. We haven't looked at Knights in a little while. Yeah. So Knights is <laughs> contesting Barkus. This is the first thing I noticed. Which on is what? On uh, pyramids. He's huh. got the Grand Mesa city, but he has no chops. So, um, I don't know. I mean, that's a really good early city, right? Like, between the, the improved salt and the Mesa and the hill, it'll just make a lot of production. But Barkus is just taller than knights. I don't know what the fuck Let's Barkus see. Is. Let's see. I mean, it's, it's a Mesa and a salt. So, like, that's, yeah. that's a lot of hammers. But yeah, so he's got 14 left on it. Let's check Barkus. This is 11. really big. It's 11. Yeah. Yeah. But is he stagnating it too? He is. Uh, yeah. But he's chopping. Okay. So Barkus is going to get it. Dude, losing that wonder is going to be pretty bad. Yeah. I mean, Knights is, I think Knights is making this assessment that like, he's got to do something, right? He's going to have to attack and he's, needs pyramids and Barkus has made the exact same assessment yeah I, I i think one one point i think is that's important to highlight is if you're knights where do you want to attack into because i think the last place i'd want to attack into is fucking miota really yeah i mean he doesn't know it yet but that's leading him well i guess he does know it that's leading him to the rest of the map and Unless Miota is right next to only Barkus, I don't want to be next to 12G or anyone else. <laughs> like, fuck that. Yeah. Is um is Miota going to do his buffer state impression? He's going to go full Poland? I mean, maybe. Yeah. I, I... All right. So from this position, who has the best chance of winning? From this uh... position alone, let's say the players are exactly the same. I actually do think Glosson. I think Glosson too. Yeah. I think Glosson's position's insane. I think the way that his land is able to like be self sustaining is pretty unique to him. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like no one else has that luxury. Glosson also has kind of has one of the bigger sim benefits of here. He's got the culture temple, right? So he gets to like scale decently into late game. There aren't that many sim benefits of the Miota if he kills knights. Well, the equal skill players shouldn't die here, right? Like, for example, Arvius to start, like if Arvius kills Barkus, right, then obviously Arvius is gonna be very strong. But you shouldn't be able to kill Liberty Sue as honor without a significant skill gap. I'm looking at Arvius right now. Um He's gonna go. He's going four cities in the direction of Barkus. So I think your assessment's right. I'm just surprised he's not heading towards Miota. Um, I mean, maybe he's just got a lot more respect for Miota. That could absolutely I think that's be a what definite it is. Possibility. Yeah. Um, look, I I think one thing I've learned from playing these games and then also from watching enough of them, if you underestimate too many people, you're gonna get burned. I mean. I know we're talking about Arvius and like his ability to war people, but dude, I've seen Barkus drag down some real players. So, 
It's a very nice way of putting it. Oh my god, what is is Nyasi? Are you looking at this city? It's a. Uh... Oh man, Barkus is pretty I'm, I'm bad. Still, I'm still looking at yeah. right now. I I just like seeing what he's doing with all of the, like the warriors and shit. Like, it's very unique to him. Yep. All right. Uh, you you wanted me to look at Muta. Um, I wanted to look at Barkus actually. So Barkus is on five cities. And I wouldn't say any of his cities are actually that high quality, right? So, Izanyathi straight up doesn't have a hill to grow into. Um, yeah. He only has this one coastal. Uh, because I think, like, there's a legitimate argument to put Sichangju on wheat. Just to, like, force another coastal. And, I don't know, it's none of these cities Wait, Why are... did he make a shrine? Barkus made a shrine. I guess he just forgot that's TP's... Did he make a shrine? Yeah, I think he did. He might just be working two teepees. I think he only has one teepee. Bruh. <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> Barkus huh. position really bad for Lib? Yeah. How, yeah. What would you have picked here? Uh, I'd play Honor. Uh, for sure. The, I think it's pretty sure. The fucking Honor of Corner, CS. man. I mean, when you... Is it... When you have this situation where you don't want to play Lib because CS are blocking your settles, that, that's Honor. That's textbook yeah. Honor. Yeah. That's a good point. Uh, uh, let's go back to 12G. Yeah, let's look at 12G. It sounds... It's got a lot of gold. 12G is making it work, TM. I think he's doing a... I think he's doing this correctly. Um, I think he, he'll want to take Khufu. And he's probably going to put a city over by the copper to the left. Uh -huh. that, that yep. Inland Sea. Um, and then he'll have four coastals, which is going to be great if he ever has to war Glossin. Who's going to open Trad for Hanging Gardens? No one. Slazerwood. <laughs> Slazerwood? Yeah. Probably. Okay. The best. The only policy dip that I'm really into, and it's easily the best, is patronage for for forbidden. Forbidden. Yeah. Yep. That's I, um, I actually that. ratio. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so oh, I want to talk about so 12G, right? Lek honor is like pretty particular to lek, right? It's not a tree that like the way it works doesn't work at all. Like it doesn't vanilla, or I don't know how it works in Amos free for all patch, but people don't appear to play it from what I've seen. So. This is going to be, like, difficult. Uh, I don't know. I have a lot of confidence in 12G. You know Look, I, I, even if you play Honor just like you would play, like, Liberty or something. Yeah. And, I mean, and he's not, right? He's He's mm -hmm. got scouts in cities, which is super important. Garrisoning mm -hmm. is, like, the way to sustain a good game is Honor. Yeah. Um, you're going to have, like, a mediocre game with good scaling. So I don't, I don't hate it. So there's that city coming down. The the question for me is when he's gonna kill CS. Yeah, that's it's a good it's a good question. I yeah, it's a really good question. It's all from all the Weavy Duel experience, but that that's Ashwin's point actually, is that Weavy Duel has nothing like um Lek is is nothing like Lek in how Honor plays. Yeah. He's he he. Twelve G has probably played the most duels. Like, <laughs> he's a he's a monster. Yeah, and Honor and Weavy and Snowy is just completely different. Yep. So, not much would carry over. Are you thinking about Pantheon right now, Twelve G? What do you take? Yeah. Man, this is so sad. He's got the stone as Axum, and he's got the incense regional. Like any, literally. Any other regional here is so much better for him. Yep. It's just tragic. I mean, this could be a situation where, you know. Oh, yeah. Do you see that? What? He doesn't have garrison policy. He went barracks before garrison policy. Okay, never mind. Yeah. Anyway, um, I will say, I think your question earlier about when he's going to take CS I'd be surprised. Like Achilles plays a lot of honor. Mm -hmm. Um, 
and I know he watches a lot of Achilles. So and Solix. So I'm sure like he, he'll know to like build catapults and stuff. But he, he got God of War, which is a good deny for Arvius, you know. Yeah. Okay, never mind. He clicked the axe and building. Yeah. I think he's getting I don't know. I, I think this was a start that had to be like something pretty lex specific and he just hadn't had the reps here, which is uh like really unfortunate. I think 12G is a great player. I think having him be relevant to the game just increases the game quality. And I'm worried. That, I mean, like, dude, if he for like I think this is amazing middle of the map spot, knowing what we know now. Mm-hmm. Right? Because think Cause about Glosson's it. Glosson's not doing shit. Glosson's Glosson's not gonna do shit. Knights wants to make a play. Arvius is going to war into Barkus, right? Yep. Knowing that, it's an, it's this is amazing for for twelve G to kind of either pick up the scraps or scale up, but his land's just shit. Yeah. Uh, let's go look at knights again. Let's see what knights is up to. Oh, hold Dude, on. I want to check Barkus real quick. Yeah, let's go. Three that, turns then. on Barkus. Okay. So Knights. Four. That's four. Yeah. Oh, Get that's wrecked. so sad. You yeah, know, if he'd uh, if he chopped that forest in the two ring of Osnika, he'd probably two turn it. Yep. Sorry, he'd probably see him turn it. Yep. Um. So. Also, I had no idea Knights was Swag Giga Chat. I kept. Neither did I. I. I kept seeing this person in Twitch chat, and I'm like, who are you? Why do you uh? <laughs> why are you commenting with such authority? And it turned out it was just uh, just nice. The swag Giga Chad was like the person that I was like afraid to ask who it was because they're yep. been around so long. Yep. <laughs> I'm glad I wasn't alone there. Yeah, I mean, look, knights building hard building a uh, pyramids like that while still growing the four pop. I mean the 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 two to three build is always correct. I'm sorry, two to three grow is always correct because you just get the other hill yeah, and you but can't the really avoid it. Four. Yeah. Yeah. Knight zero faith per turn. He's finishing the shrine now, but yeah, no, I know that's. Dude, he's he's not playing like someone who wants to rush the summon down, right? Yeah. Especially on on uh, Iroquois, right? Like you have a lot of potential to do that because you're very incentivized to take something like um uh like sacred path which pushes lib towards finisher faster than anything in the game mm -hmm. just kind of interesting because you could easily get a good chariot attack or something like that as this sieve but oh he got the he got the mid sound are they actually in the same turn two on there dude this is the moment. This is when Barkus goes Get haywire. Your bingo cards ready. Get your boys. bingo cards ready. We're actually gonna undeafen for this one. Oh, Tsunami says Barkus is at one. So uh Yeah. Sorry. Okay, never False mind. bingo alarm. Never mind, never mind, never mind. I I'm if you're watching Barkus, by the way, Barkus has decided to fix his uh no settles problem by just continuing to walk right. <laughs> Found some some spit of land that he's just throwing settlers into. These fucking dumbass peninsulas, man, and these like really weird fjords. Like fjords are off, and like what the fuck is this? Wait, okay, so all right, let's talk about pantheons. Uh, Barkus got settlements. Barkus loves settlements. I don't actually Lawson know. Lawson still doesn't land. have a shrine. It sounds like yeah. Because why would he? You you think he, the shrine is bad? Wait until you see him have to build roads. Arvius just finished his shrine. All right. So Arvius has to take divine judgment, right? What? Arvius has to take the um. The barracks faith pantheon. Uh I mean he Arvius. Arvius isn't the type of person to just feel restricted into taking like barracks beliefs if you're honor. Uh huh. You know, he could take something else. Like, I think plantation stuff doesn't look bad. I, I think divine. I think divine judgment is actually a really good pantheon. Like when, um, so Lucas actually pitched that one. Uh huh. 
I was like, dude, this is genius. Like, like it, you could make an argument for taking it over Barracks Hammers, right? Like, in just a normal. Can you? Game. Yeah. Because it, it scales really well with the courthouse stuff. I'm such a Barracks Hammers believer. Two hammers for a building you're going to build anyway, right? Like, Faith is a nice yield, sure, but you're never catching me taking that over this massive demo increase. I guess, but Honor doesn't really need the hammers, though. Yeah. No, I, I, I think you all, especially in the early game, you have so much to build. It's true. Good point. All right, let's see if Arvius misses a turn. It is turn 39. Oh, that should have been a bingo entry. <laughs> Okay. Knight, yeah, Knight, let's, let's go look at Miyota, actually. We haven't looked at Miyota in a while. And honestly, not looking at Miyota that often is. Well, okay, he actually did pick a religion. Salat, Relcom, Swords. Okay, a lot of demos. That's a lot of demos. Interesting. The vision quest is a bit weird. Right? It... It's so weird. He doesn't appear to be having happiness problems. Yeah, there's no trad, Luca. Vision Quest isn't bad. It's actually quite good, especially if you have like a Sun God Lux or something like that. Um, yeah. And you're trying to play Piety off of it. But the issue is if you don't, I don't know why you take it. Because <laughs> you don't really need the gold. Like, I see Vision Quest more of like a gold pantheon than I see it as like. I mean, obviously, it's good for happiness, too, but, like, it fixes a lot of the big gold problems that you'd have with Piety. Since when was Miyota playing Piety? Since he had no space at all? Yeah, I, 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 I mean, like I think something... Piety is probably correct here. For for Miyota, I'd like something like Settlements or maybe Goddess of the Hunt. Uh, just... So, like, his, ultimately, <laughs> this happiness isn't a demo for him right now. Like, technique, the only thing it's doing is it's pushing GA. Yeah. Um, yeah. Um, yeah, no, that's what we were saying earlier, uh, Mega. There's no reason, like, Berlin couldn't have been on gold and then Satin couldn't have been coast. No, the real tragedy about Berlin not going on gold was that it made Miota unhappy for two turns, which you, you just want to avoid that. You'd rather not be unhappy. Yeah, happiness is good. You think he's going to build the Oracle here? Yeah, I think he will. Lawson still doesn't have a faith source. He, nobody's building Stonehenge, right? And a lot of, a lot of Liberty players. I love Glossen's land. How many cities is he on, by the way? Uh, seven. <laughs> And he just put another one down. He's gonna, or he's, yeah, he's on eight. He's, is there another settler? No. Okay. So it's only it's eight. Okay, eight's fine. Yeah. I don't know. Like, Gosselin's so isolated here, right? As long as he's got this inland sea. Look at the way he settled Timbuktu. By the way, like. Oh my God! Is he building there. roads? That's not Glossin. Who is this guy? Ryan? Pin this guy. That's not Glossin. <laughs> <laughs> Who the fuck is this? Wait, also, how does Glossin have so much gold? Did he get same turned or something? Oh, it was Songhai. He cleared a camp. Duh. Tartifex turd account. <laughs> True. It's funny to not see any of these guys build Henge. Normally, they're all very big Stonehenge monkeys. Oh, my God, yeah. I would have think like, especially for knights. Yeah. Like, dude, I would not have queued pyramids. That's Iroquois. You don't need the roads as much. Yeah. Like, and... and... No, I, I thought he was going to do some um, some early war, and pyramids really would have fit with that. No, for sure. I But now that we know he wasn't thinking that... Yeah. Stonehenge instead of pyramids is just so much better. 
and it would have worked. Uh, yeah, in the, hindsight, the fact the part the part where it works, you know. In hindsight, yeah, but like even even if it even if it didn't, I would have, I think. You just think it's more powerful. I effect. think it's so much more powerful, especially as Liberty. Yeah. Yeah, like, yeah buying these stupid forest tiles is it's awful. It's awful. Yeah. Like getting Stonehenge's Columbia or something is like the best thing in the world. Yep. Dude, Glosson is actually like he's got this river, but there's no access to him. The person with the most access to him is 12G, and he's hampered by uh shitland <laughs> <laughs> i mean i was gonna say the the sea but shitland is also a good i mean and honestly my point about how glossin like how 12g is like going to benefit from having a lot of coastals mm-hmm. if anything that kind of just benefits glossin like glossin has got so many like more coastals than him yeah um this is like a funny thing about coastal exposure right like if you settle one or two coastals they're easily taxed but at some point if you settle enough strong coastals they're like oh shit <laughs> i gotta worry yeah. about this guy <laughs> yeah. yeah no absolutely i mean best example of that is fucking lumpin oh my god <laughs> <laughs> oh, were we commentating that that was i think goes, so i think that we goes were in the cope reel yeah we were yeah. and then i went to bed because yeah. they were and then you took over and the game finish on like turn 200 or some shit dude i'm convinced something's wrong with gloss and micro i think like the cargo and gen cargo and timbuktu i'm sure you could have gotten those down he's got too much baked food <laughs> bless you um yeah probably yeah like gen's like growing yeah like why <laughs> you're building the best fucking building in the game like finish the building hmm I guess, like, there's a little bit of a lack of hammer tiles here. The cap has to work. But I don't know. It's just weird. I feel like you could have microed one way or the other. Whatever. Did you see that? 70 hammers turn 43. No Pantheon. Hmm. As Songhai. Hmm. That's scary. Luca, the ruin is chilling because Glossin is cooking it for something. Like... I, I don't know how to express how insanely greedy he is. And half the time, it's not even greedy because it's good, right? He's just that greedy. Very true. <laughs> My god, Smooth Tilt's here. Yeah, he's saving it for the rocky, Rocket already upgrade. Yeah. Oh, oh god, god. Got, wait never mind he got 13 there do you, do you get the fate dude he's so greedy <laughs> and now he's gonna be like he's really like any i'm sorry <laughs> they're really like the same people yeah let's go look at let's go look at eu Miyota. let's see what he's up to <laughs> Miyota's demos are actually really strong he's top food he's bottom hammers but hammers is a fake yield anyway so you know that's fine yeah 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 exactly yeah. surely nobody has ever died because they didn't have enough hammers lots of people have starved you're so right yeah <laughs> follow me for more insights on soon <laughs> <laughs> i mean i don't know miota's land is pretty hill dense right he's got this very nice religion he but he actually lacks really the, like the swords here yeah he's lacking the sort of like white and purple yields that would scale him but i don't know he's gonna make it work i believe you know it'd be the most miota thing ever what he just takes like he enhances the fucking um holy warriors Yeah, that would be. This kind of reminds me, actually. Do you remember there was a game with Solex and Syrah, and I think subbed where Miyota was center map Italy? He yep. Played like... Yep. Yep. And Hoy was in the game as Denmark. Yeah, and Syrah went into Hoy. Yeah, 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 now I'm remembering it all. And Miyota played this very passive, like. Super fast fucking Liberty game. Yeah, and he just got teamed the shit out of. And I worry that this is actually what's going to happen here, is that he's going to try to play defensive, and 
then he's gonna die. Wait, Hoy, was that Molly? Was it Molly and Sierra teaming you? Or was it Molly Solex or something like that? It was definitely Sierra. Sierra was Normandy, Sierra was bottom middle, and okay, Hoy then, was yeah. bottom left. Then yeah. Solex was right. Okay. Yeah. Knights, workshops, expos, Miota. We'll see. I don't know. I don't actually... I don't like expoing Miota here. He's... doing. I guess, like, you see bottom hammers piety. Like, you're just supposed to run it in. What are your hesitations for not doing it? Okay, so like I I'm much worse war player than Mega. Mega says land is easy expo. I think it's hard to expo, and that's why I didn't want to do it. Um, but I see these like cities with like hills in the Memel back. Memel is hard. Right? Yeah. Memel's hard. Yeah, I don't but well, look, I, I Mega's much better than I am. I'm I'm not gonna come out here and say like, yeah, I know better than Mega. Uh but my instinct looking at the land was like I, I also thought that it was hard. I see, I see lots of hills, and I say that's not good. That's kind of my oh. like a, my in depth analysis. Yeah, no pyramids as well. Um, I there's like I don't know there's some skirm stuff which I think just doesn't apply to free for all as well because um values on city shot change right. So like if you look at memo, um, the memo uh memo has like lake in the first ring. And in Skirm, that's death, right? Because they just set up catapults and you just, like, can't clear them, right? But a city shot in Lek basically one-shots a catapult. So it's harder to get city damage. Like, Danzig is, like, kind of similar there, where to kill Danzig, you kind of have to control every tile. But big noobs, Ashram big noobs, don't look at me. Oh no, Knights is locked. Yuck. Let's check out Knights. Oh yeah, what the fuck? Big yuck. Oh, he's about to grow too. I love that greed. Look at that greed in Knights. I mean, is that greed? If no, there's no coastal player, right? No, like, there's not. It's it's not, but like it, at the same time, it's also like super ambitious. Yep. Hmm. I don't know. It's this. This is not looking super hot. I don't like stagnating. Controversial opinion. Stagnating is bad. Yeah. I'm surprised that the jade south of Mesa never got settled. Dude, Genesee River stagnating at one pop. Ugh. Yuck. Trying to get a religion. Yeah. <laughs> <'Cause>, <laughs> yeah. As soon as he gets a pantheon, right? Then he can. Yeah. Then then they'll. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, I'm with you. What? What? Do you, what's the problem? I mean, he's got that jade. He's got the truffles to improve. It, no, he just hasn't improved that many luxes, right? There's part of its gold problems, I think. Because mm, there's that fur by the Colossus City, which is not even in border. Where's Gloss and Killing River? Don't shoot! Don't shoot! I would shoot him. Fuck Lawson. <laughs> Pulling what turn Lawson gets Pantheon. I mean, isn't he getting it because he like lucked into that faith ruin? He still isn't making faith return. Oh my god. I I made a video on when to skip a shrine. Not that you should always skip a shrine. I mean, <laughs> I don't think Glossen watches your videos, dude. I don't think this is uh... I think Glossen just decided he wanted other stuff. I was just answering Hoy. Yeah. There's no way that not making... <laughs> Whatever. Glossen moment. Glossen. Yeah, he's literally too faith out. What, is he, what does he think is going to happen, right? Like, does he think he's going to find another yeah, faith? he's going to get another one. Surely yeah. he'll get another one. Just float uh, uh, float a worker <laughs> over to some islands, right? Yeah. And on yeah. his third 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 ruin he picks up, that could be a 
a faith ruin. Yeah, you never know. You know, actually, it's important to get your your scouting unit damaged so that there's a higher chance of getting the faith and heal ruin. Exactly. Right? Yeah. Look, I I I'm agreeing. I think that's the move. He's about to get pillaged too. Who got GL? Actually, I don't know this. I didn't, who was even building that? Was it Twelve G? I don't think anyone built it. No, it went. It definitely went last turn. Oh, my bad. Must have been someone you just weren't watching. Then Twelve G would make sense. No, Twelve G like Twelve G's building didn't... Oracle. So it's not Arbius. It's not Twelve G. Are you sure it's not Twelve G? Nice. Well, yeah, it's dude. It's Twelve G. It is in an expand. He he's got scientist points. Look at the top. Where is UI? Oh, yeah. huh. Where is it? It's not in the capital. Oh my god. Yo, what a fucking Chad. giga what Chad. A Chad. What a fucking Chad. Wow. That's bait. <clears throat> How did that Who that? needs <laughs> good land? I mean, he's got improved tiles, which is you know more than you can say about <laughs> some other players. Yeah. Workers are one hell of a drug, bro. Okay. Desert salt, I'm... not bad. Yeah. If you think a 2 1 tile is not bad, do it. it it's workable. You know, if, using using three worker turns to get something that's workable, I'm into it. <laughs> if Glosson dies to 12G's crossbows, he deserves it. He, would he just deserves never it. never hear the end of it. And he deserves it. Yeah. Remember when he died to Lumpin? Yeah, that was crazy. Oh, yeah. so they're contesting Oracle together. Let's check the build times. Who's um who's fighting over Oracle? Muta. Uh I mean I I would be surprised if Muta didn't get it given that there's four turns left. I think that's how long twelve G's is. No, really? Didn't he just start it? That's Could a be good wrong. build. Oh yeah, it is. It is the same. Wow. I think he overflowed a barrack into it. Dude, he's like he's actually so so good at like the micro. Is Tolji going expos here? I don't think so. Miota building a comp. I think that's just a good idea. I've said this before, but um, Oracle on Piety is so so good. Finishing your religion is just incredible. I mean, Oracle and Honor is similarly powerful because the Honor food bonus is so massive, right? That's true. Like, the only tree that doesn't, like, explode with joy when it gets Oracle is Liberty. Uh, yep. And it's not even bad, right? <laughs> No, obviously not. I mean, worst case scenario, you just dip into something else. Okay. Uh, Kel asks, is Arv simming or slamming? Arv is simming. He's teching Philo. He's not building any units anywhere. He is probably trying to set up for crossbows. That's what I would assume. Something, something Oracle OP. Look, I, I think it's good that there are wonders that are better than other wonders right like i think that's like i think chichen's a good example like yeah. chichen should be a very contested wonder like there should be strong really strong wonders not everything needs to be the same power level but oracle's like ridiculous like why why it's not just that it's so powerful the thing that i really hate about oracle is that it's the place in the tech tree where if you compete for it and you lose it you fucking, You've you just lose. got no compensation whatsoever. Yeah. But I, isn't that good design? No, I think it's. I think you want to maintain situations where people can compete and still be relevant if they lose something, right? Because you want them to be able to compete at multiple points throughout the game. I guess so. Are they actually discussing Oracle? Uh, that would be pretty funny. Dude, is, now, I can't help but notice that Brandford expanded very quickly. What do you have to say for um, yourself? 
Oh, whatever, Glossy. I, I, the problem is if, if you agree that Oracle is like the best thing you can be doing on Trad, uh, then two Trad players who both have like good games to compete over Oracle, one of them is going to get. Wait, are, are we supposed to be on emote only? Um, yeah, most, uh, I, let me double check the rules, but I think streams are supposed to be on emote only. Good call, Solex. Should not go for Oracle if you are slow. I, I just think this is such a Coke takes move. Like, they're same turning, right? Like, <laughs> now that that's the honest one of the reasons I like Oracle on on Piety is because it doesn't. Yeah. Kill yeah, your, your game. opportunity cost is so much less. Yeah. But I mean, Piety kind of has its own problems, like throwing hammers into a wonder and losing it. You, you don't exactly have like free hammers floating around. You I do lose a lot of gold, so it's actually not like it's. It's not. <laughs> That's cope. That, That's it, cope. Yeah, I mean, clearly it's cope, but <laughs> yeah. I almost never go oracle on piety. I love it. I think finishing your your uh, your religion is really good. You don't but, look at Barkus. I I kind of want to see what's going on with Barkus. Yeah, we haven't looked at Barkus in a while. So his tech seems kind of slow. Uh, like fifty four duct. I don't know where he detoured. If he detoured at all, it's He's, not uh, flipping when you are one turn faster. Shut up, Jack. Um, he didn't detour. Oh man, that's rough. I mean, it's just late cities, right? Yeah. I don't really understand why Baywax Pen One wasn't on the horse, but I don't know, whatever. He's also like in freakout mode here. You can see he's building two spears. He's got the chariot, the sword. He sees Arvis's workers, right? Yeah. So yeah, it, it, it's a rough game for Barkus. Oh my God, Glosson got a Pantheon. What? What do you get? What do you get? What do you get? Yo, he did take it. What did he take? He took Starlight. What is? <laughs> that's sick. No, no, that's cool. Dude, that's, that's a, it's like the latest pantheon of all time, and he doesn't have any lighthouses of any way. <laughs> He's building a lot of them. Okay. Dude, no, I, I, oh, Miota lost it. Twelve G got it. Oh my god. GG. That's big. GG. That is really big. Absolute GG. He has no fish in most of his cities. Semantics. He can just work GLH. Fire. Dude, I love that. I think this is actually big, right? Because what Glossin is setting up to do is to be the default coastal player. Is No one else is contesting Colossus, so that actually should go to... The Knights? The Knights, yeah. that'd be cool. But, Damn. yeah, if... Well, I want to see if Miyota's molding. One second. Uh, guys, just a reminder, if you don't have your Twitch chats on e emote only, please set them to that. Yeah. What's going on here? Yeah. Sure all my um, followers are not uh, giving me any advice. He has Pantheon next turn. Just weird that none of these like Stonehenge enjoyers have clicked Stonehenge. Does Iroquois have Pihot? Panth yet. He doesn't. He gets it next turn. No one has a fucking... P no one's contesting Stonehenge. Like, th th this happens a lot, I feel like, the in better lobbies. Like, people are scared to contest stuff because they just assume it's being contested and it expands. Yep. Whereas, like, in lobbies with maybe, like, two really strong players and the rest are, like, kind of ear, like, there's so much people just like, I'm just going to build this anyway. No one else is going to fucking beat me. You know what I mean? Like, well, I mean, the GL is such a big example of this, right? GL has this stigma around it, right? Which is that GL is so highly contested that almost no one builds it. Yeah. Uh, I will say, of all the Pantheons to get late, Sacred Path isn't the worst. Mm, he's been working a lot of for Yeah, I know, bro. but like, do you want to push Liberty that fast? Yeah. 
Isn't he going into honor next? And it's not like he's naturaling. Wait, hold on. Wait, he's only liberty three. Oh my god. What the fuck? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I would have liked that culture pave down. In other tourney lobby, there were three people contesting Stonehenge. Rye kids taking over. Are, are they? I don't know what I, taking over means, but there's a lot of I, them. Is it, is it taking over when you take <laughs> turn 52 Pantheon? I think, um, I don't know. Just right now, it feels like Glosson's very strong. And yeah, no one took Messenger. 12G is very strong. Yeah, 12G, I I think he's played this early game pretty well and I think he played this early game brilliantly. I think a lot we a lot of people would have just gone in on this start. Oh yeah, for sure. And and I think the wonders are definitely going to help propel yeah. this game a lot. What? Are you seeing this on 12G? He found a ruin two tiles from one of Barkus's cities. No fucking way yeah it's uh like apparently barkus didn't see it that's just so funny that is such a barkus thing too yep if you're 12g do you ever build the fucking building here you have to it's so much demos yeah i guess like you're just not allowed to not build that for as much as flat desert sucks i've never had an axum game with that much stone I think we're seeing, I don't want to jinx anything, but this happens a lot where if you are, you have like, this is a good example of where his advantage of a lot of stone is only really helping him in the beginning of the game. And he will start to really fall off the later the game goes just because he lacks tiles. I don't, again, I'm not trying to like jinx anything here or something, but like, this is a very common thing where um, like you're like, oh, my game's so good. And then like you, you, you just don't have any fresh water or anything like that. And then you're just like, why the fuck did I fall off? It's like, well. I think a lot of these cities do have good potential because he has the coastals. They're going to get cargoed. And so his, those um, two for sure. The inland is this beautiful banana bonanza. He got a pop ruin. Oh, my Whoa. God. <laughs> oh, my God. There's no fucking way. Dude, are you looking at Kohaito? That is a... That's a city. Okay, you were right about the tiles. You were right about the tiles. First time I've seen 12G laugh. Oh, have we got? Did anybody have a one granary capital? That was one of my bingo entries. Gotta hunt that down. Was it Glosson? Uh, did Glosson have any? Glosson had the wheat. He had and... in just stone. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. There we go. Uh, this uh, maybe I made this bingo card too easy. I think you did. Yeah. Um. No random coast. That's good. I think Miyota literally, I'm so weak to turn minus one. So, you can, uh... oh, if you click it, it actually marks it as yeah. being. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, maybe yours is bad. Maybe I just am better at bingo than you are. I think that's probably what it is. Yeah, it's a skill diff. I mean, it always is, man. I'm just shit. Dude. Smooch. Okay, so where? how do you kill CS if you're 12G? Which now you got to kill going? Ormus first. That way you can push out. Mm. Or alternatively, I mean, like, do you really want to take Cahokia? Like, I, I mean, I, I guess. Cahokia, yes. But other than Cahokia and Ormus, like, what do you want? Glossin. <laughs> One big CS. <laughs> like, actually, though, like, what do you... I, I think sitting here, it depends on 
he's not really bordering. It feels like 12G and Glossin are playing their own little mini game. Right? Yes. Uh, I, I agree 100%. So in that sense, you're sitting there and you're thinking, what is my best chance to beat Glossin? What timing am I strongest at? And fast crossbows would do it, but it doesn't look like 12G can do fast crossbows. And like, if you're slow crossbows, there's you run into Liberty Hammers and into Stonkai Knights, which are very efficient units. Um, what else? Suspicious. All right, I'm gonna interesting. Try to listen. To Never thought of it that way. Oh, that's a, that's a great idea. Orders. I'm gonna just mute it pretty much. Like put it so. And low. also your religion. <laughs> oh, that's so fucking annoying. Um, come to that conclusion? It's almost that like Axum is gonna pop good, off. Yeah, I mean Axum with God of War is just so good, right? Like, it fixes all of the problems that God of War has, where your religion just never spreads. Did you guys know that Sue has a combat bonus and boost that makes it? Multi commerce. What about this says commerce? I'm, about it. I'm really not seeing it. Uh, commerce is only an option if you have like no happy that problems. Just doesn't seem right. I don't believe it. So Kufu but, definitely. Did you know that Bacchus has a combat medicine? To this is like a worse there. case of no tiles than usual. Yeah. Like I feel like commerce. Actually. Yeah, I feel like commerce is good when you have like flat grassland or plains or whatever, right? And you're gonna trading post everything, but yeah. Oracle doesn't necessarily mean. Good commerce, it because I don't. You fucking deal with these stupid bops. Actually, never yeah, mind. Nice okay. Wait, with how fucking... how are all these people it's finishing like their policies so late? Yeah, but they're all just no monument keeping, I guess. Like twelve G you know, is getting kidding. fucking honor finished on turn fifty eight with Oracle. He definitely didn't monument, right? He was like honor right. two a while back. I mean, whatever. You no, know. you know it was because he took barracks. Yeah, you're right. It's this late. Garrison policy that actually made his game so much weaker. It it's only weaker if if he takes like it's only it, it could be made it it could have made it stronger if he takes commerce because then he'll have actually time to get to medieval. Yeah, but that's a stretch. <laughs> no monument, no shrine. Definitely no shrine. Um, he definitely did a monument. He just took the wrong policy order, and it's a common mistake. Because you look at the barracks yields and you're like, oh, those are really good. But they, they are good. But like, that's right? not the important part of honor. I have six coastals. What do you think it is? <laughs> Man, uh, Knights is building all of his Colosseums right now. And his tech is worse than. Oh, it's not worse than Brox's because he has Colossus tech, but. I think Zana. Yeah. Yeah, this is a bad, bad game to have unmuted because it's Glossin and Miota. Yeah, I don't know how you're feeling with that. Yeah, like I, I'm really tempted to mute it, but then I, then we can't fill out the bingo card as well. Yeah, I, I just, you know, I would just guess, right? And then someone <laughs> know it and if, uh, if I were wrong. Like if someone's hovering over like the in war with Miota and then hovering over peace, you know mm -hmm. he's like. I'm so weak. <laughs> yep. Uh huh. Just uh, it's not worth the mental damage to have yeah, to listen exactly. to the natter. That's a good point. All right, we're not gonna listen. To that. Fuck that. Think about our poor viewers. Yeah, I wouldn't want to put them through that. Okay, I'm gonna. What's going on with Arvius? Arvius is. Dude, the Arvius Vargas border is so fortified. Vargas has the fort and the two spears. Uh, wow. He just really doesn't want to die. I mean, it's a good call. It's the fear of Arvius. Arvius has good hammers, though. Wait, Arvius took messenger? <laughs> what the <laughs> fuck? I Dude, can't, I can't. I'm sorry. I can't. <laughs> what the I'm fuck? As hard as, uh, like, <laughs> I can't. I can't. Uh. <laughs> <What is this? laughs> 
<laughs> Dude, what? <laughs> What's the trad theory, Mika? He just really thinks multi-steel trad messenger is like a good idea. <laughs> yeah, I think it's terrible. Arvis is on board. He's playing honor. He, when did he even? I don't, I can't, man. <laughs> this is fucking four city honor messenger. Well, wait. He so he's got twenty nine faith per turn, five faith per turn. So he's had it for like six turns, seven turns, maybe. I thought the cap counted as connected. Is it not? Yeah, this is just three cities of uh, of faith. Yeah, I mean, when is he? When is when <laughs> when is Arv gonna get there? Is the question? It's definitely crossbows. Gotta respect the fast NC though. Yeah. Mm, fast NC messenger. There's there's some stuff there. All right, let's 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 go back about the profiles. Right, that was yeah, a good time. This is this is a good time. All right, so let's think about Glossen. Glossen has been playing since COVID. Yeah, Glossen and I started around the same time. I think like he started a bit before me. So he participated in every tournament, but he hasn't made it to the finals. Ever. Yeah, I, he's even made it to playoffs. Yeah, ever? yeah. The oh. the art the Achilles Mega Game was was the playoffs. That was for finals. Oh yeah, you're right. Yep, yep. that was a that was a game. It was that definitely was a, game. a game. Yeah. But uh, I think that he only made it once, right? Uh, I think so, yeah. So, Glosson likes bombers. And he's the biggest, like, tall fanatic ever. We're not seeing it this game, but he's, like, such a tall player at heart. Yeah. He's renowned to just lie to people right in front of their face. Like, that... <laughs> my, my, one of my he favorite is such Glossen a moments. piece of shit. Is like... <laughs> You know we're we're te we're all teaming game leader, and I'm like threat trying to threaten Glossin to come team game leader, and Glossin just goes Taj. <laughs> <I'm> like, <laughs> <laughs> He's like, "Don't worry, I'm coming. Just let me get this done." That is such <laughs> a fucking Taj. Glossin thing. So one thing that we were alluding to earlier when we were talking about muting on Discord, Glossin is the type of person to say every single thing that's coming into his his brain. Yep. So if you are saying, oh, Glosson, can you do this? He'll be like, oh, no, yeah, that's fine. He's like, that way I can kill you later. <laughs> like, like, he'll just say it. <laughs> like, Yeah. Uh, he, he is a known tilter. He's definitely a... Uh, yeah, Glosson he, 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 he gets so mad. He makes such irrational decisions. And then afterwards he'll be like... Yeah, that probably wasn't the right play. Or yeah. Like, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so traditional like Glossen in tournament, his successes have always come from a tall like tradition into patronage or commerce build, right? He very rarely has he I don't think he's ever won a game as non tradition. Uh so this Liberty game comes as a surprise to me. Yeah. No, I mean it's just his comfort zone. Even playing Weavy, uh like he prefers to play like piety or honor or something like more tall. Mm -hmm. So yeah, he hates Liberty. So yeah, you're right. It's, it's, it's surprising to see him play like this, but honestly his, his game looked great. So, all right. Yep. Uh, 12 G. So this is sorted by placement. So 12 G, uh, I think he, he played in tourney four, I believe. I think he, he like had some scattered games. I don't think he has ever been as successful as he is in yeah no for sure yeah. yeah how did you find this year's active thing by the way oh this is just a an estimate because he's been streaming for like seven years i slapped a year on but this is like it's at least 2016 i don't know how long he's actually been playing got it yeah um and, and for those who don't know uh Inmost mod is very much it's more of an extension of vanilla than it is of like more modded versions of civ so oftentimes you get into like really late game scenarios which is why yeah. he he's so comfortable playing these super like XCOM dropping and stealth wars and stuff like that he's also got he's 
uses Rocket already quite a lot. This is something I think RU players. Um. Yeah. Okay. That that's on me. He was eighth in playoffs. I had no idea. Um. Yeah. RU players. They really um. They'll use Rocket already a lot. You'll see it from like. Amhost. You'll see it from Twelve G. That they'll go like tanks into Rocket already. Um. But yeah. Just um. A lot of these guys who come from like the Imos patch, they'll they're really used to these long late games. They're used to having to navigate a big uh team teaming dynamic there and they're i i think the later the game gets the better 12 g is yeah he he's won the emo he's won the firestorm tournament before like he's incredibly incredibly good mm -hmm. but as we're seeing like in this game he's not super familiar with lek um and english is in this first language so that's like such a barrier actually that yeah or he's Ever. not he's not super fluent in English. I think his English yeah. is great, but um I and mean, we see this with like Achilles and, and Solex yep. and stuff, like they just don't talk as much in these kinds mm -hmm. of games. Like I think Achilles less so, but yeah. Uh, but I, I they all have great English. It's just not it's just not, they're just not super comfortable. Yeah. Is Imos the Russian mod or something? Yes. <laughs> all right. Uh Barkus. So Barkus is like an older player that had a lot of He had a big break. He had Yeah. He he kind of had a resurgence once he found the Discord, I feel like, right? Yeah. He um he's gotten substantially better within the last 6 months. Um as shown by the fact that he's in playoffs at all. And he's had some really strong games. He's very, very comfortable on wide. And he's such a settlements addict. I've never seen him not click settlements when the opportunity was there. Yeah. Uh, loves playing Liberty. I, he's not super familiar with the other trees, but yeah. Uh, for we for strengths and weaknesses, we had a kind of it was kind of hard for us to find because he just hasn't played. He hasn't played that much, but the main thing to note about him is his, his lack of experience is probably what's going to hurt him the most. Um, whereas everyone else we've included so far has a shitload of experience. Um, Barkus and Knights, which we'll talk about next, is that's kind of where they, they struggle the most. And he tilts really hard. Also, He's such a tilter. He is not afraid to um, kill scientists. So that's a that's a big strike. Very important. Lex skill. Yep. Um okay. So Knights. Knights started last year. Knights is so new. For anyone watching um that is like trying to get into Lex, but you think like you have to be like really good or like you have to be playing for a long time. Knights has not been playing that long. And he started last year. He started playing Civ from my videos. Like the guy is like very, very new. Which is definitely a weakness, but it means he's got very good fundamentals and he hasn't learned any bad habits and stuff like that. Yeah. He can also really fight. I think a lot of new players are just terrible at fighting. Uh, Knight's, uh, Knight's <laughs> got clicks. He's got clicks. And Fucking he's Garb is such a dick. Garb is a dick. <laughs> 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 Oh, <laughs> <laughs> okay, do you think JJ or Knights would win in a duel? I, I, I think I it'd be Knights. Nice. I think Knights time. would win. Yeah, I think Knights would win. Uh, let, let, let's get through this bit because Arv is going to go across those. Suits. All right, cool. <laughs> yeah, so he's very proactive. He likes to control the pace of the game, but, you know, Knights is new. He just Knights is new. Out. He's easily yeah. baited by people he thinks are better than him. Yeah. I could definitely see him getting convinced into doing some really stupid shit from Yoda or Glosson. Yep. Um, same with Barkus. Uh, yeah. Just, yeah. So, is Arby's going shops into crossbows? There was I saw crossbows queued at some point. but I mean, his gold is pretty incredible, right? When he drops GA, I think a lot of this gold is going to go away. I just meant his... Gold he's yeah, yeah, yeah. The bank's gold is like ludicrous. Yeah. Um, 
He's gonna have so many upgrades. Like a, some spears and forts are not going to stop Arvius from killing Barkus. What do you think this kind of posturing and stuff? How do you think that um, make like wh what do you think that allows for Miota? Right, we we've talked a lot about how Miota's position is like kind of bad, rough and whatnot, but if he only has to really worry about knights, um, that is like great. The problem is I don't know how hard he's going to scale. You know. Yeah, there's not much scaling for Miota. And what Miota's really missing in what that Oracle, the Oracle lost damage him so much for it was culture. Right? Yeah. Yeah. Um, Miota enhanced with Feed the World and Defender, by the way. So he's playing this kind of very defensive, very demo heavy build. But this means he's not going to be able to push a uh, secondary tree. He's not going to be able to push rationalism. So if the game stays stagnant, then Miyota is going to fall behind. I think Barkus has the best map position. I don't. Who got Stonehenge? Who got Stonehenge? By the way, Barkus is Glossing got an expand. Barkus is like five five demos. Barkus is a. Uh, Barkus is not having a good time. Yeah, that's a seven turn fucking Great Wall, in cap. Oh yeah. my god. I'm also pretty sure he queued ducks in the civil, which is. I mean, I guess you're Sue, but. Why not just go straight civil, honestly? All right, honor secondary from Barkus. Yeah, not terribly unexpected. He he's really lacking gold. In... That's a common Sioux problem. Is it? Yeah, Where's TP's, the TP's, gold? TP's just oh, don't it's only have... on rivers. Yeah. Yeah, TP's really just don't give much much gold. Mm -hmm. You like seal here. I feel like Zeal is really overplayed, honestly. I, I think it's bad on Sue. Yeah. You have a lot of faith. Like it's when you hit Theo, your faith doubles. Like you don't Yeah. You don't, you don't need Zeal. Yeah, Barkus's capital was be bad. We we talked about this when we spawned in. There was just no production. Yep. Which is unfortunate, but well, at the same time, like it, you can definitely play around it. I think it was wrong for him not to have moved, but could yeah. understand. I could understand the the logic for either one. I'd like also zeal div out. I just don't understand what the point of like fast spreading div out is. Yeah, it's not like you have guru. I think he's just been on this like I think a lot of people that watch my videos and play in the Discord and stuff are kind of afraid to try new stuff. Right? They know what works. They have I'm I definitely would be hesitant to try new stuff in a tournament. No, I like, but playoff. no, but my, my point is it's like he's yeah. Barkus I don't think has probably ever like he probably got caught like Kuba was making that huge push for for Zeo like not too long ago, right? Yep. And he probably got um like caught up in it and like liked it, so he hasn't tried anything else. So he's probably just been playing Zeal like for a long time. Mm-hmm. One thing I want to mention is I don't agree with the civil at all from Barkus mm -hmm. because you know that there's a good chance you get slammed here. You need to make yourself a harder to kill target. Me, why does me have so many units? He's probably just scared of Arv. Uh, Arv, I mean Arv is super scary here. There's a. Uh... Dude, he's got like 860 gold now. Oh shit, Glossin got Chichen. Classic. Dude, Glossin literally, this is such a, he's literally sitting in his corner, clicking every wonder he wants, right? He's getting so much stronger Dude, with. Me. Glossin's cap's insane. Yeah. And he got Petra. I don't know why Mega thinks Barkus is the best start. It's it's just Glossin. No, he said he likes his map placement the best. Uh, map placement which puts you near Glosson Arvis also is... naturaled no Whoa. there's no way yeah he's at 9 oh my god okay alright hold on we might have a bingo here what's the bingo in chat hold on I don't want to like say anything you know Do you know what I'm talking waiting? about? No, I don't know what you're talking about, dude. I'm... 
Donka gets it. Never mind. <laughs> oh, I, never yeah. mind. Okay, never mind. False alarm. Fuck, Johnny! <laughs> Johnny ruined it for the rest of us. <laughs> Oh my god, dude. Glossman's chat, the only thing in Glossman's chat is Glossman himself typing pop cat. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Glossman. Dude, he's actually... Like... For Glossman, like, Glossman goes civil first, right? Secures Chichin. He doesn't actually, like... These cities don't need the aqueducts that badly right now. I don't know how to say that correctly, but, like, he's growing fine. He has stuff to put in queue. It's a good play. Would you ever send Troy a uh, caravan Yeah, here? and I would, I would do it because I want the ally, and I do it because every military unit I don't have to build that I can put on the border with 12G is, like... Sure, yeah. It's, like, oh, really high value because... You you know you're gonna need them. It's not like yep. Oh, this is just draining my gold. It's like no, like <laughs> especially when people check like mill score. There is no way he's clicking Huey there. What do you mean he already clicked? It? <laughs> Bro, what the fuck is wrong with this guy? Dude, he's he's just in full gloss in mode. I don't I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> Like, I love that Glossin's position is kind of transformed into this I just don't die and I should be fine situation. Mm -hmm. And he's like, yeah, I'm going to click Huey. Wait, yeah. Arb's going civil? Huey makes more sense than Lighthouse Panth? No, it doesn't. He's got like six lighthouses. Do we ever get cards for... Yeah, we did those beforehand. Yeah. Um. Yeah, they were yeah, first. They, were first. We, 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 they started the game. Um, and then we had to go back to it. Can he please grow in Gao? Like, is Glosson not a good play? Like, is he just shit? Like, he should see this. <laughs> like, I just, dude, it's so fucking annoying. <laughs> Do you see him micro down? <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. The... Can he grow? Like, yeah, he's he can. Not... Yeah, he has he's a, working like three, he has a giga tiles. wheat tile. Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, someone bank Ruth. <laughs> uh, we'll we'll just put him in jail for a bit. It's fine. I, like I don't know. I think if you're, what's Glossin's secondary going to be? That's the first question. Knowing him, like fucking Connors. patronage. Yeah, Patro. I think he'll pick Explo. That's an idea. Might. That's a cool I, idea. There's, there's some, like, if he actually gets complete coastal control, he has a lot of coastals. He can put hammers in the water. Did he canal this inland sea? He did. He did, yeah. So that means the inland sea, like, Jean, Jean can actually build units, and they can get out. Yeah. He has culture. It's Explo. It could be. There's a lot of, yeah, there's just resources that nobody else can reach that Glossom can. And that's a good argument for Explo. I love these stables. Like, my God. Yeah, imagine if he built them. He did. Oh, uh, Kukia doesn't have a stable, does it? Or is he just... Oh, it does. He, doesn't he just have didn't improve the, the, the cow yet. Yeah. Because he's going to do this um, non-freshwater farm first, naturally. Freshwater farm is two yields. No, non-freshwater farm. Okay, but if it were freshwater, <laughs> then, it, then it wouldn't be right. That's a good point. I didn't really think about it like that. Yeah, I think next time you, before you see. Yeah, right? yeah, my bad, my bad, my bad. Um, and yeah, let's look at Miota actually. Uh, I'm I'm interested in the Miota situation. Yeah, where do you think Arv's going? Probably. Yeah, he's click. He clicked civil. He clicked civil for some like. I'm I'm sorry. It's brain dead. It's. Is he delay? I I don't get it. It's so it's, ambitious of Glosson to fucking click Huey given Miota's cap, you know? Like, I just don't. I mean, he's getting it, isn't he? It. I mean, he, 
Miyoto's going to start it next turn because, first of all, he doesn't know Velocin's queuing it. And second of all, even if he did, he'd still go for it because it's in a, like a shitter expand that Glosson has. I think I don't think Yamato's going to queue it. No, I think he other... has to. He's switching. He's switching tiles. Okay, okay. I don't. I don't know why he's building this uh, Colosseum though. I mean, it should be overflowing something. I don't know if Yamato's building that. What the Colosseum or Huey? Uh, I, I don't think he's building that. There's here. a reason why he's working every single, uh, like, lake in his cap that he can. He, he didn't go Theo first. Lawson's already building Huey. Yeah, but it's in an expand. So, Miyota okay, never do you think Miyota start? Do you think Miyota starts, uh, starts Huey this turn? Because it would be this turn, right? Uh, knowing him, he probably waits a turn. But I think he's going to start it next turn. Oh, he's... All right, so that's six on Miyota. No, it's five. No, he's finishing the Coliseum. Yeah. And there's it's six in Q, and this is going to overflow. Okay, so it's six turns from now. No way he's doing that. No way. No way. He's What's doing he doing? That. He's greeting. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. oh, my God. Yeah. Never mind. Dude, dude, I actually think something about the way Glossin plays, like, he just... Gets into Miyota's head. I don't. You remember that time he scammed ten thousand gold? Yes, I do. Like, I think that for me, that's what earned him the moniker NA Miyota. <laughs> he sometimes he just Miyota's Miyota. Knights wins this. What? I'd be so happy if Knights wins. I would be so happy. What does Knights have? I guess like I kind of. It's crazy. I do kind of trust Knights to close a game more than, like, Glossin. Shut the fuck up. No, I'm serious. Glossin can't close. Glossin is going to greet and give him the game. Glossin's already... You know, there's there's other players in this lobby except Glossin and Knights. It, I think <laughs> Argus is... All right, see you, see you, Garb. I understand. Talk to you later, bud. Yeah, Glossin's 100% a choker. What are you talking about? Like, Glossin, the only time Glossin wins is when he, like, fumbles his fumble. When he fails to fumble. <laughs> he fucks up so bad that it works out. Yeah. Luca, Dude, what is Arf doing? Like, you, Ashwin's saying that you'd think that, or that's what should happen. Yeah. But he's got so many units. Like, why isn't he putting like a fort on the desert tiles? Twelve G, yeah, I think twelve G killing Glossin and Artie is a real possibility. Also, I don't like Su um Songhai at Cav is a really rough timing for Liberty. Because you don't have the gold to upgrade the cheaper knights into cav, right? So you end up just over uh, overnighted. I don't think. Yeah, but then in that case, you just yeah. use some knights. Like who cares? that's true. But I, I'm, I think Gloss is going to be defending. Then you kill one city and win the game. Yeah, yeah true. Yeah, because you're song high. You get like 500 gold. Dude, he's getting away with it. He keeps getting away with it. He did go explo. Oh my god, it's happening. No, I, <laughs> yeah. I think like... I think it's correct, yeah. I I kind of got talked into it from the fact that there's no coastal, right? Like, late game, he's going to be, like, isolated in this really nice corner, and he'll be able to project force across the water everywhere, and nobody else will be able to. And he's got this um these temples for culture. There's a decent chance, knowing Glossin, he tries to take choral music here. No, Glossin, Glossin and Miyoto would have same turned. I think... 
Uh, Mir probably. Yeah, I think they same turn. If Mir to build it in cap. My point is though, Glosson even queuing it at all is crazy. Is Arv going Knight Expo? We saw him make a huge amount of gold, and we thought he was going to go Expo, and then he went Civil. You're saying he's going Knight Expo, Abraxas? I'm pretty sure he could have just killed Barkus at Expo with 800 gold. Oh, he's going Guilds now. Oh, he's going to Miyota. Dude, he doesn't know how much Miyota has. 99% of war of Miyota attackers stop just one turn before they break Miyota's front line. No, nah, but like, come on. I, mean, I think Miyota is actually more prepped than Barkus. I think so there's, too. I'm, there's a combat bonus, the ridiculous two combat bonus, and there's Liberty Hammers, but I don't know. Now, you know what would be the most Barkus thing ever? Teaming. To team and then ruin his game by trying to kill Arvids. <laughs> You're just a hater, right? I, I understand this going from me. <laughs> like, oh, oh, yeah, let's unmute. Let's unmute. Nothing. Also, why do you offer deals that don't make sense? Because <laughs> I figured there's a chance you might accept them. <laughs> Glosson's such a rat. Arby's literally just said, Glosson, why do you offer deals that make no sense? <laughs> and he's like, because I'm hoping you'll just randomly accept it. <laughs> This guy's in playoffs. I know, right? I, I, the strap probably works. Oh, probably. It works against okay. Hawks. <laughs> I mean, yeah. Dude, last time I played a Weezy with Conrad, so he kept trying. He kept offering me a locks and I was drawing the deal. And then when he finally left it up, it was me giving him a lux, and I went unhappy. We lost that game. <laughs> There you go. I think early scout kill by Arv is genius. Now no way I put units on him. I don't know. Well, he killed the he killed the like, unit. You know what? It's fine. The the, the it unit he killed. Are you talking about the twelve G unit? Yeah, he's talking about the twelve G scout. Yeah, but that was in a CS. Yeah, I I think I'm it's sure just a bit negligent by Miota to not have like a unit in that direction. I mean, but. He's he's pretty prepped, right? I, you don't look at Miota's two lines of units, and I guess it's one thin line more than two lines, but he's prepped. He has units. On what now? I mean, dude, if if you're yeah. Arvis though, like Miota's definitely top mill, right? Is he going for CS? I don't know where he's going. I can't tell, man. Arvius is so for unpredictable to me. I, have a bunch of CSs, I was so. completely convinced he was going to go crossbow. If anyone wants to deny um, a CS This isn't top mill on Miyota. Yeah. Arvius is probably 80 second. <laughs> it's obvious he's coming to kill me. Miyota says, Barkus just said, someone's in guilds. Miota says it's Arvius. He's coming to kill me. Dude, he's Mystic Miota. Mystic Miota. <laughs> yeah, but like he's saying that jokingly, you know? Is he? I don't know what you're talking about. Is he making more units? That would tell me whether or not he's here. Nope, he's greeting wonders. Okay. <laughs> he's going to lose that. Uh... Oh, wait, he's teching into guilt. And he's going to. Yeah. He's gonna go all in on crossbows because yeah. Miota doesn't think knights are real units. Um, oh, he's not taking into guilds. He's still taking education. He's building that sweet, sweet archery. I love guilds for. Yeah. Yeah. 
pretty good. Yeah, no, he's not taking off education, he's not building units, so if Arv shows up, Mioto will die. Wait, did it? No, I just have the same turn to crew. I mean, if you leave it at 9 pop... I'm surprised Arv's, like, attack. Arv's money is insane. Do you want that religion? Arv honestly has done a great I've job in all of these games to <laughs> always have a lot of money. How much can I buy a missionary off of you? Part of it's Canada, minutes? right? But... Um... Yeah, yeah, I mean, is, his GPT right now is not even that good. It's like 27, yeah, so. so it's fine. I mean, if he builds a brewery... Don't give it to him. He's already leading the game. Come on. This was something Kara yeah, was saying, like, turn zero was that... Our strengths... Oh, yeah. Our is actually all really good at making money. Yeah, because he ruins his sim to make money. <laughs> most people, most people like, to put, like... Like, if you look at, like, any of our games or whatever, like, our GPT is usually, like, the last thing we care about. That's why I'm... Reasoning with you. I mean, yeah, our, our, our makes a lot of attacks work that I would never be able to make work. I think he's just prioritizing. A lot of it is prioritizing very different things. I think it's a bad idea. I think he, he thinks, like, the way our play Civ is it's a war game that he, like, has to sim in sometimes. Yeah. Probably just have my own religion, honestly. And he's got a pretty coherent play style. No, Kel, that's not, that's not what I'm talking about. Like... I'm saying, like, he, he'll no, pick no, piety no, and go Vaharas, like, like consistently. That much? That's I, just, that's, like, uh, only him course, course. that does that kind of thing. No, I just, uh, that's actually what... Dude, does. Knight Expo on this flat terrain to Miyota is actually going to wreck. That's why he said this thing that he said. The problem is, it's hard, it's it's a what long are... reinforcement time. <laughs> a missionary for Confucius. Yeah. <laughs> you ever, like, planned a city to upgrade it? If it was late game, yeah. No, Arv doesn't get slammed because it's well yeah, known that he's place. unkillable. But I saw Pagoda's just gone and I was just like... Anybody who has ever there. tried to attack Arvius knows that for... It's just generally You have to be to so far through. ahead of him to so kill him. In like, yeah. In general. There was that game with, I think, you... They, there was you, Ryan. There was Gao, Arvius, oh and Barkus. And who was it? Like, it? Toasty, Toasty and Joe Black. <laughs> yeah. Where uh, our, where Gao on Liberty pushes I into in Arvius on this super, I, like, I, piety I, game, yeah. right? And it just doesn't work. He just gets yeah. the... He, Gao actually got the shit kicked out of him. Yeah. Nice Huey, too. Six tile. One oh yeah, Miota can't line up shots behind his cap at all. It's really bad. Thank you, thank you. There's also like no good recap angle there. You're just gonna get squeezed against that lake. If you attack bad. into Conrad, there's a hundred percent chance of ear. No, because if you attack him with calves when he's got comps, I think you're fine. Uh Miota's teched off education. I think he's like he's at least semi aware. What makes him aware? Like I don't know. Like, I'm, just... I've been watching his stream. Nothing has changed. He like he's queuing the exact same stuff he was before. He's taking guilds. I know he's that. I, 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 I'm, not, I'm not disagreeing with you. I'm just saying like what what has actually changed that's causing him to do that. Yeah, clearly stream sniping. Somebody go look at the Arvius chat logs. Throwback to when fucking PTS was it? Like oh my god. Typing. Was it a Braxis stream? I think it was. It was a Braxis stream. No, a Braxis oh was doing some embarked attack that like. I, move your move your predicted. sword up, Miota. Please move your All sword right. up. He sees the worker. He I knows what's up. Like that he's coming here, boys. That, that no. That, what's that work? Is that is that worker there to improve a farm? No, but like just <laughs> see it. You know, just you uh, should panic now. He's panicking. He is panicking. <laughs> Any gold in a storm? What's uh? Oh man, he's gonna lose happiness when this you? when oh, our yeah, war decks him. That's really bad. Yeah. Well, no, he's, he's got two calls, and, but he's growing. Yeah, he he, he can get. You know, I, I, Miota's the type of bitch to fucking get everyone to declare war. Like yeah, yeah, you can. I you, gotta, he, you, you gotta already unmute. know you that's just gonna unmute. fucking happen. You gotta unmute, right? <laughs> I am. I, I um I don't really want to buy the work for three gold. No. A lot of gold, RVS. Well, this is an artisan of his craft. 
I don't think Arvius really went <laughs> Arvius is like just lying right now. He's like, oh, I'm not coming. This is just a convincing argument. I'm just not a worker. Is he just scouting? Yeah, I'm just scouting, dog. I'm just scouting. Yeah, don't worry. Oh, wow. Come on, build some more units, Miyota, please. Oh, God. That's exciting. Cobblestone roads. Oh, okay. And Arv on his stream has that fucking stupid grin he has. Yeah. I mean, they are nice, to be fair. I mean, it looks like you're bringing them to Berlin right now as well, so that's pretty good. Like, uh, seems like we've got a... Miota sounds so flustered. No, you can just... Oh, no. He, he needs to... Arvius needs to build the roads to what get more I, workers to sell I, to Miota. The plan. <laughs> okay, does Miota take honor here? He has to, right? Yeah, he has to. This is probably GG I, for Miota. I, I, like, I mean, his it, game is effectively over, yeah. Yeah. Dude, I mean, Arvius has come in like Bardak would. Huh? I mean, I'm third in army. I just, uh, I just didn't think you were second. What do you mean by that? Like, slowly. Yeah. I'm just gonna exert dominance. Mm, uh, like, I don't, like Ari is just a really good war player. He like he's always controlling his tiles. He's always like trading well. And this flat terrain is so hard to defend. Yep. The only like good thing for Miata is that there's this semi choke by the Uluru, right? But all these tiles are floodplain. Like, uh, it's so miserable, man. It's not that he's not prepped, it's just that like his units are worse and he doesn't have as many of them. And... You think Miota holds? Zero chance. His science is very good. Um and he could get to he could get to Knight Knights would shit on Arvius, right? I think we can all agree on that. Uh like if the war goes badly or if Arvius wins or like it, from Miota's perspective. Like, yeah. knights would do a great job. Like, the unit. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm... Dude, do you want to be friends? Dude, I was actually playing skirms with knights, and <laughs> it was, really? got really confusing you really fast. Yeah, Arvius is also going knights, yeah. No, I don't... I My perspective on the relative value of the unit knights has gone down a lot. Um, Just not free, right? And the problem is they get pretty shit on by uh by pikes. And pikes are cheap. They come fast. My knights are like a support unit, similar to what Cav are. Okay. Mega is PMing me and claiming that Arvius is going into Barkus and just syntaxing Miota. This is not what it looks like to me. But... Okay, let's let's check Arvius' oh, perspective. It kind of looks like he's putting... I rogue... actually... No, I actually kind of think that he might be right. Because there's no upgrades? Yeah. He's just going for the maximum freakout? But... Unlucky for you. I don't know, man. He wouldn't. There's no reason he'd be doing comps here. The problem is, like, you, there's actually only one no way out for Miota, right? Yeah, and no matter what happens, though, Arvius is going to get probably teamed. Right? Like the yeah. Intention. Well, could he he didn't have if to get teamed if he didn't force out. Miota into uh, this. Into... Yeah. I'm sure it will, but I, just in case. I don't know. I'm not into the, it. Uh, I am not into Like, Barkus will be the first person to jump on Arvius. Like, yep. knowing Barkus. Let's check Barkus' perspective, actually. Just Barkus has really got quick. nothing. Are you saying yeah, that you can buy really his Bar Barkus, like, I think Arvius, if he just walked no, into Barkus with crossbow, gone. right? I would just um, with his maybe 800 to, gold, um, uh, then he could have just know, like been I'm strong like, enough, I, I, and he would have like cleared the flank, I don't right? Have any role play in me right now. I'm pretty uh, sure Arv is gonna get the shit teamed out of him. Just you know, because especially like the real thing he did, I don't know if he's aware he did this. Is he forced Miota into honor over commerce, right? Oh my god. So 
to, in order to advance this position, Miota has to fight, right? And he can't fight Knight, Knight's Dawn because Knight's Dawn has this, like, defensive Sioux land. And also because Knight's Dawn is giving him units. Yeah, I think I think Arvius is going to get to Which is just so fucking good for 12G and Glosson. Yep. I mean, dude, Glosson gets to sit in his corner... Keep clicking wonders. Yeah. He continues to make his game better with every turn. Everyone else is building units, right? Glosson is building sims. It's such a good setup for him. So, um, what are you asking? Glo uh, Barkus is building barracks now. I'm not asking now. anything. I'm not asking anything. I'm just, like, okay. prematurely asking if this war doesn't seem to be going so well, if you will be, like, you know, if I should save my breath or not, basically. So this is like, what are your intentions for my daughter, sort of thing. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, that's so funny. Miota's like, your intentions for my oh my god. <laughs> you know, I'm gonna make sure that What's going on? Oh my god. Okay, Glo Miota's just like rambling, and he and he's like not asking Arvius anything specific, nice. but he's just like asking him like, you know, if this happens, like, you know, are you gonna stop type of thing. Right. Arvius goes, so this is more of a, what are your intentions for my daughter type question? <laughs> That's so funny. Oh my God. That was so good. Uh, just in case anybody is interested in having okay, I'm going to offer you a declaration of friendship. I want everyone to check my gold before, right? 97. Right. How much military has Miata built? I mean, there's also. Oh, okay. He's he's de he's decking on Miota. He didn't accept. God. <laughs> what? Well, I don't want to send you money. <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> Glasson just asked Miota for one gold. I'm trying to win. <laughs> What's winning? I don't know what winning is. Okay, I'm is this just real war? Gold. I I can't tell. Why wouldn't he upgrade? I mean, he's upgrading, right? What's he upgrading? Yeah. What is he upgrading, Ashwin? I I don't know, man. I'm, <laughs> like, I'm trying to figure it out. I have What's your eyes not believe? got worms in my head. I don't understand <laughs> so my any of this interaction. This whole time. <laughs> oh my Classic. god, you can't be serious. That's got big Glosson energy, I gotta say. The classic era for me. I fucking... <laughs> I mean, like, if I'm Yoda, I'm obviously panicking, but I'm not panicking oh, so no. much, you know? Like, I'm watching his gold, and it's not changing. That's true. But Miota is literally getting shot at, right? By a comp. We know he has crossbows. Yeah. Or we know um, he should have crossbows Wait, by now. How many natural wonders are there? Like, is the whole commitment here just, like, a Miota. an attempt to trick Barkus? Like, exactly. It's turn 74. He's shooting with comps and fucking... Yeah. What do you imagine but that's what I'm saying. Like, he's still got the comps. It's not like he has Lawyers shot with the comps and then upgraded the crossbows somewhere else. Oh. Right? Well, he's not actually obtained relative advantage of, uh, here. Crosses. It's still turn 75, and nice. he doesn't have any knights, and he doesn't have any crossbows. You like Pope. You seem to be a very warlike Pope overall, I yeah. would say. You think that'd be a, a good, an accurate... Imagination. Like Arvius is mind gaming the fuck out of this. I don't know what he's doing, but it's stupid. Like, think about it. All he's been doing this whole time is getting Miota to flip out, Glossin to say, I'm going to help whoever is yeah, the real getting winner, hit. The real winner of this whole interaction is like Glossin 12G. Yeah. All he's doing is getting everyone around him to panic, and then he's going to attack into someone while simultaneously getting teamed. Like, if he just did a swift attack, I don't think he would have gotten as, like, it wouldn't have been as likely for him to get teamed because it would have just been a clean kill. Does that make sense? Like, if, if, if he shows up with, like, a thousand gold of crossbows on turn 67... Or whatever it should have been, right? Kind of a lot. But this is after he um, Barkus just dies, and then Barkus just game. dies, and then they Miota's not in a position I, I to even help. But now they both are. 
I'm just I'm glad we're on the same page. Twelve G eats yeah, Glossin no matter what. Still I don't know. Jesus. If if Arvius were center map and he could guarantee that Yeah, you know, exactly he that's the difference. Exactly. Everyone on the map. But people like Nightstone and Twelve G and Glossin have picked up so much advantage from Arvius's play. The Pope is pleased with your and fighting. it only made his it only has made his attack harder, right? Like, I don't Everyone's think Barkus is conceited enough to think, oh yeah, there's no way he ever attacks me. Like, he wouldn't think that. Um, if you look at the stream, yeah, let's check Barkus's side. Hacking education, no units in queue. And he's built barracks in every city though, and he tech deals. Yeah. Like but yeah, I don't understand what the like. He's also Arvius has made his own steal chances worse. I'm just I'm so not into the play. That's another good point. Yeah. Oh, this... man. Ow. Yeah, I feel ya. Sure about this obvious i think he's going for barkus sure I'm yeah sure he's upgrading that. on next to barkus now you know what i mean okay we're confirmed it's barkus is he piecing uh, out miota or no. you know with miota look i'll be honest this was all did he team himself i was talking to you no you know what it's i think it it's might just be that he I knows miota is like opportunistic on. enough to so just oh he is piecing out it miota I'm going to SimCity police you, and hopefully Bark is... What is Miyota going to do with all these units? Yeah, it was a very good play. It wasn't a good play. Bark is to make things. Well, we have some things. Let's see if uh, he's doomed. <laughs> Bark, I mean, he's dead now. If Miyota doesn't, like, help... Uh, Miyota pieced him out. Miyota's done. Like, I unless, like, Miyota's about to attack Arvius, Miyota is, like, not fighting. I figured if I went dead so, first, which I'll but I don't think Farkas is any like, more dead like, than he I would have been. <laughs> exactly. That's that's ultimately what it was. And he what still doesn't have education, and he's not going to tech education. There's no, there's no like um, the sim tax yeah. is true, die? but he sim taxed himself I mean, too. The who like it's not like his, he he can't steal unis much. here. That's true. I yeah. So God knows that's when he's going to get them. I I just I hate it. I hate it. The worst part about all of this is Arvius chatters are going to be like, this was Giga Brain. Mm -hmm. Arvius is a fucking god. Dude, people god. in your chatter being, this is Giga Brain. I can send you the same deal I sent. Uh, Any living, breathing human beings in this lobby? Oh, uh, yeah. Nope. Glossin, definitely. Nope. Glossin, 77. Oh, fuck. One of the best. 12G, I assume, doesn't have it. Some very smart people are saying that, by the way. What a knight. Or a knight. Is knights... Unis? Knights was slower. Knights was doesn't... I think deal. I just got Theo. Huge deal. No, no, no. He, he's... he's no, he's been there. Yeah, he, oh, he has? He, uh, he, yes, okay. Knights is a living, breathing oh, unit. Like Congratulations. Well, I was going to be in unis. Yeah, I agree. I do think this play is great. Dude, it's, it's not. Beautiful. Okay, now you have to redeclare on Miota. <laughs> I think 12G is at unis, actually. Uh, what are you talking about? No, it's not. Because look, look how much hammers he has into some of the unis. Yeah, like, they're almost halfway done in a lot of cases. Maybe he overflowed hard. Wait, is Barkus going? Is Barkus actually building unis and not you? Dude, I can't. Especially because okay, no, no, Barkus doesn't have. Yeah, Barkus is finishing Terra, but, so. Heard that helps things. I mean, Barkus is just dead. It, there's no surviving here. Wow, my gold per turn suddenly became not dog shit. Nice. Well, yeah, let's let's watch Barkus. Three city connections kind of helps. <laughs> yeah. It, it is I don't think Miota is top contender. Uh, Miota was quite weak. Was, like Miota is actually weak. The the people who are like dangerous here are on the other side of the map from Arvius. Yeah. All this did, guys, is make his initial attack a lot slower and open the possibility of him getting teamed a lot more. What happened is not relevant. Fuck you, Hoy.
<laughs> I don't think Arvius cares if he helps the rest of the lobby. He made his neighbor weaker and is far less. No, he's likely more likely to get teamed. Team. No, because he's more Yoda likely to has team. more like, units like, now, no. and he's honor. Like, can you not like, I, I legitimately, God. I can't tell when people. Everyone's are like trolling, like, and it's yeah. like the the I problem know, is a lot of people are trolling, are, but, no, but most I, people uh, don't realize that they are. I am Ugh, fine on that front. I'm just. Uh... Oh my God! Why are you finishing this ampy Barkus? I can't. No, it's a lot of overflow. <laughs> not paying attention. It's effectively true. But no, I am. Uh, I'm chilling. Yeah. He's so dead. Like. Dude, Barkus actually does this a lot, which is when he's getting attacked. Let the results go. speak, Gigabrain. <laughs> uh, like, Barkus, whenever he's getting attacked, he'll just completely all in melee units, right? And he has zero kill power. This has been a problem for him since, like. You mad, bro? No. I don't care. Also, Aro doesn't have the happy for this anyway. I mean, uh, he's on it. Like, it's fine. It'll work out. As well. <laughs> you can always make it work on honor. I mean, like, he's getting his religion anyway. He's His happy is fine. Yeah, right now, Barkus is just going to get farmed by crossbows. Oh, yeah, that's going to be so much culture, actually. Did you see the deal I sent to. He just needs to. He doesn't have a single rage unit in queue anywhere. I'm going to send you the he's same. He's just playing deal delay right here. now. Dude, he if always I'm, does this. If I'm Barkus, I'm like Wait, trying to get Miota. Like, bro, like you, we can kill him. Right, like easily. I like I don't know what Miota's gonna do here. Miota, because he has honor now, right? What the fuck and he's got a awesome, lot man. of units. Gossam's just vibing. No. He just off. He just asked for one gold, again. Yo, you just saw that again. Yeah, one turn on every wonder this game, huh? Are you building either of those? Which one? Glosson got both Aya. Huey and Aya. Are you kidding? I mean, <laughs> Boro and Aya? Dude. No, no. It was, no, it was, it was 12G that got Hagia. Yeah. Okay, uh, okay, okay, okay. But I don't know if Glosson really needs it, given that he's uh, got his religion and he's going to build all his temples. Yeah. Glosson, this needs to... I mean, dude, Glosson... Yeah, this... I'm getting it. Somebody's going to deal with Glosson, I assume. And it has to be 12G, but it's gonna yeah, be, he might get there, He's going to get teamed. Yeah, he's going yeah, to get teamed. Yeah. No, this is the problem when you go eight cities. Can I go left? You know, you want one gold from yeah. And you want to my if your land's too good. I'm just deleting it. You're just showing your hand. Uh, Sometimes your game is just war. too ah, good. Is. And then you die for it. That's, uh, that's how Civ works. Stop queuing bikes, Barkus, please. So, uh, no, I... Ivory. Dude, I was legit trying to talk to him about this, right? And he just... Right. He he just clicks so many melee units. Also, this sword, like, top left of Daywalk, third one, doesn't even do anything. Also know. needs to be an era ahead to not die to 12G. I don't think one era does it. You really think? I, I don't know. Maybe I hold Gloss into a, like a higher standard than you guys do. <laughs> no, it's not. It's um, dude, twelve G is actually like. I know he's insane. Yeah, and Glossin's not. <laughs> I think Glossin's good. I I don't think Glossin's strength will find his war clicks. Uh, they're they're not like terrible. Uh, time to check on that other game, huh? Barkus, oh my god, he clicked devoted elite, made himself unhappy, and now he's fighting at combat minus. Oh my god. Yeah, he's dead. He's dead. Miota's unhappy as well. Somehow. Looks like the entire right side of the map has gone into a. Oh, that's right on. It's a smudge zone. I, let's let's go look at 12G. I kind of I I haven't checked in on 12G in a while. I want to see what he's doing. He's just building unis, vibing. Yeah. He's taking one CS. He doesn't appear to really be taking others. A decent gold on our commerce. Pagoda Cathedral Cotel. That's a very weird religion. Because I see that and I think. I mean, it's working. 
He's at 55 fucking faith return. That's true. Kill Burgess. Yeah. Sacred mm. Sites prep. Yeah, Commerce. Yeah, it's, it's, it's a bit weird. Like, he's working. Did you see that? He was working the incense tile? Based. What? I mean, he doesn't. He has so many. He doesn't have tiles. He just has no tiles, yeah. Yeah. Uh, how's his science return? Like, what's science return like? 144 with yeah. one uni. I mean, he's going to cap out here at like 240, probably. I mean, Miyota's doing. Teams. Sorry. Um, what's his name? Arv is doing 114 with like no unis. Yeah, but, yeah, but I think he has. He's got NC and. Uh, I, I doubt 12G's got NC up. Nightstone's doing 175. Well, he built so... a bunch of unis. Knights is going to have the fastest game. Mm -hmm. That's just a given. That's not a dupe, and you can't. What's giving 12G so much faith? Stone and incense. So, so you want me to fight with yeah. Uh, Axum is a pretty Also, he built Aya. Oh, yeah. So, um, he only spawned one prophet so far. And he like he doesn't have to pay to spread the religion either. Like, the bu double building kind of makes sense. Gudwaras, fuck, fucker, he took the. Yeah, he built his national one. epic. Yeah. I don't know how much I like Pagoda, given that he's already out of tile store. Normally, I'm the biggest Pagoda enjoyer. But I mean, what are you gonna? What do you want him to do? Not grow? Yeah. <laughs> okay, never mind. <laughs> End of discussion. <laughs> As 12G, do you go snipe some of Barkus' cities? I mean, you would take Tashkent first. I don't think uh, you do because you just make Arvius really angry. Other than my winning smile, Let's check Arvius' perspective. I have my winning smile. I mean, that counts, right? Um, it's teching unis. Okay. Gonna hit him 81. Honestly, not bad considering he has knights and. Uh... Dude, he's not gonna steal anything off of Barkus. Yeah, like not a single so tech. So quickly, it's turn seventy nine. Yeah, but yeah. everyone enhanced like all at once. It's really sad. All the good beliefs went. I think a lot of the game hinges on what's Miota gonna do and what's Twelve G gonna do. Center map players. We have all the good. And beliefs. I think Miota... I think Miota's just gonna sit. No, on honor. Yeah. He has no gold, I guess. He can't push anyone. No. Going into fast. Maybe he fixes his gold in time for already? Maybe. His regional is truffles, so I, mean, I don't know. Okay. It looks Barkus like Bark perspective. Let's check real quick. He's dead. I mean, he's been dead. Like swapping through tiles that aren't rotated. He just finished crossbows. He's still unhappy. He's unhappy and he doesn't have any ranged units. The reality is, I think if this wasn't Barkus and if it wasn't, like, let's say Arbius was in Barkus's position. Oh, yeah. I mean, Arbius would never die in Barkus's position. Right? Like, I think, <laughs> it, I think it's salvageable if, if he plays it perfectly. <laughs> it, it's I don't know. Idea. Like, he's literally, he has no kill power, right? So. He, he just lets Arv take tiles, and Arv doesn't lose anything. What? Well, what Barkus could have done potentially is give up that initial buffer city. Would that have been good though? Like I don't know. Um, if you get like the catapult ring set up and you start trading efficiently on recap. The thing is, Miura stayed unit just now, right? And I didn't. Dude, if I'm Barkus, I'm like trying to convince Miota to help me. You know, I'm, he got what two crossbows queued? Can't give that city up; it's too open. I guess. Yeah. Yeah. Now, like you're you're trying to slam with pikes because you don't have any kill power. Uh, Miota would never help Barkus. I th think it's in his best interest to help Barkus. Let's say a situation yeah. where let's let's see let's check Miota's game real quick. Miota is building unis or he's building circus max. 
uh, has unis up in every city. No. Let's say this war goes on for five more turns. What's Miyota going to be building? Nothing. Really did. And if he can find, if he can like realize, if he can see like, and he's honor, and he can like say to Barkus like, yeah, like dude, I have nothing better to be building, and I can keep you in the game and destroy my most dangerous threat in my no, head. No, his most dangerous threat is knights, right? Knights done. Not in his head. Okay. He 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 genuinely thinks Arcus is like the best player. Or like best war player. I, uh, he I probably is the best war player. Uh, I don't know. Maybe like Connor. Yeah, yeah. No happiness map. That's what we always say in the weavies, right? You're on the same pop as I am, and I'm on one more city. Yeah, I don't think Miyota just doesn't like, feel like he wants to do anything. He has no happy, right? He, he doesn't have. Uh, you don't have enough cargos. He doesn't have culture. And some fuck He's just got really ass, stuck right? here. Ah, yeah, that. What is it, Alex? Troubadours. I wanted that. What? How did Miyota generate first engineer out of city without an engineer point? Uh, it's turn 81. Yeah, but he has Mosque. Great Mosque. I just assumed that would come faster. Maybe. Uh, I, don't know, I don't know if he was working it full time. Mm. I doubt it. Boston got a Conquistador from somewhere, and he's just parking it on his border with Knight's Dawn. Since building Machu and Angkor. Arbius is farming promos for free here, dot dot dot. It's true. Yeah. yeah. Um Yeah. Though I, I think promotions are kinda overrated. Um Charge is a good promo. On uh, on nights, sure, but yeah. Like crossbow promos are like pretty. Like charge is great, but if you're auto, you get it anyway. So when is it good to have that? When's um, the advantage? Like for when you're war? going like straight arty. Yeah. yeah. So it's only good to defend Kaz. I dude, but, if if I saw Barkus click devoted elite and then be like, hey guys, can I have some happy? <laughs> I'm not giving him that shit. Look at him, he's three rows deep of pikes and he has no kill power. Like half these pikes are AFK. Yep. Like the greatest enemy of of knights as a timing is the combination of pike and crossbow. <clears throat> he's still Sue. Sue's annoying to deal with. Obviously, I think it's very favorable for Arvius, but it's not impossible. Now, Arvius is just sitting behind this. <laughs> Dude, Ogula like. took two catapult shots this turn. And it's not dying. Yeah, it's got great wall and a wall. Buffalo hunters are good. Well, it's crossbow time, so. I do not need the he didn't pull a single buffalo. Yeah, it's fucked up. You can only Korea. I've thought Korea was wrong about holding many times, and he's been right every single time. So. Korea, what's your actual I like? What's your actual opinion? Like, no meme. We just sure. fight each other. I don't think we should fight each other. No, I think uh, you should. Uh, actually, I think you should. Trying to get Korea to be serious is hard. The pikes were a good idea. He has no gold to upgrade comps. Now he's setting expos. He's lost. He loses two city and holds. There it is, folks. You That's the official That's Korea. That's the official Sim Korea opinion. <laughs> <laughs> Terracotta and Barkus. Yeah, Barkus already built it. Yeah, I think that was an engineer. 
I'm pretty sure it was Lib Engineer. Yeah. This um this choke north of No, it wasn't Lib Engineer. Cat. It was uh it was uh Pyramids. Great engineer. Wall generated engineer. Oh, it could be Great Wall or it could have been Pyramids. Yeah. He dies to cannon musket. Yeah, I mean the the choke in front of Barkas's cap is like pretty well manned at this point. Sexy's gonna lose Machu. It's a good wonder. Yo, Barkas. It is a good wonder. If he's gonna lose the stage, he's gonna be happy though. That's like twenty percent combat bonus on the table. That I can do. I don't really care. Twenty percent. What? Yeah. He's minus ten. What? Oh, he's minus six. He was minus ten. Okay. Still, that's fucking crazy. Yeah. He needs to get a lux. I... But he's gonna lose Ugagala, whatever it's called. And yeah, it's fine. Losing his Great Wall City is not gonna be great. Dude, what? I I thought I, he built I it would... in cap. What? Yeah, he built oh, yeah, it in he cap. Built it in cap. Yeah, yeah, cap. you're right. Oh wait, so that's an expand that that Wall City. Okay. Okay. Yeah, it means on hill. I, I on hill, great. this is what I was saying. The counter to the impies are a great wall. 33 mm -hmm. combat strength, no joke. It's, it's not bad. You should ask someone else for happiness. I am not going I to go happiness. on happiness. Miota's Dawson looking at demos 100. and he's getting smoked. It's I really bad. Out of the kindness of my heart and the fact that I, there was no one else I could send it to, and also that I couldn't it for anything. <laughs> you know, Sounds like you're a very nice guy, Glossen. Yeah, yeah it, was, nice. uh, it was a very kind thing to do, huh? Are those sports uh, even done? Why is he going physics? Well, Barkas doesn't appreciate you, I think. Uh, I don't know. Gold. I'm trying to do the thing that's in... You go for, with, like, uh, the duet, cycling knights here, right? One, what? Uh, in two you would be teching into knights here, right? The yeah, 100%. First train to cycle on your own roads? Dude. Yeah. Biggest combat bonuses are identified on melee units. If you have knights that are Sioux combat bonus versus with and like that's when you notice it the most. Does he have longsword tech? If he has longsword tech, this is musket's path. Who Barkus? Yeah. Uh, no, he doesn't. Look at the hardwood. Uh. Huh. Arvius has longswords. Will he get tech steals here, Trebs? Uh, hey, it seems like he can give out that free luck now. I mean, it doesn't look like it. He's going to take the city well, this turn, know. so he's not going to get any tech steals at all. It seem that way. This is what we were saying. Sometimes this is the whole point of what we were saying. When you guys were like, <coughs> to Arvius. <laughs> oh, man. Dude, Arvius is a genius. Arvius is uh, the greatest Sith player of all time. Put that in a big... Oh, God. Mega's going to clip that. <laughs> He's gonna put that on the soundboard. I know. God, I have. The... I know. I know. My cities have yeah. any food, bro. At least you have a swords religion. Nope, I have a what is this? religion. <laughs> Choking on the goat D. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> You're so stupid. You know, I still think Barkus is dead, but I thought he was going to be a lot more dead than he currently is. What is this manufactory plant? I applaud your... Hmm. Honesty? Yeah. And I don't mean that in, like, a sarcastic sense. I mean that it's... No, no, definitely. Very nice. I'm just speaking in a monotone voice because I'm checked out of this game. It checked out of this game. Oh, Barkus didn't no, get no, Machu. No, he was trying to hard build it, and then he tech he stopped it. That would make you sense. Know who's why getting he has Machu? Five GPT. Is it Glossen? I sent you it's one. Glossen. Good enough. Like Glossen is actually the biggest winner of this whole interaction. Which also, makes him the ultimate loser when he gets teamed. Twelve G's playing for uh playing for Sistine here. Like Twelve G's not going already. Well, it makes sense. He's going commerce. Yeah. 
Yo, double team format, someone sims and then someone that subs in for war. Somehow I don't think this is a cool concept. But like 6% combat bonus are going to make the difference in this war. Isn't that essentially what Weavey is? Shut the fuck up. <laughs> what? <laughs> it's totally not. Uh... What, what are you talking about? That's exactly what Weavey is. No, honor player sim like determines a lot of your unit production, right? I mean, honor sim is just real. Uh... Okay, keep coping. No, what? <laughs> you can definitely tell the difference in your game between having like a good sim honor player versus a weak sim oh, honor yeah, player. Yeah, I'm just Big kidding. Games. Yep. LG lost team for Notra. Rip. Honestly, Dude. I feel like honor sim almost is more indicative of a good game than the yeah. liberty sim. If because yeah. like usually the My liberty character. sims are very similar. I mean, honor also just makes About more decisions thing. generally, right? There's a lot more ways to fuck up your game as honor because the build cues are hard to get through and you're like generally whatever. I don't know why am I talking about weavy. Um, recent time. Did Arvius not take the city? Maybe you should. Um. Nope. The crash. All right, now that nothing important is going on screen, I can talk about Weavy, which is the other thing is Honor is responsible for like all your engineer point, like so much of your goal generation. And when your Honor player is having a good game, they're ready for calves. It's, I don't know. It's massive. I think like Piety Sim doesn't matter at all. Honor Sim matters a lot and Liberty Sim matters a lot. No problem. You should mm -hmm. go back. Why is he complaining about happy? He's losing two cities very soon. He'll be happy again. Is Barkus smudging? Hey, Can I mark that off the good. bingo? Oh, shit. My hot joining? Or do you need to reload? I didn't know I was uh, no, allowed we, we, we can go. I didn't know I wasn't allowed I'm to not going to do any more moves. I'm just going to assume he's smudging. I'm, I'm going to I'm gonna trust in Barkus. I don't think he's smudging. God damn it. I'm listening. He's not He's not that well, You never know yeah, if... Yeah, still hot ones and... yeah, you never know like who can actually move and who can't, right? Yeah, that's true. Can you save first on the thing? Okay, that's a catapult. Okay, am I good to hotwine? Yeah. I yeah. believe you are. Does Arvius have it any this. unis up? I don't think I can do much more convincing, but... Uh, yeah, yeah, I think he built one cap. Yeah, feel free to send me a piece of that. I'm really excited about... You know, you, you got your check. You got so what, theology or something? Hmm. Not sure that might necessarily be the case, but if you ever think you might not kill me, then. Okay, so. Marcus, you should know that I, I can't be. Uh, I love this yeah. chat. I can give you all the, the good reasons okay. for why this. So, uh, Glosson is excellent too. He's got synagogues, which I think is kind of a weird yeah. pick. 50 damage per turn is nothing compared to, to exactly building a legend. Okay. Healthy diet I, killing? What? I gave up the project. Sounds legit. This game is a light snack for the coat anyway. <laughs> Gar, did you stop your qualifier games when you realized you couldn't meow at people in whispers? Ooh, true. Alright, time to take. Is it take team time? That's one. Alright, is he going to take the other one? Dude, look at that. He actually... Only, did he gain happy on that city take? That's a big deal. You haven't even killed a single unit. I'm just murdering you. And now he takes Oglala. <laughs> really, you take Oglala with the expo in it, right? That's, like, yeah, that's very, very nice way to put it. <laughs> I don't really understand. Don't Whatever. I don't... Like, what, what was I supposed to do with Pike's two crosses? I just have to hope that um, I cross it with myself. But... Yeah, I, I, I expect him to take it now. Yeah, you're doing. And then Bark is just, just gonna get very out hammered. Just... He's gonna trade fine you though, know, right? With like these Pikes forts. Before. Uh, uh, Arv is just gonna sweep around the sides of the mountains and then plank him hard, and then it's fine. Eventually, With two units. Eventually, I'm mm. going to get. No, no, I mean, like, cause he doesn't have to be this back build okay. on the front, right? So he he's not, he's not, he's not roading there. Oh, you mean on the left side? Yeah, yeah, on the left side. Okay, my bad. They move very slowly. They eat very slowly. You're the clam right now. 
Why that's is Guardius calling Barkus a clam? Do the, do the clams ever accept know. their fate? Uh, clown recognized clam, probably. <laughs> so oh, I don't know what you can move. After, after oh. this is done. Damn, I would hate to be a crab. That sounds awful. I'm gonna. We're, we're gonna be able to properly assess. You know what? The worst crab to be the, would be like uh, one of those that can't even. like The effects of our resist play. Put it that way. Oh, fucking hermit crabs? Yeah, imagine like imagine. So who who who, who do you think is strongest right now? Who do you think? Glosson, but he's just gonna get teamed. Nice. Okay. Yeah. So it's not after even that, close. Like... So uh, wait, let's look at knights. We haven't looked at knights. Like in the in the of the map. Knights of science looks <laughs> good. <laughs> I mean, this is gonna be oh, even better when he gets to. Like I mean, when he gets to schools, to right? Because I'm surprised he's not. Did he? So, I guess he takes steel, and that's why his renaissance is late. Renaissance is pretty late. I'm down to be freedom buddies. Yeah, he did text you. Yeah. I mean, his hammer should be Definitely insane good. here. So apparently, hermit crabs they. TBH, he's wearing, wearing kind of thin here now. We will now, need to pump no more units. We are not Arbius. We are not any of these they people. They just use those for their shell. Sometimes. Nice that seems like an nice. ecological disaster. Why? Knights, put you on your streamer panel. Wait, Mega, you're you're. I'm sure, like. Is, is your profile really pick an Arby's reference? Really, uh, like difficult to eat for like a bigger crab or whatever eats a hermit crab. Well, the issue is it breaks down. Right? Dude, Knights does not look like he's doing anything. Nice no, hammer, so good. He's spamming caravan trees. No, it's not that his hammers are good. It's that he like just didn't tech print it. Yeah, so like hammers good, tech bad. This is actually. This is such a Hawks thing to say, you know, Glosson, but Hawks thinks have, you shouldn't go shot yeah, source in Iroquois because you're going to run out of stuff to build. I'm not going to pretend like I can't get new, new, new whispers because I remember um, a pretty high number of gold. I wrote he, not we, dude, come on. And mm, yeah. going to buy yeah. labs for you. you are, uh, oh, I'm so stupid. I'm sorry. Yeah. I'm I sorry, no, Rasta. No, no, my bad. Kind of <laughs> my bad. No, I'm just I'm so used sorry, to reading no, fucking no, we. I'm very sorry we assumed that you were a massive Arby's fan who types in every chat what Arby's should do. <laughs> Thank you. Very um, yeah, I mean, like, Nightstone could just build units with all those hammers, but yeah, his tech is too slow for all the hammers he has. Is there a reason he's not queuing an artist? Not in a, this is so nice way, but in a, like, I kind of... An artist like, guild, or? No, like, he's just not working in slots. Oh, I don't know, man. That's weird. What the fuck does Miota do here now? Nothing. I, I thought he was supposed to attack Arv, honestly, because... He needed to. Like, I, he, they should have just teamed Arvius. Arvius made it so easy to get to get himself teamed. Miota's going to head to Artillery, I think. I think that's that's what his plan is. Who says we're disguised, Kel? I just, you know... <laughs> I promised myself that I wouldn't... We are, like, the most biased casters ever. What? Yeah. I am actively rooting, rooting for knights and Glossom. Yeah. I mean, Miota can't just, like, sit there and wait for an opening, right? Because he's too central. If if Arb gets this kill and then Arb flips all these cities, Miota's going to not be strong enough to do anything. It's it's a really rough... Uh, it's a rough spot for Miota. Should join TeamSpeak to fanboy twelve G and Arvius. You you can join TeamSpeak, yeah, Mega. We're definitely well, you're definitely a lot of join. Right twelve so G wins. Uh, I mean, I I like twelve G a lot. Twelve G's position a lot. Picking commerce is really good scaling. You're sh you're strong, but you're not um like the strongest. I'm worried about his culture. Well, that's why he went Sistine. I don't think if he got Sistine, then his culture is even worse. Oh, okay. He's getting it next turn. Okay, yeah, he, yeah, it's probably good. Told you he's the best player in this lobby skill wise, isn't it, Miota? I feel like it's Miota. I think Told you is really good though. Like, I, I kind of when when the game was starting, I was kind of thinking actually like Miota is going to be like the strongest and he's going to get teamed and then Told going to win. That was how I thought it was going to play out. Twelve G is the best. Also, By like, far? Twelve, okay, 12 does all crazy. this shit without playing a lot of Lek. Like, Miota is, a, like, a hardcore Lek player, and... Do you think there literally... needs to be some balance changes to Honor? Uh, what what balance changes, Gal? I, I feel like... 
No. I think honor just puts you in a position where you're able to do a lot of different things and you scale really well. So if the you design have... of Lek is such that it wants to encourage like player interaction, which means war at every stage of the game, right? That's one of the goals for Lek. And there's a tree in Lek which is designed to profit from war. It is very, very difficult to reconcile these things. I mean, I, I, I remember in uh, what was the there was in the third tournament or in the second one where Achilles won uh -huh. me Achilles and Sierra all went on her and then Yoda and Gal went lib and then Hoy yep. went piety yep it's very similar to this <laughs> Hmm. Yeah, Knights is actually just run out of run out of stuff to build. I mean, it's also telling that honor is a tree which is constantly getting nerfed, right? And yet remains consistently strong. So let's go back to watching Varkas. I'm really surprised. Uh, he's starting to look a lot thinner. Now, uh, now he's suddenly got crossbows, and now he's his front line's thin. One of these days, I'll be able to get yeah, he's dead. Today. Look at him swap. Anyone seen citrus? Anyone seen ivory or rubber? Yeah, I, I'm getting ivory from Salty right now. I think Miyota will play Artie into, uh, I mean, into Arvius. It might be into Nightstone, but I, I do think Miyota's gonna play for Artie. I guess he might go for. I don't know. You don't know. I don't know if shit. <laughs> you know, if I if I really knew, I'd be playing this game instead of talking shit about people who can't play. That's the. That's the Korea that's take. Truth. Yeah. Okay, Miyota's queuing banking. Miyota's gold is shit. Did I leave it unsettled? That unit maintenance. How thin is Arv? I think both Ashwin and I are are very happy we're not playing this game. Arv is not that thin. No. <clears throat> Honor piety. I don't think this game ends too, right? You, you just need a huge teaming dynamic for a really late game. And I don't think these guys are... Glossin's too isolated, so Glossin has to die to uh, really get into one of those late game fiestas. Yep, I agree. I, I, hmm. Glossin is playing for a lot more hammers than culture. Wonder what he's gonna use that for. R knights and twelve G triangle. I can see. I can see it. that. So, Arvius got that fort pillage. Like this is, I love knight crossbow attacks. They're so good, right? There's so much kill power, and then you get to like advance. It's, it's a timing that is really punishing to do in a free for all because it's hard to steal techs, right? 
you're you're not getting as much as if you're like doing your straight crossbow rush or even your workshop crossbow rush, but it's so good at killing people. I loved watching Skirm Tourney and people were just like, you know, playing play for expos and then play for knights. It was really fun watch. That was the best part. I think like when this type of attack is is viable, is yeah. when the game is really, really entertaining. Yep. And then things kind of stall out again at Musket. And then they fucking explode when you hit Artie. Yep. Arvan happy? I guess he's flipping two cities. Yeah, that's normal. Did you see the combat bonus on Barkus's units? There's so there's like fifteen percent from every time Sue. I've every time I've looked, Barkus is winning. Hmm. But I'm often looking when, yeah, you know, they have like very obvious advantages. Like, oh, you're gonna slam that knight into a pike, <laughs> something like that. Yeah, knight slamming into forded pike. Hmm. Hmm, yes. Hmm. He is. Arvis is kind of thinning out. I I think it's more that he's just choosing not to man the choke. As much I think as that's what it is. I I, yeah. I think it's he's just not caring. Yeah. Yeah, and Arv has lost one unit. Mega says, yeah, he's lost one unit. He's definitely not thinning. Sure, but like. You're not stealing any techs. Yeah. I mean, we've been really clear that we just didn't think this was the play. <laughs> yes. Um, that being said, I think Arvis definitely is favored from this position, like in this type of circumstance. But when you compare his game to everyone else's game, even yeah. with Barkus's cities, like he's going to be flipping cities on turn 100, guys. Like, that's not good. Not ideal. Ted, can I borrow that? Bolt? Oh yeah, put the crossbow on the tile that just got killed. Um, I guess if I don't know how much stuff Barkus has left. <laughs> Ashwin believers have been in shambles since like 2022 when I kept uh, trying to comp bow people. Uh, okay, so what we what RVS sees is basically everything Barkus has. There's like one, there's two horses and a pike in the back, and that's pretty much it. And Barkus fixes happiness, so that's something. Ooh, and a unit kill. He's popping off. Oh no, Barkus, are you trying to push out? Thank you for your opinion, Blossom. <laughs> I'm very good at announcing things for the entire map. Okay. Yeah. He's holding, right, he's holding. Skidded, I would say, in this game. Yeah, Barkus yeah. fixes happiness right. by losing 20 pop. It it's true. Mm -hmm. Everyone knows. New, I mean, this is... New meta strat. Yeah. If if Barkus had a large Twitch following, his uh his followers would be in this chat talking about how smart it was that he sacrificed those cities. That's so true. Uh... <laughs> See the thing you have to understand. You don't get his genius. I. He's just getting farmed so bad. Yeah. What? 
it doesn't even matter that like on individual trades Arvius might be losing because he's dealing so much damage that Barkus isn't. What wonder is interesting. I now I mean like look to Korea's point earlier. Should I, I kind of get it. Um how like building comps wouldn't have fixed the problem. Like the, the comps would have gotten shit before, on, so. right? Yeah. So it's not like and he had 0 dollars. That's the bigger issue. Yeah. So it's not like you yes. build comps and you can like do anything. It's like those comps stay as comps and then you're kind of fucked. Said, okay. Two comps are not bad. But that's what you implied. I guess two comp is a real unit on its own. That's fair. That's true. Is his RV switched to sim or is he still building units? I. It's so ear. It's all relative. As everyone who seemingly has an opinion on Civ would say, once you get into the triangle, anyone can win. So if that's Arbius's plan, and this gets him there, like, yeah. who are we to judge? Now, it's certainly a little... Ambitious or a little odd or... What's that? I don't think uh, don't say it. Anyways, right? so, in like, chat. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna okay. say it, but everyone knows what we're thinking. So, update on some of the other players. Nightstone went Himeji into factories. Um, love that. Feel like he's gonna be factories. Maybe I love that. No, I, 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 I love that. Especially as Iroquois, you yeah. only are essentially the only tech you're teching it's just gunpowder is gunpowder but, rather than yeah. steel and gunpowder. Yeah. It is going to delay his factories. It might lose him auto. Um, he should have pretty fast he... factory builds. No, he's not going to lose auto. He was he was first to unis by at least two turns. And 12G, who's the main person that's going to pick auto, is certainly not... Like He, he, he went Sistine. You know? Yeah. Glosson is really pushing Explo. Glosson is Explo 3, which means he's going to be Explo 4. So, Mongolia went ear. Uh, city states, but fought against it. There's a lot of potential for 12G's game. There's a huge amount of potential. His science looks really good. He's improving his position with CS takes. His culture is strong. He's Commerce 3 right now. I think... I think 12G... 12G didn't get... Simtax like Neota did. He got Simtax by having shit land, but I think he's navigated that really well. Yeah, like, we, we can't talk enough about, like... He had a That's really, really good, awful actually. start, very concise. <laughs> yeah. and he kind of just um, powered through it. Like it's really it. impressive. So let's let's consider what does twelve G need to do to win the game? Uh, I mean, step one is deal with Glosson, and you either deal with Glosson by teaming him or by like, he should be able to kill Glosson at plane timing. Given how good his game is and yeah. the general inability for non commerce players to defend planes. Um, and, like, so oh, you, you can assume, like, Arv and well. Barkus, like, whatever's going on there, they're not going to recover for, like, 50 turns or something. Right? Yep. So. No. In 12G's head, this is like a four-player game, so all he needs is he needs Miota and Nightson to fight, and he can kill Glossin, and then he should be able to take out whoever remains, right? Dude, I'm hungry for crab here when you talk all this stuff, actually. Yeah, Barkus, hungry. Barkus is like doomed. His game is over. I could go for some, for some nice crab right now. Barkus is just fighting the long-holding action. 
Arcus on two generals. Arby is holding one. Does Arby get another? The breakfast, the delicious breakfast is the important thing for the start of the day, or something stupid like that. Something stupid like something that. Something stupid like that. <laughs> No. Yeah, I only see one general. Oh, there's two? two. I don't see the other. Dude, I don't, <laughs> don't step like on that tile. So <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, so they're they're like two two each, so they can general fight. Um, User joined your channel. I mean, Barkus is purely just like playing now to help everyone else right like, which is like which is good yeah Dude, why does it feel like everyone's but his shit, game is over like, i thought it was just my yeah, game it's but it's not been over i don't know what happened with me and guac's game so mega what do you think about this I mean, um my land is just not what do you, have, good, what do you think right? about this goat play i got oh one turned on god i can't believe you just said that your land is great i just had some sort of seed or something what, no i think he, he's just had problems with team speak the last yeah. couple times yeah, fuck you, exactly. No, Hulky's supposed to say fuck me. This yeah, hand is Hulky's supposed to say fuck you, exactly. <sighs> Whatever works. <laughs> okay. We don't even have to be in TeamSpeak, because all these guys are streaming on Twitch. I guess you kind of need to yell at them if they forget to stream. I mean, I've been, I've been like, happy. listening into the yeah. the dialogue. There hasn't also, been much there. Be I mean, you could also just listen on Twitch, right? But, yeah, it doesn't matter. I am just yeah, let's go, let's go see Meanwhile in Miyoto Land. Let's go see Too what Miyoto's nice. up to you. Too weak. Uh... Oh, I heard it. Glosson said he's too weak. He did it? Market. Bingo! Everyone put it on the bingo card! That yeah, would be pretty cool if someone built Leaning Tower, right? <laughs> I was like, I switched off of the tech, because no one had built it, because I saw two people enter it. I was Dude, like, I don't right. get, no. And yeah, now, I, like, I don't know if I can I win this bingo. Good, I what I really need is I need I turn 165 plus building, and coded messages. It, it just doesn't no seem, uh... I mean, mm, that's what you do to that's me, tough. Right? You fucking yeah. sanction on me on purpose. I haven't forgotten about that for two weeks. I, yeah, yeah, I don't know what Miyota's play is here. It's... No, it's like one turn. Okay. Arv really did a that, number like on a him. Turn. Like if you were, I mean, Glosson did a bigger number on him by fucking <laughs> stealing his movie. You claim it's the same uh, Twelve G also same turned him on that Oracle. Damn, yeah, same turn on so many ones. Damn. Or Miyota. <laughs> yeah, actually same. He's like he he's really trying to fix this gold per turn. They're all complaining about same turn, and Glosson's just laughing. <laughs> That's how you know. <laughs> yeah, this Miyota looks pretty ripped. I think Nightstone is, is stronger than Miyota here, right? There's... Normally when you're playing like a taller build, you expect to have more gold for turn, right? Because you're just paying less maintenance on buildings. You have more centralized pops, so you get more city connection gold, and uh, Nightstone is making more gold out of GA. Yeah. But I feel like it's like 94, 95 factories for Nightstone, maybe. Curiosity. It's a difference. Spock is a cat. Pretty good tech. In the Himeji. Himeji's so massive. I need you to question your life's existence first. Ooh, 12G's teching muskets. What is that about? Is that like some Chad Sistine into RD play? Never thought Barkus would be alive at this point. I mean, look, the, here, here's the way I think about war, and Ashwin probably does too, but I don't want to speak for him. You have to think what, when you go into a war, or you're like about to fight someone, you have to think about what marks, what would be successful? When, when is this considered a failure, and when is this considered successful? Is... Arvius spending 30 turns killing Barkus successful? I you could argue it is. And then there's certainly the take where you could argue no. Leaning is still there. You could also argue that him spending like 1300 gold in upgrades to do it isn't good either. I'm not saying it's not and I'm not saying anything. I'm just saying like this is how this is why when me and Ashwin are critical of the initial play in the first place 
Like that's what we're thinking about. I'm, I'm not so much concerned of, well, if the only metric is, does it work? It obviously works. <laughs> it obviously <laughs> fucking works. If this were a duel, Argus would have already won the duel. Yes, exactly. All right. I mean, you always ask the question, are you better off before or after the, the attack, right? Exactly. And welcome, Mega. Hi. You got your shit to work. I'm glad. Let's try to figure out team speak. It was hard. Boomer tech. We're too young for it. Yeah. Yeah, I'll take like ramp out the computer. Um... Who do you think strong here, Mega? I like Knight's position, kind of. <laughs> I need a Knight. commentator who knows what they're talking about. <laughs> Remember, um, was it was it like Tourney Three Finals or Korea? Like Air was totally dead, and we got Korea on Mike. That popped off. <laughs> <laughs> uh, my God, yeah. Oh, Knight's on doing ninety-seven. I kind of thought his science was better 97 factories that's that's good that's good it's, it's nice one, seven with the only one scientist there's spawn. one scientist spawn and yeah knowing, uh, gun him ag yeah 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 checks out he'll probably i feel like he's gonna go factory already into oh uh, is miota is miota playing for the bingo card what would miota need to do for the bingo card look left to this capital oh my god no don't say it. Is he actually going to hold that? He slept it? Oh, no. No. <laughs> no, Miota, no. <laughs> You're allowed to do it for one turn, so he might but why? just be doing that. Why would he but... sleep it? <laughs> but it kind of looks like he's playing for the bingo card. I think I'm... That one is on my card. It this bingo be... card fucked the entire game? Yeah. <laughs> 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 yeah, if so... somebody else answers. No, I mean, yeah, I think it, it, it's correct to do. No, 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 wait, but it depends on player order, actually, because if you... I guess you're if, if nobody's bulbing a scientist, right, and you bulb now, you could get factories next turn if... Their tech finishes before the yours goes. It's like a, it's a, it's kind of looking, starting to look like a. a Glossen got me. Glossen gets leaning. You know what I mean? The you latest go. fucking turn ninety three. Dude, he literally just sits there and he clicks whatever uh, wonder he wants. He's like, oh yeah, 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 that sounds good. I'll take that, right? Glossy yeah, moments. It's, it's, it's just the uh, waiting for Glossy to get teamed by 12G and uh, Knights. Uh, he's, gonna, he's either going to get teamed or he's just going to die. Right? I think 12G could uh, take him. Yeah, I, think so. I think he's going to get teamed. He's got so many hammers on X Blow, man. Uh, yeah. Like, I'm not even uh, trying to be a hater on 12G or whatever. Obviously, 12G is a better player. I'm just saying, yeah. like, X Blow gives a shitload of hammers. Yeah. I think if, if uh, like, maybe told you could solo kill him at Bombers. Oh, That's no, the... Sorry. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. For, of, for course, of course, bombers, of course. Potentially. Yeah. Like, if Gwasn is stupid enough to click order. He's going to click order. He clicks so. X-Blow 3, so he's going to go X-Blow 4, so he's going to click order. Uh, I, I think Gwasn's one of those guys that thinks auto is the only policy tree. I know that's Barkus. And... And... And Knights. I believe leaning also makes autocracy a lot better than the no Meiji. How do these um Yoda, these Prussian coal? fabrics work? They're cheaper or uh, yeah, they're cheaper and they don't require coal. So huh. you should stand up right cool. now. Cool, nice building. Very good building. And, uh, really big and, tempo and building. Check up your bum. Oh, okay, Chris is Arv General then. Maybe the end Maybe is coming. Turn ninety-three. Yeah, Arv General didn't, but he didn't actually. Yeah. He got one road tile, so. I mean, I don't know how, how that works. Not sure how much that, that was worth. Like oh, he's gonna general in again, but Barkus has the counter general. Let's go back to that. If it's just, uh, we're just talking about Miota, so we've been on Miota. Yeah, Mar Barkus is like, it's all collapsing now. 
Dude, can't really. I, I, I don't know. Last time I looked at it, it was turn 86. It looks fucking exactly the same. No, the Arv is a tile deeper. He's like past the choke. Arv has Arv can double general in as well, and I think it's actually correct to do here. He's already generaled once. You're saying he's yeah, holding he a he this. had three generals because he, he has three generals right now. Okay. Well, oh two, yeah, I see. Yeah, I see. There's one by Bidoxum. Yeah. I, I mean guess. the thing. Yeah, but like, is that worth it? You're too strong. Since oh, when sure. does Arvius care fighting, about like having something time. like kill like efficiently and? That does make sense. Like, I don't think it matters if he waste generals here because i don't think he's fighting again for a very long time and you know he's gonna click freedom i think he's okay i i've seen i have to qualify every single time i talk about it and because i've seen arv defend so many positions i thought he was just dead in but i think arv is dead at any time <laughs> i don't think so no I, I don't think he's gonna get i don't think he's getting pressured at any time so yeah i don't mm -hmm. think till till like real bombers mm -hmm. So he has a lot of time to recover. So I actually like this spot. Like, who do you think is actually going to pressure him? I think no, Miyota. No, and they, they all have to deal with... Um, no, with I think Miyota actually has a free hand, right? Because basically, I think it's 12G and Knights go into uh, Boston, right? And then Miyota sits there with his honor one, and his he's like, okay, may as well take some cities. I mean, Miyota's game's too weak, though. I'm too mm. weak. I'm so weak. Oh, Arv. Let's see if you're... There you go. Well, Arvius Freedom like is on the bingo card. It's like a free fucking space. Yeah. There's a lot of free spaces on that Ash one bingo There card. are so many. I would like the but bingo your bingo cards minimal. were so difficult. Yeah, I, I want somebody to win bingo, please. <laughs> Similar to Glosson in that respect. Honestly, Barkus is like, he's trading pretty good. So, because he looked nice. Thank you, thank Aww. you. Force Nor didn't work. Uh, does he general right now? No, it gets locked. I, I'll be very impressed if he manages to out me. Uh, I would say that. Uh, okay, there he goes. And then the counter cool. counter, right, goes. Oh, wait. Where does it actually go? It's actually hard to. Oh, no. Oh, no. He doesn't and then it goes right online path. for her. He has to swing all the way around. Does he have the road set up? He does. Unwind is probably just yeah, there. Flames go. everywhere. This is what we were saying going in. Now yeah. Now okay. This is this is over now. It's GG. So when did he start? Oh, Turn like a uh, seventy-four. No, he started seventy-four. Yeah. I don't know. There's no way. That Actually, no. It was probably six. it was probably seventy-six. Yeah, I think it was seventy-six. The, the uh, normal time for anyone to start. Crossbow. Is Barkus going to keep this deer general course. because that actually does do a lot of damage? Well, but it doesn't matter. Yeah, he's yeah, dead. He's, he's very dead. You like just wasting money like that? <laughs> no. But it would be funny though. <laughs> yeah, he's able to general in the first. Like Gasmiota, I don't think attacking Arv even makes your game better. It doesn't. Arvius. I don't know what is. Arvius is effectively like yeah, a cancer rel player right now. Uh, He's like super annoying, but you'd never want to deal with him yourself. Dude, Miyota's gonna do something. Like Miyota he... has to do something, but he also just doesn't have the ability to do anything relevant. He's got to get in on some sort of teaming angle. I guess that's so. Which that's just... which kind of is interesting, right? Because let's say they do that. That's it's bad if they team like Glosson. For Miyota. Yeah. He's just like out of the picture. Mm hmm. Arcus, I think returning that worker was totally incorrect. You need to leave the the dead worker on the tile so that they can't repair. You wouldn't click on autocracy, would you? That doesn't seem very nice. Oh, uh, Arv captured pyramids, right? It was in uh, the. But they lost anyone? Right? Yeah. yeah I... I... That's weird. So he should have been to one turn repair. He just didn't get the he kickoff in time? Yeah, he okay. didn't click it. I don't think he realized he captured pyramids. Yeah. Huh. You think a castle is worth it for Burkus in the cap? 
probably. Yeah. We gotta get we gotta get Barkus on the call after he dies, cause that way we can that's gonna bingo. be primo content. I mean, I know Barkus is about to spawn another general. By the way, if you look, wait, at his cover. Kick him? where do where do you counter then? Uh, can you you rip your own and then you yeah you rip your own and then you counter there right? Or just on the fort, on fort spine as well. I want to claim those. I, I think I'd rip my own here in general on the deer again. It's so greedy. I don't think you can. Uh, when's his general? Probably next turn. I mean, look at his topper. Oh, that's so cheating. Sweet oh, UI. Ready to get sassy. The Zitz mm. UI. Just, you're not supposed to know when you get great people. If Sid Meier wanted us to... Whatever. I'm too tired for the bants. <laughs> Yeah, it is, it is greedy. It's probably too. Yeah, greedy. I was about to say that too, Braxis. Is that we've been kind of coming down on Barkus and stuff, but like he's actually done a really good job. Yeah, like the past, uh, like ever since like the first couple turns where he lost the two cities, he's been fighting extremely well for his cap. Yeah, he's been swapping well. I haven't. He's been using the joke. Yeah, he's been he's been fighting well. There's the general. Put the unit on it. Nice. And he's general on the right tile. Good job, Barkus. See, Barkus, you didn't need a guide. Hmm. Two combat bonus also doing a lot. He's is he building up mass? There's actually a lot of units behind his cap. Huh. Yeah. Wow. Arv getting me out on hashtag not my goat. Oh my god. He has more army? Okay. Wow. Okay, I mean, the, even the fact that he's lived this long has been a complete surprise to me. Why are you building a road out of Genesee River? But he has no signs to sit road? behind the army. Yeah, I mean, what? I I still don't think Barkus can win, but like, yeah, no one's saying yeah, no Barkus is gonna win. But ten turns ago, I didn't think he was gonna be but alive. But what if if anyone's been in this position before, they know that reinitiating a fight after you've intentionally like sandbagged wow. to try to greed is the most painful fucking experience ever. Yeah, this is like awful for her. Shame that actually, this is actually how Miota gets back in the game. Real shame. How does Miota get back? Like, if he if Arv is weak enough that Miota can walk in? Yeah, Miota just goes uh, factory already. He's going schools. No fourth school. Because you, if you kill he's Patro Zero. That entire Why? Half of the map, it reduces the number of neighbors he has. Uh, Why is Miota Patro Zero? He's not forbidden. That, that kind of makes sense, actually. Miota struggled with happiness there throughout the entire game. He's got a big food religion, like he can actually put that to work. He doesn't really care about other honor policies. I'm kind of into it. Korea just spamming Dino Dance. Good, good, good. I think the Patro is literally just for Forbidden. I guess that's also like you don't want to be Forbidden Loot Pinata in the middle of the map, but. Fuck it. I mean. Screw it, you're playing for the win. Uh, do you disagree though? Like, this is how Miyota gets back in the game, is like just RDing Arbius right now? Um, I mean, he's honor. So I actually, I think it is, a, I think it is a play, especially because it probably doesn't slow him down too much. Especially yeah. if he goes after schools and stuff. You know? Like, he's not in a rush. Arvis is now a free kill. Yeah, I mean, you can he can backstab. Well, not backstab, right, but he can right. like kind of come into into where Arvius is is working, and then or, I mean where Barkus is pushing in, and just pop his cap. 
Yeah, so there's just kind of two capitals for free for Miota if he goes there. And I think that's a great segue into that. Meanwhile, anyone else in the game that's not those three people is in a teaming triangle right now. Or yeah. like, a, you know what I mean? Like They're going to fight each other. They're I mean, going to fight each other. Farkas isn't enough. <laughs> the thing is... Farkas is in his own world. Um, when is it, when are IDOs? So it looks like Glossen should be ideology in like, I think five turns minimum. I haven't looked properly. Dude, Arvius has fucking nothing uh, left. Dude, did he actually like? And I'm just he just got out traded. That's crazy. How am I to know that you are pre building barracks? Is Barkus talking uh, shit? Yeah, Barkus is of course talking shit. He likes to go. I'm on dev But it's not a fair assessment to be like, oh yeah, I'm just gonna magically think that you're gonna be as defended as you are. This. Now Arvius is like trying to know. Arvius Arv Arv is coping so hard. Oh my god. <laughs> well, that's exactly what you're arguing for now. Oh man. At least everything that you're saying translates yeah, this to is, that. This is content. Yeah, well. This whole. Yeah, it, you did catch me off guard a little, which is why this is a good idea. If I was more careful, it wouldn't have been. I guess you just had to try it. Ultimately, this comes down to one thing. Well, if Bar if so Barkus so made the. The conscious decision to be like, hey, I'm just going to build a round of units in every single one of my cities. None of this ever happens. What? I mean, he yeah, did no, build. I mean, if, he if, built a lot of units. No, he didn't. No, he didn't. No, he didn't. No, no, he, didn't. He, he built um, four pikes, that two of which he upgraded from spears, if you remember. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then he built terracotta. Or he, he, he engineered terracotta. That's true. He didn't build anything. He was building ampies when Arvius. Yeah, he up. built. He was building fucking amphitheaters. Oh yeah, I remember that. He finished one. And and he built a couple barracks. <laughs> I mean, turn ninety eight factories is not necessarily error in these positions. It's just that he spent so much hammers and so much gold. And no, th that's not the problem. The problem is that it's not over. I'm not gonna try and take your city yeah. anymore. Like, yep. if Barkus didn't actually get anything, he got no text. I'm not doing that. He got. If Barkus is ever gonna like st get off the gas, like to try to like salvage his, his game, he's trolling. Right. His best chance is to push back. Um, and actually steal text off. And of steal text. <laughs> yeah. My God, this Achilles game is actually a banger, though. What's happening? Uh, everyone's dead besides Achilles, uh, Zuso, and Lucas. Weird. Weird. <laughs> and Achilles is currently pushing uh, Zuso. Is he getting teamed? No. I'll let you noob whisper me all you want. And, um, I don't know, can Barkus actually kill right, cities? He's gonna have to make, like, trebs or something. I don't think he can uh, actually push. Okay. The joke is too bad, and you're just pushing into knights. Yeah, so he just sits here basically for the rest of the game, like, trying to make it hard for Arby's to kill him. That's so depressing. Oh, uh, Arby's gonna have his rifles. The... Yeah, it's impossible. Okay, let's think about IDO. Glossin should be IDO in two, I think. Um, actually, well, Miyota should have first IDO, right? Because of, um, yeah. So. 12G gets factory tech next turn, but doesn't have money saved to buy any. So it should end Knight's Dawn. So, so the contest is Glossin, Knight's Dawn, um, Miyota for Autocracy. Knight's Dawn looks like three turns to me, but that's a very rough estimate. <laughs> looks like three turns. That's weird. I don't understand. Did he just get really outsized by Glossin? He went to uh, yeah. Meshi first. Glossin went to Harbors first. I guess Harbors is much cheaper than him, AG. Yeah, Harbors is one tech, I mean, mm -hmm. and it's a very cheap tech. Yep. Yeah. That's Gloss and not working his fucking deer in his cap. Gains me. Get Alex that turn as well. 
Why do you need all these workers on my border, by the way? I mean, Boston has so much scaling potential here. Well, why do I need that sausage? Because you're putting... They they have to team him because if they leave him alone, he's just gonna win. Yeah, you're gonna get rolled by this 51k army. He needs pontoons uh, in this. Don't uh, don't be coy with me. The pontoons are doing good. Standing the things that give you combat minus or standing on them are not in my list of things that I want to have. Just for reinforcing. I guess. Dude, last time I made a pontoon, I actually got my capital captured because I couldn't block it. <laughs> that feels so bad. <laughs> Yeah. Actually, and like last time I saw Fontaine, this was the last free for all I played. It gave me a capture tile motto. for a stealth stack. I miss one turn Fontaine, so six were great. Consume the worker Fontaine, you mean? Have to role play the work boots, yeah. 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 Okay. yeah. Isn't that how it works? I'm so mm. hungry. Okay, so Barkus and Arbius are basically out of the game. Nice. That, yes. That's a good one. I like that one. Who does that favor? I think 12G. And 12G, yeah. yeah. Uh, cause it... also, they kind of got into a corner now, right? Like, the biggest problem with being middle map What's is that you can get team turning angle and they can no longer be teams because <laughs> who's going to punish them? Oh my god. That's really funny. Right there. Give me 20 more turns. What's up with industrial, Dawson? I don't know. The, the more time goes on, the more I'm thinking it's 12G's game. Dude, yeah, Arvius is building these, these fucking windmills. Like, I know, I know. It's just like, I mean, what are you thinking? <laughs> you, don't question him. <laughs> don't question the goat, please. You wouldn't understand. I'm sorry. Yeah. That's true. I'm sorry. Dude, I think, um... Is Knight's done going Artie? Is I, Knight's I, going back Artie? I, I'm pretty sure he is. It's Miota he is a scientist. Is. Miota thinks he is. Miota is um, like tacked off of schools and started going back to hard into units. Oh okay, so how many people engineered Tash this way? Wait, I was gonna do that. Yeah, I think. I mean, I already I did, didn't, by the way. but I wanted to. He'll take a fall team. So is he can go for the gonna one, one, scientist to get that scientist, or is this a one turn thing? I mean, this. I was hoping production's that. really actually bad on very sad that I didn't. nights and I right that's what i'm saying i don't know why his factories are just slow like he's think, working I mean, so many one, like good four hammer tiles this seems i mean i guess it's not ga yeah looks like he dropped ga recently uh, it looks like quite a while ago he is holding an artist okay he's on yeah, yeah that he's looks like him that looks like five turns of GA or, or five turns out or something. Yeah, Chem, Chem on Iroquois is actually, uh, like, do you even really need it? No, you only need steel. Yeah. Unless you're doing Artie. So, yeah, I, I believe this is Artie from Knight's Dawn. I don't know if I like it. He's not going into Glossin, right? He's going into Miota. Um, That's actually so huge for Glossin. Yep. This I, I, I still stand by the fact I don't think 12G can take Glossin alone. I mean, I'm good. It's nice. Yeah. I mean, Glossin's being left alone to do the greediest thing he could possibly think of. Songhai takes auto. Glossin in autocracy. Glossin took autocracy, you said? Yep. Glossin took autocracy. That's so Step big. One. That's such a grief for fucking 12G. Dude, 12G's not going to make it, is he? Because Knight's done his autocracy. Knight's is also going to take auto. Well, that oh means oh, wait, no, but he can take EU. I'm not even kidding. Can you go back and pretend you were kidding so I can laugh at you? <laughs> no, no, I, I, I have a very strong feeling that's what he's gonna do. I, I mean, oh, EU uh, is a really good policy, but it just gets totally blockaded by anyone with votes. Yeah, Mia is playing for my bingo card. What's he doing? Architecture into dying party. Yep, that that was a classic. That's a great entry. 12G auto zero. Yeah, auto zero is my bingo, is an entry for me. So. Yeah, oh, ideology God. policy denied is a classic bingo card for my, on mine as well. Yeah. Auto zero is. I, I, I'm sorry, I'm never taking freedom zero. There's no chance. There's. <laughs> yep, okay. He's clicked it. Is he going to let a scientist decay, though? No, I don't think so. 
Who clicked? Mira clicked. Uh... Oh, you're saying Knights clicked already? Yeah. Uh, is is he going to Oxford here? Is the real question. I'm here. He has to, right? His deck is too slow otherwise. Yeah, nine turn scientist. Oh god. Yeah. This is actually so bad. I'm not scared. I'm kind of surprised. I didn't think Knights' game was in this state. What are you talking about? You want to be very friendly with me, friend? Guys, I think streamer panels, please. Are you just talking to Nightstone? Oh, I'm pretty sure he's the only one who doesn't. Actually, that's nice. Do you ever just do order already here? And bulb two writers for back science? Why? Oh, you... uh, I hate it. Why would you pick order when autocracy is there? Wait, you have chemistry. Because his timing is so bad. Yeah, but as long as he like gets the. He's also gonna have two policies here, right? He's maxing so that he can put policy uh, into. He's gonna take autocracy. No. I don't think. I don't think he's gonna take. I think he's gonna take autocracy, oh, and no, I actually oh, think oh, it's correct. Uh, don't, Those are don't two separate don't statements. Wait, what the fuck? His scientist DKs this turn. Did he take Lawson Snap? I thought he rejected it. I thought he rejected it as well. He also bulbed the scientist into fertilizer, unless there's another one lying around that I didn't see. Okay, I'm just on delay. Mm -hmm. Miota takes Forbidden. Wait, oh, Miota got Autocracy. He is taking order. Just straight up go okay, he's going to order Artie into Autocracy? He's fucked, man. Into, like, nothing. This shit is not happening. Because, not going to lie, that would be kind of funny. Into those pressure rifles? I, like the Thunder. I mean... Pressure rifles suck. What they're great like? attacking. Dude, they um, you, they're rifle. Rifles are great. They don't have. Yeah, but they're double attack yeah, rifles, and we all know what you want to use rifles for. No, you slam once on your road, and then you can cycle. It's yeah. amazing. Pressure rifles are scary on attack. They're three move. Oh, they're three move. Yeah. yeah. Three yeah. Move. yeah I... I, I don't know. I don't think he's going to have units as well as kind of the biggest issue. How? He's playing... Um... Knights he's is not going to have units. Is like both he's playing Erika. He five. should be like top hammers, right? By a wide margin. Isn't a three move rif a rifle with blitz essentially a cav? No. Are they on rifling tech or are they on cav tech? I don't know. Oh yeah, right. Taking ambush and not having to get and not getting the ambush minus is also. Yeah, I don't know. I think is Miota going schools? If you go schools, you can. Looks like he's not. Yeah. Thank you. Oh my God, is Glossing gonna win this? Could you imagine if he just sat there and got every wonder Didn't and no punished. one bothered him? That would be I'm so insane. He's gonna natural. I don't want to get fertilized. He's gonna natural with Chijin. That doesn't sound fun. Glossin, Glossin moment. I mean, it does, but eh, maybe later. You know. <laughs> the greed. Yeah. The the score part, the card was correct. All right, let's check my bingo. Uh, post turn one hundred industrial. Yep, wonder same turn. Yep. They haven't even teamed yet, which is crazy. I mean, Arp teamed himself. Does That's that count? True. I don't think Arp is, that would count. Did a Sarah backseat? I haven't seen him do it. I feel uh, like he's tried. You kind of uh, defeated it, it him by uh, telling jo everyone to go on emo only, Ryan. Yeah. What's he to do with uh, 
if they're all emo to him. Like, yeah, I, I believe in Sarah. I have a lot of confidence in. Yeah, he'd figure something out. Yeah. Maybe he's whispering on Discord. He could use like semaphore uh, emotes. <laughs> um. I think that's it. Yeah. Mm. Oh man, knights. Knights has some gold. Knights Don has like he's gonna have two thousand gold for the upgrade, which is uh, yeah, it's good. Check me out. I don't know. The feeding architecture already looks pretty. Like it looks like there's a lot of potential there. Yeah, that's a good one. I I, I think I'm optimistic on that one. Recap War is also pretty. Uh, and Auto Zero. Those Recap all, War is uh, like guaranteed with how many coastals there are. Unfortunately, like the bottom row is uh, impossible now. Yeah. Why is there commentators curse and commentators cope? They're very different. But we definitely did them both. We definitely did them both. <laughs> Nobody in Swiss yet, huh? Is Wow, Glasson is just top all demos. I think this Knights Dawn going right is kind of crazy. Very yeah. But maybe he thinks that he'll be left well, unchecked check when, because they'll still have to deal with Field Glosson. Maybe. Let's look at 12G. Uh, What's 12G's four. position? Hummer's four. Um, happiness looks a bit rough. Gold's pretty bad. Mm, Bank's gold is bad, but his gold return is pretty good. Um, oh, never mind. I, saw, I thought that was one. Why? 112, not 172. You told me okay. I can buy it. Um, he hasn't traded po trading posted everything. Pop which... is so low. Yeah. But that's expected. Like oh. this is what we were talking about in the beginning of the game. His lane is so bad. I'm so proud of Barkus building to crit mass and not getting baited like such Correct. a good. Yeah. Yeah. I'll uh, I'll pass your compliments on to him, Korea. God, <laughs> Dude, can you imagine play <laughs> being in Marcus's spot? <laughs> like, yeah, I'm just gonna sit here. I have nothing else I I can do. All right, this Tolji Commerce Five should do a lot for him, right? Wait. Wait. Oh, never mind. Okay, sorry. 12G was looking at Glossed's cap, and I thought it was his cap. I was like, he doesn't have Tishin. And then I saw, not auto. I saw the wonder on? list that Glossed has. I'm like, oh, okay, yep, this makes sense. Dude, this is literally such a Glossed getting away with it game. All right, He's but... NA Miota. He's NA Miota. <laughs> What? Oh my god, what? What? Why did he take ratio zero? He needs to bulbo right her or something. This policy is huge. But I guess he doesn't oh. have any trading posts, so there's no point. But, like, you, you're you gonna make those trading posts. I mean, the elephant in the room is not having the trading posts is wrong. <laughs> so. Yeah. No, there's no pork engineer coming, right? Like next engineer is in fifteen. He's not holding a engineer. There's no pork oh, no. engineer. Sorry, I'm watching another game and as he says about to lose a ten stack. <laughs> like I think I think told you just fucked up hard here. I don't even have architecture, Mr. Taj. I I bought Cam, leave me alone. Yeah. I'm hard checking Cam. This is actually going to interfere with his gold generation for fighting Glossin so badly. He needs to be making like 300 GPT by now. I think all three of those are fine. Have you considered that I'm briefing you, Barkus? No, you cannot count that on your bingo card. Yeah, one game at a time, please. You yeah, know, seriously. What, 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 what do you Frank, think this if, is? If Frank went and made a bingo game. card for his game, you know, you can go fill that out, right? <laughs> Yeah, I didn't think so. That? Frank just doesn't have the uh, the production quality that the stream has. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I 
Did Frank have player cards? Good point, Fillion. No, he fucking did not. A lot of very good questions going on in chat. And a production quality is unmatched. It it's really is. We are. I that I'm actually just trying to farm you for gold, like a human barb. So I, I've not seen uh, like uh, uh, like the lobby panel on your uh, stream. The the like uh, splash screen that Frank has. Hmm. Mm. Yeah, Frank didn't have the PowerPoint, right? Yeah, Frankly, he just... <laughs> Frankly. I can't, I can't, I can't do it. it. Just stop. Like, Quit while you're ahead. Yeah. Okay, so is, is nice time going? Like, he's he's committed, right? He's going in? Uh, he's definitely someone that's just going to, like... I see monkey how it in is. regardless. I love these fur tiles. They're so pretty. They're so nice. Um, Yoda is like finishing his school's tech, and then he's like he's building muskets and knights while he's knights is good schools. hammers. Three thirty or three sixty yeah. or whatever it is. Thirty is not much for the factories. Let's be real. I mean, no, no GA. No GA is just weird, right? I, like, okay, but like, can we? Bit. Let's discuss this. Why are his hammers so bad? No it's idea. pop, right? No, yes. it's pop. He's, he's working like a lot of hammer it's tiles. Like, for city. His average city is like what, fifteen? Well, and he's like average tile is four hammers. But Aqua Sasmi is not hammered down, I guess. But don't really get it. So his cities are start. His cities are just too small. I don't even think so. I mean, like the the tile value is insane. He's Iroquois with fucking forest. He's, yeah, I don't really understand. Part of it. Okay, like so he expanded borders late. He's one of seven already or one of eight already here. It looks That's like not, not terrible with that Oxford. I think if we fight Blossom has a little bit of a too easy time to win. That doesn't seem right. This is the instance though that you would want to Oxford. Okay. Good. Uh no scientist kinda lines up, right? Yeah. He has fertilizer already. So yeah, it's they could be 109, maybe. I don't know. He's still building a factory in one of these cities. And I'm inspiring. I wonder what his rel is. I guess be able to rel in one of his cities. I would have probably spread that, actually. Yeah, you yeah, would have. I mean, it's swords and his land looks like it needs food. Yeah. Yeah, he's over happy. Is I guess that's order stuff. He just got his shot of ideology happiness. You have order three. He's holding two raiders. I don't. Yeah, why? Did... Yeah, he's not building any knights. Like why? Yeah, he's building heroic and like he just be making units if he's doing this push, right? He's definitely doing it. He's doing the push, it's just like, he's not making units behind it. Miyota's also not making units, so... <laughs> Dude, why is Elite Forces tier 1? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's balanced. Why is he building Red Fort? Like, why are you hard building Red Fort here? I get it. Wait, what is Glossin doing? Glossin's just doing whatever dumb No, Glossin's going calf. What? He, uh, did he not get the nap? I think he didn't get the nap that he wanted. Is he? <gasps> Is he going to 12G? No. Oh, oh, spicy. It looks like he's going into... Um, Knights. Knights. Dude, if he actually went to 12G... I don't think this is Glosson prepping, man. This is him going already. Yeah, this going is... to Dude, he's going this to 12G. Is... He's 100% going into someone. He's... Mm, the units are by Night's Dawn, but the Goliath, like, you can't, it's very hard to offensively apply the Goliaths to Night's Dawn, but it's easy to offensively apply them to 12G. Yeah, but he, look at where he's got his units. Yeah. I mean, the Goliaths are just, they don't matter, right? Yeah. They're just, like, prep in case he gets taxed. Dude, if he actually went to 12G right now, that would be such a massive play. 
Uh, I think it'd be wrong because uh, knights would turn around. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. That's true. Yeah. Like knights would recognize. I, I think knights would recognize that and be like, "Oh, this is uh, this is how I instantly lose the game." I think he's. I don't know if he doesn't recognize that it's already happening. Well, he's going to recognize it when Glosson comes and attacks him. <laughs> you think Glosson is going to kill Knights down here? I yeah I I don't know I'm not into it. I mean Knights just doesn't he's not making units. God knows why. He's building banks and zoos and red fort and it's terrible. <laughs> uh, like why are you going fat already and then not building units? I decided to build he sees me out of building schools. Maybe he's just thinking I'm gonna catch me out off guard. Oh, yeah. Come, come, come punish me. Sure, but like, you can think. Uh, yeah, I, I see what you're saying. Sounds fun. How far is Glossen off of schools? Glossen's pretty far actually from Erdy. <laughs> Wait. What is this tech queue? What? Mm -hmm. Is he just gonna slam with calves and try to steal already from knights? Is that his plan? Calves have volley, right? No. Yeah. Yeah. On his sip, yeah. What? Knight. The knights have volley. On Songhai? Yeah. Yeah. They have volley. <laughs> no, I thought they lacked a particular promo, no. which was they. No, they have volley. Not volley, but no city penalty. No, whatever. but you don't. Yeah. But you get the city penalty when you upgrade into calf. Are you sure? I'm not sure. I guess we're gonna see if he's. Uh... I don't, I don't like this at all. What is happening? I'm sorry. It, he's he's <laughs> playing as if he has schools. I, yeah, I'm, I'm, not, I'm, I'm, not, I'm not vibing. Why on earth would he choose to attack knights down here? Without any ranged units. I, I don't know. make it make sense. I, I'm trying to figure this out. No armor, no honor academies or a vibe. Yeah, there's something. He could just go schools here, right? He's like, I don't know why he's schools. not. Like I. Think he's trying no. to? I'm, I'm confused. He's trying to right. force the nap. Oh, he's <laughs> such a rat. That is insane, nice. Glossin. What's Glossin doing? It's the deal I would accept. <laughs> hey, Glossin's oh. acting like he has such insane leverage here. Like no one has dynamite. What happens if you accept that deal? What There's happens? so many glossing moments. Dude, Bart, this is still in this game. Did Nice take that deal? He didn't. No, he didn't. He didn't. Now Glossin hits his natural and decides that he would indeed like to GA for the rest of the game. Also, these military academies without even um, Total War, like Total War is not even close. 
Yeah, I think I think Glosson is trying to go to. No, but I was wrong. I thought he was trying to go to Tolji. I mean, he might be, but he might be trying to sim tax, like Arbius did. Yeah. Well, I um. But if he's doing that, why isn't he building frigates? I mean, why isn't he building more Galeas and stuff? Or more cannons so that he can actually try to take a city instead of just slamming calves into it at minus 34 percent i'm trading it with knights right now 12 g's like also going cannons does this count as everyone going already well no not a single person has already so i don't think it counts <laughs> okay yeah, true true good point Like twelve of G's like I'm just gonna build my schools. I don't it's, get it. It's good school. Yeah, I know. I don't know what everyone else is doing. Arv is going electricity. <laughs> Arv. Yep. The goat. <laughs> Where's smooth tilt? I mean, he's definitely going there for his, like, stock exchanges, right? But it's still just so weird. Tim Hortons are good. They are good. They are very good. Is he ideology? No. Is he just planning on buying? Oh, uh, the bingo card. Uh, Arvius is building his artist guild right now. Oh, I didn't, I didn't remember to put that one in. The classic. Yeah. What does industrial espionage mean? It's the auto spike. Oh, okay. Policy. My bad. My bad. Yeah. Got it. I feel like Glossin is. Uh, you you remember how we talked about how Glossin has the most throw potential? Yeah. Yeah. We're watching it. We're watching it. He's going frigs. Where are the fricks going? I don't. I feel like it's got to be told you, right? But yeah, he bought. He did buying. What? Lawson just did buying. What? what? He doesn't have gold. He has gold. He's got twenty five hundred gold. I mean, that's not buying gold. It's yeah. It's already gold. If he he could upgrade so many calves and arties. Cladding? He's not. He's, he's, you need. Over there. What? No. Yeah, you need schools I mean, to climb. Well, actually. No, you don't. It's uh, it's at steam, right? Yeah, but you need schools to get there. No, you don't. No, you don't. You don't. No, need I know. You, to get I know you don't, but it's faster. <laughs> <laughs> Is that your betting line? Yeah. Yeah. Molly oh, and Glossin in a call I'm right now. Don't be silly, knight. By the way, you can't kill me. I might front stab you, but I'm not going to back stab you. Actually, this you is can't... a guard play. Guard would be going ironclads here. I think this is funny. Don't it, so, where, where's knight stun going? Have we figured out the knight stun situation? No. Literally. I think we're all just Except confused. By the way, there's the same turn uh, red fort going on between the boss. <laughs> Does the the knights accept that deal? I don't have schools and I'm pretty far from schools too. I didn't see. I think Nightstown just took nap from So what do you think of Knights? Boston? Not hundred percent sure. I mean what am I thinking? I don't know, I just saw you sign a non aggression pact with your other neighbor. Uh he hasn't accepted yet. Okay. I mean, this is actually a situation where you want to have some coded message, right? Which is you want to say, fine, okay, but, you know, I'm not going to broadcast everyone. Yeah, he took it. He took it? Like... Yeah, he took the nap. Okay, so what's Glosson going to do? <laughs> He's still taking frigs. Uh, do you trust him? Okay, I told you. Army 
Maybe it's uh, Burkus. Yeah. Did he get any money for it? Slammed into a mob. Nope. No. He did not manage to, to tribute Night's Dawn. Man, yeah, this is so suspicious for Night's Dawn. I don't. I don't understand how he lost auto. That's the real. What's 12 What's D's? supposed to do now? What's 12 oh. D's thing? Oh, he took order. Okay, interesting. Really? The last thing I would have expected from him. This Commerce 4 keeps, like, staring at me, and I hate it. <laughs> he protects me on his snap, though. <laughs> Okay, it looks like um, looks like twelve just kind of prepping. Yeah, which he's... begs the question: What is Glosson fucking doing? I mean, he's just gonna throw it in at like Frigs and Cavs and Arties, right? And uh, I think he can honestly just make it with autocracy bonuses and just force it to work into this like low gold commerce order. You can you can kill. Glosson's an anti school believer. Excellent. Must punish. Yeah. Is um has Arby's taken IDO yet? Uh no. He's building his schools instead. So who do you think is going to win the the most contested same turn of the game? Uh, Glosson. It's always Glosson. Also looks like he could have gone to turn earlier. Don't worry about it. But, but then you wouldn't get the same turn value. It's true. You wouldn't get the tilt. It's all about the psychic warfare. Psychological. <laughs> Uh, Arcus is gunpowder before Arv. Arv doesn't need gunpowder. He has um rifles. Did Glosson get Glosson getting total war next turn? There, did he actually take unit purchasing? Am I crazy? No, he did. Why? I I, I don't know make any goddamn sense imagine taking i guess he decided he didn't need the happiness so he took elite forces and unit purchasing i don't know why anyone would ever feel that they don't need happiness ever yeah, even if try. i was on 40 happiness i don't think i would take oh, of course. I guess same turn about that. yep yep yeah, told you yep Boston too good it's annoying See? Mobilization. That's so weird. I mean, it's wrong, but... Yeah. Okay, he, he has to be going to 12G, right? Because it's freedom, check. Yeah, I mean, he's it's so got late. He's got a nap. It's like absurdly late. No, that was a uh, bingo card. And there's no schools. Oh, is it actually? This is how Miota can Earth still goes win. freedom. Wow. Dude, even with your super easy bingo, I don't think I'm going to hit it. Because <laughs> you got it. It's the chariots. The chariots uh, messed you up. The chariots yeah, messed me up. There's a bunch like, of stuff um, that messed me up. Facilitate a peaceful exchange between our uh, peaceful and our horses, chariots, and people. Nice cargo. Hmm? You are. Look, I'm not going to lie, this deal that Knights has with Glosson is dumb as fuck, but I'm pretty optimistic on Glosson's attack. Dude, you were, do you remember that Skirm tournament game where Glosson literally just talked Knights into CCing? 
in a duel. I did not. Oh, how? <laughs> he, like, he literally yeah. says something along the lines of, like, yeah, I think you screwed yourself by checking crossbow. <laughs> <laughs> you can't kill me. Glass and it's not that glass. <laughs> Any way to make this to you? Oh, man. Support, like, <laughs> he just got glossed in so bad. Can you imagine getting glossed in a duel? You know, it might be it might be that Glossin thought that mobilization has upgrade cost reduction. Keep coping. Certainly not. Keep coping. <laughs> uh, I I I technically have to stand up for him. <laughs> I love the viewer counts. Arv is doing 400 viewers. Bulgy's doing 230. And then the rest of them are doing like one. <laughs> and then there's Ryan. And then there's Ryan. Dude, I've been chilling at 69. I, yeah. I kind of dig it. Yeah. Barkus is just vibing. What is he supposed <laughs> to do? Parker's taking economics. <laughs> Seriously, like, he's just sitting there. He can't win, and he can't kill Arvius. What is Arcus's placement? Um, You mean in playoffs or in this game? Yeah, like, does he get one game or two? I think he just gets one. He was, like, the second to last person in this lobby. Yeah, because I know Knights is, like, I think Knights is the lowest seed in this game, right? That's correct, yeah. It's Arvius, then Miota, then Gloss, and then 12G, then Arcus and Knights. Like, Glossom clearly has a plan here. I just don't like it. <laughs> he's cooking. He's cooking? I don't know what he's cooking, but it's something. Yeah, it looks like he's going into 12G. Yeah, it's like Sprigates, Clads, Arties. But this is actually an attack that's faster if you make your schools. Is it Clads? Uh, yeah, because he's tackling rifling, and then he'll go into steam. It might not even be Arties, but that doesn't mean he's probably gonna try to steal Arties because he's like the greediest of player who's ever clicked buttons. He is not. There's there's a player that starts with a G that exists. What? Galaxinator. What? General Burdak. Oh. No, it's Grabo. Oh, yeah. Yeah, the command on my channel for Glossin is literally, hey, look at little Grabo Jr. gonna cry. <laughs> <laughs> he really wanted to be Grabo for a long time. All this money's gonna disappear. Is Night Zone still not gone? Is he just like not going? I think he got talked out of it, maybe. I have the the Discord muted, so. Yeah. I think he I think he got think, whispered. I think he did. Miyota told him not to, and he's like, okay. Uh, I'm just gonna upgrade some defensive caps if that's quite alright with you. Yeah, yeah. Neighboring... I mean this is a tough lobby for uh knights, right? Like yeah, he's just getting whispered that. from like three different angles. We literally three told we literally said in the beginning of the game that no, I mean, what would happen. Gone. Defensive I did. So much research when it's those so player cards. That's why they're so accurate. You know? mm. Like people are yeah. the most important thing, of course, to me. So I guess like Knights is probably gonna try to come back at lane ship or something. So that said, who's in the best spot now? Glossin. <laughs> I think Glossin's gonna kill twelve G. Yeah, if, if the if the kill goes off for sure.
to watch him. I should go look at Twelve Times Stream. Pretty much every turn that the game goes on without Clausen getting attacked has been pretty good for him. Well, just trying to figure out what's this idiot doing. Well, joke's on you, 12G, because he doesn't know either. No jump cutter in the... Wait, he's playing East India. He's not going to a jump 12G cutter. 12G actually has a lot of Navy. Yeah. <laughs> this yeah. is going to be expensive. This is going to be super expensive for Colossum. I don't think if, this works. If he doesn't get Artie, like, Artie is actually the thing that would make this work, right? Colossum's well, doing more GPT than 12G is. Doing a lot more science than gloss in the I don't what relevant text are there? The Ironclad res it, but it is still on the table. Bomb small bombers? That's destroyers. Like, I don't think we're getting to destroyers or small bombers before this war gets decided. You get there faster than small bombers. This is so well. Yeah. I, mean, if you're, I guess Dolce just doesn't have gold. It's very weird. You look why I don't negotiate with terrorists. Good. I <laughs> like how Solix is casting both games. Is he actually? You, can you get Solix on here? You consider some offer from Glossen. Nice no, streaming Russian. Um, <laughs> you're, of course. You and Solix are the exact I'm same viewers, that. right? Cool. Yeah. I hope you won't. Probably because of my clout. A lot of people showed up to your stream to Probably. hear my opinion. I had to put your name in there that way. I, yeah. I got more viewers. Mm hmm. The ultimate clickbait. Um. <sighs> Glossin can't do this without Artie. I'm pretty sure. Oh yeah, no chance. And he doesn't look like he's teching Artie, oh, so I don't think Glossen can do it. Okay, Glossen, can I get on this fourth hill, please? I, yeah, he could have gotten schools pretty easily. I think just big mistake. Where to God if he pulls that fourth? <laughs> would be funny as fuck, mom. Nope. Like a, oh, 12G has Commerce 5 now, and he's starting to go around making trading posts. He's still only doing 152 gold per turn, though. Huh. I don't know. If Glossin feels his attack, which is beginning to seem increasingly likely, then 12G looks a lot stronger. What's your What's Miyota's position? Looks like Miyota is actually just going to throw it into, like, Nightstown. They're just going to fight it out. Arvius. Just greeting. Barkus. Going factories. What a weird game for Barkus. Okay, so she sees the frigs. Going for oil. Oh, so oh. Here we go. NA's strongest soldier has arrived. Never. Second come. strongest. There's a goat. Yeah. Looks very strong. Let's uh let's go see the gloss in perspective. Is this all of his units? Dude, no Artie is... Uh, okay, he's going for clads, right? So what he's thinking 100% is he's thinking, oh, I will get clads, I will steal artillery with my um with my coastal steals, and then I will be able to, you know, kill him, his inlands, right? I mean, there's not inland. Isn't there just, like, two, two. two cities? Yeah. Yeah. There's three, I think, there's a CS. Okay. But... 
I guess if like you really think like the whole fight is on the water, then you do just go clads, right? Uh, I don't know. There's a lot of calves there. I mean, I want Artie. He's also like thinking, oh, I can get Prora. Why are all his frigates uh, line promoted? I don't know, man. I guess he wasn't expecting him to have anything. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, everything has gone so well for Glossin in the first 100 turns of the game. Why wouldn't it continue to go so? <laughs> That's a good point. Mm. Yeah. I think Glossin's going to lose a city. That's my prediction. I don't have a good reason to predict it. I can just feel it. I mean, dude, clads are fucking strong. Yeah, I think he's going to lose an inland. I think he's going to actually take all the coastals, and he's going to lose an inland. And importantly, yo, thanks for the follow. Uh, also, if you're not following, you should definitely follow. I stream very consistently. And... <laughs> Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Very consistent streamer here. Um, Are you an arbiter, Ryan? Yeah. Okay. So importantly, 12G has no coal. Barkas is asking me whether it's legal for Arvius to neither kill nor piece him. Yeah, it is. But you can't. It's it is legal, but the. Problem is you're not allowed to farm someone, if that makes sense. Like it's in NQ rules. This is worse than the herb attack. Yeah, it is. I love how 12G has this whole like bay lined with frigs, so it's impossible to push. You mean push cav? Yeah. Like steam uh, clad cycling will like eventually break through there, but it's just very efficient usage of units if they're going to sit in there and shoot cav forever. Agreed. Can 12G even see Glossen's frigs? Like Glossen is GLH, right? Uh, Glossen does have it, yes. Yeah. yeah, like imagine artillery. Yeah, let's let's go see what Miata's trying to do. I don't Miota, Miota's going artillery. He has autocracy one, so he's not getting logistics artillery. I think he's just gonna fight Nightstone. I think Nightstone and Miota are just like gonna fight. Or Dude, might not Arf, be here. If Arf pulls this out, I'm gonna take a nap. I'm actually. Been, uh, I might even get a burger. Arbus versus Checks no. out. No. No, I think it was. I think he was. Huh? Is everyone else? No one wanted to go to schools. Yeah. As it goes. The the one oh five school game. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Okay. Have have we, have that. We, um, so this is not everyone goes artillery, right? Because Glossen is refusing to go artillery. Uh, I don't think so. Yeah, no, this this wouldn't count. Yeah, that's Glossen just ruining my bingo card. The worst. Hate that guy. Yeah. Sabotage. He he's he saw the bingo card because he posted it in the Discord. So. Yeah, I I should have posted away from him. Uh, I, okay. There's there's some chance for Glossin. Like if he does a big clad upgrade, like I'm coping. Obviously, is Miata pushing? 
Yeah, I think he's gonna push. He Arby's gonna four, grind four, Barkus four. out at Art. Dude, Arby's could have grinded Barkus out at fucking any crossbow. He could have grinded him out at. <laughs> so he could have actually <laughs> just killed him at the crossbow. Yeah. <laughs> mm. Uh, the, there's, there's. I'm on mobile. Can someone post the Prussian promos? Uh, there's. Wow, I there's. The only one that matters is logistics one. Yeah. On yeah. already. Well, you can get just you can get like double attack on any pressure unit at third promo. Yeah, so first promo is just like ten percent bonus. Second promo is either twenty five percent attack or twenty five percent defense. You pick one of those. And then third promo is double attack. Or cover or something. Yeah, there's like three of them. What if, what if we just made those all the, the default promos? I wonder what that would be like. Damn! If I'm in Miota's spot, I'm just like looking down the barrel of a gun, just being like, just shoot me in the head. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, our just taxed him so hard. His, like his position was already not great, and then that, our... that's the key is that his his position was already fucked. Yeah. I think they're gonna fight. Like, because what else is Mira gonna do? Ooh, logistic. He can't. He didn't have military academy. Oh, he doesn't have total war. Dude, I'm such a believer in like ranger logistics machine guns. I am too. They're so they're... sleeper good. Yeah. Oh my god, what the hell? We have so much land down here too. Speaking of sleeper, what's Glosson doing? Okay, he upgraded his clads. 12G is pushed into Glosson with the frigates and he just walked into the whole clad like Armada. Click Artie, you... Gonna be okay, Ashwin. Relax. I am so confused what your plans are. What's what's he what's he clicking instead? Archaeology, which is oh, he, the he's only still from tech 12G. that twelve G has <laughs> that he doesn't. That you're doing anything weird, but I just am at a loss. Dude, he's he's glossing himself. He's glossing himself. Glossing does not have schools. You know, this is where Sira would say, Well, if it works, it's the right play! <laughs> Isn't that more Miyota? No, uh, no. A lot of people would. No, that's Sira. Like, Miyota says, even though it didn't work, it was the right play. No, Sira says anything that worked was the right play. Yeah. It it's the two horsemen of analysis, the results-based analysis and the no results-based analysis. That's just what you sound like, sir. Do you, do you not hear it? Yeah. Why now? Uh, there's there's some, some potential for good trades on Glossin here, but the no schools is such an insane throw. The thing that's triggering me is not using the Admiral. Are, are Knights and oh, Miota fighting, or what's going on there? Uh, something I just see knights. rows of units. Knights done doing 600 science, um, 650 science, so. Something that is a bit strange to me. Maybe he heads to landship here? He's definitely going to beat Glossen by a mile to landship. Is Knights going to show you the light? He might. Yeah, the the turn one thirty five land shifts is gonna be very spooky. Yep. Headlights of his beautiful armor cars, but I don't know if I want to have any of that. So now what's gonna happen is Glasson's gonna try to first move, and Twelve is gonna just get all his guys out. And then Glasson's gonna get his his ironclad stuck in the deep ocean. I don't know if you can call it. I mean, as Glasson. I mean, Kufu's gonna pop. Kufu's gonna pop, but then he's it's gonna be a recap more there. I'm just worried at the. The main thing is Glasson needs to. Do something to take away pressure Jesus, from the inland cities so that he can hold tiles. Yep. He needs artillery. Like, yeah, if only there was a unit for that. 
which fish are those? This is Dude, the maritime not only not getting schools, but way, also right? not getting artillery. It's just yeah. whack, man. It's just whack. I don't think after because he thinks he's gonna steal position. artillery, right? But hey, he's not capturing a city for like five turns, and B, he's a uh... no schools turn one fifteen. No, Glosson's yeah. in his head too much that he wants to like greed and then try to steal stuff. Yep, he's so obsessed with like setting up steals. This is actually a good amount of unit mass for 12G. I wonder if uh. Yeah, but dude. Yeah, clouds autocracy are clads. Yeah. The clads are nerfed though, right? They're the nerfed, nerfed on nerf city part. damage. Yeah. So you're saying all these frigs are dead? All these frigs are dead. Well, they're they're not nerfed on city damage. Sorry, they're nerfed on movement. Yeah, it's like those clicks. Twelve G, fuck man, what a he, beast. He is a beast. This because it is probably going to set whoever is. He's not even bringing the admiral up. Tech steals over schools um, when it works. A weaker position than is that Sarah? No, that was Hawks. And it also has a chance of I mean, that's uh, old Ocean Weeby. This is old Ocean Weeby strats. It's all uh, as the ancient I, predicted. <laughs> oh, told you he's gonna die. That's um, not my assessment. Okay, he's gonna die. I take it all back. Okay, yeah. You are going to become stronger than me in the long run. I, I, don't know that's true. You're I don't know if that's true. You're a toxic. Otto is good. You heard it here first. I definitely didn't hear it here first. Yeah, you want some sort of deal. Guys, get your auto. Get your auto. Yeah. Auto Everyone's for sale. Everyone's clicking on toxic. Get text deals off Kufu, right? Kufu or dies? No, I, I, I cannot. Know. It's a CS. Yeah. It's a CS. Kufu dies, not sure about like dead in general. The option to fight you for now. I think that's, that's why I didn't accept your uh, map yeah. before. So make yeah, I, 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 this is such a suspicious attack. I'm so triggered about this Admiral. Like, these units would just die one shot faster. <laughs> mm. You dramatize a little? I mean... Never. I like both of you being relevant. Mega would never exaggerate. That if someone tries to land shift me, Molly uh, is I can recap all my cities. And I swear. <laughs> 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 what is? Yeah, it also means that we can team you after you kill Trust. True. What's going on with that war, by the way? Are you like is Glossin the one killing Twelve G or? Yeah, we're fighting. The problem is Glossen's going to get intercepted by planes soon. Yes, I do. Uh, it yeah. He, like, it's crazy. <laughs> he doesn't have the tech to compete, honestly. Oh my god, it's actually crazy how natural exactly it comes to Glossen. It's Glossen. so funny. <laughs> he should have actually taken spy steals <laughs> over so mobilization. <laughs> no joke. Uh, it would have helped us a lot, too, in, in bingo. Yep. Did that, we get that, anything that... else? We need an. I need an ac accidental whisper. Scientist decay feels like it's possible, and industrial espionage feels. I think. Like it's I possible. feel like we got coded messages. Did we? Yeah, with the gloss and trying to tribute. Yeah. That, yeah, that was them kind of yeah. deciding that they're going to team. We still don't have any teaming, by the way. It's kind of crazy. Yeah. Could there be teaming? I mean. I felt like they were supposed to team Glossen, but Glossen, Glossen has changed my mind about that. Glossen's playing the I'm so weak card. Yeah. You had to sabotage this game. I think you're going to get bomber stack. Bom but bomber stack's pretty likely, in my opinion. And then, and then I I just really need, what, what did I need again? Industrial espionage. That, there's a chance. I mean, there's a chance Barkus does it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So I think <laughs> I, I've been, uh, Barkus has been, 
just like sitting around here, right? Is Glosson so, allowed to kill 12G? What do you mean allowed? RV yeah. also isn't going already, so it's not just Glosson, but yeah, yeah. Glosson is definitely ruining it. I mean, is Glosson going to use those admirals, or is he just going <laughs> to... You know what this is? It's because, I, I, I bet you it's because people started playing Frigate Weebies again. He's like, okay, you know, I've got my Frigate Weeby experience. Wasn't I'm that gonna... like just today, or like just like, no, two days No, it's been going... Ago? No, it's been going on for like a week. Oh, okay. Yeah. He was preparing last night, though. Yeah. Okay, this actually looks like a big Admiral Hill he's setting up. Ashman gave him the Admiral, not to mention, uh, not to mention tech, and uh, now now he has to play uh, frigates. Sorry to interrupt, but not to mention, um, he also has really good chances with uh, buying an additional Admiral, so he'll always have Admiral advantage. Just pretty big yeah yeah i mean that actually do you see that that actually is a situation where bring the admiral up would have saved him a shot there's been many of those situations yeah these guys are getting like worn down i guess like a big admiral heal will fix a lot of this and yeah okay and he's just training well yeah it's probably fine like a good heal yeah this is that represented what like more than 500 health yeah maybe he just clears the stuff out is is night time gonna go into Is Knight's gonna go into what? Boston? Or is he gonna go into Miota? I feel like he has to go into Miota. Is there whispering going on? There's no whispering, unfortunately. Looks like Achilles is about to win. The, the, the thing I needed, Ashwin? No. Big Achilles fan. I'm just saying that there's no whispering in. Oh wait, like what is what does whispering mean to you? Does any communication about <laughs> I want you to do this count as whispering? Okay, you got an arrow for him, right, Miyota? I got a what now? You have an arrow for him. An arrow? Arrow. Oh, an arrow? Yeah. Oh, well, it's very oh, funny to me no, that I neither Glossin okay, <laughs> um, yeah, nor Twelve G have really fought on the land. Right. Um, I don't. I don't know the, the English, but <sighs> like Achilles every Miyota. single frigate should be getting two shot. And if they're not, Glosson's trolling. Well, I can tell you one of those things for sure. I mean, no, I know, I but I'm just, that, like, I'm just the, saying. The part that this is, like, why auto-clads like, is so insane. Isn't even the part of the foot that we called the Achilles heel today? Or something like that? Oh. I, I, don't exactly I think he also, remember, part of it is that he cross-promoted the frigs. He wanted them to land promo. Like I, don't, I don't remember. If I have an update for you. Yeah, what's that? I, I joined their Discord, and uh, the only thing they're talking about is that Achilles uh, is so okay. They're they're watching it. <laughs> yeah, Yoda is uh, saying uh, Achilles is gonna qualify, and uh... do you remember that part where you said we would be friends until the end of time? And they're talking about ways to beat Achilles in the finals. Okay, this um, Glosson has actually drove, well, driven a really nice wedge in here, so Cuckoo's dead. And this is importantly all of his units. I don't play. No, Zoc first, Glosson. Okay. You can take whatever you want. Chanka. What a nice guy. Was it Kelly's fella? Uh, I mean, 12G. I don't know. Yeah. I'm uh. Yeah, okay. Achilles too, 
So how do you put damage on these cities? You just like throw you, you can them? still cycle with uh um okay, I don't actually know this do with the things. You just Forest get counter. stuck harder? Yeah, you just get stuck. Yes. It's really annoying. Uh, you have to go uh watch the Arbius game. Do we there's an Arbius. there's an update. <laughs> what happened? Uh where where are those units going? He's, I think he's going to go push Artie into Barkus now that he... So it's just Glossin. Only Glossin is stopping me from... Everyone does he have Artie? Oh, he does. Okay. Yep. Glossin is personally griefing me. Surprised we didn't have anything on here for the labs. What is a lab? I had a lot of fun playing with friggin' BBs. My bad. I did. Friggin' player might click labs. Decided to do it again. Didn't resist. That's just feeding. I mean, it's actually really interesting what's happening here. It's not feeding anymore because you don't get full text, right? Boy's dead. Miota and Nightstone are literally like two rows deep on the front oh, and they're geez. not worrying each other. Interesting what's happening here because why did I just go unhappy? Do you identify sexually as a crab, Boston? <laughs> ah, that's why I'm unhappy. Um, Knight is almost at land ships. Can yeah, you get to yeah. boil? I think he's three turns off land ships. There's no way he's three turns off land ships. Is he actually? We got, the people are waiting for an answer. I don't think he he no. I don't think he even has um compass. Oh yeah, he doesn't have compass. You're right. There's no gold on his fish. Yeah. He's still pretty far. Was a question about your um, uh, self image. Let's put it this way. No. Is this Hermitage? Right. I got those order policies. Clearly. You guys think 400 signs is a lot? Because I kind of don't, TBH. Okay, Glasson's trying to shove the cabs in now without any artillery in backup. News, I'm currently building my observatories. What about the I'm bad. Yeah. He tried to combo click something, but he ran out of moves, and then obviously told you hits the swap. Dude, he's doing like less than 400 science turn 118. This is just like Boston throwing. If Barkus takes Autocracy 0, there's still a chance for me to fill Bingo. Yeah, Barkus is just going to die. Don't really know what Miyoto is going to do. Yeah. So whose decisions matter here? Like Nightstone and Miyota? They have the opportunity to do a lot of different stuff. Clausen's decisions mattered. They're just bad. <laughs> yeah. Hey, Miyota, Dude, come on, shoot the city there. first, then you can start cycling on it. Yeah, it's not that good. You see it? You're looking at I just need teaming, actually. For my bingo card. Do you actually? How far uh, are you? That's nice. I have, I have uh, four. Wow. You know, check, All right. Check your trade routes Dude, I, I just thought teaming was a free square. I, I don't too. know what to tell you. That's why this happened. Ah. Oh, poor 12G. Pretty valued by the frigs. 
There's just like too many shots, right? Um, he doesn't have C control. Yeah, Khufu should die. <laughs> Finally, I do an accurate prediction. I don't think 12G can even recap that well. You don't think he can recap Khufu? I don't, I don't think he can recap it well, right? Because he's only got the cannons. And Glossin can clear out the cannons with his... Uh, with his frigs. So I think that's the entire point of these like range frigs he built, was to clear out land trash. Mm -hmm. Dude, Glossin's actually trading so bad on the land. Whatever you want to say about Barkus, he did not die. Uh, yeah. dying, dying turn 120 to an attack that starts turn 74, that just, you know, that, that counts as defending. Austin, can you move off my uh, kill pile with your conquistador? Why? Sure. What do you mean why? You're standing on my forts. So? It's not like you're using them. It's not enough that trust me. So, what can knights do? So if knights goes into Glossen, Miota attacks him, and if knights goes into Miota, knights attacks him. Um, uh, he can go into Miota, right? He can go into Miota, but yeah. I don't think it helps. <laughs> yeah. Well, you know what I'm public schools? What? I'm gonna have care for Vin. You're glossing. Sure don't. You're just keeping me in check. Trying. Knights Thorn has entered the modern era. Wow, we were. Right, either. I'm here. What's up? Go to 12G and uh, 12G stream. There's an uh, interesting thing in his cap. What happened? I, mean, I see he's got oil, but... He's building Oxford. Where? Told you he's Oxfording small planes? That's actually going to kill Glossin. 100%. Oh, shit, he's got planes. Okay, never mind. Yeah. Like, Glossin can never get to um, small planes here. So he's just going to get, he's just going to lose six units a turn. Dude. It's just tragic to watch this happen to Glossin. Dude, it's it's the most glossy thing that could possibly happen. It really is. Yeah. Okay, what is going on? Uh, Glossin was clearly place. in the best position, and then he threw by doing some like clad cav attack without schools, and now he's dying to twelve G's bombers probably. Arvius still hasn't killed Barkus. People claim it's going to happen soon because Arvius finally has artillery. Uh, but Bark, it's not dead. And Neota and Nightstone are sort of staring at each other. 
that that about summarize it? And who's winning the war of the whispers? Uh, is anybody whispering? But it is turn 120. Why did Glasson? I think Auto Sim in the corner would have been correct. It's just even like Cav already would have factories into already would have been correct, right? Whatever this timing is was not correct. There were very few <laughs> losing options for Glasson. Getting the nap with the Knights was a very good play. Yeah. He's getting really out traded here. Which is fucked because he's auto. Yeah. And he's pushing without Artie. I don't know. He has no Artie and he has no planes. All right. Now who's winning the game? Probably the goat. God, I can't take it. I can't take it. Freedom too strong. <laughs> I how does how do these things happen? Maybe it's Miota. I'm gonna go watch Miota. Miota won't make me. Maybe it's Night's Dawn. You know what else is surprising is that nobody's dead yet. That I is guess, like, surprising. Barkus not being dead as a function of Arvius really fucking up his attack. It looks like Barks is going to be dead soon because Artie is just killing everything. This game is definitely more dynamic than the first one. This game has no intention of fucking stopping anytime soon either. Barks just lost Victoria 3. I think he's accepted defeat. He, uh, he PM'd me. I think I'm just going to go watch a movie. <laughs> like, <laughs> like, I don't know what he's supposed to do here, right? Like, I respect it. Yeah. He's done his job. He's, he's done more than his job. Like, actually, though, what the fuck is Glossin doing? He's just fucking up. He's just... Look, we talked about this. He's he's a throw master. A part of me was like, you know, no, there's no way that he'd do that again for the millionth fucking time. And yet. And, <laughs> and yet. yet. The longest tourney game happened this tournament. Dude, he's being so shredded, bombers. Oh my god. Which game was that? I don't know, but I know it went like turn like 230 or something. I thought it was last tournament. No, a uh, new record with this one. He's Which game actually... is that? Getting the shit trade out. I, I don't so know. I, I just know that one went like to two thirty. I don't see that in the. If you look at my chat logs on Discord, in uh, in the attorney Discord, I should say like something like that's a new record or something like that. Yeah, Glossman is actually gonna die. Okay, every, all of his stuff is going to die. He what Maybe if he family? really blitzes hard, he can take Kohaido once. But he's going to get out plane valued. And he's like oh, infinitely far from schools, right? You mean planes? Yeah. Still three turns from schools. With plane? no tech steal coming up, except like possibly Kohaido. The longest tournament game, according to the spreadsheet, is 158. Right? That's just incorrect. That's uh, not right. I don't go to the, sp to the spreadsheet. Wait, what Fine, did I'll you check. enter? You also entered the fight? There was one with like Kel, Molly, and Ruler. I think that's the longest one. Yes, what? But, oh, I guess I just didn't get vision on the city. I was like, why does, don't any of the cities have railroads on? They actually do. Never mind. Actually, the Braxis game is just not in this spreadsheet. He... I don't know. Holy shit, turn 114. 214? 214, sorry.
results. It was on March 18th. Yeah, that's on the spreadsheet. <laughs> Fucking ruler G spot again. No one is surprised. I'm surprised you won. It says 103 for that game actually on the spreadsheet. Okay, it's okay. definitely a, a super late one because I was watching that one. I mean, it <laughs> says it in the write up that it's 214. Yeah, game 25, 103 on the spreadsheet is it's just wrong. Okay. You should fix yeah. that, Ryan. You're the spreadsheet wizard. No, Sierra's a spreadsheet wizard. He's been making me really fucking good spreadsheets for this. Dude, he's gonna lose everything. He's actually just gonna. And he's gonna get Kohido. Is he? Yeah. I guess he only uses four. Loses four units. I can't believe the turn 114 Ironclad attack didn't work out. Is Klassen still on schools off uh, Kito? Uh, he's teching schools. So if he does, he's only stealing two turns of tech. It's really brand different deals. Okay. Didn't I give you one earlier? Doesn't matter. I'm at 27 and a half. Well, that was for a king's day, not for free happiness. Yeah, free what is he doing? Not Does, that like the best to be giving Mr. Glossin right now. Does um Kuko Kano's war over CS? No. There was war over CS in the very beginning. I don't know if it was actually yeah, war over CS, but um nah. he uh <laughs> like Arvius killed twelve G. Yeah, scout. that counts in the CS borders. Yeah. Like, I think they were fighting over a worker. So that would count. There's no recap for it, right? Man, this is so depressing. Alright, Knight thinks he has land ship in two. I don't even know if I can kill him here. It's just, I, I don't have room to push in. He's buying profits for the timing. Yeah, imagine if Glosson had schools and did this timing, the exact same timing, and then didn't die. That'd be crazy. We still top hammers, I guess. Oh man, what a what a glossing moment. Okay, let's go check on other people. Miota heading towards landship, but he's there pretty slow. Bark is waiting for death. Because uh, all the arty are on him now. Glossin doing glossin stuff, taking flight. Arf, going for Labs. Oh my god. Night's done is probably land ships in two. Yeah, I think I, I think that about hits everyone. Yeah, this game is such a mess. We're, just, we're all like so depressed right now. Oh yeah. I mean, I'm also just kind of sleepy. You know, I didn't get uh true, true. Didn't get my twelve hours that I need per day. Now the Achilles game isn't over yet. Yeah. 
Yeah, if if Miota defends this Earth, it's actually gonna win. Do you know how the Europeans conquered North America? I was like settlers. Then everyone will be saying, "Yeah, his decision to go night expo and well, fail was and completely justified because it made the other players more likely to worry each other." And then made him safe to go labs, right? And I'll scream into the void. Don't worry, I'll scream into the void anyway. That's true. Little encampments. They're forced out. And now a lot of uh, modern Native Americans, they, they spend a lot of their time drinking. I don't think Nightstone can win this. Is that kind of like you guys right now? Like your, your empire? You guys just... I don't know. I think he can. He has a, he has There's a little bit of Kuba going. vibes here, right? Which is like, he actually makes some science and then try to push into autocracy and then you just die. The roleplay is um, it's great today. I'm very happy. Well... I, I don't know if, like, Watson or 12G can recover from their position. Is there something up with that? I don't know. I just thought it worth mentioning. Man, Glossin's units are just getting deleted. Ooh, Knights is about to hit natural G. Yeah, I'm doing Stop that. doing that! Is that Glossin yelling? Okay, yeah, I can tell. Natural GA. It's all part of the plan. This is what he's been waiting for. I guess I had expected you. Boston demos are still good, but his tech is so fucking awful. That somehow keeps happening, huh? And you're saying you did this because of a past game? No, I was completely fucking with you. Is, uh, is Achilles about to win his game? What happened to Glossin's tech? Achilles has been about to win his game for the past, like, hour. You've been hard to kill. I go, would Achilles to wear headphones? Um, what do you mean? You... You know, what happened to Glossin's tech? Glossin went... Yeah, factories I, I into steam me. power and calves and frigates and never tech schools and now he is infinitely far away from every relevant tech and he did all of this for exactly two cities one of which was a cs he liberated and he didn't tech already so he couldn't kill anything that's what happened to glossin's tech no yeah, I couldn't yeah, do it. So you Most of the did. I love how the more snow drying gets, the more he just like steps away from the computer, and just leaves it out, and he's like, "Yeah, whatever." No, <laughs> something, something probably happening. That's exactly what's happening. <laughs> yeah. I was just like, I don't want to fucking like, dude. Like, this is just sad. Like, everything yeah. about this game is sad, from everyone's perspective. Like, I'd be fine cheering for Arbius if he didn't make such fucking bad decisions. I'd be happy to cheer for fucking Miota if he didn't, like, also make bad decisions or, like, have a fucking better game. I don't think, I don't think Miota made bad decisions. He just I got, think he like, could have uh, killed Arbius with Barkus. Barkus would have been here, yeah. and he would have been in ahead. So yeah, that's something. And but. his position wouldn't have changed, really, okay. from where it is now. Maybe he'd be a little more behind. Yeah, I don't think Maybe. But... I don't think Knights is yeah, able to kill him. Marcus is not mental to me. Marcus is yeah, Marcus is just dumb. Like and just endlessly slam into me. Achilles won. Congrats, Achilles. What are these guys? I will say, about? of all the lobbies, I think the first lobby was the weakest. Really? With yeah. Lucas and Achilles and Zuzo? But it's just it's just those three. Those guys are so good, though. I mean, yeah. Just have an endless amount of units. Who else is there? I. Gaffa. Gaffa was in that game. Oh yeah, Gaffa. Never mind. Yeah, wonder, wonderful. 
I, I think it's, I think it's a good lobby. I think, it's a good I think lobby they're all really good lobbies. That was the first thing yeah. I said. I think the, I, I said to them before they started, I'm like, I think honestly all these lobbies are really well balanced. Hmm. No, I didn't expect that. Oh, how? Boston just says these AFK units. Boston might be mental doomed. He said he's been, he was checked no, out earlier. I, said. I, he's I know that was a meme, always... but like I kind of think he's serious. Dude, he's always like doing some stupid shit, and he's like, ah, I don't really care about that, you know? Like... True. Yeah, true. I had, I had no question. I would just die. I think the Barkus Smoge uh, bingo card thing is can be uh, checked off now if anyone is uh, keeping track. Dude, we could we could check that off a while ago. Maybe you should I you was it really? Uh, get him in here. All right, I'll go get him in here. Okay. Also, deal. You gotta always gotta, go for right. the post-game interview. interview. So where's Knights going with his land ships? I mean, he he's gotta go into another uh, area. Yeah. Who's got Hemeji? Was that Knights? Uh, Knights don't have Knights. Hemeji. Yeah, so I thought. Or he's just going to go play Victoria. No, 50-50. Okay, so how's Arvius's position, actually? Freedom 2. There's no ratio. He finally picked up these... Um, Barkus cities. His base science is pretty low. His gold is strong. Um, I think he's dead. Dead to who? Dead to either Miota or Nightstone. If if Knights fails his push, that's how Arbius gets back. Yeah, Cushy, were you Cushy, were you watching this Arbius war? It's definitely some some goat material. To be in the winning position after uh, after the forty turn war, that's so only the goat can do that. Only the goat, you know. Glosson certainly could pull that off. <laughs> oh my god! So, do we do we see where Night Sun is going, or are we still completely unaware? Well, he's upgrading on Miyota's borders right now. Hell yeah. Hell. So if it's not... any indication of this game, probably to Glossen. <laughs> For whatever reason, there's no whispering going on right now. Yeah, I, that's I very be, strange. I, I, I was expecting Miyota to be screaming at nights. Maybe he just wants out. <laughs> I, think I mean, they all Miyota... want out, except No, Arby's. Miyota's such a tryhard. I've never seen Miyota, like, Stop trying, right? He's always, 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 always trying to. And, and Miyota loves these, this type of game, right? Like the the chaotic, like yeah. No one Miyota has no gold. He's actually dead. Oh, okay. GG. Yeah, he can't upgrade a single unit. Uh, I mean, auto calves. If he has enough combat bonus, you. Dude, can just come on! There's only one sieve in the game that can do that. Two or three minutes left in the turn when I upgraded. Shoshone? No. I think Shoshone can do that. I don't think Shoshone can do it. Maybe, upgrade Maybe if they have oh, Defender Hand and Menji. But even then. There's a couple sims that could do it. but th It's think, it's mostly it's just Morocco. I think Shoshone, because the calves are cheaper, right? It's Bolivia. Oh yeah, Bolivia doesn't even need calf. No, I'm talking just with calf. What, I, whatever the point is, I think like with enough combat bonus, you can like you just like gum up the land ships and make yourself some money. 
Okay. Oh, okay. There's the whispers that I was yeah. expecting. Yeah, there's the whispers as well. I mean, Knights of Science is really good for, like, Rel the Lobby. I don't know. It, it depends on, like, how this 12G Glossom War shakes out. I'll give you back your city. Oh, Glossom's Glossom Glossom piecing. Yep. Is, uh, is 12G going to go for it, or is he actually... What's 12G's play now? Um, Bill Arby's? Wait for a timing to kill Glossom there, something like that. I mean, you're only going to make us both weaker against Glossom. I am not pushing 12G. He has planes, and I am hemorrhaging units. It doesn't matter. Like, you're still insanely high hammers. And just... I, I think whispers is a phrase which here means talking in all chat. Um, no, this is... You're still insanely high hammers, high hammers and you're talking to Whispers is trying to like get someone to sway someone's uh, decision making process. And that right? is definitely what Miyota is doing right now. There's a good push that stops working when he got planes. Blossom's coping so hard. Aren't whispers not allowed? No, so we're when we're saying whispers, we're saying it in the sense of like talking to each other and trying to get them to do something rather than literally like P dming if that makes sense what what is glossin even gonna do here yeah thanks everyone for the follows i will be sure to uh never mind i, I can't lie <laughs> uh how do i how do i get barkus on the team speak uh send him the thing it's just the it's just the link, right? Yeah. I will say, I think of all the positions to play, I think Barkus's was pretty hard. Yeah. And Knights is playing this Liberty Star pretty well. Like, we all kind of said in the beginning, like, not sure if Liberty is the right play here, you know? And I, I think he's kind of... He's kind of doing a pretty good job with it. Obviously, this game's not great, but it's definitely not bad. Yeah. He's clicking really well. Is he? Knights? Is Mirror just dead? Knights has great clicks. Like, he's comboing, is what I mean, Ashwin. Yeah. yeah. If if he generals, um, I don't think he has one. But I would general to cross that river. I think he could do pretty well. Is it possible for me to get this tech this turn? It looks close. Um. He doesn't yeah, have any way to get it, right? Does he have Iron Fist? Iron Fist is tier 2, right? See how all your land chips are dying to my yeah, it's tier 2. Right? Um, Do you think Iron Fist should be tier 2, Elite Force is tier 1? I mean, uh, right, vice versa? Yeah. I think I Elite Force is so broken. Like, It but, definitely should be. <laughs> dude, I think Elite Force should be tier 3. I'm not joking. No. That shit's so much better than Cloudy. <laughs> Like, maybe you want to keep, like, sort of uh, signpost policies at tier 2. Like, that's where Factory Science goes. That's where Total War goes. But Elite Forces is literally, like... Ashwin. Yeah? yeah? You play Weeby, right? I, How I often do. do you take Elite Forces over Total War? Uh, I, 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 take, I would take Elite Forces over Clousy. That's what I'm saying. I would, too, but... And I would actually take Total War over Cloudy. <laughs> Maybe tier three policies are just bad. Honestly, I was about to say that. I don't think yeah. they're not like. I mean, they're good for what they're doing. Yeah. Like order and freedom. Tier threes allow for win conditions. <laughs> okay. Uh, Barkus is coming. Barkus is in. Oh, yeah. I like how Miata's trying to 
whisper uh, nights off this one. <laughs> User joined your channel. All right, welcome to the welcome to the smoke zone. Okay, wait, I have to yeah. get the microphone and uh, speakers set up. Give me a second. Yeah, I mean, that looks pretty dead. You just didn't have money and doesn't have gold or doesn't have relevant units, so rip Miota. Okay, I can hear now. Can All you right. say something? Uh, how'd you feel about your game? Uh, yeah, great. It was definitely one of the best games I ever played. Uh -huh. I loved the uh, love the spears into pikes. Into... Oh, actually, this is worth. Con you defended you. the the crossbow knight really well. Like Korea was in chat. Korea was like popping off. Korea was like, "That's my guy." That's very nice. Thank yeah. you. Yeah, like I think the most, uh, like the only thing that's really worth talking about was the part before the uh, sixty turns gear war. Um, you played the general war very well as well. Yeah. Uh, I think that went pretty well. Like once the generals were done, it was really basically unpushable. I mean, yeah, Irv kind of threw that. Yeah, I don't really know why he threw the citadel there. Um, I guess he felt he had a significant general advantage, which for a moment he did. But then when I had like when I matched him in general count, when I got my third one as well, it kind of screwed him. Like he basically had to kill me before I got my third citadel out. Yeah, and Bart, he sh should have been able to. He just. I he wanna. I wanna ask about other stuff. I mean, the war was interesting, but by that point, it was kind of like already kind of fucked, right? Like. Yeah. Um. What do you think that Lib was the right decision there? And if not, what do you think was? And then also, um, how did you think your game turned out? Uh, do you regret doing anything specifically? Like, what? How would you yeah. have changed in hindsight? Yeah, that was probably um, not the best call there. I think I might have done some archer honor. Um, it's like it's just that like I had two relatively close flatland uh, CS, so I definitely could have done archers. It's just that I saw them a little too late, and at that point my mind was already set to lip, even though I could have still pivoted into sure. archering. Uh, nevertheless, I think lip turned out fine here. I think I'd like. What was it? Seven decent cities. It's just that the land that I had in general, I think I think I had like really good Sioux land. I had so many TPs, but I didn't really have many hammers. I didn't have any hills in my land, and yeah. I was just bound to be lowest hammers. Yeah, I think. I think, uh, biggest, I, I, I think I, your I, biggest I, issue was just the ampies, right? No, you were no, queuing I all the ampies. I don't think that. I don't think that's the issue, biggest issue. I think. I don't think I really finished many of them. Yeah, you could have. I think Lib. I think you turned Lib into something pretty good. Um, your game was obviously a lot slower than you were hoping, just because those really far to the right cities came down as late as they did, right? Um, yeah. But I, I think a lot of us were thinking on our first. Did you consider moving? Um, or a second? Yeah, I, I considered moving one left. Yeah, mm -hmm. which exactly. Would have um, like given me the first ring hill, which was also guaranteed to be my iron. Yep. Um, I don't really know why I decided against it. I think it had less growth tiles or something. Yeah, I, I I don't think it was. By the way, I'm not asking this in the sense that we think that's right. I, I think we were just considering it and wanted to see if you were talk, thinking about it as well. Yeah, um, I, I I thought you played oh, the lib gosh, part you. pretty well. I think the sim up was fine. It was just like slow which obviously sucks for liberty yeah um i really liked you you saw the lip settler was going to go in the wrong place and you like micro the workers that the yeah, that lip settler good. spawns and pops across the river yeah Very i nice. felt like a pro doing that <laughs> yeah yeah um i think the the main thing that i Tournament games don't really need to be insane right if you yeah, have an yeah, insane yeah. game you're gonna get team so Having a decent game is good enough, and I think the one thing that I am like asking myself is what I could have done to deter RBS from attacking me. If like going straight into crossbows when I saw that someone's in guilds like Miota did was, would have been the better call. I think. So here, 
Miota, I, I, I'm not convinced that Miota was never the target. Okay, like if Miota had nothing, I think Arvius would have just said fuck it. Oh, right? for sure. But Miota had a ton, like he had a lot. Um, yeah. And I think when you knew that he was like trying to, when you knew when Miota said that, here's a road like he's coming. And he didn't declare war, or he, like, like no, nothing was dying, right? Like, Miyota wasn't like saying like, "Oh, he's killing me" type of thing. Like, at that point, like you have to, you have to say to yourself, "Something's up." Yeah, this is weird, and I, and I think this is easier said from like our perspective where we have perfect information, right? Um, but even we had perfect information, we were still debating. Like, is it, like, is he going to fight Miyota? Yeah. Holy yeah. Asher was debating. It's, I'm a member of this conversation. We were debating it. Yeah. It was just, it was just something that we were thinking about because it feels like, um, when, when you're in that spot, the only thing you can do realistic. So I, I there's two things to this one. I think civil was a bait, um, Mm -hmm. I think you you like definitely needed the hammers, like yeah. that. that now obviously you got a ton of food, and it made your game better, but you weren't gonna get Chichen. Um, so I yeah that that was the first thing. The second thing is I I didn't like your religion that much. Um, I think zeal on Sue is like silly, um, mm. especially because I, you never got there. But when you get Theo it doubles your faith per turn. Yeah, that's true. So that was, that was another thing. I, I thought we, I, I would have personally picked honor there. Uh, in hindsight though, I don't know how much help it would have been. You're next to fucking Arvius and 12 G all of who, both of which are honor. Um, uh, I think you were very, very lucky because you one turned knights on pyramids. And the yeah, only reason you even one turned him is because he just didn't chop anything. Cause he's Iroquois. <laughs> yeah, Iroko is pretty good. Bad at getting pyramids, right? Yeah, but but either way, like I, I thought I thought your game like looked pretty good, and I think all of us agreed that you did a really really good job of of holding um, holding Arbius. I think the only criticism would be like you built so many pikes, and it's not necessarily yeah. a bad thing because you didn't have any GPT um, to upgrade comps, right? So that was kind of useless. But maybe you could have built like a couple horses or something to help kill crossbows. But either way, I think you did a good job. And I, I was, I think we were all really impressed that like, you know, Arbius is one of the best war players in the game. And you made him fucking take 30 or 25 turns to realize that he's not ever pushing through. And then, yeah. 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 Thank you. Uh, um, do you have any questions, Ashwin? Or maybe? Nope. I think you covered. All right. Uh, thank you for the interview. Um, <laughs> it's, and it's enjoy to... casting. We're enjoying all right. Yeah, we're definitely <laughs> not killing ourselves. But that's... Uh, Barkus, before you leave, yeah. Um, what turn do you think this game is going to end? That's a good question. Um, I didn't really look at the game state. Uh, I think, yeah, I don't know, maybe... I'm coping, and that's why I'm saying that Arvius is yeah. in a better spot than people think. Um, but he's just sitting in the corner, and no one is paying attention to him, right? Yeah, we, we, are, we all like Arvius' spot. I think it's just... It depends on how well Knights pushes into Miota here. Yeah, I didn't really... Ooh, pay Knights has real tanks. But I, th I think it's not going to be like a 200 turn stock. I think someone is underestimating someone's position here, and then they win. Do you think like a 150, 160? One, 170. I'm gonna go okay. with 170. And uh, you think it's gonna be uh, CC or uh, Dom or? Yeah, some. Yeah, definitely. I mean, it's not gonna be tourism. We know that for sure. So. <laughs> exactly. It's not gonna be tourism. It's probably not gonna be Diplo. So. Yeah, exactly. So Diplo it's gonna be Dom. Yeah. Yeah. So 170. Up, Thanks for the raid. How did you know it was guaranteed iron? Uh, so the way the map um, generates is that in your first two rings, there's always an iron tile and it's always on a hill. 
So if you only have one hill in your first two rings, you know it has to be the ram. Okay, uh, I'm going to go then. Yep, thanks cast. for coming on, Bark. Yeah, anytime. Bye. See ya. Oh, uh, that's sad. That's fucking Pentagon Engineer of all time. Knights is order, Panda. Also, Korea, I was with you the whole time. I don't know what you were... It's not just you, buddy. I, I was with you. Did gloss in in 12 GPs? Yes. No, I wasn't. What are you talking about? Game one was nine hours. Yeah, that's fucking crazy. Nita looks pretty dead. Yeah. He, he's still uh, coping, though, and trying to convince uh, the 12 uh, nights that it's a mistake to go into him. He hasn't said anything for a while. Maybe he's just done. This is kind of me at a curse, right? Like Zuzo. Just... You lost to you lost to you lost to Achilles, buddy? Yeah, as I understand it, three way late games, you're so Lucas, Achilles, and Achilles just manhandled them. Achilles smurfed. As he does. Yeah, Danzig is dead. And then... Yeah, like, Miyota just has nothing. Holy shit, that's actually nothing. I mean, he's playing tall, he's behind in everything. He shouldn't ever have a chance to defend here, you know? Mm-hmm. Mm, he has combat bonuses. I guess not that many. I, <laughs> I messed up one turn really bad. I was eating when this kid moved in 10 rocket arties. <laughs> that is the most Lucio <laughs> sentence I've ever seen. If, if there was a burger <laughs> reference, that would really clinch it. <laughs> oh man, that's so funny. Arv killed Barkus at Artie. Yeah. Yeah. It uh it took a while. It took a while. Like fifty uh, turns. The classic I mean, knights and expos in his schools into uh, Artie. The real staple of the game. <laughs> Art can definitely win here. Um Glossin and Tolji. Glossin did the stupidest timing of all time. And it didn't work for some reason, and <laughs> they won't peace. Wait, I thought they did peace. No, they're still at war. It was um, factories into frigates into ironclads without schools and never teching arty and never teching schools. And then going right into fucking archaeology. I can still move. He stole one tech. Was Arvius farming? That's what all the Arvius fans were saying, Keck. You know, farming is a is a bannable offense. Oh, twelve G offered. What? I think maybe twelve G counter offered with Kohito and Glosson wouldn't give it back or some stupid shit like that. No, Glosson offered the city. Oh, okay. Why isn't Lawson burning it? I don't know. He's making science for him. This lobby looks pretty ape. It's really fucking stupid. How's Knights Miura going? I think Knights is winning. Miura um, just on there. They, Knights was just kind of shitting on him, so I kind of went. Well, away. Miura's kind of making some like autocracy line, right? Like Knights' land ships are thinning and they're not trading as well. But, but... now Knights is just going to start pumping planes. Yeah. Too many NA players in one game. Yeah. NA monkeys win. Autocracy is gone. Um, Miota went honor because no. Arvius was shooting him. And he really wanted to be commerce. 
And he went Patcher zero because he wanted Forbidden. Uh, I think Forbidden pickup for Miedo was probably good. Like, he's happy. He was. I don't really understand happy why kept. his happy was so bad. Uh, yeah, his game is shit. Like, yeah, I mean, Glosson we had I, the best yeah. fucking game. Oh, For yeah, anyone who's like so new strong. here, Glosson's game was crazy. Like, a, like actually, just that crazy. And then he just fucking threw it away. When when Knights decided to go into Miota, right? That was such a free win for you guys laughed, but Glossin. Arbius's tax move basically eared Miota. It, it, it no. eared himself out. That was the, the thing that we were criticizing. Yeah, Ar <laughs> like Miota's play was to then team Arbius. Like Miota, the only way Miota gets out of that hole is by like him and Burkus teaming yeah. Arbius. Like that's why I was laughing because I'm like. You watch all these games and everyone's just teaming each other, and then you have Barkus and Miota, two of the two like two most team friendly people in the fucking world, and then they don't team Arvius. So weird. Swords feed piety plus shit land. I don't think his land's that bad. It's obviously not good. I think he griefed by not settling Stetton and um, Berlin on fucking coast. Uh. What you think it should it shouldn't be coastal? Where are the resources? I mean, I just uh, yeah. I I Shetan went on a Lux, right, which is good, and um, I am maybe the cargo is just worth it. The Whisper Ban nerfs more people than others. Dude, Night Sun is out of frontline. What? He's out of frontline. Is Arvius gonna win? He's building this too game? many planes is kind of what's happening. Was this a good idea, dude? Oh, oh my now, god. Now 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 I'm yeah, talking shit. Oh here we go. You're this is when you're supposed to talk shit, right? It's exactly when the other guy fucks up hard and you're like, why did you think this would work? Yeah. But maybe I'm wrong. Oh my god. Dude, it's actually happening. <laughs> Arvius is gonna win. I go for some stew. Did you eat anything all day? No, I, I literally woke up and. Dude, go get food. The computer. Like get Uber Eats or something. I'm not getting Uber Eats. What is? What am I like a? It's such a millennial thing to do. What? Uh, yeah. First of all, you are a millennial. I'm not a millennial. Are you 97? Uh, I'm December 96. So you are a millennial. I'm not a millennial. You fucking account. bitch. You are a millennial. I'm, I'm 97. I'm the start. <laughs> <laughs> the point is... <laughs> you know, that's actually how Zuso lost his game. was eating food. That's a, I'm, I'm learning my lesson. Oh, okay. Got it. Well, Jess is making... <laughs> the strategic money. fasting. Exactly. That's, that's how I won that... Uh, that tournament game. Yeah, it was Hungry Ashwin, right? Yeah. Dude, Hungry Ashwin is literally a demon. Yeah. Fuck. Um, is um how many how many bombers does Nice Sun have? Three? Mm, that's not that many. He 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 could lose a city. Dude, this is the quietest I've ever heard Glossin. Yeah, because like, he knows he fucked up. Like, like, like ever. <laughs> oh, man. Now, I don't understand why he's trying to push in currently. He's supposed to chill until he gets real units. Especially, like, in... I guess he has triplanes. Yeah, he just shot down a bomber. Okay. He's just shooting the city with bombers. It's fine. Okay, okay. All right, I'm going to go eat dinner real quick. Um, Where should I leave it? Um... Probably nice POV. Yeah. Nice. Okay, cool. That's where I am right now. All right, I'll be right back. I think Knights can lose this, actually. His, all of his land ships are, like, low health or they're dead. And Miyota's guys are trading really well. 
Nice thing. You want to move your plans? You're just trying to uh, get out of this war. I don't know. I think this is uh... no, only going to make it suffer once. I don't know. I feel like I, feel like I would need to think about it, but we're not allowed to roll. roll. Uh, I mean, if, if you're okay, okay with it, we can just say we're only going to start the next step, step like, two like two minutes. Like two minutes. Yeah, yeah, you need time, time to think about it. About it. But, but obviously, obviously like, like, you know, you know would be would kind be of cringe, cringe to just, like, move like, planes out, out and then, then say, oh, no, I'm not doing that. that. <laughs> uh, <laughs> so, yeah. So, yeah. We go in by the honor, go in by the honor, honor system here, honor for, system us. here for us. I also, I also have, have my own system, system, system. So, in case that, that helps, helps you decide, decide at all. Mm. So much for you in this game. Man, I feel like you have so little. Is the stream uh, echoing that bad, or it's just doing much here to you? I mean, you've se you've seen how the last turn or two have gone, right? Like, you can kill me here, I'm sure, but it's going to cost you way too much to win after. You already crushed me. Nightstone's moment bad. of you reckoning. Want you want to keep fighting? Yep. Okay. I know this looks very rough for knights. Where the fuck did my Gatling go? So unit count, Miyota has six artillery well, there, there goes and some planes for the bingo card. Wait, who lost a plus plane stack? Knights lost two planes. Uh, he lost one. I don't. I don't think one is a stack. Did he get the one out? He got one he got out. One. Hey, Glossen. Hi. Sorry. What do you think I'm, about I'm arbitering knights down with the. Me? I'm not even close to the bingo. Fighting, uh... Doesn't count. <laughs> well, maybe you can hmm. start fighting him and like. That would be said. his prerogative, not mine. I mean, the more the merrier, you know, maybe 12 to 1. Help out. Oh, oh fucking Yoda. <laughs> Man, you really hurt Yoda. Like, I was considering making peace. 12 G's gonna lose a stack. 12 G's not gonna lose yeah. a stack, right? Um, I'm chilling, doing whatever the fuck. So, Glossin, like, what technically could set up a capture peace, on you said we're gonna keep fighting, so a duelist, fighting, right? but there's two yeah, units like, on top I of it. It doesn't really look possible. I wanted to peace out or not. No, but like this is you, you can't just be like, oh, it, it actually is possible to see guys turn, but then do it like a turn yo tell me turn. tell me when to like no. adjust yeah, I mean, i'm not gonna ask for these players like more. the screen if you want so like what do you mean you know, I, I, like, mean, like just swap the like who should i watch fully within my rights um just, like, you, can, you can go watch gloss and 12g right now there's some interaction <laughs> yeah, i mean that's fine like you can try to convince them but i don't think they should do you see what gloss is doing <laughs> What is Glossin? Is he buying planes? No, he's doing the Ryan Kryptonite strat. Good lord. What's that? Spamming conquistadors for capture units. Oh my god. You know, Glossin could have won the game even attacking 12G if he come with like factories and RD instead of this completely stupid steam power cav push. Steam power frigates cavs. What even is that, man? Yeah. Everyone's playing some unique uh, timing pushes this game. Yeah. It's full NA monkey. It is honestly full NA monkey. I, I can't move. I can't fucking move again. I crashed. Um, oh my god. Yes. 
You know, this is the type of game Barkus would win. I mean, if the or not Barkus, uh, Dirtback would, would win. This is the type of game Arbius would win. Did Gloss and Crash? Yeah. It's all good. Uh, Ryan, you still here? You need to swap the screen. Oh, he already did. Great. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, you can see that, like, theoretically, Glossin could set up a capture here, right? Like, he needs to clear the Ironclad and the Musket, and the Water Unit doesn't Zock, right? Um, the the Embark Scout. So, you need something like, I would say, five shots. Mm, doesn't seem great. He has two frigs. Three frag shots. Yeah. Those probably do what? 15 damage to the ironclad? Yeah, so I guess your frigs want to shoot the clad and the musket, and then you want to bomb down the city. It requires a 12G uh, to be AFK, though. Yeah. 12G well known to miss all of his clicks. Yeah. Your yeah. 12G has land ships. Ugh. I have lost so many units. Who do you think is the next person to die? Miyota? Miyota. Is Miyota dying? I wasn't uh wasn't aware the of the world, situation. I was a he looks dead. He looked dead last time and then he yeah. pulled it out. I guess he has what? Open one the stream, he's dead. Yeah, I see one land ship and two right coming now. out next turn. I see Knight's Dawn has three anti tank guns and uh, a is, Yeah, so Mira's probably dead. And then I just decided, all right, this is what it is. I sent you deal three times. <sighs> what? Arvius is, um, three times. Doing 650 signs. Why did I not get that? Yeah. Am I feeling so stupid? hard. Let me get that turn 132 replaceable. He's, he means to say yes. Yeah, it's uh, all it's all happening. I'm so sorry. Okay, well, yeah, I'm fucking stupid. I'm so sorry. Uh, I, right, night's I, done. Does this change anything for where you? Where do you think Night's done goes after he kills Miyota? Does he just keep walking right? Try to find a squishy target? Austin, wouldn't you like to see the downfall of Miyota? Uh, Can I, you go to space? I also don't. I'm not think he can't keep going? Not, this is not, this is not the can't he go to space? In four player yeah. game with seems rough. He's not in the middle. Well, I guess he kind of would be. He's like when you bring literally oh, everyone. Oh, okay. So Knights is dead? I'm so sorry, 12G. I had not realized. Glossin's uh, going less or something? Oh, wow. You, Glossin. Glossin going labs would be such a fucking Glossin like, move. The whole reason it would be such a Glossin move. Was... You know what he's going to try to do right now? He's going to try to kill nice. Nightstone while clicking labs. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry about that. Also, a Maybe he goes battleships and tries again on 12G. <laughs> <laughs> he's going labs. I'm thinking radio, man. <laughs> like, that's... He doesn't want to make the tech cheaper for Arbius. I see. Yeah, imagine if people were making techs cheaper for Arbius. And turn 131. Uh, there's some degree to which he kind of wants to say he okay. He Blossom wants somebody to kill Arvius, right? So if you're Blossom, you want to um, you want to kill Nightstone and you want Bulgy to kill Arvius, uh, and you want to kill Nightstone after Night Skills uh, Miata. Wait, 12G's Commerce 5 with 50 GPT? That's so gross, man. 48 GPT Commerce 5. Absolute yuck. In GA. He just didn't trading foe stuff, I guess. Yeah, this could have been a lot more gold. He just doesn't have any trading posts. What do I need? So if we get, did we get coded messages? We did, right? From the naps. Yeah, I can win did. bingo we did. We did. if turn one sixty plus happens. Mm. 
Glossin couldn't even tax his neighbor. How's he going to tax the goat? You wanna put the stream on nights on, Ryan? <laughs> yeah, this is a this is kind of an interesting play. He's literally just frontlining his anti tank guns. I don't think Miyota has an answer to that. Lawson gonna try to steal labs. Yeah, I mean, Knights is a Knights's position is okay. It I don't know what Glossen's doing. Oh my God, Arvius is getting turned one thirty nine laps. <laughs> Holy shit! You guys think that was still a good idea? Or... Yeah. It, All right, cool. Look, he he hasn't been attacked, right? It's um, if he had played better, he would have gotten teamed. It would have been terrible for him. It's imperative to his game plan that he get laps this turn. He, he calculated it. This is the only. This is the earliest turn where he doesn't get instantly teamed. He predicted this. He predicted this turn seventy-two, and everything mm -hmm. since then has been in service of that goal. I believe it. Yep. Knights is in Dan's the best position. Not gonna lie. Uh, it depends. It really depends. I don't think Knights is in the best position, but... Obvious, where's your statue? He's got good science. He did already use, um... Oxford. Oxford. Glosson did not. Yeah, maybe if Glosson had used Oxford, he'd be on two empires instead of, uh, having Oxford. Well, I think the problem with that logic is that one of those things is guaranteed and the other one's not, right? So, like... He yeah. could have a guaranteed option of still having Oxford. <laughs> <laughs> Did you think about it like that? Probably not. I wasn't thinking about it like that. Thank you, Ryan. You're you welcome. really yeah. brought into my horizon. No, you're right. right. See, okay. like sometimes you just need a second opinion. Yeah, this is gonna change the way I play. So. <laughs> um. Yeah, I really like this this kind of frontline anti tank gun play. From Knights Dawn, I think it's you just need some space for his artillery to shoot. Yeah. And you don't really want to be trading your your order land ships versus their auto land ships. Also, like if he takes Enzig, it's gonna be pretty hard for Miyota to fight over that city. He needs to flip Mamel if he can. He has the happy, right? And I think he has party leadership here. Not hundred percent sure. What? He took party leadership? I said I wasn't 100% sure. <laughs> How does Knights have a total of two units? He lost them, actually. With pushing into other people's landships on their roads, especially their autocracy, it's just hard. There it is. The goat's going to win this, isn't he? He's, he's, his chances he, are good. His chances are pretty good. Yeah. Look at the discipline. Why did Look he at do him. it then? Uh, this game is so weird. Dude, fuck. You're so critical after you make such <laughs> awful mistakes. Like, it's crazy. Yeah, tell it, tell him Ryan, speak it to him. <laughs> oh man, this is uh... okay. And <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I, I I think Knights is about to lose this wave of units. I mean, yeah, that's not looking pretty. When in, in like. 
in these situations where you're constantly like each side is saving a bunch of units because no one's really got like a bunch of like you know um enough power to just push in yeah right mm -hmm. just favors auto so fucking much yeah i mean it's also just a function of knights down not like building up a lot of unit mass he's I mean, he's got no oil oh shit oh okay yeah that'd do it that explains the ac tank guns actually i thought that was on purpose but that's just because he has no oil <laughs> Yeah. If this is a with every with every passing turn getting to look like Arvius's game. No, I don't know. I I, I still like at is it current stands unless twelve G and Glosson go at it again. Yeah. I think Glosson's probably in the, in a better spot. Do we have any idea of what twelve G could be doing? Let's check. He's building a destroyer. No, this is just like stuff which is cute right i think is he also heading to labs yeah i mean he's much further away but he's order yeah Boston's at radio oh he's getting louvre that's good i mean 12g could go right and like take some stuff off rvs right he could take some text 12g so handsome take notes garb yeah 12g if you were that attractive you'd be in playoffs you are I don't believe you. Yeah, post post uh post picks. Yeah, and don't no cap, I don't want to see no I don't want to see any of that Photoshop shit. I don't want whatever new Snapchat filter. Uh got to got to be the real shit. Yeah, me and Ashwin aren't afraid to show ourselves. Fuck yeah. Loser. Yeah. You're the pathetic one. Yeah. Pussy. Yeah. Am I allowed to sell an Pussy or no? channel? <laughs> <laughs> it's on Atomic Era. I mean, he's not in Atomic Era, I am, so. Yeah. You know. Is this. Wait, why do you have emotes, Garb? What the Does fuck? Really matter? You monetize your Twitch channel, you fucking yeah, loser. Like, like yeah, now I have to watch ads every time I yeah, join you. Yeah, I'm definitely never watching. I wasn't gonna watch your shit beforehand. Now I'm definitely Look, fucking not. I don't not. wanna reload over killing an Aqueduct. I also would not wanna reload, but I don't think. Dude, I think Knights is gonna. Knights Zone is gonna stall out. Oh, you sold some. I'm never okay. streaming again, bruh. Right. Yeah, I've, I've had that uh, thought too. In the city that you sold it in. But on that note, everyone <laughs> should follow. <laughs> oh! If you guys want to get better and, and see yourselves in this. In this oh, game, if you want to play like no, Night Star, join the game. Rising Stars Discord, <laughs> uh, <what's that> <laughs> where everyone learns how to play for free. Give you some gold. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Unfortunately, now I already slammed. Oh, sold buildings that. apparently. I assume Glossen's raging out. Perfect. Yeah, he didn't have to do that. No, he's not. Knights and Neoda are still just Neoda's just like True. shit talking. Uh, I respect it. I think more people should shit talk when people do bad attacks into them. It's just a uh, like you don't, you don't really like get it until you start feeling like shit. You know what I mean? Oh well, that's disappointing. It's it's like if I was in a call with Santorum every time he tried to fucking warn me, yeah. like he'd never do it again. Yeah, right. Because he'd just be thinking like, God, I don't want to get flamed again. All right, I joined Zuzo. I just finished a bomber in the city, you know. Oh, for fuck's sake! Very nice to have. Yeah, go teach him, Ryan. Can you teach me now? I actually have a whole video series that might be able to help you. Yeah. It's called uh, uh, the 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 um the power of workers. You might want to mm. you might want to check that one out. Ah, uh, the slam into here, landfair is just great. Dude, I can't watch Azuzo when he fucking plays Weavey, man. It's so painful to watch. Yeah. He, like, he does so well, but I don't understand how. It's because, I'm telling you, right? Like, there's two types of Weavey players. There's there's givers and there's takers, right? And Azuzo gets the, the resources he needs. Of course. Let's put it that way. Mm. There are silly mistakes being made. But 
that is the nature of the fight. Everyone makes silly mistakes and then obvious. I'm back. Yeah, we're just arguing about why Arvius is the greatest uh, Civ player of all time. It's a, it's a good debate to have. Yeah. It's the perfect player. Is there, is there much to discuss? Don't think an Oxford you know, lab. You bet Ashwin is a taker. I basically pieced. Uh, yeah, every you time I want to respond to that. <laughs> I could actually start attacking efficiently. <laughs> oh, that was a good one, Frank. But it's just to continue there is the by I feel like Sierra does pretty good in building workers. I'm sorry. Oh my god, I had another. Yeah, but like the Zuso, Miota, maybe it's just like a German thing. No, Chloe's German. Yeah, I mean, I have nationalism, also, right? I have, uh, I have 100 percent extra uh, XP. In you my see, name. what? Labs what? Alert. Who did you say? Is you uh, showing me well, They don't. Oh, okay. um... I am shocked that this is happening. Kex doesn't workers. really build workers either. He's German. Kex doesn't build anything. <laughs> 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 Trying to build. Sierra doesn't make any workers either. Yeah. Arvius oh, is uh, Arvius is probably done. winning, given that Knight's Dawn attack is stalling out and um. We'll see if... 12G and Glossin are still mating or something. We'll see if Knights gets the chance so... to do something about him and how much he can do. No, no, Knights and 12G aren't fighting anymore. Uh, Glossin and 12G? Yeah, they peaced. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Like, no, they're. I guess 12G is just like pre building stuff. The, um, railroads, but it's kind of cringe. What? What? I think you should bring these guys in to flame each other. And, uh, <laughs> I, I, I think it would wake me up. I've never known about that. I'm gonna. Yeah, like, and... <laughs> that is the reason. Give her confirmed. <laughs> I didn't realize that a, a Twitch stream could be more homoerotic than Frank's, but here we are. Here we are. I made some very bad decisions this game. Yeah, yeah. me too. This is I... like... Tech advantage is weird because like the big deck advantages, right? There's like being like five turns up on land ship normally just kills someone. Yep. Right? And then after that you're just kind of like I don't think there's a big power spike till radar. Is radar that as big as land ship? No. No. But it's like the only one that I feel like even mentioning. I don't like second tanks is not a power spike. Stealth. Fucking replaceable parts Stealth. doesn't Stealth. do so. I mean, you could, uh, if you were to talk to Kuba, he'll say Jet Fighters. Yeah. Bit of a slow kill on Miyota. I don't think Miyota's dead. I don't think it's happening. You not? Really? Dude, he's he's losing another city. Bro, bro. Miyota's more dead than Barkus was. Okay, that's true. <laughs> I like how Miyota threatened uh, that he was going to have planes and then just never built a single one. <laughs> uh, don't worry about it, dog. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Is Solex, uh, Solex streaming the translation channel? I'm just annoyed because um, I'm like one, one off of... Um... I've been going three different directions, and uh, I just need teaming. How the yeah, fuck no, have we had up with this game? Yet? Nobody has teamed anybody. What do I need? Uh, yeah, show, show us the I need autocracy zero, which That's is not, not can't happen. Yeah. Um. Yeah, I think it's. Sierra backseats in Twitch chat. Did he do that? I don't think he did. He didn't because Johnny O fucking yeah, warned him. Yeah, fuck you, Johnny. Uh, Johnny, you're banned from this channel. I don't <laughs> want to see your face around here again. <laughs> um, what else? Accidental whispering? No. Glossin whisper. 
Mm -hmm. Wait, did 12G really. get a stack sniped? I don't think he did, right? No, he didn't. Clausen definitely whispered, by the way. Okay, then we can mark it. I think there's good chances for farmer stack snipe. I mean, uh, it depends on what you consider bomber stack, because there was a bomber stack snipe. It's okay, just one, one, bomber. one bomber is not a stack. You <laughs> at minimum two things to stack them, Mega. I don't know. People in Arby's chat are doing this mercy wing thing. Solex, hop in team speak. Also, thanks for the raid. Hop in team speak. Is Solex even in team speak? I don't know. Ashwin is complaining about uh, like he he hasn't stopped since turn uh, turn ten. Yeah. Um, just just download TeamSpeak and get in here. Yeah, just download it. It takes two seconds. I want to ask you, like, what what happened in uh, the other game, and then also, like, what your opinion is of this one. No, we uh, did we have a recap war? I don't think we so. We did not. We did not. Yeah, 12D didn't even somewhere. try to recap. Yeah. So weird. He just didn't want that city. So Miyota recapped. Does that That's true. Yeah, yeah. If if he caps it again, I think it qualifies. Like he recapped his city and killed a plane. That's a, that's a recap word. Huh? He killed a plane. Oh wait, he recapped two. You know what? I'm I'm declaring it. I'm I'm. Recap war is a yes. That's the official. Bingo guy ruling. Okay. I think Lawson told everyone his plan as well with the, uh, the 12G attack. Yeah, that's kind of a kind of a free space. Really? I feel like that's yeah. Weird. I mean, he he was saying, um, "I'm not going to attack you, knights. I'm going into 12G." When he did the nap, it doesn't help me at all. But whatever. Whatever. Hopefully, it helps you guys. Yeah, it doesn't. It helps <laughs> me. I just need turn 160 and four teaming, and I and I get it. You definitely get it. <laughs> Farkas is giving us smudge for free. So. Oh, damn, I'm in the bingo card. <laughs> <laughs> Industrial espionage is not a talkercy policy that um, halves the time it takes to steal the tech. It's um pretty good, but nobody has picked it yet. Maybe Miyota will. Yeah. There was a lot of wonders that got same turned. Yeah, but that's not chariots. Yeah, it doesn't count. Yeah. Yeah, I think that chariot was your single like ranged unit. You were just spamming. Yeah, he out. had two. He had two. He had, yeah. he had he had two chariots. Right, because of Terra. Because yeah, of Terra. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Oh man! Yeah, no, Miranda's right. That's the biggest down downside. We can't watch Miyota sacrifice all his bombers if he doesn't build any. <laughs> Honestly, that's that's how he fixes his problem. He just never uses. He never builds them. <laughs> that way, he never has a temptation. Uh, well, um, Mio so twelve G actually Miyota the bomber. He uh, blew up a. Uh... Yeah, but it's not Miyota if you keep doing it. He he bombed an intercept three turns in a row, and a bomber exploded because of it. Okay, that counts. We're pretty close for mine. 
yeah. I'm they, they're gonna have to team, right? They're gonna do it at some point. Yeah, everyone if if fucking Glosson had teched Artie for his attack, I would have gotten it. <laughs> he has Artie's now, does that count? <laughs> No, it doesn't count. It definitely doesn't count. <laughs> Has a scientist decayed yet? No. People have been holding them the full turn they're allowed, though. 160 plus for a bingo? Dude, that's definitely going to happen. If if someone flips to autocracy, does that count as autocracy zero? No. Zero. <laughs> uh, zero, you're the only person who can get Megawax bingo. <laughs> as if there wasn't a bingo card for Arv goes AFK. We should have had but, one for Arv is late. Yeah, yeah, Arv late, Arv AFK, these are all good contributions. And then AFK Arv is like... That's too easy. So it would have had to been like Arvius misses one plus turn. Yeah. I mean, the other classic one for Arv is like uh, the dogs going crazy in the background. Yeah. <laughs> or the guilds after industrial, which he did this game. I don't understand that. I mean, Sira is like famous for his late writer skills. I can only get bingo with autocracy zero. Yeah, you're fucked. What are they waiting for? Who's not joining? Oh, right. Of course. Why did I even ask the question? I mean, I think 12G is also AFK. Yeah. I'm pretty sure he said he was going to be like five minutes. Yeah. This is a plant. This isn't like spontaneous. Let's Let's go through the player profiles again. If anyone wants to see them, they're here. So, what what jumps out at me is that we, <laughs> you know, there's a uh, we said Arby is very good at war, which you know this is generally understood to be true. <laughs> uh, for timing defense, that uh, is also true. I guess these go together. How about Miota? Uh, <laughs> yeah, we were totally wrong on Miota. The no bomber suicide. I think we right. are wrong on everyone except well, no, no, Knights and Barkus. We were right about. Yeah. Is Twelve G's favorite thing tradition? He's his games in tournament have generally been like these, like tradition, Wonderspan games. Those are the ones he's won. Interesting. Did you get the deets, Mega? What was he listening to? He's w watching YouTube shorts. Oh my god, he's... Who All is? Right. Glossin. Totally wrong on Glossin as well, right? Super uh, wrong on Glossin. Yep. I mean, the, the strengths, greed, weaknesses, tilt, and big mess. I think that counts. Glossin's Gloss smudging. Uh, yeah. Let's see what Glosson's saying. Really not the target here, which is nice. Like, Arvius is the target. <laughs> Everyone's gonna go into Arvius. Glossin's fan really this fucking loud? <laughs> I didn't know Glossin had a fan. <laughs> uh, okay. 
Kirby Slave Case. Ox, your current computer is your old computer. Yeah, what like, get a new about? computer, please. You have actually no excuse not to have a new computer. Like, you know, you're, if you could host, we would actually fire, we would fire so many more Weebies, we would get through late game. This is actually your fault. Didn't he uh, win, like, prize money to get a computer or something? As yes. Well? He did. He did. We also offered to buy him one. Yeah. But I, I, he probably spent it all on like baseball cards or something. I spent it all on Coke. Yeah. Yeah, I could go for a Coke right now. Uh, yeah. 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 Did it cool though? What? Did it cool? I like all these chair cams. Yeah. We mean all these. It's just a. Uh... Just Arby's. Who's winning? Twelve G. Uh, uh, Arby's. I think it's it's more of a question of who's losing. Because yeah. if you're asking that, it's us. <laughs> the six hours of streaming. I. It's like. Boston is apparently in the smudge zone, so... Boston is so far in the fucking smudge zone. Yeah, Bart he, he, he got creative, and uh, the creativity failed. Yeah. <laughs> I think bingos... Bingos should be symmetric. Bingos should be, like... You know, they should be glued to their... The tops and the sides should be glued together, like donuts, right? So that you can make... um, You can make any kind of line, Right. Am I making sense? What? What? <laughs> okay, so, like, there's a main diagonal, right? Yeah. And if you connect that, you get the bingo. But if you could go, like, if you got the off diagonal in the corner that, like, doesn't interact with the result, right? Like, all the, when you know, like, all the, he said he was gonna be you know what I'm talking about. No, the, I don't. Yeah, I need to, <laughs> I, I, how much time has like, okay, so, on your, your one that's on screen, yeah. right? Yeah. If you got like, so you have one grander capital, I'm so weak, gloss and whisper, right? Everyone's and then so scientists to gate industrial espionage, that would form a line. Oh. If, yeah. I'm just going to defend my pope. I just need you want nice world rap bingo. bingo. I, would have got the, I want double world rap. Defeating uh, architecture and <laughs> two arty. That's all I needed. Yeah. I mean, that's Miyota's fault for not feeding. It's my nice fault for not uh, converting the feed. It's a nice fault for not building any unit. Go and cab RD and then not clicking on the RD tech. Yeah. Well, auto zero can't happen, so it only bomber stacks night is. That's that's Ryan's best chance here. No, yeah, auto zero is never going to happen. We can get Sierra back in here. Not gonna happen. Yeah. I think Sarah might fall asleep. That's not yeah. Either. yeah. No, it's not. I, uh, I thought some of these were gonna be a lot easier. I thought science game was pretty free, but uh, I mean it was it was close. Yeah. Yeah, I know. It still might happen actually, because like someone might read a text deal or something. Honestly, I was seriously yeah. considering just going. True. Through. What if Barkus AI takes auto like, zero? That, that would count. count. That, that would definitely count. Back. I don't know I whether just now. Yeah. How would we know he did that? Somebody would uh, check policies, yeah. I guess. I mean, you would have I don't with think me. You ever, Teaming no, free space has not yet been filled. So bing. This is the issue. Days, like, for some reason, these kids haven't teamed each other. Now I can't win bingo. Yet, like, I don't know. I've been, I was, I mean, I think Random coast is also just like random coast and chariots. So sad. Yeah. I was very heavily considering. Yeah, I can take ideology. The, I think the only coast in draft was fucking UAE. Oh yeah, I saw that. <laughs> you can still do that. I mean, this is this is a different band system, right? This is like four bands, four picks, six, three, bands, four pick. three bands, four picks. It's uh, three bands, four picks. Hmm. No, no swaps. I'm down. Hmm. Wait, where was the draft? I'm okay. I streamed it, and I put it in playoffs. Yeah, just 
gonna point out that the option still exists as long as I'm still in this game. Yeah, gloss and tagging like a fucking bot. Bingo, that is actually so true. Ruined yeah. bingo. Yeah, you're right. He ruined it. He, he ruined, ruined the, the fucking bingo. For not dying yeah. I fucking now hate that guy. Yeah. I know that was not ideal. Arby's is thinking it's right. More dominant than it is now, but. They did agree for like 15 minute break or something. I mean, he's playing a scaling. Yeah, Harvey has said he was 15 minutes. So Jag, he teched factories into harbors, into calves, into frigates, into steam power. <laughs> into astro uh, into archaeology. <laughs> yeah. Well, and I want to play. Uh, I want to play a thing in the in the Discord. Do oh, you know all the bingo things that I don't? Uh, I was talking about was them with Nico last night. What was that sound? Who's making oh, who's making duck sounds downward. with the sound soundboard? It's Ryan. Oh my god. Like such Ryan. a sneaky just rat move. Like that's just that's just what a literal human rat would do. There we yeah, go. Why would you, you say even, such a thing? I didn't I didn't, I didn't even have to use my own to describe what Rai is um, doing here. Why would you say such a thing? <laughs> Why would I say such, such a thing? Because I was playing a game, game of Civilization, Civilization 5, 5 Tira. Tira. Right, right, right. Oh, Glossin! <laughs> Mega fuck off. <laughs> You should do that, I will kill your entire family. That's the best one I <laughs> The best one's the Myros one, but... The, 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 started playing Weebies. Cause the like, killing one is... When did they adjourn? Is that the 8 hour mark? I didn't find it, I was... Ah, uh, you're allowed to at 8 hours, yeah. What? It might be in Ryan's Discord. I don't know how it works in playoffs. But... Is it? I don't know. I mean, Achilles was saying he didn't want to be there longer than 6, right? I mean, his game went nine hours, so fuck do I know? Either gonna be in Ryan's Discord or Transkipper. This one? Oh no. Oh, Glossin! Oh! <laughs> it's not that one. Do you have Nitro? Did Frank put the VOD up? I could uh -huh. go watch some of this. Cringe. I mean, excuse me for making sure that we can have proper. Speech. Mega, did you see? Did you hear the one sound bit I said earlier in the stream? What's that? Did you hear the one sound bit I said earlier in the stream? No, I didn't. Oh god, it was bad. What was it? It was like me yelling at people uh, who were wonder, like, find the fucking, the like uh, Maybe hyping up Arbius, well, and I was just doing like a the gawk gawk. <laughs> and then I literally <laughs> I said, mean, "Oh shit, Meg is gonna fucking." I'm like, from Arbius' stream, if I wanted to, but I'm probably too lazy. Motherfucking dogs. Oh, wait, Frank did upload. Try, try, uh, try right. I literally said right afterwards, I'm like, oh fuck, Mega's gonna clip that. Be more immortalized. It's it's nothing done. Oh god. And do you think she's the last shit I take? No, 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 no. What happened in the Achilles uh, game? He just like chatted all over it. the scrubs or something. Yeah, it sounds like he just never got teamed. Yeah. Are you gonna upload yeah, this? Yeah, one. of course. He I just like killed one player after first another. First he went into Gao and, and then he went into Azuso and then he uh, killed Lucas. That's it? That's all you do? You just go around and kill everybody in the lobby? <laughs> yeah. It's here. It's somewhere here. Try whispers. Whisper, you think? Oh, that could be it actually. Trying to say that I'm in a really good spot. Trying to say that I'm in a really good oh. spot. I'm going to fuck. Oh, I'm not. I'm saying... going to kill them. Oh yeah, that, that <laughs> is. There it is. There it is. <laughs> Here, play it one more time. Guys, what is wrong with you? I'm going to kill them. Oh, nice. <laughs> I'm going to kill your family. <laughs> That's fucked up. Shut to up. To be perfectly <laughs> accurate, I'm going to kill your entire family. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, excuse yeah, me. Yeah, get the quotation um, right. 
You literally just Actually, you know, I said Yoda. I don't know. Right, you know how many turns I didn't have those three city connections up for? How long? How long? <laughs> That's like fucking like it was at least, at least like 30 turns I was or just... something. I was very impressed was very with Glosson's impressed. ability to make roads before turn 65 this game. I truly don't understand how you guys aren't, like, just miles ahead, by the way. That's all I'm going to say about this game. Well, it's very clear how I'm not miles ahead. <laughs> well, I mean, no, like, in the early game. Yeah, Glosson, we're going um, to... We'll, 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 we'll talk about we'll this talk. after that game. Um, the, Glosson, the, uh... Glosson needs to go to... It needs to uh, take a remedial class. <laughs> yeah, I made some really <laughs> bad <laughs> macro decisions. Really? Oh okay. Oh, okay. Interesting. <laughs> Did you guys, yeah, did you guys see the, the player profiles we made for all of you? I would like to see them. I no, but them. yeah, I'm very I'm very uh, excited to see them actually. All right. Here, can you send me mine? No. No. I'll just link you the whole thing. You'll put it in play. All right. All right. Let's see what we got. Where the hell is obvious, by the way? That's the real question. And that is in everyone's mind. Strength of Whispering oh God, It's not even loading. <laughs> Why is it not loading? Uh, there it goes. All right. Scientist decay. <laughs> oh, it's so true. Bummer All right, wait, how do I... These are really good. How do I keep... How do I keep cl Oh, it's just the loading. All right. This was all this Ashman, was all by the way. I, I like this. I like this the science so decay great. and obvious. <sighs> yeah, I sort of did both my listed preferred times. Yeah, like you and Barkus were the only ones that actually did your listed shit. Uh, fucking Barkus, one turn me on pyramids. Yeah, I don't. Yeah, little bitch. There, I mean, there's a lot I mean, of macro lot stuff of you did. You, did. you have no reason have to, no ever to ever go for a I mean, pyramids when you are Iroquois and not gonna jump. To my credit, I've always done a lot of forget war. Yeah, I mean, I just sorry. Wondered, how, how, how is that, that to your credit? credit? <laughs> what are you saying? <laughs> I'm saying he's saying he's I'm proud saying of what that he's done. I lived Ashford. up to one of my preferred timing. He he's, just he's, didn't include he's it. He's proud. That's what I'm saying. He's proud of his current game, Ashwin. That's what he's saying. He's so good. I'm saying I lived up to one of my preferred timings. Why did I have to choose fucking maids? I could have just chose Henge instead. That that was what we were saying actually the whole time is that you sh it would have been better to I... pick Stonehenge because if you lose yeah. it, it's fine, and you don't even need pyramids as you're Yeah, like it's just I do not one. understand. <laughs> How Henge went on like turn fifty. You, you know, there's there's a lot of interesting things. Well, you guys there. didn't build it. Yoda got I got a so uh, I got a see through in. Uh, I, was, I got I was, a little bit fucked. It's okay. That's the playoff experience. True. Yoda's had what? a fun game getting taxed by everyone. All game. Uh, it was a fun game. It was a fun game. It was just difficult to play. That's all I'm going to say. I mean, I think I could have just clicked like a fast Liberty game and just like thrown myself at Avius, but I don't know if that would have been much better, you know? I don't, I don't think it would have been much better. better. Just... What were you thinking when Avius uh, Rhodes came to you? I was both expecting the attack and that he didn't actually want actually. But there's nothing I could do, right? Mm -hmm. Like, I wasn't surprised when he attacked me, and I wasn't surprised when he fucked off to kill Varkas instead. But there was nothing I could do about either of those things except, like, build defense, right? Yeah. You, you, got, you got pretty railed by a couple things, so. Yeah, it's true. The Oracle thing was... That was bad. The Oracle thing, the, the having to open honor thing... You losing Huey as well. Oh my god, so many things. The fact that Glosson like had the confidence to just throw that into a one tile Huey expand was crazy. <laughs> <laughs> like, 
pictures of fucking Huey Cap. You know what Hawk says? This is a premium wonder. Well, I didn't build it in the cap, right? No, like, I know. If I oh built my it in the God. cap, I could have had it in time. No, no, you would have same turn. <laughs> uh, no, yeah, you might be right. Uh, it was good. We were, we're, we were watching the whole time. There were a lot of same turns. Game, there were so many same turns. I and do not understand them why all. Them all. And Glosson won them all. <laughs> wait, 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 what did yeah, I same turn? Awesome. What did I same turn? Uh, you same turned. Off the top of my mind, you would have same turned. Uh, Huey, you same turned Red Fort. Same. <laughs> I'm here. Oh, ah, boy. beautiful. What else? Let's get. Um, Io went go. back to yeah. die into nights. I uh went to. <coughs> I didn't know oh, that was all not you. Not you. It, right? Yeah, that was that was twelve G. There was something else I'm forgetting. Um Pura. Oops. I don't think Pura was a thing. I don't know. I'll I'll we'll think about it. But anyway, good luck in your game. Thank you. Thanks for casting, man. Yeah, fuck you, bud. Right, let's go. Exactly. Okay, so... Why was that? Um, okay, uh, back on the, back on the, the on the horse. Win. That's all, that's, that's all the, um, the solace I have now, as my capital is crumbling around me. It's bad, man. Yeah, back on the horse. Hold on. Also, when you guys get back in the game, please turn on your streamer panels. It is turned on by default now, by the way. So the people who turn it off... Uh, I'm doing it on purpose just to annoy you, Ryan. I just want you to know. How much? How much longer? Will they go? Okay, let me think. Miota and Nightstone are actually going to stall out. So, when's the next time anyone can Why actually... Why do you think they're going to stall out? He's already stalled out. What are you talking about? Is he? Yeah. Wait, isn't Miota like dead? He's yeah. been He's quote unquote kinda... dead for ten turns. I. It is time to shift enter, gamers. Uh, one sec. Zero seconds. I want to make sure I did everything. I figured. I, I was. I forgot. Uh, actually, I I'm sure you did. I forgot that. I shift entered. Miota's just got to make sure that. Yeah. So this is actually. I know what I'm doing next turn. Make sure all those. To push in, then I would have thought. Just like you should just like start deleting some units. I think you have too many. Actually, it's, it's like taking a negative toll on your gold again, As long as he gets his longsword out. Yeah, I bet. Yeah. Wow. She doesn't really appear interested in doing, but. I guess like the city's bulky enough that it doesn't insta get popped. Oh my god, look at the clicks. What a legend. It teaches Miota a fucking <laughs> to be, to, in in fairness to Miota, I didn't think that was gonna happen. <laughs> it just blew up. I big guy, can you take the city already? <laughs> What are we waiting for, week, huh? You know, it didn't what's, have what's the, the, uh, the Alans at all Bloody. necessary to conduct warfare. Uh, what are you saying? Try and... I'll be right back. I don't know. I don't you sound like you're it. fucking, oh, like, way don't too exhausted for this shit. <laughs> uh, I quit my job recently. I, can I haven't had to do anything for Wait, really? <laughs> yeah. I, wait, you're not working for a PhD anymore? No, my job was like <coughs> teaching assistant. The oh, oh, PhD's oh. done soon, oh, okay. so I was just like quit the. Sure, that makes sense. Yeah. So now you don't have to sit in office hours. Yeah, pretty much. Got it. Yeah. yeah, that's good. So, this is like my replacement for office hours. Glad to find wow. this stream. Yeah, man. <laughs> you still have a rate my professor page. Yeah. Because uh, I only have like three reviews. Can I give you a review? Uh, I'd rather you didn't. Oh, okay. we won. Yeah, I think everyone in Ryan's Discord should give Bashman a review. <laughs> yeah. 
<laughs> yeah, if you've ever been backseated by Ashwin, that's technically him teaching. <laughs> I don't, I'm going to argue with Barkus in, in chat instead of in voice. Turn 135, Christo. It's honestly faster than I would have expected. Yeah, well, why was that built? Uh, he needs the social policies. I was, where's Boston labs wise? Taught me how to swap a unit. <laughs> ten out of ten. <laughs> You're welcome, Garb. <laughs> What is so nice is just kind of waiting for I lied, I lied. You can't prevent the recap. Batman. Oh, not like this though. How do you say this is still not like this Ashwin? though? Oh my god, what oh! the fuck happened? <laughs> oh uh, huh. I mean that's <laughs> probably not what you wanted to do with the tank. Oh uh, god, Knights just lost. I think that's the optimal positioning for it to slam your arms. Right, for... That is very true. Sorry, actually. stream. Hold on. Have fast move, so you might I need to, to lower the volume. You guys need to tell me it's too loud. Why is everyone in this chat fucking a math major? Like, am I missing something? Uh, mathematicians are naturally drawn to sieve. It was a good volume? No, it's too loud. I guess I should push to talk. I'm going to argue in chat. It would be a good idea. Just mute Miota. No, Miota is like good content. Miota is the most important voice to hear. You know that when Glosson's not talking, he's just scheming. I like the gloss and unmute to explain all the ways he messed up the skip. That's just Glosson. That's that we said, you know, Glosson's gonna do commentary whether you put him on the mic or not. <laughs> True. Oh, Miyoto's building a plane. <gasps> we have potential. Here. Oh my god. Oh my god. Wait. Everyone? Is it happening? Hold your, Dude, does hold your bingo triplane? cars ready. Knights has two triplanes. Oh, oh man. man. This could be it. All this right. could be it. This could be it. Look at him. He's like focusing it down too. Oh, look. He, he just, just got gifted a fucking... Oh, I didn't manage That's actually so value. Wow. That's crazy. He got gifted a fucking machine gun. Here we go. Did your really leadership out me? Oh, yeah. Click it. Click it. <laughs> He's like, oh shit, there's four. Did he do it? No. Come on, Miyota. You know you want to. Everything. Wait, why wouldn't he take the. What? Why didn't Hell. he take the. He took hill? You're not even on a hill. Am I what? Oh, he wants to shoot the. Ugh, pussy. Yeah, like why wouldn't he take Prussian promo? Uh, Pressure promo is bad, right? Because double anti cab is the best. Oh, it's a machine gun? Yeah, it's a machine gun. I don't know. Can Let you triple go. shot with the uh, Prussia? Uh, no. Oh, shit. Did you see demos? Is our. Ver it's is all obvious.
Yeah. Yoda Dej. Yeah. Okay, now he looks dead. Now he looks dead, Dashman. Hey. I'm sorry. <laughs> I, I I keep I I keep overcompensating, right? Like, cause when he initially got attacked, I thought he was super dead, and that was like ten turns ago. Yeah, imagine a war taking over ten turns. Imagine a <laughs> casting taking over ten hours. Well, we're here for it. Imagine a game going to turn two oh eight. Are we here for it? I'm I'm thinking about that burger. Get what the would burger. Do? Yeah, I'm, I'm looking for my escape. Get the burger. Yeah. Honestly, though, good game by. Though. Like, I respect this by Knights. Like, it doesn't matter. I think so too. I, I kind of <laughs> wish he did the thing a bit earlier. Ah, but... It might matter because you might not play it correctly, but it shouldn't matter. All my efforts were in vain. What is this lobby? I mean, we are human. Like, I mean, no, your efforts are not in vain. I feel like the... Mentioning the possibility of you making a mistake is not rude. He's not gonna win, he, dude. Just because he's in the best spot now does not mean he's gonna win. <laughs> no, no, you're not the yeah, it's more that he's too good. He's gonna get teamed. Max, that's how I feel every single time I'm in a Discord call with these idiots. Someone says something. Oh, my professor said this. And then it all devolves into. Wow, it's like listening to a recording of myself. Yeah, you, Kuba, Cox, Clawson, all of y'all. Anyone that plays a weepy sounds like that. Let's be real. And the problem is that's true. First move. Otherwise, it might actually work out for me. But this way, there's no chance. At least I kept it to chat. You know, I could have been just talking math in voice for the last ten minutes. D does Knights go anywhere after this, or is he just gonna chill? Don't think he can. He might get noob whispered by Clawson to go into our, but. I think you should just play for lives after this. Motor 12G and Glauson do. 12G is going ballistics. Does he have labs? I don't no, see. No, he doesn't. Weird. Glauson is at labs now. I'm crashing again, man. And Knight's done is not far behind on the labs. Is uh, 12G a spiteful player? Will he go into Glauson? I don't think he is. I think he's too good to be spiteful. A lot of good players are spiteful, though. Name one. Solex. Azusa. Me. Miota. Miota's not spiteful. What are you talking about? Miota's not that spiteful. Okay. I feel like when Solex plays serious, he's not spiteful. I yes, he is. Maybe. How I'm am very I spiteful? spiteful. Harvest freedom. You were right. Harv is indeed freedom. Who could have seen this coming? He's going to push full ratio. Then he's going to get lumber mill tiles everywhere. Well, it would be better if he actually opened ratio. But... Yeah, it was set one step at a time. Watch them. <laughs> How does Harv he is open? spiteful. Sierra is spiteful. Who else is spiteful? Lucas is kind of spiteful. No, what are you no, talking about? These Lucas are literally is... people no. who are the opposite of spiteful. These are the people who will peace and then not take revenge, right? I think Abraxas fits the bill. Abraxas is very spiteful. Are you kidding sure, Abraxas is spiteful. Kuba? Oh, come on. Couldn't get the insta here. And Lucas is like, he, he tries to find excuses to attack people, so. Those are small slights. Garve is spiritual. Garb is my spiritual liege. Once he posts the physique pic, I'll uh, I'll staple it to my wall.
I have to make the physique. Arv's channel. top of basically every demo. That's that's what freedom gets you. But that's about it. All it gets, if it, all it got you, was, if it were good at getting demos, I think it would be good. Doesn't knights? I don't know. I feel like knights down could just run the tanks down into guards and whatever. Probably does that help him win the game though? Ashman. Oh, I just hate Arf. Oh. <laughs> you said he's last hope. What are you, what are you talking about? It's like, lobby with the that's gonna have three NA players. Three and NA players and twelve G. Ooh, dog. Dog spotted. Did someone say caster curse? What happened? Somebody panda said something about casting curses. Let's check back in with the knights. Okay, we, I, we, I'm, I'm gonna at least stay to get the Miura interview. Very important. Poor Miota. Yeah, I kind of feel bad. You ever think about how, like, just nap spawn is so influential on your game state? Yes. What is Miota supposed to do here, actually? On the spawn? Cry? He was supposed yeah. to team Arbius. He was actually supposed to team Arbius. I'm serious. Yeah. Like, like... As soon as Arby's taxed him that hard, like there was no opportunity to get a timing on Knights done, right? He needed to do something, and that was the easiest way to pick up cities. There is no better way to gain pop than taking cities. Well said, Ulfing. Ashwin. I'm so good Does at this game. Does anyone else have an Ulfing? I assume no. This is why I built it for the yes. No, man, Knights is cooking him too. I mean, I don't think I, I I like knights a lot, but I don't think this is a testament of knights' skills. It's more like <laughs> how awful Miota's game was. But this is what I'm saying. Like when he got he he got taxed that hard, he needed to do something. Yeah, no, I, I, I dude, I said it right away. He had to go kill Barkus, or he had to go t kill with Barkus. If you have shit land, the best way out of it is getting new land. Why isn't he taking his capital this turn? I don't get it. No. He still can. He can capture worker into kill city. Not if he does it with that tank. I mean, I was saying it here, but like the way I would have played me at a spot is um, as soon as Arbius is worst all dead, I would just go to straight Arties. Yeah, yeah, you were that that would have worked too, I think. I don't know, fighting into the um the Canada rifles are annoying. Do you gift away a tank to capture this turn? No. Probably not, he, right? He no. could no, there's no point. There's literally no he's point. He's got nothing left. I mean he, I guess he's got two land shifts. Three. Yeah, he's first mid as well, so he just clicks cap with uh tank and 
it dies. So yeah, yeah. if Miota makes another bomber, do we count as a bomber stack snipe? <laughs> uh, he's making he's making a rifle. He's uh, he's griefing us. Yeah, so Miota not only doesn't suicide his bomber, but also doesn't even lose a bomber stack, which is uncharacteristic. He's genuinely for him. griefing us. Yeah, Miota needs to pitch uh, into the stream much more. I don't know. Not my... We need not in my hands anymore, so it's fine. We need Sierra to backseat him and uh, tell him to make a bomber right now so we get the, the double. Yeah. <laughs> that would be awesome. <laughs> Where's Sierra? He, he said he was awake. Uh, trying to get really. that Frigate oh, Weezy in. What is it with, what is it like Maybe Frigate Weezy? Some more quests happen with CS, huh? It's just like the flavor of the week. Idea. Okay. Really the priority here? Kind of like looking at other things this game is actually gonna go super late because nobody can put on a good win con i guess it would be a triple actually because the suicide building it would be a suicide it's yeah it'd be miota mioting bombers it would be uh losing a bomber stack and it would be uh be high value yeah high value that's the phrase i would use <laughs> Is Lawson not going to get space run 160? No, he's auto. And he just got labs. One day, Lawson will get out of my forts. He I skipped schools. <laughs> like, he's, he's so behind on tech. The fact that, like, Lawson's labs are in the same conversation as other people's labs, or it does it to... How fucked the lobby is. It's also how good his game was before he just blew That's it up. That's true. Out. He was so ahead, dude. He this was the when when he got the the okay from Night's Dawn to not have to fight Night's Dawn. That literally he should it should have just been GG. Should have yep. just been game over. Yep. Would um order have served Quasim better than Otto? No, he because he would have. What would have served he him would, in a real timing? Yeah, that's true. Yeah, I mean, it it would have served him better, like now. But, like, Gosling legitimately had the opportunity to win the game here. Oh. Why does twelve G not have a sensor maker in his cap? Why would you win the game when you could get big demos? Thanks to your intercepting triplane. The Prussian Great War Bomber attacking your artillery has been shot down. Mark it, <laughs> boys. That counts. Can you please just take the city, Knights? Like, what are we doing here? here? The guy has Defender. Take away the fucking Defender bonus. Kill the goddamn city. What are you doing? I'll prevent recap. Um, I, I don't think he would have been able to. He's got Zocked everywhere. So the Gosson's wrong play was when he attacked 12G right, with, with frigates on. and ironclads and no yeah. RD. That was the wrong play. All right, someone get Miota in here. I mean, it's just a yeah. Is he gone? No, no, he's staying. He's not. He's not there yet. But... I could send him the team speak link like aggressively. I'm pretty sure he's. Uh... He literally has three units. Okay, he's got four. Oh, Nightdown got the Forbidden Happy. That's actually, that's pretty nice for him. Oh, well, that actually gives him, is it time to go Diplo as Knights? Uh, I mean, I honestly don't hate it. Just like we have something in the pocket. I don't know. Batman coming over to the Vatican. I mean, yeah, honestly, right. he should Always put up World Ideo Auto and then. Um, yeah, that'd do it. That would actually. Be and then because so he already used his order scientist. Yeah, Team that would be great. Plus. 
Lawson saying, oh, yeah. Team Scary Arvius. Um, it's gonna end on do, this map. I can do bombers on carriers. You're gonna help by going lab? Yep. I think Lawson has entered the meme zone. I think he's just well, saying the thing that he think will be funniest. Uh, I don't he... think so, bro. I don't know. Why is he killing Atomic, atomic Theory? Come on. I can make. He's got one coastal on the CS. What is that? Hey. Don't come near beautiful Stettin. Very, Very nice city. Can we look at 12? 12, 12, 12. Sure. I'm trying to figure out what he's doing. Because he has to do something here. Radar play? No, he's checking. He's not going labs. I don't know. <laughs> it looks like he's in this mode, though. What do you mean? It's turn 139, that's why. Oh, there's another city there, isn't there? Yeah. That would Maybe God fun. will send down an angel in the form of a nuclear <laughs> missile. Angel of the um, Prussian Empire. Berlin. Mm -hmm. Which is the one tile I didn't scout. He's praying to RPS. <laughs> a very good tile. We should have scouted it. It has like 200 yields, that tile. You know, that's pretty good. I think. So, yeah, pretty good. like, two days ago, I went to bed, so, like, and then I woke up, and whenever I would bite down with the left side of my jaw, like, teeth, my ear would fucking kill. Hmm. It's the weirdest feeling. Is it done now, or is it's it like, still happening? It's still here, but it's it's kind of going away. I don't... Like, this morning, I couldn't chew with it. Like, it, it was just incredibly painful. But Oof. as the day, like, went on, like, I was able to use it more. It's just weird. I went to bed two days ago. Thanks, to Zuzo. There's a... A comic villain, Max Damage, who he gets more powerful the longer he's awake. So he's just very sleep deprived and he's doing his bank heist and shit. So he does all sorts of dumbass stuff. It's pretty good. Did you say Matt Damon? Max Damage. Oh. That would be pretty funny, though, what? too. My worker. God. God damn it. I can't get any moves off on why you. Is, why is Miyota still in? I guess he just fights to the bitter end. Do you think order was right for 12G? No, of course not. What is he supposed to go? Like, freedom? Yeah. It's it's literally better than... Or auto zero? Auto zero is actually the right choice. He's just griefing our bingo. Correct. Stop mewing. It's hopeless. I don't. What? Well, How many more chances does Mio to get after yeah. this? Well, wait, we actually. There, there should be a bingo card for the defeat screen. Oh, yeah. That oh, be yeah. This Mio to gets to see that next turn. I wonder if Nightstown is going to be able to make these cities functional. Order really doesn't need much to make them functional. Yeah. And he... Hold on. Is he piety second? He's piety second. Why does he close his thing? Because oh. he, he hates you. Enough? Dude, he's just a little bitch. Correct. Poor Miota. Gift away a unit, it's fine. You've been defeated. Hey, Nidus. How much would it take to, for you to not take Berlin for two turns? It's really good I'm on push to talk here. The whole stream yeah. would be all my obnoxious yawning. Um, how much gold do you have? Like, I have a lot. What do you get out of it? I think Tolji yeah. was kind of looking at Arvius. He's actually I thinking about it. He's thinking, I gotta stop Arvius. Um, 
I wish twelve G had played the Defiance tournament. That would have been that would have been pog. How much would you value? Oh, Solix would have played it. Solix did play. Then he like just stopped. Four thousand even. It's gotta be like five, six thousand gold or something. Oh no, not that much. I mean, one science. Dude, Arvius sitting on ten k gold. Pretty accurate, no. So Arvius right now is asking Knights how much it would take for him to not take Berlin for two turns so that he can get a spy steal. How much money? Five thousand gold. So Knights asked for six. Nice. All right, my guy. <laughs> Hell yeah. And then instantly declare war on him. <laughs> instantly take Berlin. <laughs> yeah, take take the money, <laughs> take the money and run. <laughs> Do something about it, bitch. This is what I thought. Vile your labs. I don't know. Well, ask yourself, what would Glossin do? Glossin, Glossin would, would take, take more Berlin. money than that for starters. If tanks are not coming to me immediately after. Is someone supposed to post the result for the Achilles game? Yeah, Achilles. I can do, uh, how about like 3,000 for a nap, and I won't take Berlin. He said 3,000. No. Knights introduced Yoda to the art ever. of the smoge, and Arvius to the art of the deal. The I like this deal for him. Nice. I, I like this deal that Knights is proposing. 3,000 gold for a nap. Sounds. 3,000? Oh, is Arvius get a scientist, scientist DK? It's one of his known weaknesses. Okay, so I'm not taking Berlin. So, sorry, what is the uh, 3,000 for now? 3,000 for not taking like Berlin. Turn, I believe, after no, what the f And a nap. Gotcha. Yeah, I'd like this deal for Knights because he has built labs anyway. Uh, I don't like it. I want more. I think uh, the nap isn't really a big deal. And I think the Beautiful. gold is massive. Maybe what? He got 3,000. No, but like he, he, he could have gotten six though, right? No. You oh it, no. my god, you have such good first move on me. God did did Arby and Science just decayed? First move. <laughs> what do you mean it's not first move? I can't like cycle any moves on you. So, not sure. That's his first move, right? Yeah. What are you tar not, not like not in the turn transition. He could have. Uh, now he can yeah, actually just like, capture because uh, there's a nap. Yeah, I, I, like this, I like this deal for both players. I mean, is Glossin dangerous or is 12G dangerous at this point? 12G looks pretty out of it. He doesn't have science and he doesn't have gold. Take Stettin, dude. I mean, so for Knights, he's not. He, he's, uh, he, he doesn't want to attack an Arv right now. Sure. Glossin's useless. Building labs over there in the corner. And then 12G is... I don't know what 12 she's doing. I hope um, Arby's spy dies. Oh, it would be so funny if Yoda moves his spy to Berlin. What do you mean move? <laughs> oh, he did. He did move his spy to Berlin. Based. Based. All right, Knight's done his labs next turn. Another, like, two turns while we wait for Arbius. Uh, I'm just gonna stay until you kill me. Sure. That's next turn anyhow. Now, have you found my settler yet? I mean, um, box Knight's done and Arbius made some deal there. because Arbius is trying to get a steal off that city. Roll all the units. Pope's sword will so, at the very end. So, does Iroquois make you more or less inclined to build your hydros? What? Like, if you're going to build, right, if so you're Iroquois, right. do you want to build your hydro plants more or less than as another Sith? Why would it be different? So because you have more hammers. You know how Berlin is the capital uh, of Germany in this Wouldn't game? that make it less inclined? 
Yeah. But you have more free hammers, so maybe you want to build everything I you can. I may have thought it was my capital and put a counter spy in there like ten turns ago. <laughs> <laughs> I guess so. I don't know. I see hydras as like a way to like turn. fix super super low yeah. pop low hammer cities like in the late game, which is incredibly actually, no, rare. Wait, I put this in. Wait, did I put this in after my cap died? Actually, I'm not sure. I think maybe I put it in after my cap died. So you're saying you'd only ever buy a Hydro? I just like, yeah, I'd only ever buy it. He is hoping. It obvious gets I certainly it. wouldn't have never expected I that subbed in for Miyota once in a Weavey, I, I and I, I they were like dying to land ships, and Miyota had all his Hydros <laughs> being cute. Icons. So, yeah. That is pretty funny. I, I actually I actually didn't notice it myself until Mega just told me. Um like this turn. Dude Mio is so stubborn. He really He's is. sticking around to see if his spy kills Sarvis' spy. It's correct. We should be on Narvius' POV to see if the spy dies. Yeah, very important. Let's see if he just wasted 3,000 gold. I guess it wasn't even a waste, because yeah. it's still a, like, a uh, map. <laughs> Hopefully Miyota's building, like, I guess Constabulary yeah. doesn't help. He can build his NSA, because he's only got one city. <laughs> <laughs> Buy Constabulary, build NSA. I feel this turn. Maybe. Yeah, you can take the city now. Alright. GG. Get it? Nope! It died! <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Get Miota in here. Rip Miota. Oh, he was trying to leave the game and then he died. Then... Another one down. Four yeah. players left. Three K in the trash. <laughs> That's so funny. User joined your channel. Yoda. What's up, Yoda? GG. Hey. GG, bro. I I didn't even realize that I had a counter spy in there. <laughs> Um, until Mega <laughs> told me. I, I'm not even sure when I put it. I think I must have put it in there after my cap died. Like, I don't know. I'm pretty sure that was your first spy. Like, I'm pretty sure that was your industrial spy. Wait, that was in, in Berlin the whole time and not Königsberg? Yes. There's no, there's no way. <laughs> Maybe you got it confused. Maybe you thought Berlin was the capital. I mean, that's what I said, right? Um, I mean, I guess you guys don't have... Um, I guess you have Discord muted. No, we don't. Um, we just... But, I mean, I, I don't think so. I'm pretty sure I moved it in there after my cap died. I could be wrong. <laughs> yeah, no refunds. Um, how, do you, how do you think the game went? Um, well, I didn't like my start that much. Yeah, we figured. I think, I think Truffles is like the worst regional. I think you're uh, the hardest uh, start on the map, to be honest. Yeah. Agreed. You what? Gear start was the hardest on the map. By far. I think so too. I mean, I think 12G start is also not great, but 
uh, he had like good cities to settle, and he could just. He had a lot of decent. stone, which kind of carried his early game. Yeah, and also like I think um, desert incense isn't even that bad. Usually, like you can just settle on top of it. He didn't really do it, but he could have. Yeah. Um, so I think this is like really bad capital, like not much land between two players who I know to be aggressive. Uh, I, I, I don't know. I think still piety was the correct choice here. I because like, I don't I think like I piety. can read tradition on this. I, I, wasn't, I don't think there we was were, another choice. We were surprised. Most, I, we were surprised about your pantheon. Well, you saw how bad my happiness was the whole game, right? Yeah. I think it was correct. Yeah, I was just, we were curious why, why it was I so I mean, shit. I had like four Luxes here, right? Or something. Five? I'm not sure. Not that many, anyway. I had, I mean, I, th I had my cap Luxes. Uh, and then I had um, Jade, Obsidian, and Gold, right? That's it. So it's five Luxes. Sure. So I really felt like I needed happiness. I think maybe... I mean, you were right. It was just... pick was... It was just interesting. Incorrect. I actually like the Swords pick. Well, yeah, the, the demos on your all were very nice. I mean, I'm, I'm th I think I'm supposed to not go Apple here, right? Because if I do and I rush Theo, then I just die. Yeah, I agree. Yeah. But I... I think it would have maybe been better to just go indulgences um, because I really don't think I got that much out of swords here. Keep and I also... Can you sell hmm? one more city? Or was it not possible? It really wasn't, I think. I could have gone like further south, but that's like very far out and it doesn't have a unique lux. So I don't what think What was so. the... I could have maybe pressed, uh, pressed knights a bit more to get the salt, but I don't know. I think that just leads to conflict between us. What was the reason between not um, settling the coastals? Uh, yeah, that's my first question. I looked at your land, like the two one tile off the coast cities. Especially the Uluru, you went unhappy because you didn't settle on gold. Uh, felt a bit weird. I mean, I just really didn't like the on gold city, but I think you guys are right. I think those cities should have both been on coast. I, I, I mean, think I, makes, think like, here, I, I think it was fine. I think it was fine if the there was no coast. on coast. If there was if there was other coastal players, I think it's fine. But you guys are sixth inland, like, you know. Yeah. That, that was I honestly, I don't think I even considered that when I settled those cities. I, I was like, I, I didn't think about the fact that there's no real coastal player. Is yeah. Glossy going into Knights right now? Is that what he's looking at? Mm, he was just hovering it. Like, what happened was Knights put units on the border, and then Gloss and started like. Oh, okay. Yeah. We, I, the one, so I think you played fine. Like I mean, you had a really hard hard start and stuff, and knights going into you is obvious, and obvious doing something was stupid. I mean, you got double taxed. It's so painful. Yeah, I, the one yeah. the one question I had, and right when Arvius did that, I was like, Arvius is griefing because if I'm Miota here, I'm gonna team Arvius. Why didn't you? Like, you mean team with Bacchus? Yeah. That that I that I thought was like I you and Barkus team all the fucking time. Like I thought that's I thought Arvius was making a huge mistake because it was so like clear to me that that was gonna happen, but no one. I did. considered it, but uh. So so what I said, you know, when uh, Arvius's war started stalling out, is uh, this is the one out for Miota, basically, because I thought you would uh, just go straight Arvius and go a turf. Oh, not Bob just told me that he's that I'm the true winner in his eyes. Uh... <laughs> the true winner was Barkus because he got out earliest. Although yeah, he was, he was stuck there for a while. Yeah, I, the way I thought about it, Miyoto, was that when you were forced into honor, you just weren't allowed to sit around to something like you know planes or landship anymore. So you had to go kill someone, mm -hmm. and the best option there was. Well, the thing, the, the the answer, I mean, or the reason, like my reasoning is, um, I never expected this war between Barkas and uh, and Avius to stall out. Yeah, yeah, no, 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 none of it. No one did. Absolutely, no one did. Korea did. I mean, Korea did, and I, I said it was. <laughs> I said it was only possible if Arvius didn't build any How more units, mates? but and he didn't. So there's, I was like, there's a bit of flubbing going on. Happy Miura's dead. I kind of figured that if um, 
So I don't know, like the, the way Avius and, and Barkas were both talking, I, I thought like Barkas was just gonna die in like five turns. And I figured if I team with Barkas, like I, I wasn't ready to go right No, away, no, right? yeah, no, not at all. And then like yeah. I'm just gonna also die or like go into an era with Avius, and I really didn't think that that would help me win. Yeah. Sure. Yeah, that's fair. Um, did you ever think about going artillery when it was clear that they were gonna stall out? Yes, but. I decided that I needed to build schools because I didn't think I could kill Avius quickly because he was going to have like five generals already. He had a lot of gold. He, there, well. Did he not pay attention? Because there was a, a big citadel war. I mean, I saw like a, a, a couple, like one or two citadels. Um, Arvius planted but three. I, I couldn't really, like, I was kind of scared to scout the Arvius, right? Because I only had like two scouts and I didn't want to lose one to the Honor Barbarian. So I didn't really scout Barkas's land. And I, di I didn't know how many citadels were put down. I thought it what was probably just like one or two. Mm. Got it. I mean, that's when Arbius should have actually killed Barkas, but he kind of flubbed the citadel more. Who's winning this game? Probably Arbius. Who do you Arbius think? Who do you think? No idea. I mean, I I don't know. Like, I, I was in the game, right? I thought Arbius was probably in the best position, or maybe Glosson, honestly. But I, I have no idea how, how good 12 this game is. The degree of gloss and flub here has had me in spirals. 12, uh, 12G turned off his lights and uh, is looking very upset. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I mean, I don't understand why Glossen attacked him like without schools. That's just insanity. You're right. Uh, yes, I don't think anyone you does. are not wrong. Like, I think Glossen should be easily winning this game right now. Yes. Yep. I mean, that was correct assessment if you did normal stuff. Yeah. It was factories, compass, cabs, frigates, steam power. And that's when he attacked. It was turn 115, and he had cabs and ironclads. Yeah, and then he was shocked that um, the 12G made it to planes. Oh, I mean, yeah. On turn 120, surprising. he's like, oh, what? He made it to planes. <laughs> I, I, so <laughs> weird. That was kind of funny. I mean, uh... I feel like I should... Okay, Miata, the real question. What turn do you think this game ends? I mean, if you don't want to accept... Uh... Something what? No. Oof, that's a good question. Non-aggression pact? I mean, I think it depends very much oh. who wins. I don't really care about the non-aggression pact. I uh, I think like one... Non-aggression pact, which is that... 75. 175? That's a good guess. Yeah. To space? Yeah. Obvious space, 175. Well, oh. um, did we get a scientist to be on Arv? I missed if it. I'm embarking bombers into like. Did we get a what on Arv, sir? Scientist to K? Uh, I don't think so. Unfortunately. It's nice to uh, not have to worry about dying. Yeah, make sure to get your bingo card, Mieta. Very important. Oh. Yeah, we can fill sure. you in if you want. All right, so commentator cope. I'm just gonna like yes. click on that. Yeah, I'm sure that that's yeah, yeah, correct. Percent. So somehow the teaming has not happened yet. Yeah, <laughs> it's the craziest well, thing. Teaming happened in some small sense, but not really. I guess. No, right? no, not not in the sense that we would like say, yeah, that's teaming. I I technically suicided a bomber, but it was you like did. 20 health. It's okay. 12 feet also suicided bombers, so yeah, you can yeah. mark it's, that off. It's the, it's the Gloss and whisper. Uh, I mean, what does a whisper even entail in this kind of uh, game? Because whispers are I think, I think we banned. checked off that, right? Like, I think we checked. All right. We, we count whispers as like convincing someone to act on your behalf. Bombers that get sniped. I could have done that, but I was too nice to knights. I was still so like, trying we're to, in to uh... stop. You only killed one, and I was very disappointed. Well, I was like, I was, I don't know if you had the Discord muted or not, but I was negotiating with him to like try to get him to to make peace with me because he's yeah, scared I, for his bombers. I, I was listening. Uh, everyone goes artillery is kind of true, right? No, because I mean, everyone Glossin didn't. Glossin didn't do it. Oh, okay. Gl Glossin skipped Artie's on his attack in his threes and it failed. Recap war happened. Three plus player patronage. That's an interesting one. I'm, I'm surprised you put that in there. Um,. Industrial espionage happened. Did Ooh, it? Uh, so, so where's 12G going? Yeah, I have industrial espionage. Oh. Oh, okay. Nice. So one granary capital that that happened, though, right? Yeah. 
Yeah, okay. Yeah. Colossus one Fake war right. happened. Kind of. Yeah, it happened with you and Irv. Yeah. Obvious multi steal, I'm sure, happened. Yep. We need Did an accidental die? whisper. That's what I'm missing. No general. Did the general die? die? No generals. No die. general dies. A coded message is definitely. Bingo! Dead. Tsunami got bingo. Let's go. Tsunami got bingo? Hey. You got bingo? Tsunami. Oh, Tsunami. Congrats, Tsunami. You you won Sick. the great prize of a free sub to Arbius's, uh Show the clip to people. To, uh, Dude, Did anybody okay. get post on 100 industry, by the way? Yes. Yes. All right. Did Sarah show up? Is this the clip? No, is this what no Zuzo was talking about? Is this Zuzo losing, like, because he was asleep or he went to eat or some shit? No. <laughs> oh, oh, Azusa lost two 10 stacks. Jesus Christ. Holy nice shit. I, I didn't see this one. Because he lost a 10 stack in Rotterdam as well. <laughs> of stealth? Oh my god. I think this Mega? is. A 10 stack of stealth or what? No, it's 39, so I. It, no, I don't think No, it's... it was bombers. I mean, it's still really bad. First I guess. 10 stack was fighters. Jeez. Oh my god, how is it? Oh my god. This oh is so lord. bad. What the fuck? Oh lord. Oh, oh no. Dude, he definitely could have saved that. <laughs> 100 He's literally AFK. He's so ridiculous. He's just cycling. I didn't That's see so this turn. Holy Christ. For fuck's sake. Oh my lord. <laughs> oh, wait. You said sound? Oh my god. Oof. <laughs> Dude, I can't watch no. I can't only... Delete you, no. Delete you, Blyat. Delete you, Blyat. You want to see what's going on here? Yes, what the hell? Just like this. Jesus, Solex, it's weird hearing vo like joy in your voice. Yeah, terrible day to have here. <laughs> <laughs> that that looks like like literally single player like. Yeah. <laughs> you guys are so rude. What? No, it literally does. That's what it... <laughs> <laughs> there was no action, no responses. <laughs> Jesus Christ! He's not even fortified. <laughs> By the way, what did you guys think about this deal that um? I thought it was good. made with obvious. Good for both I hate people. It's good for both players, to be honest. Oh. What? I thought it was good for both players. Yeah. I That's why I said one turn one. decided that it was a free game if he didn't do that to me. Hmm. Can why all the players turning... be forced to run fields? <laughs> no. Oh, I'm down to do remove EUI. Dude, obvious is looking so strong. Actually. Was that sixteen hundred something? Yeah, I mean he's almost a turn. GPT. It's a lot of schmeckles. See, this is, I, I feel like three thousand gold for Arby's is actually like very little. It's like two and a half turns, uh, three and a half turns of money. Yeah, it's not that. I large. mean, he's he's almost at a thousand GPT. Like that's a lot for not commerce. Yeah, he doesn't have rash open though, which is. <laughs> that's oh, oh that's that. pretty bad yeah yeah is, that's what i'm I assuming he's gonna open it next right right you, i mean you he has riders what? he could just ball the rider oh yeah maybe he should he definitely should like well it depends on like if he can actually like he has two riders he can definitely get a policy it, it depends on how, how his scientist spawns look actually like, oh. if his scientist spawns are kind of fucked anyway, Rashi might not do that much for him. Yeah, I mean, his scientist spawns are fucked in the sense that he built unis after going knights and expos and fighting for five, ten turns. I mean, he built them instantly, though. Like, he had 81 unis, which is slow. Obviously. People's army? What? 
Knight's is, is this Knight's done? Yes. Why? He's gonna flip to auto? Does he have Brash open? He does, right? Yeah. I mean, what what else is he supposed to pick there? Golden the Golden Age. Age. He's yeah, about he to fall out. There's zero chance people's army is better yield than Golden Age. Dude, he's been listening to fucking Barkus and Yoda too much. Dude, there was like when Barkus started playing in Rising Stars and he kept trying to make people's army work. He'd go like honor order every game and try to click people's army first. Also, Ned should be fully stagnated now. He should serve all the cities. Well, I, think, I, moment. I think people's army is all right, like, but not in this situation. Dude, put up world IDO auto, please, knights. What? Why? 100%. Why? Because he used all of order, so just switch to auto. I agree. Oh. Oh. oh, oh. Second. oh. oh. Wait, oh. he's on it. He's on it. He's listening. Do it. <laughs> the snake. Okay, good. I mean, it, it was already once uh, proposed uh, Ryan's and hive mind didn't is pass, straight. right? It didn't pass on the first. Um, okay, now now he's just going to take GA if he's uh, putting that in. Yeah. Oh my god. No, he's thinking about people's army because he wants to build his military get it with the bonus. That's what he's thinking. That is I mean, it's not going to pass anyway, right? Like, Glosson voted it down the last time it, it was in the Congress already. Like, he's just going to vote it down again and he has 11 votes. Yeah, but Arbius might vote it up. If I'm Arbius gets sure, that, yeah, he might I win. Guess. Yeah, like if Arbius, Arbius gets to... And, uh, yeah, that's a good stealth. point, Ashwin. Because, like, look at how much gold he has. Like, just imagine going stealth right now as Arbius. It's a free win, right? Yeah, that's true. If you could, like, buy, like, 30, that'd be pretty good. Yeah, Jay's Garv is a scheme last uh, three turns at least. I don't know. People's army to me is just so shit. How is he getting so much gold? I guess it's just Tim Hortons and EU. He has Freedom 6. Has it even? Does RP still have Oxford? Uh, Very I'm possible. Sure. I'm not sure. I, I mean, I know that 12G used it. Uh, Knights used it. Yoda used it. I don't think Glosson used his. No, Glosson no. did not. Because he want we, this was the discussion me and Ashwin had about guaranteed versus <laughs> discussion <laughs> extended bit. <laughs> I'm actually, I'm actually so uh, annoyed that I didn't just go kill the knights when I had the chance. When did you have the chance? Artillery. I don't think you had a chance there. No, uh, I, I think I did. He went straight calves. No, but I mean, like, when before he got land chips, there was like a 10 turn window where we yeah, both we just were staring at each other. I mean, he had Himeshi as well. I don't think he had a real chance. Also, there's all that rough terrain everywhere that he uses his roads and you get stuck on. It's just not good. I, I think, I I think, think your uh, best play this game was just to go straight Ardius into Arbius. But... Heidi Axum with Aluru? Was that in the Achilles game? Probably. Um, wasn't Achilles playing America? So yeah, Achilles was America. No, I I just meant like in the game somewhere. Whatever. Um. Yeah, RV. I mean, RV says a lot of money, but like, how do you convert it? Flip to auto. Buy forty stealth. Upgrade forty stealth and jet fighters. Old G host, I guess. What was the clearest uh, try pick, Solex? You mean on on me? He wasn't Axum, dude. What? I don't really care. Yeah, that was uh, mouse pressure. I didn't like the land for tradition. I thought it was, I thought it was not that good. Yeah, your land was weak. Yeah, it was not good tradition then. Are getting CM? Chat camp food coastals. Dude, I was thinking about camp food on your spot, actually. It wasn't the good. The only only cap really got to use it. Yeah, there was like four cap tiles and then nothing else. Yeah. I don't know. I think that's one way to... I mean, I think that they might 
work, Solex. Yeah, yeah, I don't know. Yeah, but... I think my game would have been very strong if I didn't get Fuck, you can just, say that. just crossbow text like this. Is the... What, uh, Ritual Sacrifice is viable in FFA right now? I don't know what it's it does. It's one gold, one culture, two gold. So okay, that's fair. I, I think it's pretty good. I think that's it's like a Liberty good. Crossbow Pantheon. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it actually sounds like a Tread, tread uh, belief, no? I don't trust you on Tread. Let's look at how much in this mode. <laughs> Ever since the messenger take. Yeah, yeah, the, yeah, the, the messenger take actually. Is that one, the one of these that? days, I'm I'm gonna actually play it. I've not played. I I've, I've only played it once. You've only played what once? The messenger tread. Um, I've done that actually. I think it's. Yeah, I think it has potential. I've only played it once though. <laughs> okay. I, didn't I don't know what he's doing. He went tanks first, and then. <laughs> Now he's building ampies. Why does he not have his ampies? He built. He went cysteine, man. Smoge. How does Mirta feel about the one tile? Oh, sorry. Skyscrapers into buy the ampies. That's the play. <laughs> yeah. Is this the least build you've ever seen on Commerce 5? Yes. Nah. You missed the part where he was negative with Commerce 5. I mean, I he had a... Um, 12G had... Um, he had a qualifier game where he was Commerce 5 and he was like minus 350 GPT. What? Yeah. How is that even possible? Like... Uh, where he had a lot of units and a lot of railroads. <laughs> <laughs> That'll do it. Uh... No gold was just crushing. Yeah, I agree, sir. I think um, I think maybe the um, swords pick was not correct. I think swords is fine. I think feed was wrong. Yeah, maybe. Because no, I don't mind fine. feed. I don't mind feed. If he takes relcom, I think he needs feed. Yeah, I mean, you enhance with feed, though, right? I did. And that's when you were queuing calciums. I, I I didn't like the Relcom, if anything. But I'm a known Relcom. I, I thought that, I thought about that too. I thought the Relcom was maybe also wrong, but I don't know. Like picking Relcom just fits so nice. Yeah, I mean, you're never going to be criticized for picking Relcom. Really, the so. the idea, of course, was to get Oracle based on this. Of course, right? yeah. Dude, didn't getting happen. same turn, <laughs> getting same turn is such a bullshit. I can't. Well, it was one turn off, actually. Oh, you was? I thought you were same turn. No, I thought you were same turn. Wait, was I really? Yeah, you were same turn. Oh, wait, okay, I get to be even more mad about this game then. That's pretty good. That's why I was saying you got fucked. Okay, I didn't even realize that. I thought I was one turn off. <laughs> it was one turn off? Are you guys sure? No, it was same turn. We were... There's a lot of people saying one turn off. I thought I thought one turn off as well. Unless, unless, uh, unless 12G sped it up, but I, like, I, I went AFK for another time, but it was same turn when I went AFK. I really tried to speed it up too, but I was like four hammers off. Yoda same turn 12G on Noter. Oh, really? Yoda really needed Noter. Yeah, I did. Yeah. I mean, if I got that, if I lost that as well, I would just be completely out of the game. You were completely out of the game. I mean, I don't know. I was tech leader, like, pretty much. Yeah, no, next time I was just because Glossin was like. No, I was like scaling. I was like tech. Uh, I was like ahead of knights um, a, a while there actually, when I had schools mm. and he didn't. Mm. Well, that's because he went already instead of schools. Yeah, but I'm just saying, like I wasn't out of the game at that point. I didn't think. Maybe. I like I, I don't know. I if I was twelve, uh, sorry, if I was knights there, I would have just like he committed to cab already and then he didn't do it. Yeah. I mean, it seems like he's kind of made it to a position where he's fine i mean if he'd just gone cavati into me by the way he could have just absolutely crushed me really oh, that's sure. been the fucking theme of this whole game is that people are overcomplicating an attack just fucking kill kill them yeah could have said the same thing with arvius and either you or barkus could have said the same thing with glossin into 12g could imagine said... people doing real timings I don't know if, if Avius could kill me that easily, actually. 
but probably well, definitely Barkus. Definitely he just fucking decided Barkus. to go workshops first. No, he went. Yeah, yeah it was like workshops, knights, and expos. Right? Yeah, yeah. I mean, workshops and civil. I was so confused. If he'd come for me a bit sooner, obviously he could very easily kill me. But uh, I think if at the time that he came, uh, I think I would put up some decent no, resistance. No, I, I think he kills you much more easily than he killed Barkus. Because yeah, that might that might be true. Yeah, know. but like it's better for Arbius to kill Barkus from That's that position. True. Yeah. I mean, he should have just gone straight expos. Like he had eight hundred gold. Uh, yeah, uh, Bob. The, the reason I didn't do apostolic is because I um, I didn't want to go Theo fast. And I and I, like I said, I think that was definitely a smart heads up play. That would have been such a bait. Yeah. I mean, obvious would just like, he would just be so happy. It's like, wait, I get to make a good religion for myself, and then I get a camp religion on top as well. Oh, and this guy gives me free really theology? Like, could... fucking sign me up, you know? Like, he would for sure... Arvius, like, that. literally made it so that he was getting absolutely nothing from killing Barkus. Except good map position. Yeah. Can <laughs> you please backseat someone? Let's check out... Not settling coastal there as pressure was very bad. Yes, I think I think you're right. I honestly, at the time of settling those cities, did not think about the fact that there's no coastal player. I love how Gloss and picked Explo. Thought that was yeah, really good. It's good. I mean, like I said, his game is so good, and he should just be easily winning. He should have just rolled 12G. <laughs> I don't know yeah. what to say. Oh, if he'd just gone like artillery straight away. If he'd gone artillery or if he'd gone like schools, if he'd gone schools, he would have been at like the quote unquote timing he picked at the same time, but he would have had, you know, the ability to fight planes. Mm. Awesome played it very well until Ironclads. His early game was like really good. Yeah. I and mean, the double pop rune definitely helps. Double pop rune on Pure Hill Capital. But yeah, I mean, like, the Wonders were good, Expo was good, he, like, nice religion, just this attack was so bad. Do you guys think anyone's actually gonna do something here anytime soon? No, I'm gonna leave to. it eight hours. That's my call. I think they have to. Who, I mean, Arvius doesn't have to do shit. Arvius doesn't, uh, but... 12G can't do anything. Glosson is forced into action, but he's the only proactive player on the map, right? So he can't actually win. He's... The only thing, like, if Glosson somehow talked Knights Dawn into killing Arvius or some shit, but nobody's attacking into that, like, 10k gold stack, right? You know what this is, like, reminiscent of? It's, like, reminiscent of the second tournament game where Arvius is essentially where Miota was. You know? And no, like the only remember. way that really so they can win with, is if no uh, Knights gives like open borders to Glosson and then they the fight board. through him, and then yeah. somehow yeah. Knights doesn't return. die after that. Like that's uh, <laughs> what that's what has to happen. For yeah, that for, seems likely. <laughs> but like <laughs> that's that, you know, like something yes, like that. I mean, it's probably be be triple team tier probably, and I don't think. Like, Austin is the only person with auto bonus here, and he can't even get over there. Yeah. So, it's probably actually RB system. Did the Ahara Synagogue Sacred Sites go? And I don't think 12G is going to play for... Like, I don't think 12G is going to play for killing Earth. Like, I don't think... Oh, maybe he will. Maybe he'll play objectively, but... I don't know if he has any play here. He's just so He's fucked. He's so fucked. Like his turn one forty eight, he's not gonna have like replaceable. Yeah, he can't. He can't do anything. He can make Arbius' game miserable, but that's about it. I mean, like Glossin, there's some chance like Glossin could like farm his way through twelve G with, and then be able to fight Arbius. But I think there's too much meat on the ground to for Glossin to do that though. Yeah, indulgences here, Bob is not good. I, I like the swords pick. I don't think swords was wrong. 
If you're going to do sacred sites, I think it's okay, but he needs to go Pagodas first in that case. I lost the crossfire, yeah. Yeah. I think a dungeon just could have been alright. I don't know. I think swords is what you needed. You had a lot of hills. Except yeah, in except true. in your southern city. Like I thought swords was great. It's I just kind of rail center versus rail com, right? Like I, I just yeah, I just I don't know. I think taking rel I think taking Relcom forces forced you to pick something like feet. Because you that, that you were really lacking demo. Like like efficient demos. With cargos he didn't need it. Okay, well now we're talking about two different things. I mean, I think that's that's my main takeaway from this game. Honestly, is that the city stop being coastal is just a very silly mistake. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, if he's coastal, it's a different story. Does this tick the backseat bingo? I think it does. What did Sarah do? He's like telling Miyota what he should have done. I mean, I feel like, I feel like, um, yeah, I think that reverse, counts. like, Dude, I just need teammates. hindsight backseating doesn't count, no? Miota, we're trying to fill a fucking finger here. Can you have me so yeah, difficult? Miota, shut the fuck up. Yeah, we, we don't right, care sorry. about your opinion. Miota, right. it's, been, it's been seven and a half hours trying to fill this damn bingo. I'm so sorry. Why can't they all just start teaming? Oh, wait, I get <laughs> Turn 160, I also I hit. I didn't think this was going to be a thing that could possibly happen. Dude, I get bingo, like, three different ways now. Sierra was the linchpin to me getting bingo. I just need <laughs> 160. I'm, that's all I'm waiting for, so please just let me know when that happens. I'm, uh, I've started an FFA, so... Second bingo. The tsunami's hitting. So okay, what's gonna happen next? I should know this, but who like how are um like playoffs part two selected? Well, it's just gonna be the top twelve remaining. Oh, okay. Yeah. Like the same it was last time. Was Achilles top six? Uh, I think so. Yeah, he's sixth place. If Arbius and Achilles both win, um, then um, my chances of going to the finals are rising. <laughs> All you need is the lottery. Yeah. I mean, no, I just need Solex, Abraxas, and Tony to also win a game. And then I'm just going to get in there for free. You need to send someone over with Tony's <laughs> burger to hand feed him. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, that's actually. Uh, this was all your fault. You should have been uh, eating Aziza yourself. I mean, this is honestly, by the way, what I said at the start of the tournament. Like, I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get into the playoffs on some bullshit wins, and then I'm just gonna get to the final on the on the lottery, and then I'm just gonna randomly win the final because somebody like ear wars each other accidentally. Got it all planned out. <laughs> and then I'm gonna then win I'm gonna this tournament, even though I played the last I mean, one so much better than this one. And yeah, that's the Your reputation right. precedes yourself. I'm not sure if you're going to win. Dude, why eh. the fuck is Boston going nukes? What does he think he's doing? <laughs> the auto nukes. He's literally I'm trying to troll me. Troll. This I, is I such am a convinced. Bad design. We're trying something now. We'll see how it goes. What's the difference from the last tournament? There the lottery? Lottery for a six slot. Yeah, the, the, we're just not doing the third round of playoffs. It was like, I mean, the people that are saying time. it's dumb. I mean, it is dumb, but you also didn't have to fucking do the scheduling for this shit. With yeah, like, it was, terrible. it was awful. Don't forget the delay in starting the tournament. You can blame me for for how terrible it was. Hmm. You, you you and me, Ryan. You you and me were fucking up the scheduling. <laughs> what do you mean? I didn't play you, the oh, last tournament. Or was that tournament three? It was there. It was. No, I, I, I dropped out of Tournament 3. Yeah, you and me both dropped out of Tournament 3. Yeah. Lol, lol.
X. I mean, the, the 12G, the 12G despair cam, by the way, is pretty, pretty interesting. <laughs> Why well, was it decided that this weekend can hold three games, but the other one can hold two? Um, it's just the the difference is the lobbies for this game were determined by schedules. So when you get to fewer and fewer amounts of people, the harder it is to schedule specific times that meet all of those people. The main thing is that like forcing people to play two games on one weekend is kind of difficult. Yeah. yeah. Like it's uh, especially when these games can last like 10 hours or more sometimes. It's hard to make time for two games on one weekend. This one is definitely no end in sight. Yeah, I, I like my prediction of turn 208. Shut up. I, I don't I don't see it going that long. Like, obviously, it's going to win before then. No, I guess uh, you to keep the amount of people while you are still scheduling with 18. Yeah, but we're reducing the amount of people that are needed. Um, amount of games I, that are yeah, played. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm not, not thinking about this shit. I mean, the way... Uh... The way like the Firestorm tournament works, uh, it's like the top 21 and then top 18 or something like that. I mean, that's another way of doing it. I really don't like it, though. I think it makes the qualifier meaningless. And they have this thing where they like do um, fixed spots. So like uh, if your if your qualifier score is better than another players, you like get to have guaranteed wonders on them and stuff. And I think that is kind of dumb, too. Like I, think, I actually kind of like think, that. I don't know. I mean, I'd prefer same turn wonder thing than that. I just think, um, I just think the qualifier having like actually some. I mean, I, I don't, I don't like the the lottery thing. Like, I, I don't think. I mean, I I was against lottery it, but, thing is dumb. But obviously, it it is like not something that anyone was excited about, right? It was more like a maybe we kind of have to do this thing, but. I uh, I just think it's good when the like when every qualifier game matters, you know. When you go like when you actually when everyone actually cares about every game. I think it makes the games more fun. EU is like one of the main reasons to even pick fucking I mean it's still better than the first two tournaments for uh best top spots instantly qualified, right? That's true. Or just and usually I was just like playing easy lobbies, so. Uh, yeah, the, I mean, the second tournament was just like the top two got in instantly, but then the other four had to play, which helps a lot with scheduling, honestly. <laughs> yeah. But, but, yeah. I mean, we we did it in that, we did it that way for that tournament because obviously the first tournament, we only had like 30 or 40 players and we didn't know how much um interest there would be in the second one so we yeah. just thought like, yep that was the reason why we did it this time uh, like that time or spot gets the final one to 19. spot one gets the final problem with that is you get a bunch of tiebreakers in the first one like yep. it worked out actually in the second tournament because only me and Miyoto were the, per the people that go like a perfect 4-0 or whatever it was um, no it's not true like Avius and and um, Achilles sure? also had three wins in that game. In that yeah, there, there was uh, there, it came down to a far away uh, for yeah. perfect score. And oh, really? it came down to like points for hosting, which was kind of stupid, but that is what happened. Interesting. Oh my goodness, I misremembered that. Thought you were better than you were. Had to check I mean, yourself. You did, but... have, you did have the best score. You went like three wins out of four games, and I think. The rest of us went went um, three wins out of five games each. But yeah, check yourself, bud. Yeah, I had just one, so I think I was okay. Huh. 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 <laughs> Despite having hundred players time after this tournament, something like half of them didn't play a game or just had one game. Yeah, I mean that happens every time. Yeah. It's no way to avoid this. Like I, I we literally had... was contributing part of that. Yeah, we had I think like eighty six people sign up or something this time, but like 
Actually, I think it was more. I don't remember. I mean, I could check, I guess. I was literally just looking at this. So. Uh, okay, 92 people signed up, and... Uh... So many people on 69 points. And I guess 68 uh. people actually played a game. Which is around the same number that we've had before. I mean, we had like a couple games less this time than we've had like last tournament. Pretty nice. There's 23 people on 69 points. Nice. Then... Okay, Call of G's heading to radio. Glosson is setting up for nukes. Are you I like how now you fucked up your that. playoff games and then get. Have you ever been as points. scared as uh, this for uh, the auto nuke timing? It's not. Auto nukes, so powerful. That 25% modifier, right? Goes so far. <laughs> like, like, he's probably thinking, oh, I have to nuke Arvius to remove GPT. I don't know, some shit like that. I don't know. It's just. How does he plan, plan to get there? there? I don't know. Uh, yeah, uh, nuclear cruisers, subs, obviously. He's going to get Knights Dawn to gift him a missile cruiser. Yeah, that's not banned, right? Gifting units is not banned. Yeah, sure, sure, dart effect. Yeah, if only you had three or four more accounts, you definitely would have made it. It's true. Oh no, he's gonna give it over there because he has a conquistador, right? So he settles, rebases, might even double rebase, then he's fine. Astronaut, I'm just in crossbows, so that's why I'm Liberty. Do you think Liberty's wrong here? Mm, I'd rather not talk about your game on stream for this game. No, no, Mega's yeah, no, game no, is much more important than this game that's going on. There's nothing happening in that game, so I decided to leave. Yeah, Arv is making more gold than science, and he's making the most science. Nobody can kill him because he has infinite oh, gold. He's doing thirteen thirty-seven gold. What a what a lead gamer! Yeah. <laughs> did did he do that on purpose? Probably. Did he? He, that's definitely Probably. the sort of thing you micro. Um, yeah. Glosson, the only person with combat bonuses, can't get over there. He's making nukes anyway for some reason. So, yeah. <laughs> I should stop flaming. Sierra is the best. Oh, hell, Sierra. He's actually trying. I love Sierra. We love Sierra. That's the thing you're forgetting, so Alex, is when you like shit talk it, you're literally shit talking your friends. And like, like, dude, we're like we're trying here. Like, I like how you say that in Korea. Is like at least Vienna has gone good. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I think I think it comes from a good place. But so I know, I know, I know. So like, I think Solex is, is not always the best communicator, but <laughs> he's he cares a lot, and I I appreciate yeah. that. But I just had to say something. So what's wrong, Gawson? Oh, we're all just sitting here, aren't we? I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna sound cringe. Language gap, right? So. I kind of miss bomber meta. Shut up. Oh god. Yeah, let's bring back. Uh, let's bring back. Uh, what's it called? Bombers. Bombers are so fun. Experience on uh, auto. At least they were doing something, you know. Now they're just gonna sit around. Let's bring back some Iron Fist. I think Fist this Mad. is more of a thing about how everyone's game feels like shit, so they're not going to take action. Not yeah. necessarily like. If only we could have more fun. Anything about the policies? Yeah, I think the mod is actually very balanced right now. I've been saying this for a long time. The mods felt balanced for a really long time. Going to space. I think after the uh, the tech stealing changes and stuff like that, and if he can do something with spy steals, like. Yeah. 
and by something, I just mean like copy what they have at <laughs> Mimo's mod. Yeah, but sure. if they, if you could do that, like I, I think the mod would be fucking amazing. I mean, they did do something with Spy Steals though, right? No, I mean, I, I'm, what do you mean? We, I'm, we survived. They were nerfed. Okay, I'll hot drain. Yeah, hot drain. No, they weren't. What? No, they weren't. Yeah, you can, uh, because you can all like, you, you can't max duration. Uh, I mean, yeah, but well, that, that's, that's, that's cheesy and stupid. That's a rule change, not. No, no it's no, also a, a, a mod change. Oh, really? Yeah, if you max duration with a free tech, it just auto picks like the most expensive one, I think. Oh, oh no, I didn't want that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I mean, man. It, I was like, no, worried I was you, you max duration and then like all the scientists and. You know, spy steals kill spy steals. Good. Science shouldn't be a yield you can just get. The messenger shouldn't exist. Part I killed bronze, that's actually hilarious. Yeah, I think Glossin's gonna try to conquistador his nuke over, but it's not gonna kill any. Like, there's no kill threat, right? So none of this shit matters. I mean, I think Avius is not out of the woods yet here, though. I actually think he's very, very, very stable here. The the gold is so high. Yeah, I mean, this game looks very over. <laughs> I don't understand why he still has an open ratio, though. He doesn't need it. Is, I mean, obviously egregious mistake, but... He's the GOAT, Mega. Don't stop questioning, please. Yeah. I mean, you know me, I'm never questioning Arf, but... I'll be right back. It was fun, though, I will say. Um, when, uh, like, some people who were shit-talking uh, a lot got um, got a little bit of a, of a reality check. Oh my god, shut up, Miyota. He played so bad. Like, literally, the only... I, I can't deal with it. I can't deal with it. He played so bad, he made such awful decisions. And it's only, like, glossed and making somehow worse decisions that has led to this game state. I mean, that's what a free -for -all is, though. That is what free -for -all is. That's why we love it. This is, this is all what it's all about, Ashwin. Uh, someone... Uh... Please uh, check off uh, Ashwin Malting about free for all. That we checked that off like 15 minutes in. Hmm. Checked that off multiple times, but just check it off again. Yeah, I'll yeah, go I'll do it. I'm gonna go to bed. I can't. You're going to bed? Yeah, it's time. I've been awake for um 
at least eight hours. No, I mean, that's the time. time. Is it like four o'clock? It's five o'clock. Uh, I I actually sleep generically about 12 hours a day. So. Oh my God, shut up. I'm serious. If you're important. actually, if you're actually serious, um, that doesn't sound healthy. <laughs> yeah, this game doesn't look like it's going anywhere. I'm gonna, I'm gonna head out. You're done uh, with this one. I'm done with this one. I got no more use for this guy. <laughs> you, you, you can't stomach the, the goat. I honestly can't. Correct. He opened trash you. Oh my god. Put he Rashio. is the goat. He is the goat. Ratio after freedom eight. That's that's going after that's going in the bingo. Yeah, why why is that why is that on the bingo card, Ashwin? Yeah, I honestly just didn't think about it. And that's why he's the goat and I'm not. Is that I would never think about ratio after freedom eight. Exactly. Maybe he took New Deal. He has a lot of planted merchants. A lot of generals. I um I even proposed um the great person tile thingy and it passed. Well, oh, that's pretty nice. Oh, for him. historical landmarks. Uh -huh. Yeah, he has a lot of generals, so it's uh, it's actually very nice for him. Look at those for culture tiles. Has, no, any, has anything happened? No. Ashwin's just been getting. Like, Ashwin decided he's going to bed at sense. five o'clock. Yeah. That's the only I way I can make EU Weavy tomorrow. Ashwin is EU Weavy. Isn't there going to be one? Good. There's always one. Thirteen thousand gold. I mean, some of the EU Weavy's players are going to be playing a tournament game tomorrow. You know. Well, they'll die quickly, and then we'll get our game. Are there any any NA players in that tournament game tomorrow? Because. Uh... They seem like the, 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 the U players. All the NA players were in this. Actually, no. I guess Argent and Galfat are also NA, right? Argent's NA? Which is Russian, isn't he? Like, uh, I thought he was Russian. I thought he was NA. I don't think he's NA. No, he's not NA time slot, at least. I'm seriously concerned that he's just going okay. to try and back rotate them. But no, there's only EU players tomorrow. What time is the game? That's a great suggestion, but uh, same time as the second that. today, I believe. Actually, no, same time as the first game today. Sorry. Yeah. Well, you have been buying Makes sense. You did just it does make sense. I mean, the other thing would be late for the Europeans on a uh, Sunday. Yes, you did. Exo got his first uh, NQ win. Woo! See, when someone says they're gonna come over with battleships and carriers, I like the. Korea, get, get, get on the mic. mic. He's also he's been playing pretty well, so. Yeah, he's yeah. he's gotten a lot better. Right, comment to stuff. I'm getting bored, dude. Shut yeah, the no fuck up. Actually... Yeah, we can talk about tile yeah, macro. Yeah. Let's uh, yeah, let's think about the thing. tile macro here. That's the really important thing. I'm watching 12G build fucking hospitals. There may or may not Base. be a couple frigates in my uh, it's, harbor well, in It's to fix this broken heart. That have never gotten upgraded. Possible. Smooch. Smooch. Knights, this is really up to you what we're doing. Wait, are they C do they want to CC? Is it happening? Well, I cower in fear as I have orders with all three players. Not really, but like, I mean, I feel like it's hard for me to make the first move given my, uh, what's it called? Exposure to everyone. Mm User disconnected from your channel. Bye bye. Who is that, Mega? I'm here. Ash Ashwin. 
Hey Ryan, because I'm bored, you want to take a bet for tomorrow's game? Sure. What turn do you think that ends? I don't even know who's in it. But. There's 148. Say 155. All right, so I'll just take wow. the so I'll both... just take the under. I'll take the under. Those are both some low numbers. I'll take the yeah. I'll take the under. Yeah, I'll take the under. I'll go with the over. Okay. And uh, same deal. We're donating to whatever charity Fuck, of choice. Fuck, dude. I I don't even know anything about it. I don't feel comfortable doing that. <laughs> I don't know anything about it either. Fine. Sure. Hundred bucks, whatever. Hundred bucks, okay. Yeah. You all get on this, Miata? Uh. We're both like uh, uneducated Americans. We have no no idea what we're putting our money on. But... No, I, don't, I, I think I'm not gonna. I'm sorry. Pussy. Schmooge. I'm boring. Smooge. Who is that? Who is that? I know Braxis is in that game. I'm probably poor compared to like um, fucking Korea making you know, a hundred thousand bucks every year sucking cocks, you know, like, it's pretty difficult. You can't to compete. Compete. Chris just Who needs could to compete? go to the blood, blood donors and uh, donate plasma. Don't worry. Lucrative business in America, I've heard. Yeah. Yeah, okay, I'm 100% sold on. I, I like your under bet, to be honest, right? Hell yeah. So Alex, uh, Tom, Sierra. That seems like the under. I feel like Solex is going to fucking force it. Yeah. He's going to exert his dominance and the game's going to end. Oh, yeah. Probably. But, like, I, I think, yeah, I, I'd like your under bet. I think you're going to probably win this one. We'll see. Got to pick the charity, though. Oh, I, I, I have a charity in mind. I was thinking uh, in order to, you know, in the, in the theme of Civ, might do, like, autism awareness. Uh, my sister just crashed her car, so uh, oh, she has to change that org. Uh... I hope she's okay. That is suspicious. A little suspicious, but you know, um, you, you, you can you can speed that one. Help me! Help. I live in Ukraine. The fuck? <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, we could we could do Ergo as well. Oh, true. So, like, I would, but you're just kind of mean. Yeah, it's so true. Did Eric go play this tournament? No. He did not. He didn't have time. Yeah. Mean people don't deserve charity? No, just Solex doesn't deserve charity. So, like, Scare has offered you a spot on his couch for so long. You just need to uh, hit the turn 105 uh, real tanks. <laughs> like, come on. Is Care going to ad ad adopt Solex if he manages to do that? that that's the word. That's, I don't know if it's still, nice. uh, still on the tables, but uh, that was the original word.
I make mom jokes and Solex takes him literally and gets sad. Oh no. Adopt me. Oh my <laughs> god. I'd rather fucking kill myself than adopt you. Care Bear, uh, great to adopt you if you hit 105 uh, real tanks, uh, Solex. Come on. Get on it. Maybe, like, I don't know, but in America, you're, like, still about to, allowed to hit your children, right? Like, if you, if you adopt Solex, at least you get to hit him. That would be pretty good, no? That's a good point. You can't hit him no more? Damn. I'll help you kill yourself if you hit the last, me. <laughs> the last bastion of freedom has finally fallen, Korea. It's Batman. Can't even hit your kids anymore. <laughs> what are we? What is the world come to? What is the world coming to? Bunch of pussies. <laughs> oh, you try to... But, I mean, I think it's only your own children that could be wrong, but... <laughs> <laughs> I could I just know Korea's like giggling to himself as he's typing this shit. Oh. <laughs> I'm on a yeah, that's so true. <laughs> he's probably like <laughs> <laughs> There was like such a gremlin sound. Drop <laughs> in boys. Just gotta weigh up the risk reward. I mean, you just gotta teach him not to be a fucking snitch. That's <laughs> <laughs> True. Oh, okay. Oh, there we are. I'm in game. Yeah, I'm in game now. Um, this doesn't look right. Don't snitch or I'll hit you again. <laughs> exactly. Because <laughs> we're so dumb. <laughs> 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 when the Ryan quote comes in, if you snitch, I'm going to kill your entire I don't know why you guys think that's so crazy. Like, did you guys, like, not say this to all it's your not, friends? No, it's not yeah, crazy. It's normal to just kill someone's entire family. Yeah, but, like, you it's say it. It's not like I'm gonna, like, yeah. you know, do it. It was just, I just liked the tone of voice. I just thought it was funny. I'm going like, to kill your whole family. Yeah. The, the, <laughs> the deadpan way you said it. I'm going to just kill your entire family. <laughs> <laughs> yep. yeah. Also, I don't know, like, I feel like, I mean, I don't know. I, I feel like that, that specific happens, thing doesn't really translate. Failed wars. What? Uh, I don't know, like, saying, I mean, obviously you say, like, shit like like I that but I, I feel like something like bell. that doesn't really translate to, to german i don't know i don't think anybody would really say it say it like that <laughs> way <laughs> no, actually that's not it doesn't some translate to english would. so uh, <laughs> i agree <laughs> some people definitely would say that here to be fair uh, to their friends but i wouldn't go that far maybe unless i was very drunk and mm, thought i was funny German saying i wouldn't go that far uh, Walk and bring up. Right. I mean, I, I, I don't know, Korea. Like, I, I'd say like other like the things, right? But, I, I, that's why I was just saying like that. I feel like that thing just, or like that phrase just wouldn't really translate well. So what is this? Korea, what is wrong with you, bro? Probably a lot of things. Fine, I'll donate to his, uh, his cause tomorrow. Well, Mr. Auto Player, who do you think is the person that should die here? To Korea's cause? Mm. Nice. And, uh, 
when the game ends on turn one, 140. I mean, honestly, like, autism is, like, terrible and all, but, like, does the world really need to be more aware of Korea? I like, I don't know. <laughs> Pretty good game. Hmm? <laughs> I feel like there's a limit, you know? <laughs> How y'all are going to effectively determine if that's your chosen plan. <laughs> Too many bitches at men. <laughs> can't wait. Knights, you can take everything. <laughs> I just want Arvius dead. Uh, yes, I can Knights, respect it, Korea. the heaviest price. Come get it. Yeah. Well, I'm not doing nothing. Do you know that autism flag and Ukrainian flag are literally the same? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not surprised. <laughs> Who said that? Solex. Solex. <laughs> when you want to go or something? <laughs> Dude, why does everyone have a fucking flag? Why does autism has have a flag? Like, because it makes no sense, no? Proud. Yeah. I'm proud to be autistic. Well, surely you have enough iron. I don't know. The autism yeah. flag, I just googled it and uh, it really doesn't look like a do have iron. Ukrainian flag at all. Yeah, I have enough iron. Okay, let me do some math. What? Is it just a rainbow? No, that's like the gay flag. I mean, there's, no, like, there, there is, like, some, I mean, it's just, it's just like... <laughs> Solix <laughs> is fucking stupid. It's like an infinity, it's like an infinity, uh... A sign apparently on like yeah I just pulled it up colors. and then there's also like a version where it's like the fucking I don't, I don't know like this this weird flag where it's like all the all the rainbow and then the the triangle um, the unit rebase is two times the... there's also one version like that I don't know Solix sounds like a carrier of autism. Well, you would definitely Wait, be sorry. right. Yeah. So Lex, so Lex is like a carrier of uh, autism sounds that. like it's uh, like contagious. Which, to be <laughs> fair, like maybe Solex is autistic enough yeah. that it's actually <laughs> no, contagious. Is like That's definitely <laughs> Korea. Uh, Though maybe Smooth Tilt also has it. LGBTQ Palestinian hybrid flag. <laughs> That's that's interesting. I think Spoo's chill infected Ryan, so infected me. Smooth infected all of us. Yeah. yeah but you you're not the most prominent carrier. What? Of what? Of Dude all guy infected. The, the amount of people that say fucking meow is insane. Yeah. Yeah, I mean that's curious though. That's not. That's what I'm saying. Like, uh, like you, you caught the smooth tilt. The the fucking like smudge and shit. If so, yes. And I spread it like crazy. Mm hmm. Yeah. Like smooth tilt was like patient zero, but you were the guy who was going around, you know, having like. Um. Being a super spreader, basically, let's yeah. say, let's say it like that. Yeah. Yeah, you also have the biggest audience, so. It's Down Syndrome flag. Okay, why <laughs> does that have a flag? <laughs> <laughs> By the way, what's going on with the game? I'm not paying attention. Who fucking cares, man? Like, they're not doing anything about Arvius. Like, whatever. Yeah, so it's GG. The goat wins again. Hell yeah. I mean, he's still very far away from space, by the way. So the goat may may have some ways to go yet. I mean, his wind conditions are though, right? Is it? Well, I mean, that's the easiest wind condition, at least. Is what? I guess. His wind condition is what? To just, just go, go autocracy, autocracy and, and buy, buy stuff, but he doesn't, doesn't even have that much on aluminium. I don't think that's the move. I think it's probably just space. And I agree. Bet on them not figuring it out. Like, as in figuring out how to team him. It's 
1,600 gold per turn. A lot. Not that's, with, that's, with that's with zero that. commas. <laughs> so silly. With commas, you would be at like 3,000. Yeah. Uh, that, that's probably a bit too much, but yeah. It, it's very good, obviously. <laughs> I don't know. It's like it's two extra um, trade routes, right? So that's like uh, another ten percent modifier, and then it's like all the merchants. It's plus one gold on all the trading posts tiles, which he would actually have in that case instead of these farms and stuff. What do you uh, mean, Glossin just nukes him? What is nuking him gonna do? He's not. Gonna make he's him not sad. commerce. And how is he gonna nuke him? <laughs> I still don't understand the, the nuke idea for Glossen, but he's here. I'm not, so. You can't even say home owner, home owner, home owner without meow. <laughs> Dude, that's, that's so true, actually. What the fuck? That wasn't Korea that said that. No. Who said that? Flat Wales. Jesus oh, Christ. It's contagious. It's spreading. He's literally buying a part per turn. He has to get there for a stud. Red. It's going to be an interesting game still. Who's going to stop him? I, like all three of them? have to come together and through the power of teamwork yeah the tier two gold policy which one is that like the the one you get for building like stadiums and shit i think you might have it yeah i'm not sure maybe it's so fucking over yeah, yeah probably. i almost missed me over it's gotten too quiet <laughs> yeah. Did you hear what Knight said? What? No, what did he say? He said, I miss Miyota. It's gotten too quiet. <laughs> <laughs> so true. Glossin's smooching if it's too quiet. Yeah, I mean, Glossin's been quiet for way too long. He, he was so talkative until the fucking... Uh, until his, until he just hinted. His, his experiment failed. Yeah. Yo. Big noob. Yeah, Glossin's land it's is such... crazy, too. Like, I thought he was going to play Trad, honestly. But... I think what was... actually... Okay, by the way, what actually went... I mean, I know what went wrong with Knight's early game now after he told us on, like, turn 60, wait, my city's unconnected. But, like, what actually went wrong in Glossin's early game? Like, I... Nothing. I was nothing. so surprised... Glossin's early game was fine. No, no, nothing. But his... Honestly, nothing went wrong in Knight's either. He just didn't have the cities connected. But I don't know, like, I, I was so surprised that they didn't, like, beat us, like, me and Avius, like, by a lot in tech and stuff. They should have. I mean, Avius taking Messenger was hilarious to me, because obviously Knight should have taken it. Yeah. That's yeah, so good for the Iroquois. No, I mean, I, I think Sacred Path is good. He just needed to build a shrine, like, a lot sooner than he fucking did. I don't know if you know, but he built a shrine. Like his, he got his pantheon like ridiculously late. Yeah, I know they all did. Which is just bad was... on on Iroquois <coughs> especially. Yeah. So much culture just be leaving, be leaving, out to dry. Not for sight. Nice. 
for a quest, I would like to be its friend. You can't for the <laughs> Ergo watched the whole movie and borders have not changed. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty you just funny. Have to keep throwing missionaries at it. The only way. Alright, I mean. Alright. My faith isn't doing shit, so. I go fill up piety now? There are... Hold on. One, two, three, four, five... I have planted six admirals. <laughs> Unless I'm missing a couple, which is very possible. I think I have a lot of faith, but I don't really know what to do with it. Klaus and Spectre talking a bunch. I think he might be winning. I think he might think that he's winning anyway. All right, so if we were going to put, like, odds on each player winning the game right now, like, maybe. On what? Odds on each player. Uh, Arvius is obviously Claire's favorite, so. I would say, like, 50% obvious. Only 50 yeah. Actually yeah. surprising me. I would say 50% obvious, like 35% Glossen, 10% Knights, 5% Twelfty, maybe? I'd put Glossen on Twelfty probably right now because he looks just not checked in. You think Glossen has less? Uh, I think Herb has more, and I think uh... Glossen's probably about that. Okay. I think that's good. I mean, knights hit industry hit in um, information. Looks like he's going modern armor. It's so hard to push into obvious here, though. Like, it's such big borders, and he already used so many generals on me. trick. <laughs> Let the festivities begin. Anyone who's interested in joining in the fun, well, I got started early, but. We'll see how this goes. actually doing he was trying to plant a uh, settler on a uranium island so i killed it i also I mean, snagged does that mean you're ready to go or uh i'm ready to get started uh, I have a couple stacks of bombers that are in range. They don't really have anything to shoot because I don't really have good visibility set up yet. But yeah, I'm ready to get started if you're ready.
I need like two more turns before I can really get rolling, but Okay, let me know because I'm gonna be pushing into like probably six Probably stacks or everything. Yeah, yeah. And um, I'm gonna need air support. Yeah, I'll have air support along the coast ready in a couple turns. Uh, it depends where you want it. He's also got. What the fuck? He's a refrigeration? Am I reading that right? I have the he Yule does. bug. He does. I kind of, I, I kind of like how they're just kind of like talking off his right in front of him. Yields on the oil tiles to the right of the fish. You know, uh, right of Berlin. Are they? Yeah. Because I see the outline of an oil, uh, of an offshore platform, but I'm not entirely sure. I haven't um, been over there in a little while. It's one one for me. Okay, I'm just, I'm just imagining things. Pause. Two turns to create platform. Yeah, I'm not sure. Oh, Glossen actually has a big fleet coming, huh? What's the over under on Glossen getting at least one carrier sniped here? Yeah, Glossen getting some planes? No, no, a carrier. Like getting a carrier sniped. I know. That's uh, that's steering some planes. But, but yeah, I guess yeah, yeah, I guess that's the steer. I've associated steer with other things though. So. I really need another carrier. The steer to me is always uh, zero production focus. Oh, when you're flipping cities, just go on default focus? No, 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 just like in BD. Like, he just doesn't put production focus on. Oh, yeah? How is he it's so good? You know, it's like Chris is special. He's good at recovery. <laughs> Isn't this effectively kingmaking? Yeah, like I, I don't know who's gonna be stronger after they kill Arvius if they manage to. I mean, it's not kingmaking because Arvius is in the best spot. Yeah. If the carriers all got nuked, that would be hilarious. Oh, is Arvius nukes? I don't know, but that was just put in chat. Teaming sucks, you suck, Hawks. How about that? Teaming is, is the spice of FFA. Yeah, come on, Hawks. Play some more 170 game, uh, 70 turn uh, games. Exactly. Oh yeah, they're all grouped. If there's a, if if a nuke dropped on all of those carriers, that would be so funny. I don't think it will happen though. I mean, I don't know if Avius is building Manhattan even. How cooperative are you feeling, knights? Uh, that's 
a weird question. I you want to give me a text, y'all. I'll tell you what city if you want. If you don't want to, then I'll just roll like, for it. Um. He should have to up? pay for this. I don't have any money. <laughs> I assume you're spying my cap? I'm spying one of your cities. I don't really care that much. I don't think it's a big deal either way. But Boston's trying to get a free text deal from Knights. Classic. Science is pretty valuable at the stage of the game, no? Yes, it is. Possibly more valuable than gold. Yep. Yeah. Um. Bomb now? No, I, I tried to bomb through an intercept and I took half damage on a bomber. Which admittedly, like half damage is not that bad, but I was bombing a musket. I'm just probing, trying to figure out where. Defend. Sight range that fighters give. Uh, not sure. Trying to figure that. I think I'm gonna gonna go to bed as well. Alright. See you guys. <clears throat> User disconnected from your channel. Let me know when I can push. Um not yet. Okay. Two turns probably. In position. Nice probably shouldn't be swapping an auto anyway. He should be trying to kill Arbius then space. True. Yeah, I kind of agree with that take. Uh, open the goat. this shit work? Which, which shit? Change ideologies. You click the button, you have no production for two turns. You have no science for, I think, two turns as well. That's kind of bad if I'm generating scientists though, right? Yeah, you don't want to do it if you're generating scientists. You can do it whenever though.
wonder what 12G's thinking this whole time. These fucking Americans. <laughs> He's like, I fucking hate my life. God, I, play, I hate playing with fucking Americans. These guys don't know how to play the game. He's not wrong. He would be wrong if he was thinking that. Not sure if he is. These guys keep watching fucking O'Brien guides. Imagine. I think anyone can win, man. It's kind of been the theme of all of these fucking shit games. He wanted to go to we bed. I mean, that, that's the theme of free for all, right? Anyone could win because it doesn't matter what you do. True. But the whispers. Arv is not doing space. Well, when is he gonna switch to? What is he doing then? GDRs. I know he's got a uranium island. Maybe he's gonna stealth. Sure seems to lose that one. I mean, that's why I wanted Arf to go auto, right? Yeah. Because yeah. I thought stealth was his blood. I don't know how he does it, actually, on this. Did so, Arvius get Arvius shelters? I know he attacked refrigeration. I don't think he went up there. So, like, so you think it's over seventy-five percent? Is that what you're saying? I think uh, I think Arv is probably like more than sixty percent on winning this game. How does that cope then? Has to. Okay. Is that the bomb shelters? Let's watch our. Are you able to do any reporting on the distribution of his units? Um, well, he, I don't actually have any units, but once I push, I will be able to. Um, I have nuke cover up now. I just need to know where I'm nuking. I don't know how long I can keep you cover up though. He's gonna be able to probably push out and take the city eventually. It's not a very secure city. Do you have a lot of boats? I have a couple boats. I don't have that much. I also don't have the gold to upgrade my boats. What? I, 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 so they're all talking to each other right now. 
Mega. Uh, I don't think so. It's just funny, like, Lawson's like, I don't have that many boats. My city seems uh, very vulnerable. Yes, like, it's just funny, like, as Arbius hears him saying that. <laughs> it's like a one-turn move away. But, like, he's trying to be helpful to knights. So I get it, but it's just, it's just funny. Bomb shelters in all the cities. How much damage does it's triangle do? gaming on the tables. I think if, depending on what happens here. Yeah. I don't know. But, I mean, Arby's making a lot of gold, but let's keep in mind, guys. He does not have any fucking defensive modifiers whatsoever. All he's got are demos and gold. Which is technically a demo. Not a single combat modifier. Knights will have every single combat modifier after this. For the ex with the exception of Defender. I mean, he has Defender, it's just... Only Demo, oh, yeah, Science, Gold, no big deal. I'm just saying, like, when you're getting teamed... You can throw any demo advantage you have out of the window. They pick 25. Okay. He's only making 1300 gold per turn now. Well, the problem is difficult to nuke him down. Knights is top hammers. I mean, if they team, it's close in favor to win, right? I don't know. Knights is going to be on mo all these cities. Yeah, but... So, auto scary. They're all auto. Knights can switch now. They can. Oh wait, wait. If Arf can switch to auto, then it's GG. He can't though. He not. When is he gonna switch? He doesn't have time. What's it look like to push? I'm not, I'm not actually looking yeah, at the game. I mean, so. he's gonna have planes. <laughs> My input uh, is stupid. Yeah, Knights just flipped. Thank you, Solex. Um, Arvius can flip, technically, but he realistically can't because there's no time because he's getting teamed. Really don't want to see those. Fuck. Seems really dumb that frigates can. Uh, Gao, I don't think... I don't, I don't want to say ever, but it's... I don't know. Guys, here's the thing. Like, everyone's like, oh, Arby's is going to win. Arby's. 
these fucking free for all games are bullshit, man. Like, I feel yeah, like you never know what's gonna happen. Everyone, like everyone, always underestimates how fucking important and effective teaming is. Like, it's brutal. Brutal. Yeah, it's 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 crazy how much teaming can sway a game. And ARP has not been teamed very much in tournament, to be honest. Like, yeah. Like, actually, out of, like, notable people, I think ARP is one of the few people that really doesn't get teamed very often in tournament. Achilles doesn't either. At least this tournament. Arv hasn't been teams in tournament much, but he's been teamed a bunch in the past. Well, yeah, but yeah, obviously that's but not like... a a anyone playing tournament and like winning games has been teamed a lot in the past. Arvius doesn't get team five fighting Arvius is a thing for a reason. Uh, that's a thing in his fucking Twitch, bro. Like what? He he does not get teamed very often. Dude, That's I've seen the, him get teamed uh, a couple times, and he, he just not get teamed very often. It's only a of time before I die. You want me to have this? Yeah, I agree, Solix. Is it? Yeah. You have fucking nine hundred something hammers producing nukes all day on me, and I'm being invaded by tanks, and I can't defend. I'm not so the he, one. I'm gonna get rolled. He definitely does. Like, I, like I said. He has a shitload of gold, shitload of hammers. No, it's it doesn't awesome. fucking matter. Oh, he, he actually just switched to auto here. Why did what? he switch to auto? Oh my god, no! That, is that two turns with no prod? Three. Dude, he's just gonna die. Oh, is it is it only two? Thought it was three. He folds over without combat modifiers. It's not that. It, it it's the there's like a, I mean when I don't know how to uh, make it like. Tell me if you don't agree with this, but at least to me. Often it feels like there's like this flow with when you're warring and stuff where as soon as you like let off to get like in the Barca situation, right? You need to. Yeah, I mean, it's initiative, right? It, yeah. That's the word. You, once you lose the tiles you're standing on, it's really hard to take them back if you don't have like a critical mass of units. Yeah, I agree. Like it's, it's, so, it's, it's initiative, right? Yeah. So it's not just the fact that, um, He's going to like have no combat modifiers or whatever. It's mostly that even when he gets them, he's got to finish building the units. And then those units have to then like take position, which they weren't in in the first place. So his, condi his win condition now is surviving with the team. He yeah, but he's not going to. Uh, he might survive. You're not looking. I mean, even if he loses his cap, it's not the end of the world, right? Why? Because he has enough hammers and gold to... He's not going to have any I mean, gold. Just... It requires whispering, obviously. Oh, for sure. Why didn't Arv go stealth? That is a good question. And I don't know. That's, I mean, he was supposed to. He was supposed to go wild. That was what Mega was saying he should be doing for like 50 turns.
What is crazy to me is that he went shelters and it worked out. You know what I mean? Like, that's the craziest part. Because <laughs> no one should have went nukes this game. Like, it didn't make sense for anyone to go nukes. He sussed it out. He knows Glosson better than Glosson knows himself. I guess so. When you decide to be passive against teaming, it always feels the worst. Yeah. Damn, Knight's got some good clicks. Second heal promo snipe I've seen. Dude, Knight's is a like he's a good war player. Like genuinely. Yeah, he beat Ryan in tournament. Like, come on. True. You're not wrong. I mean, I did lose to him. And it wasn't close. It wasn't even close. I hope he wins this game. I, I really do. Glosson deserves to lose based on the yeah, anyone, absolute anyone besides dis Glosson disaster. Is kind of where my money is at. 12G comeback. Look, if anyone in this lobby could pull it off, it's him. I, I agree. Like, 12G can win this game. It's just... It's his so hard. Is so he's, so, he, he's so bad. Any one of them could just walk over and just be like, <laughs> and he's dead. I'm gonna be dead in probably like four turns, twelve G. Consider your plays. might be in your interest to help me. Twelve G needs to snipe some text off Arv. That's a good call. I think I think if twelve G wants to have a good chance, he needs to snipe some text. That's something that like it's so hard to time properly, if that makes sense. Right? Because if you like if you go too early then you may have just swung it and you know you don't want to be the that guy who's like swings it and makes the it even worse but you also want to make it so that it's as expensive as possible for knights and Clawson. but if you're too late then you get nothing and then it's just fucked it's hard yeah it's i agree it's very hard to time match that stuff Since Knights and Glossen share a real border. I mean, Glossen and 12G share a border. So, I mean, Glossen and 12G share a real border. But yeah, no, I know what you mean. Who nuked Arv? Glossen. I think like twice at least, maybe three times. The play that was considered, I want the next one. <laughs> yeah, looks like it. Three times, yep.
So under that logic, are you saying Glosson's in the worst spot? What are you doing right now? What am I doing? Yeah. yeah. I'm letting my units heal for a turn. I'm also moving another nuke over. Forest nuke. I did launch four nukes into him, though. <laughs> That's uh, not nothing. I'll have another one ready to go in two turns. I mean, it's finished now, it's just an issue of getting it over to the city. That stuff's thinning out a bit. No, Glossin's building nukes, man. Yeah, I'll that's, be able to that's a lot of hammers. Round in a minute. But Glossin is a rat, so... Um, I... I fully expect I the worst. I'm mostly bombers. <laughs> How is his air cover? Um, he has quite a few fighters and jet fighters, but I'm sleeping, so. Okay. Are there tiles that you know for certain are clear? I mean, know for certain are clear. Like, have slept through. Um, nope. I used all my sleeping stones. Okay. You know, I have some more here. I dare you call Glossin or Brett. <laughs> Rats everywhere would be offended. As I remember, Arv helped 12G in this game. How did Arv help 12G? He pulled himself back up and he has more. Am I missing something? So. The only time I remember Arv interacting with 12G is when he killed his fucking scout in the very beginning of the game. By giving him free text? True. What's up, Azo? All the EU people went to bed. Well, most of them. It's too in my mind. Most of them went to bed. I just watched my viewers drop over the last hour from like 100 to 70. You had, uh, yeah, because all the raids, uh, all, all the Russians went to sleep. No, we, we were chilling at 100 for like two hours. It's 4 a.m., Tom. What the fuck? Tom, aren't you playing a game? In yeah, you're playing tomorrow. You're, you're playing today. Yeah, you're playing today. Tough. That's a <laughs> game. I'm like... <laughs> probably like five hours from now. <laughs> no, I think it's 12 hours from now. Yeah, I think it's 12 hours. Is it only 12? Yeah, because I think the, the last one, the first one today started at 9 a.m., and I think the other one was at 9 a.m. too. My time. Good luck, Tom, by the way. Tom. May you rule me Macedonia again.
got some sleep. So how likely do you think it is that this game adjourns? Not very. Hmm. I, don't, I don't think it's... I don't know, it depends on 12G, I guess. Well, g are there any slots that would be useful for me to nuke? near Aguala. Left of wine in Aguala. I don't have range on it, but I'll have range on it pretty soon. Um, two turns. Yeah, okay. Uh, I don't have as much spy sight as I would like is the biggest issue. Um, but yeah, I, I am trying to nuke for units, not for cities. There's like a nice array of units between Vancouver and Ottawa. I'll see if I can hit somewhere in that mix, maybe. Proposal for your knights. If you want peace at some point, and you want to do something different, I'll work with you. You're currently paying the highest price in this war. I mean, I feel like most of your units are occupied with me right now. And I don't see the efforts elsewhere. I am dropping so many nukes. Yes, I'll die eventually. Just, uh... I'm more than happy to change the team order here, if you find it in your favor. Arvius is like desperation trying to whisper right now. Gotta respect it. The problem is Watson has more you can what you have to do. Yeah. Um, he's got a huge land army. I just foresee... Okay, more nukes going to me, you finished me off, and then you're gonna get nuked. Yep. Which what if I, I make like a deal? I'll say turn 162. Ten turns, no nuke after Arvius dies. A miniature nu uh, non -nu nuclear non proliferation. Is that fine? Good deal let by Glosson. Let me be specific. Glosson is saying. Arvius is saying. Cities. Once you stop warring me, for ten turns, Glosson's gonna nuke Arvius you, leaving myself open to and you're fucked, my own cities, right? To nuke the tiles between Timbuktu and Genesee River. Glosson's like, after, uh, how about I won't drop a nuke on you for ten turns after Arvius, Arvius is dead? Goddamn. To add to this, I would like to note that I am autocracy. I don't have as much gold. I cannot buy space parts anymore. I do not have uh, full rations or anything like that. So the threat you thought I was is not necessarily the case anymore. You're still top top. Arv getting three v one, dude. This is how. This is how the games always end. The guy who's closest to winning is just gonna keep getting teamed. Until they're all super close to winning, so and then it's hammers. yeah, gold is hammers though. That's how it goes. Not so much anymore. I mean, as oh, long as I'm not I'm not I'm yeah, that's not how the first game went. I didn't watch the first game, so I don't have much. 
many comments. I'm not in an overwhelming position, is what I'm trying to tell you. Yes, but you are isolated on the other side of the map. And Get a chance to team his Achilles and didn't? Yeah, I mean, look, uh, that was my first question. Was why wasn't Achilles we have team? No hope of moving this game anymore. Because he was in the best spot. Because the CISO was in the best spot. Because you're isolated. Is the answer. You're really far away from everyone. And then Azuzo is eating a burger. Azuzo is eating a burger. There you have it. That's why I didn't get to eat. Just don't eat a burger and uh... There's tanks and planes. It doesn't really matter. Like this tile it's the most Tony thing ever? Yeah. Yeah. No. I don't worry. I have no doubts. <laughs> <laughs> Died eating a burger, XD. Korea, I thought you said 12G was going to war him. What if I animate for anti tank art? so cool. You, I thought you said 12G was going to war Arvius. Oh, dude, I don't know. Do you guys want to watch someone other than Arv? I feel like Arv is kind of covering all the bases. That's why I'm staying on him. Dude, I'm tired. I've been streaming for nine fucking hours. Oh yeah, there's 12G. <laughs> well, yeah, 100%. And Knights knows it. But maybe Knights... But that... Okay, you're right. But what you're not seeing is you're not seeing it from Knights' perspective where he's like, maybe I can tank it out. Or maybe I can convince them that killing me right afterwards is not how either of them win the game. Or I have to convince one of them to come into teaming with me. That Arvius is right, but that doesn't mean that it's in Knight's best, best interest to let Arvius live. If Knight knows what's good for him, and he, trust me, he does, he knows that Arvius is probably very, very close to stealth. And if Arvius hits stealth with, you know, eight, 900 fucking gold per turn and auto bonuses. Yeah, Knights knows this situation. Yeah, like, I, I, people, I, I, I'm not watching Arv chat right now, but I could just 100% just see, like, Arv chat just being like, oh my god, Knights is griefing, it's king making. Like, it's not. Like, Knights' best chance is to not let Arvius live. I'm not saying that's what you're saying, Kriya, but they're not saying anything is a Z mode only. True, I forgot. I don't think Knights is grieving. Knights, think about think about what Knights is getting for this. Knights is stealing his way up to stealth. So him killing Arvius is not just like putting him as a big threat, but he's also get he's he's put propelling himself into. First place science. Well, gee, if you can call Kyle, he immediately gets teamed, but. Um, yeah, he gets teamed, but like, he's still gonna be in a really strong spot. Nice. And w when when you hit triangle timing, like best you can kind of okay. convince people to do stuff a lot easier than fo with four people. Four tiles left to yeah, four tiles left to blah blah blah. Twelve G, is the one getting played. Uh, I, he kind of has to enter, try to win. Not necessarily. I don't think 12G is getting played. Who's he getting played by? No one asked 12G for help. You know, 
Yeah, 12G is just, just in the shit scenario. 12G is just trying to salvage his fucking game. On Cotton. That one's gonna be a bit tricky. Plus a great uh, so. I will do what I can. 12G's play makes more sense than Knight's. Uh, I mean, given the context, maybe? I don't... You can't really compare the two, though. Because, like, 12G's only makes sense given what Knights is doing. Figure out what I'm doing after changing ideology. And think about it like this. If they don't go for fucking Arvius now, he wins the game. I don't understand wh where the disconnect is. I mean... Yes. I mean, clearly Arvius needs to be teams, so... They should stop attacking and let, let, let him win. Yeah, I actually agree with that, Box. Good point. What's wrong with RV is winning? This is a good question. I mean, there's nothing wrong. The GOAT deserves to win. He had the best game. He, he had the he, clearest fucking... Uh, best decision-making. Yeah. Best he, sim. Best decision-making. Like, he uh, went in Berkus and uh, had a very clean kill. Everything he did was super fucking calculated, worked exactly as planned. He deserves it. He made Miota relevant to his uh, fake war. The one person I feel bad for is 12G. Genuinely. Got such a dog shit start. Simmed out of it into a pretty 12G? good position. Yeah. Simmed out of it into a pretty good position. Had really no opportunity to do anything except maybe to punish Glosson harder, but even then I don't think he could have. No, I don't. His game is Yeah. Like, yeah. yeah. Like, I, I wouldn't know what to do in his spot. Yeah, neither would I. Arby's playing 60 chess with everyone else, stalling himself for his Barkus to farm. Oh, wait, wait! I hit bingo! Guys, I hit bingo. Oh, wait. Turn 160 yet. Have I hit my bingo? Yeah, it's 163. Oh my god, we hit bingo twice. Oh my god. Dude, pogs in chat. Holy fuck. That is lit. Bingo, bingo, bingo. Got that city for you. Like, you know who's not getting anything from this? Fucking Glosson. Nice. Glosson is literally getting nothing. He's getting a he's getting the ability to sim behind it, which is obviously something. But compared to fucking Knights, who's getting a shitload of tech steals, and 12G, who's getting tech steals, all Glosson's doing is building nukes and throwing them away. Now, he's obviously prepping for war with the next people. So, obviously, his position is still really good. But I'm not saying... Like, it's not as clear-cut as people are making it out to be. That's what makes these late-game Civ games pretty interesting. Is because everyone is doing the correct thing right now. And I can, I can confidently say that. I agree. Knights, can I have that destroyer? <laughs> no, Arb's fine. Yeah, he, he's got it. He, yeah, the one floating around. Is Knights uh, waiting for another nuke to drop? Knights is probably biding his time, oh right? He knows that the longer he waits, the more nukes are going to come. The more he can sim up behind. The more he's going to be ready for everyone else. It's in everyone's best interest to do the least amount of work.
Literally can't tell if Arv's holding on or not. I think it's... I, I don't think he is. I mean... I think Knights is just kind of chilling. Waiting for more nukes to come. I think the problem is, once he gets stealth, they all are going to just pop him. <clears throat> he, he doesn't have enough gold to upgrade enough stealth to kill everything. Yeah, and he's not auto. And he, no, he's auto. I don't know. He, he's auto. Who has stealth? No one. But Knights, uh, Arvius is, is the closest. Wait, Knights has stealth? Hold the phone. Oh, good job, Knights. Yeah, because he just... Um... I guess that's what he was waiting for. Yeah, I mean, there's those, those, those literally the benefits of killing Arvius. 100%. 100% Glosson will break that deal with Knights. You know, it's possible, depending on how if Knights gets additional steals, that he can get to... Um, bunkers, which would be huge. Or shelters, sorry. Your RR surely now is when you tell Glosson about the stealth. Do they know he has stealth? Yeah, so Knights is waiting to push because he just switched to auto. Yeah, he can shelter us from art exactly. 3k gold really backfired. Not really. I mean, Arvius was making fucking two, like almost 2,000 gold per turn. When at yeah, the time no, he this, gave him, it was 1,300. This was both. This is a this is a good play from Arvius. It was worth the risk. Two turns of gold is worth a potential tech steal. 100% of the time. Um. What's up, Zach? Ooh, and Knights is about a natural hey, GA. Now we're talking. Um, I'm pushing once again. I have a nuke that can go somewhere. Eight already died this turn. Worthy sacrifice. Yeah, I agree. It's not just the knight's attack, guys. If knight stalls, builds a bunch of stealth. Um... Like, is, uh... I wonder what's happening with the 12G. Um, Let's look at him. Coffee, of Ottawa. Be nice. coffee, no, so he took one city. Yeah. Wait, he just moved it? Yeah. 12G is benefiting a lot. Where did he move it? Do you know? And he's stealth intent. All of this because they're teaming Arv. Yeah, the only person not benefiting is Glossin. Arvius is not benefiting. Okay, well, he doesn't count. For keep track. <laughs> For keeping track. 
I'm sure Irv would prefer not being teamed right now. Done. He did get Arv's cap. That's what a nuke does. So laggy now. How far off stealth is Lawson? Good question. Let's check. Lawson is heading for GDR. <laughs> my course. Yeah, my course. Yeah, everyone should pay me. I mean, Glosson probably knows. Knows what's up. I.
Glosson looks kind of weak. Oh, wait, but I thought Glosson was just going to shit on everyone right as soon as he finished killing Arvius. Wait, guys, I thought... I thought... Ar what? Oh, guys, I'm confused. I thought Knights Some was griefing. Come on, come on, come on, guys. Guys, I thought Knights was griefing. This is king making. This is king making textbook. I hate all of you fucking morons. Guys, I think Knights was great. I, I think, guys, I think this is textbook king making. Um. <laughs> Clausen's king making for 12G. Someone ban him. Guys, I, I can't believe knights would do this. It's fucked up. It's fuck I was, I'm, me and Mega are arbiters. We're going to ban him. We're going to ban him. Arbiter. Oh, you're not? I think you were. I was at one point. Oh, yeah. Wait, then you just fucking fell asleep during the game. Dave, uh, <laughs> <laughs> Mega is asleep. Oh my god, I forgot. That was so funny. Now it's the time for the teamers to start back t stabbing each other. Uh, Probably. I think uh, it's in their best interest to kill like Montreal first. But well, How long does this no nuke pact last for? Ten turns? Is he considered dead now, but, but still in the game? Uh, I'm considering it since the loss of his pack, yeah. Why did I make that? This is a dumb thing to do. Shouldn't need to control you into killing someone who needs to die. Just break it if people like seeing it. Is it the standard rule it. where if he still has half his cities, he can stay in the game? You can stay in the game as long as you want. You can stay as long as he wants. After also, atomic. I'm going to offer even you without atomic. For your I don't think there's a rule for amp, right? Uh, uh, no, it's the same as NQ rules. Hits no point. Right now. Or, so, NQ rules, I, I think, is after 10 turns. Hits no you have to go, but that rule is not... So for example, if you take some... Um, you haven't moved any in. in effect, <laughs> post-atomic. You consider that within the letter of... Or within the spirit of the agreement? Sure. Hawks! Over, under, uh... I'm interested in killing Arbius right now. Yeah. Like, do you think... What are the... I have a new position. Are you... Do you think that Glossen's gonna break like, this deal? You're being pretty quiet on that front. I mean, I don't really have anything that I can do at this point. I don't have sight on the right cities to bomb. No? I have bombers available. Yeah, I don't think so I have, either. Uh, I'm getting good vibes from Glossen. that are, like, around Tegadus. I have this debate as well. Uh, There's a turning theme that says something Tegadus, else. Arbiter says thank you. Probably move that one. Uh, or near the city. Um, We're scrapping the 10 turn rule. Maybe the game is specific to the tournament. That I can move in next turn. And yeah, that's my material. With with I islands gone, I don't think that rule is necessary game. anymore. As I have been doing for like this entire war. <laughs> oh yeah, I don't. I don't and doubt you, your. Loyalty at this uh, being like, what happened been, after? I've been pretty clear how I've been doing this this entire time. Been pretty clear, been pretty open. I will nuke where you tell me to nuke. I will nuke what you tell me to nuke. It's 
if you take this deal of knights, I will only be interested in 12G. What's the deal? Well, I can't do that since it has a nap in it, but... Nap? Oh, well, uh... You know. Wait, there's no more naps post-atomic, right? You want to stop attacking me, though? If yes, I man. stop attacking yeah. Argus, I will consider that breaking the deal. I mean, yeah, like... I'm not gonna... Drop. Oh, shit. That seems pretty cut and dry. You took my capital, though. I'm currently bombing down Vancouver. We're nuke. We're nuke. Need to go. What's up, Glosson? If I'm Glosson, I'm not nuking Arv anymore. Oh yeah, no, no, no shot. Knight's making good progress. I'd like to see him take Montreal.
Knight's getting team soon. Uh, I think they want to kill Arbius first. I just don't understand these wars feel like critical mass of units is meaningless at this point. I mean, it is. But if you, like, can soak up more shots than them, then you can potentially get a... Uh, Um, like more damage on the city or something like that. Is 12 GF stealth yet? Nope. Uh, he doesn't have a scientist for... S so this is seven full turns. Austin is still hard teching. I don't know why he's going GDRs. Our boy is pretty close to space. He was also the only freedom player. He was shitting on everyone in demos. So, oh, true. He's fucking song high. I forgot. That's why he's going GDR. Duh. Okay. Okay, I, I like this a lot more this from Glosson's perspective. Twelve Gs out of steam into Arvius. I mean, this is when Songhai shines. This is why you pick so fucking Songhai. This end game bullshit is when you is the reason you pick Songhai. I'm crashing. Bit five's not responding. I made it to load screen. Was I host or were you host? I think I was. But okay, it's not responding when I'm just black screened. Pretty sure my closet has expired. So that's fun. Mine and 12 Gs are fresh. Because they can attack GDRs from the sea. No, because GDR's problem late game is crossing rivers. And Songhai doesn't care about rivers. Am I hot pointing or do you reload? Uh, not sure yet. Hot join. Hot join. How many stealth bomber hits can a GDR take? It really depends on promos, right? If you have a stealth bomber that's promoted with all rough and it's standing on rough terrain, and that's the, and let's let's assume that stealth bomber's got triple promos, triple land promo. Um, right, my good swing. It'll take probably like six to eight shots, maybe more. But if it's on flat and it's got rough terrain promo, maybe like four or five. So it really depends on promos. It pauses the same timer, so it's still long. Does that sound right to you, Mega? Uh, yes, I like that. So essentially, GDRs are amazing unless you're fading, un unless you're fighting Commerce Stealth, because Commerce Stealth is able to build a shitload and then buy a shitload. Right? If they can buy four per turn, and they're taking a ton of damage. It doesn't really matter, but if you have to hard build them, and maybe so you have like your like aluminum shortages and stuff uh, like that, GDRs will just oh, well, rip them uh, apart. Problem is, and I'm sure Glosson's gonna face this issue too. 
You he doesn't have gold to buy GDR. He doesn't have faith to buy GDR. How is he gonna get them? Hard building them? Okay, Glosson's still nuking. So, I mean, as you guys are well aware, the higher the base combat of the unit, um, the more important, like, the promos matter. GDRs are the highest base combat strength of any unit. 250. So... Arvis basically Barkus now. Came full circle, I guess. Or something. Just kind of patrolling. I wouldn't mind sniping uh, Ogwala if it's alright. Um, yeah, I think that one. You have to ask Gold G4. Patrol G, do you mind if I snag Ogwala? Uh, I'll have it next turn. I can't, uh, I can put damage on it though. I like how they're talking about like uh, sharing which cities they're each one of them are gonna take. Very cute. I mind. Yes. <laughs> RP no says, I mind. <laughs> oh, I probably don't get it. <laughs> That's really sad. Why do you gotta be like that? Where's my fight? Alright, that's fine. I've said it before, but it's borderline impossible to win a uh, 3v1 team if the three people attacking are not completely irrelevant. Like, even if they're like an era behind, it's so fucking hard. It's like not possible. Like 2v1, doable. 3v1, no. Yeah, it's, it's, it's so brutal. If I was 12G, if you were 12G here, would you have teamed? I, it's, I don't see 12, what 12G is doing is teaming. I see it more like opportunistically getting techs. Yeah, did you lose units in this one? Uh, yes, he did. Especially if the guy teaming doesn't have an advantage. Well, that's never the case. You never get 3v1 teamed unless you have an advantage. You'll get teamed, like 2v1 teamed if you have an advantage, if you don't have an advantage, but you'll never get 3v1 teamed if you have an advantage. RV has clearly had a very large advantage here. Um, yeah, there's a reason why we were saying, like, he's like 70% chance to win the game or whatever the yeah. fuck. Oh, from like does that RV even have more text than him yeah, anymore? It, it needs to be an than who? So it's not about does he have more text. It's what, does he it's have text that Knights doesn't with, have, uh, right? So Arvius went up to uh, bomb shelters, or whatever. It's very unlikely that Knights tech that. Is this the point where 
So even if Knights has more like text total, it's very likely Arvius still has text for him to take. Really cool. Would it also be really cool if I turned around? So after all this is said, who do we favor? I don't know. I think. I think it's like. <laughs> this game is such a shit I think it's like 40 40 Glosson Hot Knights and then 20% for 12G. Like, 12G just has way more experience than both of them. You have stealth. So I gotta give him, like, something. But let's say it was, like, Knights in the 12G spot and someone random in the Knight spot. I'd probably give. Knights I mean, the 12 I previously spot, said like, there was a one percent chance for I Oxford fucking 12G to win. So. I think it's higher than that now because there's a chance that he gets to stealth. Yeah, he's getting stealth. Like he's five turns off. But the problem is he's got no fucking gold. But it's not like there's no bomb shelters. <laughs> is this the lowest gold you've seen on cover fly? Uh, no. Seven turns to build them. He was he was losing more than that earlier. I just don't understand. It's because he's not building any fucking uh, trading posts. Yeah. Oh, fair enough. I actually think 12G will clown on them. Look, I, I think if 12G was in even, like, any, like, incrementally better position, 12G would be substantially more favored. Right? Even though he's weaker, I think he'd be favored. But his position is so ass. It is so fucking bad. Yeah, he, he needs... Like he's relying on the triangle. Between stealth and reset. And triangle honestly, I open. I hate to say this kind of thing, but it's true. His, the fact that his English isn't perfect means that against Glossin, he's never going to get a word in, and it's going to be really hard to navigate like the teaming triangle. Does that make sense? Like Glossin is such a, like a dominant speaker when he's talking. Like he he will just. Yeah, but the, the issue is his gloss and song will be the uh, strongest spot. So, like, I don't think he's going to get persuaded into attacking knights, for example. No, but I'm saying, because I, I feel like knights is going to be kind of the the, in, in, the integral, I, like, and, and, person and to convince. knights is going to be baited into attacking 12G, because 12G is obviously the biggest spot in this game. Sure. Uh, his English is very good. That's not my point at all. I think his English is great. I, I've said, I feel like everyone... All the Russians or Ukrainians that play with us have like phenomenal English. I think it's just that they like aren't super like confident, especially enough to talk over people. Yeah, I agree. Like it's the confidence, I guess, so speaking. But in, Solex in doesn't, doesn't, doesn't count. He doesn't need and, and and Achilles right. kind of breaks that rule. Achilles will talk over people, but even if, even still though. He, Achilles is still like kind of quiet. I think I think this is actually a position that Twelve G would like though, right? In this game, not not like, but like uh, he he doesn't have to do anything, like because he's obviously never getting attacked. Sure. Like it's literally a gloss and knight duel with him riding along. So he can just like sit back and uh, build stealth bombers. Yeah, potentially. Like this is one of the scenarios that I am very terrible at. Like I'm, I, I try to be more proactive than I should be. But uh, the problem is problem if you are too passive, and the other people are like killing each other, you'll get what happened to me in the Kuba Care End Game. In you. you were in that game. I killed you. Do you, mind if I you remember? Do I was Byzantium. Yeah, the worst spawn of all time. Yes, that was I terrible. Sure you want that. Um, get, like, an or but in, in if you remember, like my position Did in that game, they were just killing each other. I was just building uh, a bunch of units, and then they just decided, actually, which, let's like, just kill him. Confused. And then they just Didn't popped me in like two turns. Yeah. Even I mean, the, the game knights yeah. won. Oh, that actually qualified him oh, was the game where I uh, did exactly what I'm talking about. Like I uh, was over eager on teaming. Yeah, I remember. And 
like this is the scenario that I could see uh, 12G falling. <laughs> Dude, because she said sunlight coming through the window because 12G's kind of... It's so funny. How does that make sense, Glosson? You say you don't really care, but you're specifically asking for something that you must care about. I don't really care. I care, I just don't care that much. I have marble elsewhere, and I don't think it's going to be a very relevant factor in this game. Hey, Ryan, are you driving up to uh, New York to uh, see the clips? Uh, I am not, no. That would be hell of a drive. Ever. Is that real? I annexed it. It's visible in my city. Uh, I believe Damn. cities don't ever get passed. I don't know. Let's see, so... Is, I haven't looked into it at all. Oh my you God. should come up to Montreal. Ooh, no. Whatever. Th there's snow here right now. You can uh, put your winter tires off. Uh, I don't think that would work that <laughs> I haven't driven in my car in the fucking snow yet. What? Kind of scared too. I mean, I it'll be fine. Just... Nice and I have like good tires. Not get any tech off I, it. I mean, I would assume so with the uh, with your car. Yeah. yeah. I did not get any tech. It's a little suspicious. These dips don't get tech ever. If you did have good tires, that'd be uh... yeah. We'd be in a bit of a pickle. Be a bit annoyed as 12 to you with Irv. How like, you... why is Irv taxing 12G hardest? I don't think he is. I just think he knows that he's there's no chance for or there's no point for him to put units in front of cities because him and Glosson are coordinating so well. So it's like. At least I can stop something. Yeah, I guess. So far, 12G lost I mean, more than I mean, he can I mean, walk. I guess he just sit That's on not remotely on. true, dude. He, Sukap. he gained so much in terms of tech steals. Even just from a single tech steal. Oh, yeah, I'm trying to keep Okay. Yeah, he's still trying to win. I don't really understand, but I see. I'm confused. I'm not seeing what you're seeing. 12G has lost more than uh, lost more than he won, but he's also like. How about I just? He has to do this to have a chance in the game. Yeah, exactly, Box. Just on a completely non-bingo related note. Vashwin complained about FFA yet. <laughs> uh, oh, yeah, I, he, I got bingo. he complained so much about FFA that he stopped, that he left the Discord, or he left the the, the stream because he just didn't want to take, he couldn't take it anymore. So I don't know if that answers your question. Mm -hmm. I got bingo with my turns again. Easy peasy. <laughs> Hell yeah, brother. I hit bingo twice. I guess I'm just... If only team... Actually, teaming happened. Yeah, teaming yeah. happened. Yeah, I, I, I've hit... I've hit it twice. Bingo! Has Scientist Decay happened yet? Yeah, Yoda. Uh, got some Scientist Decay. Oh, three times. Easy. Everyone in chat should know that Mega lost an Expo War to Zack during the conf... <laughs> what? Mega, is this true? Yes. What the <laughs> fuck? I didn't lose it. It was just like I captured two cities <laughs> and then I can't make. I stalled. I did the Arpius. 
Mm. I'm crashing. Minute to meter. All right, for everyone that's here, be sure to follow the stream. I stream very, very consistently. Well worth the follow. Exactly, Box. Yeah, you, you, everyone just subscribe to Ryan. Yeah, everyone subscribe to me. I'm a super active Civ player. Easier your primes. I don't have. I I will never monetize Twitch because the fucking ads. I hate the ads. All right, Box wasn't following me for this long, bro. What the fuck? They don't play ads. Yo, thanks everyone. And if you want to get better, if you want to be playing in these games, I don't know why you would, but if you do, <laughs> Night's Dawn. There, there's a Discord for that. There is a Discord to get you up to speed. Become a playoff contender in six short months. Yeah, I can't, I can't take this fucking ads, man. So I don't put anyone else through it. Join. You could do what me and Ryan were not able to do, yeah, that which is qualify good. for playoffs. <laughs> yes. Kind of. If anyone wants to do my stuff. work for me, I will no, qualify for playoffs. Otherwise, it's Let's gonna see. be a no for me, dog. Yeah. Then. Did you guys Did actually play this time around? No. I don't know. <laughs> I haven't played I haven't played Civ no, in three no, months. <laughs> Something like that. Okay. You played. I played a I single played a fucking game. game. I played a single game. Six years on Twitch. Bro, I did monetize my YouTube channel. I'm making bank. You wanna guess how much I have made name? so far? I don't know, my host has not been the most stable, but... Mega, do you want to guess? Mind. Okay. Your Twitch? My... My Twitch doesn't make any money. My YouTube. Your YouTube? My YouTube. You, you said Twitch on, uh... Let's see... Yeah, I was gonna say zero for your... For your Twitch. And for your YouTube, I'd guess, uh... Yeah. Uh... 48 cents. Nope! A dollar twenty-eight. We are cooking. Oh, Go off. The, that's going straight into the, the donation fund. Yeah. Tomorrow. Oh yeah, dude. I'm fucking killing it. Now, honestly, the only reason why is because I only have one video monetized because I only just turned it on. So it's just this one video. Which one? Tearless. The tearless one. And I set it to limited. <laughs> Because I just assumed that's what it was, but apparently I can have it on like non limited and normal, and I would be making even more money. But I, I haven't posted any videos. So. Yeah, you're, you're, you're missing out on bank. Like, you, you put Dude, that I'm missing out on so much potential profit. You, you, you could post that video, put it on. Uh, Wait, is RV is done? Monetized. And, you, leave? Uh, you know the video, Doc. Yeah. I mean, that would definitely pull a lot of views. And everyone would get really mad. <laughs> yeah, Herb's gone. I'd be gone too. This boosts 12 G spot for sure. Right? Arv is gone, Ashwin. You can come back now. Thank you for the follow, bro. Don't fuck up. I have no promises there. I will stream once in the next two months. 
That is a promise. How about that? Reading on our band. It's a pretty big, uh, pretty big commitment for me. So you're Make welcome. Oh, Arva's trying to retry. Bro, oh, Arva's, his stream died. No, it's, Ergo, it's you haven't been following me either? What the fuck? We're, I thought we were friends. First box, now Ergo. I unfollowed to follow again. Yeah, okay. RuneScape Plower. Dude, I've been on a RuneScape kick lately. It's really good because I've been working a lot. So it's something I can do on the side. And then like I can like play it more actively if I want. Knights. Oh, you want me to invite? Thank you, Ergo. I appreciate you. I don't believe you, but take it. It just says add friend. Yeah, you send a friend request. Yeah. Let me just boot up in this game. Uh, Add I think my internet cut out, so. Okay. Yeah, it says you're offline on Steam, so. Oh, now you're online. Okay, try it right now. I have almost hit 1,300 subscribers on YouTube. That's pretty good. I'm, yeah, I'm you, getting you can, like... You can get so many subs. What? You could get so many subs on Twitch. No, I don't want... To, I'd feel really bad taking people's money. Especially because I'm like so inconsistent with it. Like I don't, I don't want the responsibility associated with having like a paying subscriber. Does that make sense? <clears throat> Yeah, I, like if I sub to you, I want content. <laughs> like a real. I'm not talking about you. I'm not talking about you. Twenty four seven. Getting DMs in the morning. Where are you? <laughs> Why aren't you streaming? Yeah, ergo. That's exactly how I am. Oh, I'm sorry. Lawson did not take good care of your destroyer. I didn't. <laughs> There's like a collection of units up north. Okay. Um, and We're getting we're nukes. Getting so, do you, do you think Lawson manages to convince 
12 G to team. I don't, I don't think he does. I don't think so. I, I think 12 G is immune to that. Does, uh, does Glosson win the 1v1? Does 12 G win the 1v1? Uh, Glosson. Glosson win the 1v1. Between Knights? I would lean, I'd be inclined to say yes, but I don't know. Why is Arvius still here? It's a good question. Arvius is banking on 12G, accepting peace. Always on allied, start of turn. Yeah, it's because I Which it at the turn of the is not going to happen. <laughs> Be like that. Oh, all right. Walk this is still going. Uh, I mean, I don't. I don't know. It's kind of lame, but sure, if you want. I mean, it's kind of lame. So it takes the CS. But, yeah. Sure. I mean, I can't, it's not like you can get it back. So. Oh, uh, okay. What? Knights has stealth. Why is it lame? Knights has had stealth. I did. I did. For over <laughs> 10 turns. Like CTS, but... 10 turns? Yes. Yeah. Why is he not attacking the awesome? I don't know. <laughs> so there's. He definitely should be attacking Glossin if he has stealth and auto. But in this case, I can't buy it back, so it doesn't really matter. Or a Mirage. They all have auto. I don't know why he's not attacking Glossin. I think it's because Glossin said if you peace Arvius and we don't full kill him, I'm just going to nuke the shit out of you. I mean, isn't Arvius still alive, though? I mean, I took all of his original cities, and... Arvius is down oh, okay. literally uh, yeah. one here. I, I, I mute Discord. It seems like a bad idea to just let him be. Arvius has fucking three cities. <laughs> Glossin's trying to convince Knights not to attack him. Knights, I, Knights is going to finals. Your, your kid is, uh, is popping off. You guys are going a little far with this teaming, to be honest. I think you should be dead, but that's just my personal I, I know, I've lost like all my main cities. <laughs> well, then why do you want to keep playing? Why does 12G want to keep playing? Because 12G actually has a winning chance. Just a reminder. As, as much as I do. Just a reminder as we enter this lovely stealth endgame. Um. You're not allowed to use asterisk or W to cycle, but I'm sure all of you know that. I just wanted to remind you. Yeah. Okay. I think to say that I have to leave is a bit preposterous here. You don't have to leave. I'm saying I'm not saying you have to leave either. I'm You're saying You're implying that. that. You're no, I'm implying not implying that. that. I'm implying that Knights should see that should see this through. I think that's ridiculous, but you guys do what you want to do. Okay. It, you're saying this under the pretense that I am a threat. So you're either teaming from the beginning of, all right, we need to stop Arvius from being a game-winning position, or we need to completely kill Arvius. So it depends on what your deal was and what your intention behind the deal was. That's fair enough. Arvius is trying to like. And I didn't sound like that was the case, Tackle this from like a too logical perspective. Lawson's just gonna like ignore the fuck everything he's saying and just be like. Nah, you're stupid. <laughs> like I could. I, I hope that he just goes and kills him. Intact, but ultimately, it's really up to knights how he wants to play this. Well, I mean, like to me, he's like basically completely dead. Okay. To I don't me, know if you agree with that. 
to me, his cap is gone, but he, if knights, or if uh, 12G can't kill him alone, then he's not dead. <laughs> but, it's up to you. What, what, what do you take, take from this game, right? I mean, it's already like, what kind of question is that? Wait turn, but I did want to deck this turn. Wait until next turn, you took the booty anyways. I will say though, I don't consider I don't him dead. I, I actually yeah. understand what Glossy's I mean, is. Nice is so but fucking on the, the table. The like, he, that, he's uh, like, uh, I want to deck this turn, but I'm not going to. Initially. I mean, I would just roll. To do that. Right? He's not obligated to do anything. If Wait. you want to know why I would stay in the game, it's because you guys could potentially have a ridiculously long info era war, and I don't see 12G being that much. Uh, exactly. Hawks. Like, do you, do you just, so you, knows what like, you, you just roll the tra timer and stick for war this turn? Units. Oh, for so, sure. Am I, like, pretty much fucked? Yeah. Do I really think I have a chance to win? Not necessarily. I can't see it, but who knows what happens. All right, here's what I'm going to say. I don't consider him dead, which means I consider this breaking our deal. But so at this point, how would it not be considered his breaking favorite. our deal? Like, what can I do? Like, you crazy. You can kill him. That's be nice, right? Uh, probably. I, I Sydney. Yes, I'll I guess I'll send more units at him. I have a uh, counter thought to this, Nidus. Okay, Glosson's well, so far you guys himself. Made a deal yeah. to where it's, it's, well, no, but he's got GDR. Nuke you until a certain time. Don't ask me why, but right? I, it's got something to do with the fact turn. that he's Songhai. No, it's, uh, it's, 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 it was like one sixty-five. Will there be vods? Can he kill City? Yeah, it would be it would be one seventy-five. But I'm interpreting this you know in the most kind way to myself I because I consider it kind of a dumb deal to have made. This sounds like nuke whispering to me. You have nuclear missiles, you have death robots. What's the problem? I don't have stealth. You have death robots. See, yeah, yeah, I guess he has GR. Either. He has no gold per turn, though. Like, he can't I buy any. Did he buy some? No. Okay, this, I know, that's what, that was what I was saying Especially when like you have, earlier. like, 10 uranium. Yeah, but they died of stealth. They're more hammer efficient than stealth. Are they? Yes. I don't think that's true. How is it not true? Explain it to me. Okay. Um, GDR die, stealth don't. And how many stealth the hammer shots efficiency does it take? Of a stealth, the hammer efficiency of a stealth bomber is that you invest uh, the you invest the 361 hammers into the stealth bomber, and you get more or less unlimited shots from it. The hammer efficiency of a GDR is you invest uh, 402 hammers into it, and you have it until it's dead. Now, if you play perfectly, that can be for as long as you want. But realistically, that's not what happens. Uh, Korea, no, because he doesn't have a way I'm to kill the that You're not addressing my yeah, point, I think... which is that they are more hammer efficient. Yeah, I think that's nice. just that they can't die to stealth. Okay, Which is crazy. Well, I'm kind of argument is point. that if you have 800 hammers or a thousand nice hammers game, and stealth bombers, are they going to beat a death robot? Yes, they are. It's going to take about five shots to kill a death oh, robot. I'm declaring war. Okay. Here we go, baby. The thing is, no one has stealth that's scary. Does that make sense? Like, to me. Like, no one's stealth is scary this game. No one has enough money to make it scary. They Nets have to... is... Okay, okay, uh, okay. Uh... He just lost that two of his fucking cities. Scary. Like, he just lost two stacks. Well, not... Like, they weren't full stacks. They were, like, three or fours, but still.
Rip Barkus. What? Yeah, I mean, Knights has, a, has actually a scary stealth stack. This is what? 20? Ah, uh, no. 20 is scary, it's right? Not, that's not 20. That's like 13. Well, he doesn't have them all on screen. No, I'm, I'm just looking on his. On the sidebar. Where's that on the sidebar? I got night stream. Like his unit list? Oh, yeah, I was lucky as unit list. Hmm. Yeah, it's like Got 13. twice and lost like... But he lost, he bars. just lost like... 8. He lost 5. It's not good for me. Did you not have shelters? Nope. I'll cause three shelters. Um... Kind of. He needed to keep killing Arvius, man. Seriously. Kind of? He needed to like that. That was the that was what puts it push blah, 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 pushes him ahead. Feel like that's you kill Arvius, you steal that shelter okay. tech, right? Why? Mm -hmm. you're just gonna get and then by you don't care over about Glosson's fucking you get your things anymore. You laugh at him because you've got stealth. Yeah, I probably wouldn't know. I, I probably would have done the same play as yeah, the to be honest. honest. Which might be wrong. Let's look at this from Willis's perspective. Yeah, let's go put the goggles on. Glosson's stock is increasing. I don't know, man. If Arvius has anything left, let's say he kills knights and they've got anything left, then he's going to get triple teamed. Twelve G's has been chilling. Oh, Lawson's set up to snipe that city. Oh, does Sneka? that one shot? Oh, I think it does. Yeah, it does. Plus, I, I Lawson has like bombers too, like normal bombers. So those can help with cities too. Well, this is what I was saying. Knights need needed to um, keep killing Arvius. Like I, I don't think Glosson's wrong. Like I, I, if Glosson keeps the deal, and and I think a lot of my idea is about like, okay, let's. What do you think? Let's like assume that Glosson's going to keep his word, which is, as we all know, very, <laughs> you know not guaranteed but let's assume he does if Glosson is going to keep his word then those 10 turns are when you can build shelters and you don't have to worry about Glosson's nukes anymore all the while you can pass nuclear proliferation and then just get the game on and then then Glosson's just kind of fucked I mean there's a very easy way to make sure he keeps his word which is a nap you can't nap In a time oh yes, yeah, against the rules. Yeah. Runtime error. Runtime error for Glossin. Fucking shit. Uh, can I hot join? I'm still on loading screen. Okay. I think Glossin crushes him here. Probably. 
You, 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 you need a critical mass of stealth. You need a critical mass of stealth to kill GDRs. And, and if GDRs can hide and, and chill, we're, we're in a tough spot as knights. Uh, okay, that's because you have the to the fucking kill them down. because they can't pillage. So if they if they show I their face, the you have thing. to they have to be able to kill them. Yeah, and this three stack dying. So and and the these stacks dying is not what you want. Not to mention, Gloucester actually has a ton of Holy boats. Dream. And I know we have been kind of sleeping on that, but Akizawa it okay, can so die, and then. so can his other cities. And he has zero boats. And I know those die to stealth, but. Guys, when you don't have an unlimited amount of stealth shots, which Knight doesn't because he's not commerce, this is what I was saying earlier. Um, stealth shots are a resource. Not, about to die. What'd you say? It's a problem. Like, RVS is genuinely not dead here. I thought. Because it dies to railroad plus GDR slam, right? Oh, uh, yeah. I think he's got and if that dies, that's the three stack on. Fuck. Got a fleet up north. 12G. It's also a tank in a mobile not stand. Peace, but he's not like it's, <laughs> it's literally GG if he. Okay, if obvious, dude. I mean, I think from uh, the first turn that I declared one, it was clear that you had a lot of strength that you were. This is like like game with. experience, right? Yeah. What? I'm just saying that like you're really strong right now. Wait. I think we have to reload. To me, this would be red flags, yeah. like seeing your city on, like, tap HP. <laughs> the three stack in it, but... You can't move it, he already shot. Uh, oh, fuck. Was I speaking just now? Yeah. Um, you're talking right now. There's a Discord bug, which when I... Uh, reload. When I'm, like, booting and tabbed, it triggers push to talk. I was talking to stream. <laughs> I don't know, to you, would this be red flags? Like, you'd just be like... That's annoying. But, I, I mean... I every know, I fucking, my, like... I, I, just said. I don't know, I don't, I don't know what I'd screaming. do. If I, if I was nice, I don't know what I'd do. Say that. I mean, uh, how, how many more nukes does Clawson have? Yeah, I'm worried about the nuke I'm person. I'm worried he's just okay. gonna take, take the city I planted. You're on. Does that matter uh, for you? I don't think Nice on is being... Uh, I think he sees through is the Is Arvius so fucking okay. dumb? Like, he can't pronounce uh, my name. He I'm can't pronounce Knight's name. Now. What the uh, fuck? Yeah, I mean... I think... Me and you are like, he calls right me now. RY. Yeah. Bro! Uh, you still say you definitely that. know my fucking name. And GDR. Right? You've right. you modern armor. Robots. What? Yeah, you have and he keeps GDR calling head. knights night GDR has dawn what i i mean i saw pretty early i had very low yeah he says ry count, or, um, aluminum like, count, so i decided like I wanted you to are like, fucking lying if you don't know if you want to act like you don't know and also coming out of Who are my int into 12g <laughs> um i had like i'm six rick admirals so i just planted them all in one of my central cities and built nukes out of that because nukes care about Rick animals. Ryan. They're better with I don't know players. how strong 12G is, but I'm pretty sure he's close to self. I'm just scared of 12G. <laughs> I've never won a duel against 12G. Okay. I don't know. I don't think he's that strong, but I also don't know if he can solo Arbius. I don't know what's up with all this distraction about me. As far as I'm concerned, if you're not team soon, you just win the game, Glasson. Night has dawn. On the other hand, if they do team me, I feel like Knights just wins the game, so. Well, that's... I have a bad estimation of Paul G strength right now, so. Might be a lot stronger than I think. Anything can happen. <laughs> mm -hmm. Then we just fucking three man war and Arbius goes to space. How can I go to space? <laughs> I mean, it actually would not surprise me if Arbius pushed to space. Because he does. 
He does have a bunch of the tech. I think he doesn't have the science, is the only thing. He's paying I have three cost. cities. How would I even build them? Yeah, just <laughs> madness talking. Is this a Glossinago? Yeah, I guess you can't. You don't have engineers, you don't have purchases. We believe in Glossin now. A metocracy. On his face. Um, I mean, he's by far the strongest save of the last yeah. couple of remaining. Just shift enter, yeah. Oh yeah, for sure. Believe so. Canada's up there. So, first things first. Do we think Knights sees the threat of the Sika? No. I don't. He would have zocked. He would have put someone in the zock. We could capture the weapon. He's, he's already messed up. Yeah. Okay. Let's watch this from Glossen's perspective. Watch it. Nice. But yeah. Oh, there's another nuke coming. That's a lot of nukes. I think that was what my last one. What? Why nuke there? You why nuke the there? Sky. And then why tell them that you have no more? What? Also, why isn't he why catching? Like this? Boston's already won. Like, come on, come on, bud. Why isn't he capturing the city? Why did he nuke that city if he was, if he can cap it? Does Glossin know that he can cap the city? <laughs> yeah, uh, you know. The reason these guys are in the, the playoffs. Yeah, I'm sorry. They're in the playoffs. What I have There's a play. calculated reason why Glossin's doing everything. And I'm too ignorant to see. Because I'm... Just a wee baba. It is so laggy. Okay, Fox, but that nuke was just obviously wrong, right? Hello, stealth. That didn't seem very fair. Like, oh, that, that nuke was perfect. obviously just terrible. Dude, maybe he did it for city damage. I don't know. <laughs> he didn't need city I damage. don't, I, I, I'm not, I don't know, okay? I'm not defending it. Like, I, I have won to have some of the worst nukes of all time, and that was up there. Hawks, oh, what's your excuse for not having a fucking new computer? I'll wait. I'll wait. No, don't erase the cities. Don't do it. I'm gonna erase the cities. Doesn't need one to dominate. <laughs> this one works yeah, just pets, fine. Don't you? Fuck off. I do. Twelve J, shouldn't you be assisting Nidus? Nidus. I am dying right now. Nidus. What is this? The fucking okay, I like. Will help attack Glosson if you stop attacking him. That's just because you will help attack Glosson because you want to kill Glosson. No, it's not. I don't know. I it actually don't sense. think that I can push this all that easily. Is well, Plogy in second? I am dying. And... Does it matter? You have oh, a bunch of GDRs knocking on my door. I'm dying. What do you want me to say? I'm dying. <laughs> yeah, I think you can CC here, right? CC 12G, right? So what do you want here, 12G? Or Arvius, maybe? How can we be friendly? CC, uh, 
Sí, Perkins. Uh, ok. Fucking meow. This is Colossus' first final. If he wins? Yes. Does he... Do you see a, a different scenario? Yeah, I do. I think there's a big chance that he doesn't win this. How? He gets triple teamed. Yeah, I think he can survive this triple team right now. I don't think so. Army has significantly dropped. They're getting... Nuked and GDR'd. Is Glosson getting a lot of hate? No? Glosson's... This is getting appropriate, man. Hate. <laughs> Arbius barely counts as a team. Apparently he's got a fleet. You want to try to find that? I mean, his game is just so boring to watch. Oh, that's the fleet Glosson's scared of. Okay. Four units. <laughs> yeah, this is the reason I'm not... I don't think anyone can team Glosson. Because... Uh, let's check 12G. We haven't Olin. looked at 12G in a long time. Twelve G's about to hit stealth. Maybe twelve G is relevant. I don't know. This looks super over to me. He has three stealth upgrades. He's building a solar. He's still trying. Of course he is. I'm going to die very fast, by the way. Uh, I don't think that's Let's true. watch the perspective of Knights. Knight has dawn. Look, I'm ready to concede if 12G isn't doing anything. I, I warned you this was going to happen, Knightus. Knightus hey, dawn! Knightus dawn! <laughs> I think yeah. that this is over. If 12G, if, if you're just attacking me out of some sort of, like, deal you guys made, this is the most extreme noob whispering I've ever seen. He's not. The problem okay. is Knights didn't stick with the original deal. Just kill well, fucking Arvius. me further is crazy. Attacking me in the first place was yeah, already correct. correct. You lost a lot of attacking. Like, I, I, I don't know, I, 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 I'd fall into the game. I, I, I would you should be definitely fall into the same trap, there, to yeah. be honest. If Blossom kills me, the game ends. I sure. never... How did that... Or, uh, I never would have... Okay, like, I, I like... Um, I still have I usually know game what game I would do play. in these situations. If I'm Knights and I trust Glosson to hold his end of the deal, that's what all of this is contingent here, on. You guys. But if I trust <laughs> Glosson to do <laughs> that... <laughs> I mean, you're, like, laughing. But, like, I, I, I so believe like, it. It's a, little, it's a little bit... Uh... We'll play Glosson. This game looks over. Every variant is bad for me. 12G, uh, Achilles is, I mean, sorry. Arvis is asking 12G if he wants to concede. Like, I don't know why Knights felt the need to keep Arvis alive. But there's no uh, counterbalance. I, I, I would He's... do the same play that I said. Remember when you completely backstabbed me only to CC Zuzo two turns later? Yeah, fuck him up, Cushy. Yeah, fuck you, Korea. Shut the fuck up about backstabbing. 
Yeah. Go in. That's the game by Blossom. I mean, the, game, the game's not over, right? <laughs> I mean, it's not, but... I've written it off on my scorecard. If you're saying the game's not over, he could be alternatives. I think there's a chance 12G wins this, but I don't know. I'm looking at it more. I don't think so. <laughs> I still think Gloss is going to win, but I, 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 I'm so hesitant to say anything because teaming can be such a fucking detriment. I mean, this game has been like casting a curse like, of steroids, but... yeah. I don't think this game. This game's over. Dude, why does Kushi hate Korea so much? God damn. He has a nuke for 12G as well? Okay. Yeah, I mean, he's sitting on two nukes. Alright, then never mind. The game's over. How dead are United? Uh, I was say, is this Gloss's best game? Um, yeah, depends on how fast he pushes. <laughs> it was terrible. I think one or two more nukes and... So you just never getting killed. Over. Nope. How come you had your stealth bomber so close to him? Is this Gloss's worst game? I mean... Like... I had them pretty spread, but... I just had so many nukes. You didn't have well, shouldn't they have been like Buffalo Creek? If you yeah. had him on Aquasama, Oshinka, Grand River, or Jenny's River, you're just a fool. He had about yeah. 10 off between those like four I mean, cities. It was no, like they should have been in the middle, Buffalo Creek. Yeah, it's yeah, like a second really... time I've played versus Bombers, man. Like, or... I mean, that's just an experience, right? You're just not familiar. That's why I'm telling you this right now, so you don't make the mistake yeah. in the future. You'd want to have an Air Force in Buffalo Creek and Mamel. Maybe yeah, in Collinsburg, and you could I wouldn't put one in Buffalo Creek. What? Definitely well, fucking I don't think that helps when he has missile cruisers, though, right? It does, because I. the thing is, you're trying to control... You just need sight. I mean, Buffalo as long Creek as you can keep sight north of Aqua Sesame, you can buy your What did you just say? Buffalo Creek is the, uh, spot, but all your Controlling planes, the ocean but... outside of Aqua Sesame, you can just... Why? As long as you have sight up there... Because it can be intercept okay. without being, like, swept. You get two coastals, Easily. you could add some stuff, and he wouldn't be able to run missile cruisers in there. Not so easily. Yeah. But I mean, it doesn't... That I would never like... have naval, like... What do you call it? He can do whatever the fuck he yeah. wants right now. It doesn't matter. <laughs> so I didn't bother making that many ships. That's a wrong assessment. No one was actually coastal. Gloss ended up having the strongest presence on the coast, though. Might as well have been a coastal empire. Yeah. I essentially. So I hate when Argus does this dead. type of thing. Reacts all high dead, and mighty. But I'll be dead very and soon. like, you should have done this. Just You're wrong. You needed to do this. Well, like, bro, look like has your sim is helping, dog. So. Fuck off. Nice attack on fucking our boy. Yeah, come on. Give him a break. He's got a we tenth of your hours. Come on. Come on. Yeah. He used his nukes, and either way, you're next, right? So you have no choice.
just seems like, like wrong if he, to me. If he nukes you, then he's... Like, or he has to nuke me to kill me, I'm pretty sure, here. No, I don't. I, I've, I think I've spent enough nukes that... I don't need to nuke you to kill you. Well, maybe. I might need to nuke you to finish you, but I don't. Harvey's like, played a pretty good I've game today. Killed enough units here. I mean, to Herb? get what? Herb? Advent Mess this game up like, so hard. Positioning. Dude, yeah, Arv had a free fucking win. win. Capture with the city. But... Oh, god damn it. Yeah, maybe not even. It's probably less than a tenth, honestly. You're right. I mean, this is I'm like, sorry, but anyone who goes into a, what was it, a 50 turn war with someone and steals literally nothing, I don't and think with, that's with good. With 1,000 gold. With 1,000 gold of upgrades before doing it, I, I don't think that's a good game. By, I'm sorry. Uh, four or five. It's a lot. Did you, did you kill a stack of planes, Arvius? I did. Whoops. Like, you could put so many asterisks on this game. So, when you go into these info error games, Nidus, you need to be more careful about the deals you make. No, uh, the, the Especially one asterisk. Especially if you're doing a, I, that all we're gonna war is, until uh, this player is totally dead to it is not Because happy. someone else could just be overwhelmingly powerful at the end of it. My bad was wrong. I definitely underestimated Gloss's position right here, but... You all I mean, are getting noob whispered. Like I don't think you underestimated before 208. I don't think you underestimated position. I said my two eight is and I think wrong. this is all just coming down to yes, a few mistakes. The, the placement. Of Someone, I think Miyota said one seventy five. One seventy six. Miyota said one seventy five. It's very up in the air, but you just had too much Hawks presence at the front where it was. It's up to knights if we can CC. Oh wait, so is the game over? Start of this war, it was very even, and. Just the decisions that were made in the next like two turns were sure. kind of what made the difference. No one could do anything. Does that make sense? Yeah. I mean, the one time I did play versus nukes was versus artifacts nukes, so. That's not playing versus nukes. I mean, I don't think it's completely over if... So, can... here's the issue. So... I have stealth now. I don't think this is all an experience thing. Because, again, you're paying... You're the pushing person. You're getting the tax, but you're paying the heaviest price. Lawson pays way less of yeah. hammers to then... Just drop nukes on my head. Yeah, again, all of this comes down to knights not to taking shelters. Me. I mean, I was sending a <laughs> and I actually else. did send what? 24 bombers over. I think to everyone else could have done. Uh, I think everyone could have done guns. different points. They just, I, did I didn't really have. I meant like what? his vulnerability to knights was, was just yeah, because was, didn't he didn't do the shelters. Right. There were. No, you just weren't bombing me. Well, there were three carriers. No, I mean, I had no targets. For a lot of the community, like, the same bomb? attitude there as were three right carriers now. And What do you mean by that? I think you were pussyfooting the war, and Nidus was just getting chewed. And then 12D is getting chewed, because he's, for some reason, attacking me. I had no idea why he's attacking me. Uh, you see the three strongest players at war. Don't you want the person that's getting teamed to just last longer? It made no sense. I think 12G just wanted tax, right? Yeah, I think 12G needed tax. That's just the wrong decision to make. That is wrong. What could be better than a high tech player just staying in the game, making units to then attack the other players that are stronger than you in the game? How does getting one tech off me help when he's losing like 20 units? And I'm not using my units on someone else. Seems terrible to me. I kind of agree with Arvius, but at the same time, like I think the only chance 12G had was to get some good text deals. Yeah, I, I mean, like I understand where he's coming from, like for sure. But at the same time, it's like, dude, the only chance he had was to be relevant in tech. 
And I understand what Arbius is saying too, where it's like, bro, I can't defend this shit with fucking units. I just get nuked. Yeah, I mean, Gloss and just Arbius uh, is correct and wrong at the whispered, same time. Whispered yeah, these guys. I mean, and, a lot of the community uh, gets salty if someone who has less experience than them gets salty about making a decision they disagree with. I don't think Knights is salty. Knights has not said he's salty at all. I just think... I, I, I'd be so salty as 12G, though. Yeah, I would be losing, very salty as salty. Losing to uh, Glosson. <laughs> when Glosson does that attack. I mean, you know what this is like? This is like when fucking um, Lucas attacked Pilu in the finals that one time. You know? More Arvius and 12G. Look, I, I I understand why Arvius is mad, and I get why he'd be you, upset if someone's making in, what, what you player. consider to be wrong decisions. Or only the like, I get it. But at the same time, knowing uh, what Knights do, knew, I don't think it was a wrong decision. I think yeah. he he uh, yeah, he, was mean, by, he was by he was ten turns. He was everyone agreed he was in the best spot after it. He was ten turns ahead to stealth than anyone. He was. All he, they, they had to pass nuclear proliferation. He made himself very vulnerable to nukes, and he didn't account for it. That's all that happened. Hold on. I'll be right back. Anyway. Watson just filled this game. The sweet whispers. Why is he killing these units? They died to Citadel. Dude, it's, it's late. Arvius has a holier than thou way of talking. Excuse me, Pope Arvius. Look, I, I think Ar Arvius. Yeah, has almost more experience than anyone in the game. Nuke my stealth in the front. I, I understand why he's frustrated, and I understand why he thinks that, that he, is, through my cities. he can, like, stand on his high horse and, like, tell people how to play the game. But ultimately, his so game was... He misplayed so fucking hard, too. Like, he, he threw just as hard, uh, if not harder, than Knights did. Like, the fact that he thinks that he's, like... In a position to tell yeah, Knights what to do is fucking so, so uh, ignorant. Knights also has not played the game much. That right. we talked about that when we were so going over player profiles in the beginning. Minimize the damage of a nuke. You basically want it to be killing no more than three units. Like if I was gonna, like a nuke yeah. has so, 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 so basically there. turn zero if you're yeah. gonna load it to anyone. If you're it losing five units and then, then, nuke, and then if you're right. losing seven. That's disastrous. And I sent multiple nukes that got like five or six or seven units. And that's just Which, so hammer inefficient. I mean, I, I would also like put knights up on that that pedestal. Like the, like these are like the, the three best spots. Betting with nukes spot. is genuinely right. just Knights had furs as fucking Iroquois. Yeah. Glossin I mean, had whatever as I, song high and then Arvius had like it, it was very obvious who the, had the worst land you know yeah Arvius <laughs> I mean, had like very suspicious land spots. and fucking if 12g yeah do miotas was though. terrible and so was, I mean, it was miotas work. wasn't like completely then terrible i think if he settled the coastal it would have been a lot what, better what but 12 g's yeah, I mean, was I mean, obviously I mean, terrible are you close to being able to 12 do g's was like, i can stall for like I have six, six stealth. From he, he, yeah. Like, that he's still in this game. He's also got stacked cities. The test being in this skill. Yeah, I agree. From I mean, he's pushing you me. You could have charged your tanks and your rocket artillery in there, but... Why do too many things? Stealth. I have tanks. I have GDR. He doesn't have... He doesn't have the mass of stealth to push GDR. Dude. I mean, I, I can send all my units there, but uh, I will have no chance to still use in this game. Yeah. Basically, I don't have them now, I think. Yeah. So 
supposed to just see him, don't I think? Yeah, yep. No, I know, but Natalia, that's not the point. The point is like Arvius is like the penultimate person to do that kind of thing. And I think it starts with people like him. Game where four people are alive, but I mean, I've played this game with the intention of keeping Arvius from being able to do anything because 12G is more experienced than I am and Arvius is more experienced than I am, but I slammed 12G early, which made him, and he's also dead in the middle, and Arvius is the person who can outplay me. I'm reloading. Ziff, do we want to continue? I thought the first person to be nice to you was Sounds fresh, like Kel. Doesn't sound like that, but... Mm -hmm. <laughs> From my perspective, y'all got noob whispered. I definitely think I should have been teamed to some extent, but not like the way this went down. Yeah, I mean... I didn't expect I, guess, that I don't even kill know, you like, so easy. Is this game Sorry. actually over? I, I, don't I know told you guys. I was like, look, I'm getting mowed down, and you guys still kept going in. Well, you're either getting mowed down or you're chewing through uh, knights. It's not both. Can I repeat, please? Do we continue or not? I think it's just me who wants to concede, or who hasn't voted, right? Yeah. Congrats to the Austin. So you decide. 12 is not, uh, well, 12 is not gonna attack Lawson, so I'm just gonna leave, so. I think that makes your decision pretty easy. Yeah, alright. Guess that's GG then. GG. GG, nice game, Glossy. GG. Thank fucking God. I can go to bed now. <laughs> right. do, you think, do you think that game was, like, over? Uh, yes. Okay. And it's finest. Okay. <laughs> Thank you, Chris. I know I die fast, but it's like. I think it really did come down to those first couple turns with nukes. Yeah. I think. I think my my things were like just fake spread. I like had them in cities that were long distance from each other, right? Yeah. I think all of you had I... good chances to win, except 12G, who just got kept getting fucked over and over and over again. I feel really bad for him. Yeah, I agree with that. <laughs> I kicked a player, I think is what happened, and then I couldn't see the peace offerings that 12G was sending me. I'm fairly sure that's why. It's just annoying. I lost my Vagrant card. I guess my game doing what I did. I lost it. You, you just need the last 30 more turns. Would you Oxford Watson? Nukes. I uh, Oxford and Nukes because it lined up with my scientist timings. Uh -huh. it, I mean, it's not the most science efficient thing to Oxford, but I just like, I needed to start nuking Arvius. <sighs> I genuinely was terrified of Arvius. Glossin until you got. I've been doing it. He wasn't like my fourth strong. All right, right? No, Glossin won. Yeah, by far. Come, like, come I don't think anything less than 3v1ing him would have killed him. Arvis is already to battle, brother. That's brothers. just wrong. God, God damn it, Glossin. Like, the yeah. game is already over. We don't need to actually pretend anymore. We don't need to, like, manipulate people anymore. Arvis, you I trade on a reputation. You trade on a reputation of being terrifying to attack. It's the reason a lot of people will avoid attacking you in the early game. People will show up with crossbows and be like, nope, it's Arvius, I'm going somewhere else. I've seen this happen before. One of the consequences of that reputation, which I think is well-deserved when it comes to warplay, is that in situations like this, that reputation still stands. I think that Agree with together, Austin. we totally. can kill you. I think if you drop one of us, we don't kill you. I agree with Austin seen... completely. I've seen you fight 100%. off, like... Yeah, I mean, the, I mean, the commentary, commentary was everything. Like, like, we well, gave what, you're, what you're saying is essentially that people are thinking irrationally because they're not skilled enough to realize what's actually capable, what's actually possible. No, what I'm saying is that 
You have a well-deserved well. reputation for being very, very scary to attack into. You are one of the best defensive war players in the game. That means the consequence of that is that in a game like this, where we are attacking into you, the war skill that you have makes the difference between you living or dying if it is just two players attacking. To that point, I don't think most people in your spot would have gone bomb shelters. I wouldn't have, and I would have had all my cities... Yeah, bro, that was fucking crazy. That was crazy. I mean, it worked out. But... Yeah, like, I would not have gone bomb shelters, and I would have had all my cities nuked to shit. Well, it's... And I would have died there. I'd be out of the game. Well, the crazy... The reason it's crazy is because there's no reason Glosson should have went fucking nukes. Like, that's what made it crazy. What do you think I was supposed to go? Stealth? Just, she just goes stealth. Fucking win the game. Like, the I crazy... Like, like going the bomb shelters makes no sense. Everyone's fuck. I mean, it worked. Like, obviously, it was right in hindsight. But the fact that Glosson decided to go nukes randomly was like... What? And then... I don't know. It's crazy. It was a cool game. It was really cool. But... I don't know. I think that this game was very tight until Knights lost a bunch of units to nukes. I understand that I am very skilled at war and more skilled than most players, hence the reputation as you say. But doesn't mean I can do the impossible. And you maybe you can't see it, but like when I'm plainly saying, hey, I'm getting completely destroyed, and then people are like, oh, no, 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 that, that's not happening. It's like, you guys are getting noob whispered when that's happening, when you're when you're thinking that way. It's like, you, when you see what's happening. When I say that you're not, that's me, like, being like, okay, I need, like, more help from you guys in order to kill them. Right? What a star room. Like, if anything, that's me, like, noob whispering them, kind of. Auto nuke broke. I know, it's like, Look, I who would have expected Glo I don't think Glosson knew he was going nukes, half dude. Half the in entertainment for me is, like, I will look at people's positions in the game, and I will think, they objectively should do this, this is the right play. I don't tell people what they should do, or what they... I'm not gonna go out of my way to do that, or, like, make them do a certain thing that's gonna conducive for my play, because I like to see if people can figure it out. That's it's fun for me to see if you can figure it out, but I like I'm I'm giving you the information. I don't felt like you. I felt like you guys didn't figure it out. And it's like <laughs> I'm what I'm saying right now. Cerule, like, yeah, hey, you're 100 percent right. Moments where you were you had the possibility to realize this. And I'd love to explain to you what to look for and why, um, how you come to this realization. And I, I'm hearing in Discord is, no, this was all, this is all the way it had to be. Look, I had to be teamed to some extent, you guys. I'm just trying to say, like, if you want to, if we're, when, when you find yourself in the, these tournament games later on, if you don't know how to navigate the teaming circle in the information era, you're going to end up in the same situation of, oh, well, the teaming ended and now I just get fucked. You have to be some degree perceptive of what's happening. And that's why I'm saying it's like, okay, why is 12G I, 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 coming I in I feel bad me? for... This for makes no well, sense. Oh, it's, like, oh, it's, oh, it's, it's like, that's crazy, dude. 12G was this fucked just wrong. 12G was incredibly fucked from start to finish. There is nothing... He got self bombers at the end. What? Yeah, he had self bombers. Yeah. He's so far from bomb shelters. And he also does the top bomber math that Knights does. Was I supposed this to go bomb shelters? Argument. I don't know. Yes, uh, you were. I, 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 I can talk to you about it afterwards if you want. Okay. Yeah, I think Ryan probably knows better than I do. Saying that that uh, 12G is just fucked is just like writing off this whole idea. It doesn't. If he's going to be playing to win, he shouldn't be trying to attack my city and losing all he his units. My my, 
I watched the whole thing. I think he needed to attack your city. The only way he's relevant is if he can compete with Lake Intex. Yeah, yeah, yeah I, I agree. agree. Like, like there, there's zero chance he's relevant if he doesn't, doesn't like, like steal some text off you. And you're the only player he can steal text off of because he doesn't stand a candle's chance chance in the snow of taking cities off of either of us. His army couldn't fight me. And I can't fight back against stealth. I can't fight back against nukes. I'm not trying to grief 12G. The natural decision is to no, no, funnel I... all of my military down. I mean, I mean it's, 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 it's the correct decision, decision for both of you, you right? right? Like, like it's, it's he, he can't, can't win the game, game if he doesn't, doesn't steal, steal like, like towards like like texts text from, from you. you. He needs, he needs uh, to, uh, to defend. Hey. I think... Let's say this is reasonable. Let's say he takes this city. He needs another city. I agree. He needs to get in a stronger position. But he also needs us to, to fight. And he needs people to, like, get bloody. So, take one of my cities, but don't push. I offered him peace several times. Take the city. Go take a city-state. Work to... How do you get this dead player to then become your grief machine to attack another player? Because I offered it multiple times. How does that change, how does how that does that change, change the scenario? scenario? Of like lost and just winning the game after he kills knights. Knights and 12G invested too much into attacking me. Lawson did not, and they had no answer for that's, Lawson's position. That's afterwards. not. It, it. Let's say they invested nothing or less. Knights. I mean, neither of them have bomb shelters. They both get nuked and they die. Yeah, so the question is... The so question is, how did they get to bomb boarding? shelters? And it's by taking techs off you. No, this is the wrong way to think about it. Okay. Are you saying... Are okay. you making the argument that knights should be killing more of Arvius so that he can steal uh, further to bomb shelter? I could have killed Ogala. Ogala. No, I'm saying... I'm saying that knights needed to force you, Glosson, into nuking me more. How did you end up having five, six nukes going into the war with him? Because you need to by pay the higher time, price. Because by the time we had reached that stage, um, there were I couldn't nuke any of the uh, I couldn't nuke any of the cities. Like I couldn't nuke. So I'm I'm building three nukes, right? I'm building three nukes okay. at any given point. These nukes are in my cap. It's a four turn. To Gaza is a five turn. To Buck two is a six turn. Um, which means that within three turns, just on average, it takes me about two turns to move a nuke in range of you. Which means that there is a every, approximately every three turns, I'm getting at least uh, approximately every two turns, I'm getting a nuke. Right? Um, average of five turn build, three cities. Yeah, every approximately every two turns, I'm getting a nuke, and approximately. Uh, given that a nuke takes two turns to deploy and launch, um, it takes, uh, I'm sitting on at least one nuke at all times, right? right. That math makes sense? We start talking yes. about, yes. he takes my CS in one turn, we start talking about, okay, this is, uh, okay, we're going to be going to war soon, I stop nuking you when we start fighting over the CS, um, I'm holding... Uh, at the time, I think I was holding two nukes in reserve and moving one. Um, then we war for another two or three turns. I, in that time, I produce another two nukes. And that's how we get to five nukes dropped. Right? Moving one, one in reserve that I've just been holding in reserve this entire time. Um, and two produced and then a third one produced on like the like fifth turn or something that math checks out do you guys care about this discussion like i i really don't you want to hear it okay fine is the other thing is if he's, if he's no. not taking your cities then there's also the risk that i snipe him and I do have text I can steal off of you. So there's a separate thing there because a uh, puppeted sea, a puppeted sea, a city is not a. Uh, I can't steal tech off of that. Okay, cool. But I can steal yeah, tech I'm off tired. of one of your cities. So there's actually incentive for him to keep killing your cities. 
it's not like a big deal. It also doesn't require very much for him to kill Montreal and Toronto after Ottawa is already dead. I think if Knights forced me into a deal of attacking you, that would be bad advantageous for him. Well, another thing is, how do you attack me? I did have a coastal at the time. You did have one coastal at the time. You had a fleet. Your fleet dies in one nuke. I consider you know where it's at. at. I do know where it's at because I accidentally ran a. Harvey's bro, your 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 fleet was five ships. Come on, what are we what are we doing? Like, you you can't really attack. To say that I wouldn't be able to do anything is not. I, I'm not saying you can't do anything, but to say that you could deal with Glosson or do something to Glosson is a little ignorant. No, it's not. I, I could have done something to Glosson. I have 24 planes User over there. User disconnected from your channel. And I'm able to play them as strictly coastal if I want. All right, I can't. I, I don't think you I literally, like, am watching people's fucking had, stream, and I, I know what they can do. Arvi is saying, oh, I could do something to Glossin. Bro, fuck off. Really what? Back onto me. No, you That's fucking like can't. I went nukes is because I, it's I everything, felt. every time. Ryan's saying it's wrong. Ryan's saying that I should just come self. There's a very strong argument for that. But I felt like I couldn't kill you. I couldn't interact with you without nuking you. That's why I went nukes. You yeah, also you can't really easy. get back to me. What's up? You have coastal dominance. It's All right, I'm. That. Yeah, I'm done here. I I fuck can't take anymore. This is fucking stupid. I would have needed some of my cities to, uh, to then. I don't know. Move carriers out there. Probably not. You guys want Arvius, or after you've lost the cap, you guys want Arvius, Kush, I think not kill my um, knights or Glossen. Maybe my path is going open borders, running over. That's a really long walk. Probably four or five turns with railroad system. Glossen. Maybe. How much unit? Like, you're Take care, bro. Units, you don't have All right. Cover. Let's raid Glossen. Your units just get shredded. Look, man, I'm just saying, you're Nidus. I have no choice but to accept the deal. If I'm Knights here and I have this situation, I think I do, like, I think on the front with you, I'm playing the same way. I'm killing Montreal, I'm killing Toronto, I'm killing Vancouver. Well, After I that, hope you all... I think the decisions that were made, real quick. I'd probably... Thanks everyone for watching. Uh, we hit 120 concurrent, which is pretty cool. Um, I hope you all hit bingo. That was kind of sick. Uh... I think that's it. Yeah. Well, anyway, I'm off. I know, uh, I don't know who's streaming. I think Frank might be streaming tomorrow, so go check out that game. I think it starts in about eight or ten hours or something like that. But anyway, I will see you all later.